Welcome to Tribute to X Gemini. Let's play Mega Man 3 Part 1. This is Ron Moore along with Green and Star Soldier 1. Yes, I'm alive again. Yo, what's up, my babies? Yep. <laughs> Wait, I'm your baby? Whoa. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, uh... He is your father. Get used to it. <laughs> oh. um, yeah, so uh, I put it in the description box, but four years ago, a friend of mine, X Gemini, passed away in a car wreck and. Uh, Almost every year I've done some sort of tribute to him. So last year I couldn't think of nothing else and I was like, oh wait, I could have done a tribute on S2K. We haven't done that yet on the S2K channel, Mega Man 3. So yeah, uh, doing that for him this year. And uh, yeah, so I think Mega Man 3 was like his favorite Mega Man game. And Green also knew Gemini. Mm -hmm. From back in the day, Mega Man's Clubhouse on Yahoo all day. Or MSN. Mm -hmm. Yeah. All right, yeah. Yeah, it's great taste in video games. Yeah. <laughs> eight new robots. What do you say, Star Soldier? I'm sorry? It's an eight new robots. What do you say about them, Star Soldier? AB? What? A no, B? eight new. Oh. <laughs> Am I cutting no. out? <laughs> I'm sorry. I... <laughs> he, he choked at that one moment in time. It's yeah. all good now. <laughs> yeah. I'm... Yeah, I'm sorry, uh, maybe I'm not hearing things well. Yeah, okay. Uh, let me know if I'm cutting out, because that happens sometimes lately. Alright, here we go with Proto Man. Yeah, what's the deal with this guy? <laughs> well, I know what happens. <laughs> I don't know if this is the real guy or if this is a fake dude. And yeah. he's no, just messing is... with me. Yeah, this is the real one. He's just being a troll. That's all he is. <laughs> <laughs> he's being mysterious. We first saw him, like, who is this guy? Why is it? Why, why do we keep fighting him? Why would he die? <laughs> yeah, exactly. I'm like, who are you? Why do you have sunglasses? I want them. Yeah. <laughs> oh, I hate those freaking uh, Jack in the Box things. Yeah. Don't they shoot rockets in this game? I wasn't looking. Yeah, they shoot yeah. boxing gloves or something at you. Yeah. Yeah, the slinky eyes. I hate those things. Oh uh, yeah. <laughs> well, at least they're easy to kill. Yeah. I hate a lot of things in this game. <laughs> yeah, this game is uh, it's Mega Man, so yeah, yeah, pretty much. And this game is a bit more challenging than Part Two. Yeah, that I was think only it all got part harder part after two. two. I hate this part right here. Oh man, seriously, this is like real tedious here. Well, here I, I got down for the most part, but there's like and Mega Man Two Heat Man stage. Those, I know there's a way of shortcut around it, but. In Heat Man stage of Mega Man 2, then pretty much every Mega Man game after that, they appear and... Oh man, it's so, it's so annoying. Mm-hmm. I still think Mega Man 5 and 6 is, um... Are the hardest out of the originals. Really? I think I 1 is the hardest five? out of the original. Um, I don't know, I just think, um... I think because 6, um... The way the damage is done, like to you and to the bosses, it feels harder. And uh, popcorn popper now. Mega Man Six had uh, moments where it was pretty difficult, but I thought five was pretty easy. I think it was just me being a scrub. Yeah, <laughs> I don't know why I thought those were knuckles. I hate that show. Knuckle missiles. <laughs> they they do look like just missiles. I thought they looked like little knuckles. <laughs> Boxing gloves coming at you. Oh, this stage is short. Yeah, here's Horseshoe Man. <laughs> I mean, Magnet Man. <laughs> no, it's a horseshoe. They're just deceiving you. Hopefully not the jobber wrestler Horseshoe. <laughs> mm. I don't even remember Horseshoe. Good. <laughs> and uh, <laughs> must have been WCW. Yes, Raven's Flock, I think. <laughs> All right. Uh, yeah, Magnet Man, not that hard. Easy pattern to do right here. Using my magnets. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Oh, get back here! Yeah, stage. Yeah, stage. Oh. Pretty easy. Especially yeah, the, the problem is to run out good Mega Man games at this point. Oh, look at this! I got a big magnet. Well, I think Mega Man Four Fear is me. when they really started to run out of names. No, I think like I think they definitely showed it when they came back to it with like Mega Man Ten, and they were like, "Hey, Sheep Man!" I'm like, "Oh, <laughs> Capcom, why?" Bang. Yeah. Now we got the Magnet Missile. Yeah. As Mega Man looks at you all, weapon. as Mega Man looks at you all dazed and confused. Oh, 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 oh. 
and I love the password music right here. Weapon item acquisition music is pretty cool. Yeah. This game has a cool soundtrack. What do you say, Jay? Well, I don't like it. It's, 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 it sounds like a big game. I'd rather listen to Eminem Call of Duty. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> Eminem oh, Call of Duty. It's called Hard Man. <laughs> yeah, Hard Man. Now, this is where they rent. I guess the worst I've run out of ideas is Hard Man. He looks like an old fashioned Freddy Krueger oven or something. I don't know what the heck he is. <laughs> Hard man, uh, there's a trick in, in Mega Man 3 where you gotta have two two controllers to do it. Jump to a pit, then jump right back out, you become like an invincible. You can't do that in this stage because there's no pits. Oh yeah. So in a way, this is the hardest stage, no pun intended. <laughs> These damn monkeys. Oh. Dang it, freaking back from Mega Man 2. Yeah, they're back and harder. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Well, the first one, maybe the two that weren't hard, really, but this one, they're like really annoying right here. Oh, ah! <laughs> Dang it. <laughs> yeah, that's what I always do with that guy, too. It's yeah. Cheap and effective. Yeah. Yes, but there but he is. He deserves no... it. He was always throwing, throwing it straight. There's no that. honor in these types of games. If yeah. they give you a method, you will use the hell out of it. Yeah, like the... You expose the brokenness of it, too, like Metal Man's weapon. Mm-hmm. It's the most broken and greatest game in Me uh, game. A uh, weapon in Mega Man 2. <laughs> yeah, that's the problem, yeah, though. Mega There's Man no great broken. weapon in this one, though. Mega Man 3. Yeah. I think that's the only problem with it is the weapons here kind of suck. Except oh, for, like, uh, the weapon and... Well, yeah, I mean, I like some of them, like, I like, uh... I'm trying to think. <laughs> you know it's what? Hard, Never eh? mind. Uh, uh, I'll, take, well, I'll tell you one off the top of my head that sucks, and that's Top Man's ballerina weapon. Stupid. Yeah, but it's so hilarious if you time it right. If you kill Dr. Wily in one hit, it's fucking Seriously, scary. I don't... How, how embarrassed is Shadow Man? I mean, <laughs> that's your freaking weakness. <laughs> anyway, here's Proto Man again, spamming and... Finding you the same way Freddy Krueger does in Top Gun Nation for the NES. Alright, uh... Yeah, Hard Man has awesome music, stage music, though. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I think it is. Yeah. Does it, uh, pretty much, uh, the game has awesome soundtrack. I mean, Mega Man's pretty famous, I think, for its awesome soundtrack. Oh, mm -hmm. yeah. Alright, here yeah, we go. I see the ones like... Shadow Man, that one's kinda awful, but yeah, I like that. Uh, Gemini's music, I like Yeah, Hard Man stage. And the first stage of this Dr. Wily theme. Yeah, oh, yeah. spoiler, Dr. Wily is a bad guy in this. <laughs> oh no. No way. Whoever would have not thought of it. And we made short work of a hard man, who was not that hard. Totally easy. And uh Yeah, so yeah. now we take Do what? Wait, what about easy? Yeah. You Our got was Hard Knuckle. <laughs> Alright. Next. Oh man. Next is Dredo Man. Man. Top Man. Now he has a cool stage and music. Oh yeah. Everything except him is cool. Yeah. <laughs> I think it's cool for some reason he, there's trees inside of glass. Yeah, I don't get that. Man, I think I figure he would stadium. have more like a Jewish stage or something. Yeah. Maybe more Star David or something. <laughs> <laughs> I think we're in a baseball stadium with something, sports lights in the background. and Yeah. I don't know, kind of a unique stage for a for a top man, but still pretty cool. And, and music's pretty cool, too. And for some reason, in Mega Man Anniversary Collection, uh, the remix music for Mega Man 3 is, uh, th is not a variation or a remix of this. Of this song, it's actually uh, a remix of the state of the opening stage music in Mega Man 7. Yeah, I thought that was yeah, you know, pretty weird, but it's awesome though. But it's like 
it's not a remix of Top Man, but oh well. Uh, it still fits. That's all that matters. It's still freaking cool. And <laughs> Jeffrey, uh, construction worker, guys. Oh, 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 nice timing. Yeah, that's kind of luck right there. All day. As we fight uh, one of the village people. Y M C A. We're gonna fight with them here too. I know they call me tools, but I've always called them hard hats. <laughs> Whoa, watch out for uh, Gentoo's cat. Oh man. <laughs> watch out for the Nian, Nian cat or Nian cat, whatever the cat's hell called. Is. Yeah. Damn, that damn pop tart. <laughs> pop tart. Yeah, it always makes me hungry. Oh, look watch at that. Like, oh, why am I watching this? I don't have a pop tart near me. <laughs> Got Robo Garfield here. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, I think that was. This is the only time we see him in an entire game. Mm -hmm. Yep, or twice, anyways. Ah, yeah. <laughs> and we see this enemy later on in the game, and but. It only made sense in this stage. Yeah. Mm -hmm. this Super tops. Cool. Yeah. Oh, I died. Oh, I died again. What died? Because jump in the pit, you get life. <laughs> Alright, here's the fearsome boss battle with... Top Man. I hope he's on top of his game. <laughs> Which he won't be. Yeah. He sucks. <laughs> See, how, come you can't, how come you can't use those top weapons instead of just doing a stupid... Not a ring to spin. Yeah, those look like awesome weapons. Yeah, but no, he had these stupid spin attacks. Like, really? Yeah. I think it should be like Mega Man Nets, where you could use both. Yeah. And boom, he's dead now. Boom, oh, yeah. tough action action. <laughs> all right, let's suck all the energy out of this room. Oh yeah, That's the the because we energy. got the worst weapon in Mega Man history. Yeah, really. Oh. Well, either that or the charge kick, but now we got the oh, top the charge stand. kick has some use. Oh, oh, oh. Some. All right, now who's next? I hate to sound like Goldberg, but who's next? Oh, Shadow Man is next. Oh yeah. Not the big to dip for Star Soldier. I think Shadow Man music is pretty ECW. I don't know. It's kind of drowning, and I'd suspect the more fast path. I don't know, intense ninja music, but... Yeah, that would make sense. Um, I like, uh... I like the remix of this on Anniversary Collection for PS2. I wish we could be playing that right now. <laughs> well, it's the same game. Oh, yeah. Music. They just uh, changed some of the... I don't know... They give you a map, and sometimes they'll give you I, games. And yeah, remix like in my... <laughs> yeah, they really dumbed it down on easy mode. Mm-hmm. I mean, there's, well, there's a, you don't have a, an option to make Man 3 for difficult or easy, but in Anniversary Collection, for PS2 at least, you do, and for it both, really dumbs it down, and, and the exclamation mark appears, and you push start, and Dr. Light or somebody tells you, you a random hint. Yeah, and how to beat the Robot Master with, with, with a certain weapon or whatever. And uh, try to be cryptic and fail. <laughs> I thought... This stage looks you freaking cool. You spin on <laughs> Shadow Man. Yeah, yeah. It could be the special weapon. You never know. <laughs> yeah. I mean, this is a cool stage, though. Yeah, yeah pretty deep very, design. Very interesting. I mean, Shadow Man. Is it, the stage environment at least is limited to his name. I don't know why there's fire in it, but it still looks pretty cool. I guess you need a fire stage in every Mega Man game. And bigger. Yeah. I went yeah. up on the Shadow Man stage. Yes. Like, hey, we don't have, we don't have a fire type enemy. What's the closest thing to fire? Got it, ninjas. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> shadows. <laughs> Wrestling with shadows. Bret Hart is one of the bosses in this game. That will happen. <laughs> right, stupid, stupid skydivers move out the freaking way. Holy, you got their one up. Yeah, awesome. That's it. You beat the game. Yeah, th this game gives you every. Ridiculous amount of power-ups. Yeah, I mean, uh, really it's almost a lot of power-ups. So you can get like nine energy tanks. Yeah, mm -hmm. but Mega Man yeah, One and yeah. Two. I don't think you get. No, you got no. Eat, you got no energy tanks at all. I'm thinking Mega Man One. No, you didn't. I uh, hear Shadow Man, and 
Yeah, that's usually. Oh, look at this battle right here. Yeah, let's just spin and dance with them. And there we go. Yeah, just dance. The sequel. You die. <laughs> but sometimes really? you gotta time it just right because when the I use the top spin on them, sometimes I do it. Sometimes I just drain all the top spin. Yeah. Oh, the hilarious thing to that. Then you're like, oh crap, what do I do now? <laughs> yeah. Now I got Shadow Blade. This is all right. Oh, and Rush Marines, pretty cool. Even though <laughs> they're worthless. Attachment, mm. practically. All right, and so we will see you guys in part two. Until then, God bless and take care. All right, <laughs> thank you for watching. Make men free rots. Woo! Welcome to Tribute to X Gemini. Let's play Mega Man 3 Part 1. This is Ron Moore along with Green and Star Soldier 1. Yes, I'm alive again. Yo, what's up, my babies? Yep. <laughs> Wait, I'm your baby? Whoa. <laughs> anyway, uh... He is your father. Get used to it. <laughs> oh. um, yeah, so uh, I put it in the description box, but four years ago, a friend of mine, X Gemini, passed away in a car wreck and. Uh, Almost every year I've done some sort of tribute to him. So last year I couldn't think of nothing else and I was like, oh wait, I could have done a tribute on S2K. We haven't done that yet on the S2K channel, Mega Man 3. So yeah, uh, we're doing that for him this year. And uh, yeah, so I think Mega Man 3 was like his favorite Mega Man game. And Green also knew Gemini. Mm -hmm. From back in the day, Mega Man's Clubhouse on Yahoo all day. Or MSN. Mm -hmm. Yeah. All right, yeah. Yeah, it's great taste in video games. Yeah. <laughs> eight new robots. What do you say, Star Soldier? I'm sorry? It's eight new robots. What do you say about them, Star Soldier? AB? What? A no, B? eight new. Oh. <laughs> Am I cutting no. out? <laughs> I'm sorry. I... <laughs> he, he choked at that one moment in time. It's yeah. all good now. <laughs> yeah. I'm... Yeah, I'm sorry, uh, maybe I'm not hearing things well. Yeah, okay. Let me know if I'm cutting out, because that happens sometimes lately. Alright, here we go with Proto-Man. Yeah, what's the deal with this guy? <laughs> well, I know what happens. Uh, I don't know if this is the real guy, or if this is a fake dude. And yeah. he's no, just messing is... with him. Yeah, this is the real one, he's just being a troll. That's all he is. <laughs> <laughs> he's being mysterious. We first saw him, like, who is this guy? Why is it? Why, why do we keep fighting him? Why will he die? <laughs> yeah, exactly. I'm like, who are you? Why do you have sunglasses? I want them. Yeah. <laughs> oh, I hate those freaking uh, Jack in the Box things. Yeah. Don't they shoot rockets in this game? I wasn't looking. Yeah, they shoot yeah. boxing gloves Missiles. or something at you. Yeah. Yeah, the slinky eyes. I hate those things. Oh uh, yeah. <laughs> well, these are easy to kill. Yeah. I hate a lot of things in this game. <laughs> yeah, this game is, uh... It's so much it's Mega Man, so... Yeah, yeah, pretty much. I think this game is a bit more challenging than Part 2. Yeah. That I was think only part, part two. After two. I hate this part right here. Oh, man. Seriously, this is, like, real tedious here. Well, here I, I got down for the most part, but... There's, like... In Mega Man 2, Heat Man that's Stage, that's I know there's a way of shortcut around it, but... In Heat Man stage in Mega Man 2, then pretty much every Mega Man game after that, they appear and... Oh man, they're so, they're so annoying. Mm-hmm. I still think Mega Man 5 and 6 is, um... Are the hardest out the originals. Really? I think, I think 1 is hardest out of the original. Um, I don't know, I just think, um... I think it's like a 6, um... The way the damage is done, like to you and to the bosses, it feels harder. And uh, popcorn popper now. Mega Man Six had uh, moments where it was pretty difficult, but I thought five was pretty easy. I think it was just me being a scrub. Yeah, <laughs> I don't know why I thought those were knuckles. I hate that show. Knuckle missiles. <laughs> they they do look like just missiles. I thought they looked like little knuckles. <laughs> Boxing gloves come at you. Oh, this stage is short. Yeah, here's Horseshoe Man. I mean, Magnet Man. <laughs> no, it's a horseshoe. They're just deceiving you. Hopefully, not the jobber wrestler Horseshoe. <laughs> mm. I don't remember Horseshoe. Good. 
<laughs> and uh, must have been WCW. Yes, Raven's Flock, I think. <laughs> All right. Uh, yeah, Magnet Man, not that hard. Easy pattern to do right here. Using my magnets. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh, get back here. Yeah, stage. Yeah, stage. Oh. Pretty easy. Especially yeah, the, the problem is to run out good Mega Man games at this point. Oh, look at this! I got a big magnet. Well, I think Mega Man Four is when they really started to run out of names. No, I think like I think they definitely showed it when they came back to it with like Mega Man Ten, and they were like, "Hey, Sheep Man!" I'm like, "Oh, Capcom, why?" Bang! Yeah. Now we got the magnet missile. As Mega Man looks at you all. Weapon. As Mega yeah. Man looks at you all dazed and confused. <laughs> and I love the password music right here. Weapon item acquisition music. It's pretty cool. Yeah. This game has a cool soundtrack. What do you say, Jay? I don't like it. It sounds like a pick game. I'd rather listen to Eminem Call of Duty. I don't know. Eminem Call of Duty. Hard to ban. <laughs> yeah, hard man. Now, this is where they ran. I guess the worst start running out of ideas. Hard man. He looks like an old-fashioned Freddy Krueger oven or something. I don't know what the heck he is. <laughs> hard man. There's a trick in Mega Man Three where. You gotta have two two controllers to do it. Jump to a pit, then jump right back out. You become like an invincible. You can't do that in this stage because there's no pits. Oh yeah. So in a way, this is the hardest stage. No pun intended. <laughs> <laughs> These damn monkeys. Oh. Dang it, freaky back from two Man too. Yeah, they're back and harder. Mm-hmm. <laughs> when the first one. That Maybe the two that weren't hard, really, but this one they're like really annoying right here. Oh ah! Oh, dang it. <laughs> yeah, that's what I always do with that guy too. Yeah. Keep our pet though. Yeah. Yes, but there's But he deserves it. He was always throwing thrown it straight. There's yeah. no honor in these types of games. If yeah. they give you a method, you will use the hell out of it. Yeah, like the uh, you expose the brokenness of it too, like Middleman's weapon. Mm hmm It's the most broken and greatest game in Mega uh, game. A uh, weapon in Mega Man 2. <laughs> yeah, that's the problem yeah, though. There's no is great the weapon in this one though. Mega Man 3. Yeah. I think that's the only problem with is the weapons here kinda suck. Except oh, for like uh, the weapon and Well yeah, uh, I mean I like some of them like I like uh I'm trying to think. <laughs> you know it's what? Hard, eh? Never mind. Uh uh, I'll, tell you, well, I'll tell you one off the top of my head that sucks, and that's Top Man's ballerina weapon. Stupid. Yeah, but it's so hilarious if you time it right that you kill Dr. Wily in one hit. It's fucking hilarious. Seriously, hilarious. I don't... How, how embarrassed is Shadow Man? I mean, <laughs> that's your freaking weakness. <laughs> anyway, here's Proto Man again, spamming, and finding you the same way mm -hmm. Freddy Krueger does in Top Man Energy the NES. All right. Uh, yeah, Hard Man has awesome music, stage music, though. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I think it. Yeah. Does it? Uh, pretty much. Uh, game has awesome soundtrack. I mean, Mega Man's pretty famous, I think, for its awesome soundtrack. Oh mm -hmm. yeah. All right, here yeah, we go. I see the ones like Shell Man. That one's kind of awful, but yeah, I like uh, Gemini's music. I like yeah, Hard Man stage and the first stage of this Dr. Wily theme. Yeah, okay. spoiler, Dr. Wily is a bad guy in this. <laughs> oh no. No way. Whoever would have not thought of it. And we made short work of a hard man who was not that hard. Totally easy. And, uh. Yeah, so. Yeah. Now we he take. Do what? Wait, what about easy? Yeah. You hard got man was Hard Knuckle. All right, next. Oh man, next is Dreadle Man, Top Man. 
Now he has a cool stage and music. Oh yeah. Everything except him is cool. Yeah. <laughs> I think it's cool for some reason. He, there's trees inside of glass. Yeah, I don't get that. And I think I figure he would stadium. have more like a Jewish stage or something. Yeah. Maybe more Star David or something. <laughs> I think we're in a baseball stadium or something, sports lights in the background and Yeah. I don't know, kind of a unique stage for a for a top man, but still pretty cool and, and music's pretty cool too. And for some reason in Mega Man Anniversary Collection, uh the remix music for Mega Man 3 is uh is not a variation or a remix of this of this song. It's actually uh a remix of the state of the opening stage music in Mega Man 7. Yeah, I thought that was yeah, you know, pretty weird. But it's awesome though. But it's like it's not a remix of Top Man, but oh well. Uh, it still fits. That's all that matters. It's still freaking cool. And <laughs> Jeffrey, uh, construction worker guys. Oh, 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 oh nice timing. Yeah, that's kind of luck right there. All okay. day. As we fight uh, one of the village people. YMCA. Go. We're gonna fight with them here too. I know they call me tools, but I've always called them hard hats. <laughs> Whoa, watch out for, uh, Gentoo's cat. Oh, man. <laughs> watch out for the Nian, Nian cat, or Nian, Nian cat, whatever the cat's called. Yeah. That damn, that damn Pop-Tart. <laughs> Pop-Tart. Yeah, it always makes me hungry. Well, look watch out for I'm Bear. Like, why am I watching this? I don't have a Pop-Tart near me. <laughs> <laughs> Got a Robo Garfield here. Uh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, I think that was, this is the only time we see him in the entire game. Mm -hmm. Yep, or twice anyways. Ah. Yeah, <laughs> and we see this enemy later on in the game, and but it only made sense in this stage. Yeah. Mm -hmm. this Super tops. Cool. Yeah. Oh, I died. Oh, I died again. What died? Because jump in the pit, you get life. <laughs> Alright, here's the fearsome boss battle with... Top Man. I hope he's on top of his game. <laughs> Which he won't be. Yeah. He sucks. See, how, come you can't, how come you can't use those top weapons instead of just doing a stupid... Not arena spin? Yeah, those look like awesome weapons. Yeah, but now he had these stupid spin attacks. Like, really? It should be like Mega Man X where you could use both. And boom. He's dead now. Boom, yeah. he took that and action. <laughs> Alright. Let's suck all the energy out of this room. Oh, yeah. That's weird. Yeah. Or, because we got the worst weapon in Mega Man history. Yeah, really. Oh. Well, either that or the charge kick, but... Now we got the top oh, charge spin. kick has so many oh. Some. All right, now who's next? Uh -oh. I hate to sound like Goldberg, but who's next? Oh, Shadow Man is next. Oh yeah. I have to beg to differ, Star Soldier. I think Shadow Man music is pretty ECW. Uh, I don't know. It's kind of drowning. And I'd suspect it more fast path. I don't know, intense ninja music, but yeah, that would make sense. Um, I like uh, I like the remix of this on Anniversary Collection for PS2. I wish we could be playing that right now. <laughs> well, it's the same game. Oh, yeah. Music. They just uh, changed some of the... I don't know. They give you a map, and sometimes they'll give you games. And yeah, remits like in my... <laughs> yeah, they really dumbed it down on easy mode. Mm-hmm. I mean, there's... Well, there's a... You don't have a, an option to make Man 3 for difficult or easy, but... In Anniversary Collection, for PS2 at least, you do, and... For it really most, dumbs it down, second. and... Yeah, and the exclamation mark appears, and you push start, and Dr. Light or somebody tells Gives you... a random hint. Yeah, and how to beat the Robot Master with, with, with a certain weapon or whatever. And uh, try to be cryptic and fail. <laughs> I the this stage looks you freaking cool. spin on. <laughs> Shadow Man. Yeah. yeah. Oh. It could be the special weapon. You never know. <laughs> yeah. I mean, this is a cool stage, though. Yeah, yeah, pretty deep design. Interesting. I mean, Shadow Man, is it, the stage environment at least is limited to his name. I don't know why there's fire in it, but it still looks pretty cool. 
I guess you need a fire stage in every Mega Man game. Man. Here? Yeah. Uh, why not put yeah. in a Shadow Man stage? They're yes. like, hey, we don't have, we don't have a <laughs> fire type enemy. What's the closest thing to fire? Got it, ninjas. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> shadows. <laughs> Uh, Wrestling with Shadows, Bret Hart is one of the bosses in this game. That will happen. <laughs> right, stupid, stupid skydivers, move out the freaking way. Holy, you got another one up. Yeah, awesome. That's it, you beat the game. Yeah, th this game gives you a ri ridiculous amount of power-ups. Yeah. I mean, uh, really it's almost a lot of power -ups. how you can get, like, nine energy tanks. Yeah, but Mega Man yeah, One, it too. I don't think you get. No, you got no. E you got no energy tanks at all. I'm thinking Mega Man One. No, you didn't. I hear Shadow Man, and yeah, that's usually. Oh, look at this battle right here. Yeah, let's just spin and dance with him, and there we go. Yeah, just dance the sequel. You <laughs> die. But Is sometimes really? you gotta time it just right because when the I use the top spin on him, sometimes I do it. Sometimes I just drain all the top spin. Yeah. Oh, but that's hilarious when you do that. Then you're like, oh crap, what do I do now? <laughs> yeah. Now I got Shadow Blade. This is alright. Oh, and Rush Marines, pretty cool. Even though <laughs> they're worthless attachment, mm -hmm. practically. Alright, and so we will see you guys in part two. Until then, God bless and take care. Alright, cool. thank you for watching. Make Man Free Rocks. Woo! Welcome to part 3 of Tribute to X Gemini. Let's play Mega Man 3. This is Ron Moore, along with Darth Gentoo, the Wii guy, and Rockstar Gamer ECW. Oh yeah! <laughs> what was that, Gentoo? We're fighting punctuation hell. Yeah. <laughs> fighting the alphabet again. Needle Man? <laughs> nope. Wait, how's that the punctuation joke? I don't get it. <laughs> it was a question mark. Uh, yeah, it was the, uh, I'm yeah, we're, we're fighting, we're, we're fighting the Riddler or somebody. Oh, my bad. And this is the ruins of Sparkman stage, as we are fighting the Doc Robots, or the Emulator Robots, uh, where we fight the Robot Masters, uh, from Eggman 2 again. You spoiled oh, the game Ooh. for me! <laughs> oh. <laughs> Spoiler alert. You spoiled the Every game. Come on, everyone knows this game. Eggman will spoil you. A newborn baby yesterday don't know this game. Maybe it's not. Maybe it was subconsciously at least. <laughs> Green's baby brother knows it. No. Well, doesn't he know everything? Yep. Yeah, he beat his brother. Oh. oh no! Oh no! Boss battle. It looks like. <laughs> no! 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 It's a mini boss battle. You call uh, this thing a go. boss? Is that a doctor? Oh, metal man. I fought bosses like this before. <laughs> I want to boss you up. So you use a oh. magnet missile on Metal Man. And he goes all down your, like a fool. All your bosses are belong to us. <laughs> Lols. Lols. Once again, we listen to this exercise music. <laughs> By uh, exercise, you mean awesome? Yeah. This Don't is the music. Spy. One, two. Don't We're gonna search your Simmons now. This is the music I uh, that plays when you like. Try to run on the treadmill at the, like max speed, then you like fall and you bust your <laughs> nose. <laughs> yeah, you bust but, your knee. But we got was actually, but we got was trolling the treadmill, so he used his skateboard. <laughs> <laughs> okay, this much. level, this level is screwy. It is. Yeah. What a shock! Ouch! A lot of bolts. <laughs> what a <laughs> shock! <laughs> yeah. Electrifying. Did the ECW? Did ECW? ECW? Such a Wait, wait. I said this was Needle Man stage. This is Spark Man. My bad. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I got for confused. a minute I was like, wait. I, don't so I, was, taking, I was taking a needle when I, I said that. I mean, um, Spark Man. <laughs> <laughs> apparently Quick Man ah. likes electricity. Hey, yep. Quick Man now. Why has he got the Nike symbol on his forehead? That's what I was thinking. He has a boomerang and a Nike symbol on his forehead. And ouch. Wow, I'm getting pwned already. He has to try to get hey, Gemini Laser. a newborn athlete. <laughs> yeah. This is Quick tricky right was... here. And I'm going to spam you with boomerangs to show off my Olympic style. <laughs> I remember yeah. when I first played Mega Man 2, Quick Man was so hard in that game. He's even harder on here. That's Usain Bolt's uh, 
alias Quick Man. That's what I hate about Gemini Laser, you can't pause. Yeah. Uh, while the laser is it's still on the screen. Yeah, while it pongs on the screen. Yeah, you you gotta like wait till it goes off the screen to select a new weapon. It's so annoying. That's why I use search snake on that guy. I just jump and shoot him. <laughs> snake? Question mark. I, I'm gonna again. snake. And I'm question mark number snake. two. Here's Needle Man. And oh, Needle Man stage him. in the dark. This is Seattle in the nighttime. It's a porcupine. Why Seattle? Because it had like a giant needle tower. Oh, I get it. I was there. No, you you were. were? I've been there before, I mean. With right? we guy? Get out. Needle tower? Or am I thinking of something else? Needle we guy? <laughs> needle needle guy. game. <laughs> needle gee, needle dumb. Stop it! That's enough! <laughs> <laughs> needle gee, needle dumb. The puns are too much! Okay, get the extra Bulls. man! Moles. Yay. Everyone loves an extra man. <laughs> I don't. <laughs> oh, Bear does. <laughs> oh. <laughs> that was just too much. <laughs> oh, that's, no, no, that's it's just the right amount. <laughs> <laughs> too One little, man too is just enough. Wait. <laughs> <laughs> ah, Air Man. One of my favorite stages in Mega Man 2. I can't beat you off track. Because it was such a breeze! Did it? <laughs> yeah. I still can't beat him. Here, man, don't let him blow you off track. <laughs> Gen 2, stop trolling. Don't even. I'm don't not trolling. You. <laughs> I know what you're saying, by You can't beat Air Man. I know what you're oh, saying. Come, oh, come on. It's easy, breezy, yep, and easy. You can't get lots of air with that. <laughs> what I thought you were about... Hey, I thought this was a makeup advertisement. <laughs> I thought it was just totally innocent. <laughs> I hate this part right here. You really gotta uh, watch out right here because you gotta use the rush jet to get through this whole area. And if you die and you can't get the power ups for the rush jet again until like you get game over or something. So it's like, I mean, you can, but you gotta keep killing those dragonflies and stuff, and it could take a while to power up on it again. So I wanna get this done the first time. Do what? It's like game over, you mad bro lols. <laughs> Two-player two cheat? <laughs> oh, yeah. Well, we don't cheat here on the SC2K. <laughs> yeah. Oh, really? Yeah. I don't. Find, I, dare, I dare to find a video on the SC2K where I cheated and prove it. Pictures or videos, footage, or it didn't happen. <laughs> okay. The video itself is the footage. <laughs> You simply just copy and paste another clip of a video. No, no pictures or it didn't happen. It's okay, we'll take a snapshot. V video responses or it didn't happen. <laughs> Comment, like, and subscribe or it didn't happen. <laughs> yeah. I don't know. Lols or it didn't happen. Oh, fail. Oh, he goes a plunger. I know, Lols plunger always now. happens. Oh. Hey, look, the Star Trek is LP. <laughs> Ah, I get it. Taking damage. Ah, dang it. Again. You gotta fight this freaking helmet from the TV show MASH. I hate this thing. I love MASH, though. <laughs> da, 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 she works at the hospital or something. I don't get it. What's with the cross? Yeah, I, think, yeah, I don't know. I, I, like I don't MASH. see those guys at the hospital before. I like MASH. MASH you never watched MASH. I actually watched MASH when I was young. That was quite interesting. I actually watched it when I was young and I liked it. I watched it. I was disappointed. They didn't show no mashed potatoes at all. Exactly. Mashed potatoes. <laughs> no sense. Jitsu don't support I mean, this. What, what does MASH stand for? Monster Association Smash Hats? I don't know. It's stupid. Make a small hat. <laughs> yeah. Let's see. My ah, here we go again. Go get it! Go oh, get yes, it. yes. Get it. Bear could be in here in spirit. Oh, 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 oh. He has, he has a spirit? I don't know. He has no soul, so I don't know. Bear make gum? <laughs> he, he's, he's a durid. He's bear durid. He's a, he's a gingerbread man. I'm the lovable gingerbread man. <laughs> <laughs> he's the gingerbread man? Well, I'm the ninja bread man. <laughs> There's... Here's, uh, okay, now he's here to crash the party. Here's Crash Man. Oh man, that's too, that's, oh, these are too much, too much. Dang. Uh, I don't know if this is the right weakness, but it's working. Here, Mike Tyson's punch out. 
Yeah. We got hired Crash Man and Crash, uh, his friend's wedding. Oh shoot! Oh, that was close. Oh. Over here, it did. That was blow the belt. <laughs> Man. Right down. Ah, oh, too late. You're not ready. Alright, here we go. And... I think he hit his shoe when you hit him. <laughs> X Gemini Park. Man. So many lives. <laughs> yeah. This so game gives uh, a substantially... Uh, su substantial amount of power-ups. Right, Andrew? Oops, I mean Rockstar Gamer. <laughs> nah, don't worry. My identity's safe. I feel like I'm in third grade all over again. <laughs> yeah, but... Question marks. Yeah. If, if the teacher's asking us all these questions, why ain't she in school? Oh, yeah. wait. <laughs> <laughs> Lols. Yeah, but like Ron said, this this, this game gives, like, a, a buttload of power-ups, so if you, if you don't use a mirror... Let's let's put it this way. You've 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 got issues. You got to rethink your life. <laughs> yeah, your you card. Can't beat this yeah, game. Rethink your strategy. Yeah. Unless you want to be super hardcore. Yeah. Like a guy with no life. <laughs> Don't be like me and try to go through every dock robot without using an e-tank. You're gonna die. <laughs> oh yeah. I could do that with my eyes slipped. And slipped. welcome slipped. to Let's Play Metroid Part Two. This is Ron Moore. Oh snap. <laughs> I'm sorry. Did you say something? I like your mom, she's cool. <laughs> Get it? No, anyway, alright. Oh, these things Jeff's right mom, here. remember? That was a reference. Oh, yeah, yeah. That's what I was referencing. Oh, I want to meet your mom. Right. Um, okay. Why? <laughs> it's a nice video game, I just want to meet her. That's not what I said. <laughs> I want to meet your mom. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> He's like, oh, okay. Uh, you know what? <laughs> I snorted. Wink, 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 yeah. bacon, bacon, bacon. Whoa! Bacon. Hey, we got enough drug references in this game with Needle Man. We don't need to talk about snorting. I don't no snort drug reference. Oh, <laughs> what's wrong? Snorting. What's wrong with snorting? We got likes role playing as a pig. <laughs> oh. <laughs> what's going on? I'm so spooked. Oh man, I'm having a horrible flashback here. It's a face of Flash Man. Flash hey, Man, the flashiest dent disco club ever. <laughs> no, Flash Man was a convicted felon for indecent exposure. Just watch out, he'll flash you right here. Whoa, wait. Indecent exposure. <laughs> <laughs> Damn it. Yeah, what, what's the freaking weakness here? It's oh. Needle or Spark. It's Needle. It's and I'm, <laughs> I'm about to die. I'm about to get Flash, man. Come on. Oh. Okay. Terrible. I'm a fire in my laser. Blah. You know, Dagon's Flash Man. <laughs> These emulator robots make these Mega Man 2 robot masters harder. Yeah, a lot harder. This Super is harder. Well, this is the first time patch notes were ever implemented in the game. Oh wait, never mind. That was the U.S. Uh, Constitution. Never mind. Lols. <laughs> <laughs> wow, you actually made a. You made a reference to Congress. Yeah. Wow, um, whatever the hell it was, I don't even know. <laughs> What's Congress? Uh, yes, Russian right here. Is that toothpaste? You can just press toothpaste. <laughs> the Congress toothpaste. I get it. <laughs> Doesn't it make sense that you're sub? Hmm. Wow, a you're lot of water. Yeah, keep your head above water in this level. I wonder who the next Robot Master is. Water man. Aqua man. Splash woman. <laughs> Aqua man. Splash woman. Yeah. Splash we got you, man. Shut the hell up. <laughs> oh, I can drop you. Guy. <laughs> I can drop you because I was holding you and now I'm, I'm gonna drop you. No, no! Yeah. We got, we got <laughs> the I didn't mean to hit me, no, no! Oh. Shoots and ladders. Shoots and ladders, but with lots of danger. In yeah. real life. <laughs> Ooh, I know who we're fighting. Wait, this is real life? Who? We're, we're fighting, uh, Launch Octopus, right? Yes. Oh, for Mega Man oh, X. Bubble Man. I never would've guessed that. I knew it, Bear Man. I'm I mean, a Shield Man. Bubble. <laughs> yeah. Alright. Yeah, of He's course. so personally easy. I think... No, they should've made him the hardest. <laughs> like, if they made him the hardest. It was like, what? I think, uh, let's see, Spark, Water and Electricity don't mix. Yeah, yeah. dude. Oh, shoot. <laughs> Don't die. You would know, oh, too. Oh, close. K.O. If 
Frost and Fire can mix in World of Warcraft, it can mix in this. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Ah, uh, only Sweet. one more uh, Doc Robot stage to go. Has to face another question mark. Hmm. So terrifying. As the, as the background has to constantly remind us that we're playing Mega Man 3. <laughs> We're playing Mega Man 3? No, we're playing, no, we're playing Mega Man Roman numeral 3. <laughs> oh yeah, that's right. That's oh, what yeah. the video title says. <laughs> <laughs> no spoilers. I love the music in this stage. Yeah, it's one of the best, but I don't get why Shadow Man. I mean, what? It doesn't look anything shadowy at all. Well, the, the fire rock, but yeah, it does, like the illusion's coming up here in a minute. This looks like Fireman stage, except it's lava. Yeah, but I mean, come up here, you know, it's just Kool Aid. No, it's blood. Now here we go. This oh, is no, over here. No, this is Galaxy Man stage. <laughs> Galaxy Man. No, Plus Man. Astro Man. Oh, shut up, man. Yeah, it doesn't that. exist. <laughs> it's it's Sh it's Shutter Astro. This should be Illusion Man. It'd be cool. That's what ma Magic Man is. Yeah. Got a black oh, yeah. magic woman. Brace him in his Yu Yo cards. <laughs> I hate those stupid peppermint eyeball candy wrapper bosses, whatever they are, get my nerves. The bosses! Such a terrifying boss! Oh, uh, wood man. Uh, here's Bear, and... <laughs> we got wood. <laughs> What's dog? Log man. 2011. And yes, Needle should do the trick. Aw, oh, dang it, I don't have any more E-Tanks, I might die right here. I have to do a skip and edit, do an edit through here. This is un oh, available I mean, available. Ah, yep. dang it. I jumped on you. Yeah, that's Next cheap. How can you avoid that? Come on. <laughs> I guess you can start under while he's jumping, I don't know. It's called strategy. Use it's it. Called, called well, what is the strategy then, Mr. Strategy? It's called slide under. <laughs> Use a strategy. <laughs> Your face is a strategy. I know, I planned it out. <laughs> That it's way. So perfect. <laughs> That's right, it's a strategy. <laughs> and I totally won that duel. Oh, yes. <laughs> you can be my wingman, Jin too. No, we uh. got. You can be mine. <laughs> 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 hey, y'all talking about? I'm talking no, about the right. best man for the bride. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. That's what we're talking about. No, no, actually, no, we, actually, no. His wedding's got... coming up. <laughs> Who's wedding? We guys. <laughs> no, no. <laughs> Shush. <laughs> You're not supposed to make any reference to anything. <laughs> oh yeah, they did say on We Guys uh, Twitter update that he was gonna be the maid of honor. <laughs> wow. <laughs> Wait, We Guys a girl? Well, at least I'm not stupid. <laughs> I don't know. That's what All this, right, uh, now I'm ready. Do your now I'm ready. With your stupidness. <laughs> Yeah, fight stupid with stupid. <laughs> That's how you win. How's exactly. a leaf gonna hurt you unless you got poison ivy on him? Yeah, it's poison oak. Poison Professor Oak? Poison ivy from Batman and Robin. No, 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 <laughs> Yes, 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 here we go. Well, See, this is why I win. <laughs> this is why Batman does not eat nachos. <laughs> you just can't handle the power of Sunny D. I can. If that comic can. <laughs> the heck are y'all talking about? That comet that like trolled the sun. Troll. <laughs> <laughs> Troll. <laughs> I get it. Actually, no, I don't. Because like the sun's supposed to be the hottest thing. Hotter. Sun's off. No, no, the sun that's supposed to be hotter than um, um. Fire. Don't you? I don't even know anymore. Hotter than Emma Watson, then, probably? <laughs> <laughs> For God's sake, she's too I don't know. I exactly. can't make a pun. <laughs> you're, you're no fun. You're no pun. Very punny. Yeah. This isn't funny. Very punny, Ronnie. But at least we, we're we gonna meet the Easter Bunny. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> the Easter Bunny. Quick, I need some honey. He bugs Bunny. <laughs> Gemini's like, you guys just scrap this tribute, y'all suck. <laughs> hey, hey, shut it, I got the money. I'm taking this to my grave. <laughs> so watch out, Cunny. Ah, oh, yes, uh, we got we got some heat with our subscribers because I fell. Never mind, Heat Man now. 
haunted cigarette lighter. Banded that joke. <laughs> and here comes Heat Man with our with his with his flame mail. Wow, that didn't work. What the heck work? Forgot. Fresh shadow bleed. Thank. Ah yes. Thank you. Oh no. Ah no. Flame mail. Leave me alone. Oh. Looks like, he, looks like he's flaming. Yeah. Oh, Super shoot. fabulous. <laughs> Not Joe Verde. <laughs> Super hot in here. Salsa. Yes. There we go. Lots yeah. of big salsa. Of flaming. Mega Man's purple. <laughs> yeah. Oh my God, this is like so straight, you guys. <laughs> oh my God, guys, this is breaking. Whoa. <laughs> Time for a break. <laughs> well, let's see if he can break, make us or break us. They make break no, I of don't, fame. I don't consider. Some uh, give, give me a break. This is a joke battle right here. Come on, same battle throughout the whole game. And Jonathan Wiley's gonna be like the Breakman. So how are you gonna beat Mega Man, Mr. Breakman? So, so I'm gonna do. So I'm gonna do, the, I'm gonna do the most productive thing and like jump and shoot like an idiot. <laughs> look at this. Notice this right here. Look, look. <laughs> nice Gen two. Wiley is spelled wrong. I'm gonna jump Wheel. in a predictable pattern and and wonder why I can't beat anyone. Oh, uh, here we go, Skull Castle. Oh, oh. Wiley ran off with my Gamma the Magnet Warrior. Oh, oh, no, oh I wait can't a minute, no, I, I'm right, I'm right this time. We are going to Skull Castle in part oh, four. And why shoot UFO? Yeah, so until Lobster's then, I bless and take care. Yeah, peace out. Yay. Bye. Welcome to Tribute X Gemini. Let's play Discuss Mega Man 3. This is Ron Moore, along with RGX, the Wii Guy, Minecraft Martin. Oh, wait, no. Star Soldier. Uh, who's here? We got too many people. I'm losing track. <laughs> I'm here. <laughs> you forgot about me. Oh, yeah, Green. Lols. Oh, yeah, I'm here. <laughs> and Jay, I think. Oh, yeah. That Listen that to that it? awesome music. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, oh, yeah. The soundtrack is Skull Castle here. Pretty freaking ECW, just like in Mega Man 2. Yeah. I know, right? <laughs> Finally in Skull Castle, thank you! Yeah, here we, here we are, it's Skull Castle! Up. What's Yay. with Wily's yeah. fascination with skulls? I never knew that, or got that. He's just why, why not? <laughs> every every <laughs> major bad guy back in the day used skulls. Well, see, before he was an evil doctor, he was an archaeologist. Mm -hmm, like Indiana Jones. No, no. <laughs> this skull belongs in the museum, then he stole them all back. So do you! All your score belong to me? <laughs> Lols. Mm -hmm. Alright, and uh, Skull Castle, also known as Power Up Castle. Hmm. Free Wallace yeah, Castle. this state is so easy. <laughs> yeah, yeah really, it's like I mean, so generous on E-Tanks and free man, free men, whatever. <laughs> yeah, uh, room filled with Power Ups. Oh yeah, really, and like, I remember in the NES game Atlas magazine, they was telling people, uh, you know, just... Go through it, face things head on, you'll be fine. And that's because there's a lot of power ups in the castle. I think yeah, this should run right through everything. <laughs> yeah. So am I the only one that thinks this is probably the easiest out of the current ten classic Mega Man games? Uh, it, it probably uh, is. It might be, yeah. Because I, I mean Man like... Six is an easy fortress, but it's an easy game overall. <laughs> um yeah, I just think the fortress. Mega Man two bosses you fight earlier actually harder than the Wily stages. <laughs> oh yeah, the dragon boss is freaking hard at first. Then you figure yeah, it out. Yeah, until you learn guys. you can just jump and shoot it. <laughs> yeah. And that freaking that super jump. computer boss in Dr. Wily stage 4 Mega Man 2 It's freaking hard. Oh yeah, that thing that's... Like the whole game is hard. On the track. <laughs> <laughs> ah, dang it. That thing is so annoying. I hate these freaking disappearing freaking blocks. In every Mega Man game, so they're easy in Mega Man 3. Yeah, because you can just use the <laughs> fully controllable rush jet. You can just yeah. use the force. Well, in Mega Man 2, it's easy in the Heat Man stage, because you use a jet ski, as Skip Rogers would say. Mm -hmm. And here's the first boss of Wally Castle, some machine that drops turtles at you. Ninja Turtles. Teenage, damn it. And you guys and, use and, and and he just killed like, Raphael. And, and you use your uh, tadpole power to... I mean, there snake search to... <laughs> There goes Santello. Just watch out for uh, Michael. Angelo. Oh, Angelo. dang it. Uh oh, <laughs> Leo. oh, well, he's coming out Lost with Shell. shell. <laughs> oh, Shell shot. Yeah. Oh, you stole my <laughs> There we go. Wow, the Techno Drum was easily beaten. Yeah. <laughs> I used Pop Spin there. 
much easier. Let everything run into you. Uh, here we go, Dr. Wally Skull Castle stage two. Oh. Yeah! Alright. I remember this part also has a lot of power ups too. Yeah. Power ups. Yeah, especially down there. like <laughs> get that the spike. Oh, one up! <laughs> yeah. Free man. Does that make us power man? Yeah. Extra life man. It Actually, makes it ridiculous exist. man. Oh no. I hate this section. The bees! Uh, the bees! bees. Ah, the bees! The bees. Ah, oh no! Guys. Ah, get out of my way! <laughs> Oh, oh no! Go 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 go! Oh, 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 I can't oh, jump, jump up! I can't. Oh, I'm can, dead. You can do it. Rush it, man! Rush it! Rush it! Oh oh! I think it's too late. Cause if you pause the game and unpause it, then you'll the spike. Oh right, right right Okay, totally forgot about that part. Like the hit detection. Well, like they, you can't use a pause trick on thinking Mega Man Three. I think they discovered that glitch in Mega Man One and said, "Nah." -uh. Well, they discovered that Mega Man, Man is allergic to bees secretly. Oh, well, Mega Man Two, you can use a pause trick. I think. When I, I I don't I, remember. I don't remember. I don't know. I think they took that out because you can only pause with the one button. Oh yeah. Uh, and bring up the menu you where they took that the out and make fancy. <laughs> yeah. Well, here's the easy way to get past all thirty items. Yeah, this little uh, secret right here, or strategy to get rid of the uh, the bees nest. Back away, then all right, here we go, and then it disappears and you get back on the screen. Yeah, I thought you just selected a rush clip, oh, just go like, that's doing into the spikes. I know the E tank, yeah. And now another one. Wow, well, see, look at that. No. I wonder if they're dead to really put fear in your Please heart now when you first played this game. Given you. Uh, the target did all these power-ups put fear in your heart, because like, oh man, who are we going to face next? We got a lot of power-ups here. And then, of course, you got... Stupid. Oh no, it's domestic violence. You got the rock monster or the yellow devil back again. Aha, the return of the yellow devil. Except he's easier in Mega Man 3. Well, yeah, he's also made fun of a lot easier. Yeah. Oh, first I don't remember how I beat Mega Man 1, probably Game Genie, because I don't remember beating Yeah, him. shameless plug, watch our old playthrough of Mega Man 1, he's a lot harder. That's me, yeah, yeah. and I did well on it. I throwed it because I'm awesome and I don't uh, cheat. Uh, Bear did the LP, not you. No, I'm just kidding. He does LPs. <laughs> <laughs> oh. I thought Bear was a big guy. That big <laughs> jumping thing that tries to crush you. Yeah. <laughs> oh, a bust in his eye. Okay. You're committing domestic violence when you do that. You uh, come on, how do you get past that by getting yeah. hit? New move. <laughs> Probably sliding. Ooh. He's the boss. Bam. Yeah, it's weird. Why does he have boobs here? <laughs> he's knows. a real man. Not Meg Man, but the uh, Yellow Devil. <laughs> the Yellow Devil. Why did the white cop when she died? Why is there no cops? <laughs> Alright, you awesome soundtrack here, or track. Yeah, just sit on my microphone. Nope. That's a freaking popcorn popper right here. <laughs> hey Orville, move out of my way. Exploding popcorn. <laughs> we don't we don't like your oh, kettle you corn know. here. <laughs> yeah. Alright. <laughs> Better energy tank. We don't like you popping one in here. At least you could use it in this level though. It's kinda of difficult. Yeah. <laughs> E. Oh, uh, Shadow Man stage again. Oh. <laughs> These G.I. Joe midgets come after me. Oh shoot, I'm gonna get the extra man. Here we go. Really I don't really like need it, I got enough E tanks to survive. <laughs> you only it's got like a 18? fat green teenager running after you. Yeah. Or some fat turtle. There's suicide on. bombers come after me now. And, oh, what? Uh, gangster yeah. with a hat, I don't know. <laughs> ah, I hate this thing. Watch this. Oh, okay, I made it that time. Oh, dang it. Here we go. <laughs> Starts clapping really loud. <laughs> yeah. Bravo, uh, you dodged it without getting totally... <laughs> this always reminds me of Frogger. <laughs> yeah. Don't get hit by the car. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, it's like Frogger, except you're going up. And George yeah. Costanza comes and starts playing Frogger and beats his old high score. <laughs> wow. So. For no reason, just My cause. God, you did it! You did it! Yeah. Hopefully these are good power ups. Uh, oh, come on. Oh, oh, oh okay, that yes. one was really good. Oh, oh that was good. They're being two no chairs. middle ground oh, there. The E stands for ECW. Your 40th energy tank. Yeah, right. Really. You might need it here. And here's another old boss. I always hate this one. boss. <laughs> yeah, another thing. Is this? I love this boss. This boss is so easy. You can just mash the fire button and kill it. Yeah, I know that. has no invincibility frame. Yeah, this boss is cheating. He's doing like all the bosses in, I mean, all the enemies in Metal Gear shooting diagonally. 
to game of hide and smear. Yeah, the that's queen. not fair that he can shoot multiple directions and has two clones of himself. So you yeah. can't shoot. He loves come Michelle. On. It's hard to figure out which one is real. Oh, come on, no, come on. You can do it. Don't use the E tank. Oh, I bet. Oh, oh. <laughs> I changed my mind. Oh. Use the E tank. Look at that. We're down. <laughs> I think Mega Man loves himself too much. Come on. Oh, He's really? Close. <laughs> there we go. Another Mega Man 1 boss defeated. <laughs> or Mega Man 1 Skull Castle boss. Mm -hmm. Just remember, Mega Skull Man 1's boss is more spaz than this one. Yeah. Everything it jumps on you. It's yeah. like, I love you. <laughs> E-C-W. This game is freaking E-C-W. At least it's not burning. Man spastic. What? Uh, what? Spandex. Uh, what? No, I said spastic. Spandex. <laughs> Oh, I don't even understand how you get past it easily without getting hit. Well, I guess I just did. Well, um... Oh, another power up. And it's all right. <laughs> Skull Castle, yeah. like, you got enough power ups for now. I got 11. Did you say 11 E tanks? No, oh, oh, 11, oh, 11 lives. lives. That's just as bad. I think you can only get 90 E tanks. I used to stock yeah, up in Mega Man 4, stock up at E tanks all the time. That's how I beat it, because that game was so hard to me. I mean, I first played. I, I don't have to agree on that one. Barrel Man stage will kick my butt. Oh, come on! Oh, 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 oh. I could've got a 12th life there. Yeah, like you don't have as... don't have many. Yeah. As in, <laughs> it's not like you have enough. <laughs> okay, now no, we're gonna skip this part. Have more. But we're gonna have to watch Ron do this whole thing without dying. No, I'm not. I wanna skip through it. Because we've already seen this before. <laughs> oh, so wow, he's beat that fast. <laughs> yeah. Oh, that was quick. The power How did he do it? I don't know. He had to talk about. He had to tell us about the future. Yeah. He had to freeze time. What's in the future? All right, Something stupid. Man. Stick your face. No, I'm just kidding. All right, here we go. Find out that Sony sues everyone for no reason. Bone stick. Here we go. Last yeah. castle. Yep. Last yeah. castle. You mean last stage in the castle? You made it. No, he Something has more than one castle. Crap. Come on, and hey, what's gonna be in this one? Oh, <laughs> oh my God! It's such wow, a... an extra man, another man for beer. I wanna see, yeah. top, I wanna see some top yeah. spinning. There's oh, got too many men already. Right. Are you using top spin right here? No, no. <laughs> Dude, it's spin. Not, this spin. not this part. Yeah, not this part. This is a uh, pinbot. <laughs> I get oh, it. Oh yeah, I remember that pinball table. <laughs> that was a great game too. Rare made it. Yep. It's one of their few good games. Yeah! Uh, what? Wait, what? One of their few? <laughs> There's only any other way to dump this guy other than jumping I like the Rare. Like, I love Nejo Kazooie, I love Donkey Kong Country. It's oh, yeah, just a new Super Rare. Tank, right. was amazing. Get closer. Get closer. Alright, as we fight the uh, Grandpa Have you ever Bob played Child? Drive by the Ghoulies? <laughs> no one... Uh, what's that? Well, we don't know what that exists. What is that? That's not Mega Man. Stop talking about non-Mega Man and not good games. Yeah, <laughs> oh, wait a minute. He's a robot? That's a ploy. Let's get out of here. It's Google -Go Gadget. And that's the end of the LP. Thanks for watching every... Oh, wait, there's another stage. Thanks for watching. Oh, my God. Whoa. Whoa. Power up city. And there went up. What, what is this? Go down city. Wow. This man is cheating. <laughs> you got fortune. He's Ladies freaking up with you. This man has broken the game. <laughs> Um, yeah, I'm using Game Shark right now. Ah, <laughs> oh, <Man>. dang it! <laughs> One more eating you have broken the game. <laughs> this is almost like an insult. <laughs> yeah, really. This is insulting. No, this, this is supposed to strike fear in your heart, thinking, "Oh, this final boss must be hard. Let's get ready." No, no Capcom just thinks we suck. Oh no! The original two games. It's like, oh, it's hard. You'll need everything you got. All right, here's Gamma. That insulted me. It's like if Ronnie played through Kaiser without uh, dying once. Oh, no. Shadow Blade. Nah. No. Hard Knuckles. System. Hard Captain Knuckles. <laughs> wow, that was fast. All right, now oh, this second God. part's gonna be hard. Watch out. Hey, Man. white on face. <laughs> no. Oh. Point what a joke. Day. What a joke to beat <laughs> this game, the game like that with a top spin, just like that. And NES game Atlas, it told me it finally has a use. Yeah. Uh oh. Ooh. Who would have known the most useless weapon would actually do be a one hit kill? 
Yeah, mm-hmm. really. As it's Dr. Willie. Long again. It's Willie. I mean, it has its uses, but you can't really make much use in Mega Man 3. Mega Man, you regain consciousness. I found you lying here when I arrived. Oh my gosh, it's okay. Great voice. Just wording whistle. Just put the batteries in me, I'll be fine. I wonder who brought you here. Just whistle of seduction. <laughs> Joe, I can't name. take it anymore. It's not Brother Brother man. man, it's Breakman. Yeah, I thought it was Breakman. This game lied. Capcom can't, can't oh, spell or tell the, the truth. Fun. Brother Man is a good guy. You tricked us out <laughs> I think there was two of them, and that's why they I changed the name. You but, but this is a pretty good ending right here. I mean, look at this. It's showing the old Robot Masters from Mega Man 1 and... The yeah. ones that most yeah. people didn't play because they started from 2. Yeah, right, like me. <laughs> <laughs> I remember that. It's like, who's Guts, man? He sounds stupid. Yeah, when I see him as a Guts Dozer in Mega Man 2, I'm like, I thought that was his debut. No, he was actually <laughs> reincarnated from Mega Man 1. He somehow came back from the grave. Yeah. Bro, when'd you find her? I was keeping but. Oh, we fought Mega Man? Jeez. You fought yourself? You were interested in that. We did that in the first oh, game. You, you find yourself in the first one. Ourselves. Yeah, and I like the ending music right here, too. It's pretty cool. And this, this part right here, when they show Pro Man's face, look on the right. Dr. Wally's saucer's flying. With, and I, I thought that was a bird. At... I thought I was it was like a bird, too. Bird, I mean, like, what you looking at? <laughs> yeah, I thought that was a bird, and then I found out, no, that's Dr. Wally's uh, escape pod flying in the background. That man is obsessed with skulls and UFOs. Yeah, really. Like, he liked uh, the new Indiana Jones movie. He's German. Mm-hmm. What do you expect? <laughs> Hard man, the guy with the worst reputation ever. No, 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 no. Splash Woman has the worst reputation. Top, he always likes to be on the weakest one in Mega Man 9. But anyway, yep. that's the end of Mega Man 3. And these awesome robot masters, Snake Man. I mean, after Mega Man 3, uh, the names, the ideas for robot masters started to go downhill. But Mega oh, Man 3 has some pretty good robot masters. What are you talking about? Plant Man like was a great that? idea. <laughs> what? I said, what are you talking about? Plant Man was a great idea. <laughs> so was Wave Man and Charge Man. And Dust Tom- Man. Tomahawk Man was totally not racist. The fearsome Dust Man. He'll leave you in the dust. I like Tomahawk Man. I like, I like, I like Tomahawk Man's music. Dust Man will yeah. make you bite the dust. <laughs> there you go. That's, <laughs> if he was a wrestler, that'd be, that'd be his interest music. I know who bites the dust. Dun, dun. Yeah. I'm gonna be the opening music in another game that's not related to this. What game? Uh, WWE 12. <laughs> oh. I like the indie music. Right, the indie music right here, this, uh, Hispanic music, whatever. It's pretty cool. Indie music. <laughs> it's NES music. Indie music. Wait, did you say Indian music? <laughs> it's not even that. It's NES music. Get it right. <laughs> Presented by Capcom, which will suck in the future. But you don't know that yet. If we can't, yeah. Oh, give us Sega Man Legends 3, please! Yeah, really? <laughs> I want to play that like game. That much. Apparently we don't love him enough somehow. <laughs> yeah. It's such that they're abandoning the Blue Bomber. Well, I, I think they should have done a long time ago, because they ran out of ideas from Mega Man a long time ago, and there's too many sequels and respawnings and spin-offs, and it's like... It's suckage. Just let the robot rest in peace. He's a legend been humiliated. Go out <laughs> it's had great soundtracks. I would still like to see more games and maybe yeah, see these cool. iRobots return. Yes. Yeah. But anyway, uh, that is the end of this LP. Tribute to Extreme and I, Mega Man 3 for the NES. One of the greatest video games of all time for the NES. One of the greatest uh, in the series. Um, one of the easiest. Who is the creator of Mega Man? I forgot. Kenji and Apune. Dr. Yeah, uh, Kenji. Yeah, and Apune. There was a rumor that he said Mega Man 3 is the worst in the series. Yes. I don't know what he was smoking, but I mean, uh, Mega Man 3 is not I'll the worst I'll find the artwork series. and I'll tell you after the recording. I wonder yes. why. It's not like it was very easy. <laughs> <laughs> well, still, even though the game is kind of easy, it don't mean it's bad. It wasn't that easy. It wasn't like no. freaking no. Big Rigs over the road racing easy. I yeah. mean, it's like, I mean, Mega Man 3 is still a freaking ECW game. I mean, you got a game that has an awesome soundtrack. Um, good robot masters with the exception of maybe Top Man and Hard Man. Um, <laughs> I, mean, I think man. that's why. Because they exist. <laughs> well, he wasn't on top of his game in this game. And, mm-hmm. I mean, Mega Man 3 just, just... I mean, man, it's an awesome sequel to Mega Man 2. Um, I can see why people think it's the best in the original series, or at least for the NES, Mega Man 1 through 6. Um, 
but uh, I don't really see. I mean, I know everybody's entitled to their opinion, but I don't see how people can see Mega Man Three is the worst in the series. Period. Um, but Mega Man Three definitely uh, one of the great classic games for the NES, and um, just the gameplay is pretty awesome. Yeah, the game's pretty easy, especially Skull Castle. It's kind of a joke. I don't know if they thought, oh, well, we make the, the castles in parts one and two too hard. Let's make it easy in part three. And I don't know what Capcom was thinking, but I mean, Skull Castle is still pretty cool. Um, it's an overall great gaming experience, uh, especially when you discover the glitch where uh, you use a two-player cheating uh, mode where you can jump out of the pit and be in, invincible. That was funny. Yeah, that, that, was, that was pretty cool. Um, <laughs> so it's, I mean, Mega Man 3 is uh, this freaking awesome. Uh, one of my all-time favorites. I definitely had to give this game a 9 out of 10. Woo. Uh, green? Uh, hmm. Well, just like we said, you know, just because it's the easiest doesn't mean it's a bad game, but it was still good. I enjoyed it. Um, I did have um, some issues with some random deaths, so for that, I'll give it a 9 minus 1 out of 10. Wait. <laughs> what? Not too much math. Oh, God. <laughs> it's 8 out of 10, then? Is yes. that an eight? <laughs> yes, that is an eight. I just thought it would be funny if they troll pe- someone. <laughs> Lol. You're trolling it's Gemini, right? <laughs> uh, um, troll noob. <laughs> uh, RGX? Oh, well, for me, this, this, this game was, I don't know, the, the plot twist was, you know, it's just like any other NES game. It's very simplistic. It, it really kept, the storyline was good. I like how they introduced, I like how they introduced Breakman, as they as they call it, in my opinion they they could have made they could have made him a bit harder instead of making him jump around like kind of an idiot, you know. And yeah, but 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 the stage design, like if you if you if Mega Man Two is your first game, you're 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 really gonna have some trouble, like with the with the Robot Masters. It's 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 definitely safe to say that this game was definitely a bit more challenging in, in on the Robot Master side than Mega Man Two was. But easier than Mega Man One in some respects, but it's mainly because you know, you know, the bosses will only take like one damage and and so on, and and the patterns are a bit, you know, they're not, they're they're somewhat predictable, and and I think the damage got increased, but that's aside from a point. The music, I I I, I love the boss theme on this. This is just, it's it's really good. It's it's really spastic. It really you know gets you going like makes you pay attention. It's a lot like Mega Man Nine in a way, but except this time you can slide on unlike. Yeah. The level design. Hmm. I don't know about how the how the robot masters in the rock paper scissors concept holds up. You know, with the weaknesses, some of them make sense, others don't. But the Wily, the Wily stages. It's just I was a little disappointed with the Wily stages. You'd, you'd think that. After all the, you know, hell you'd gone through, through all the dock robots, you know, after, which, you know, were just a pain in the ass on my first run, huh? for everyone, I, I bet. Huh? Oh, yeah, really? You'd, 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 you'd think after the dock robots that, you know, you'd expect more hell, but, but, then, but then you find out, oh, we're in the clear zone right now, it's, it's all easy, they're just handing us power-ups, What's, what could possibly be so hard about this next part? Huh? And you find out, you know... <laughs> face the yellow devil and find out that he's a joke in this one, really. Yeah, really. They watered so him down big time in this one. Yeah, they, they totally nerfed him. Like, I mean, I mean, he's still kind of a, th- he's still a threat like he is in Mega Man 1, but I, I, I find him harder in, in, in Mega Man 3, to be honest, totally, because, you know, Mega Man 1, it's it's got a pattern, and once you get it down, you know, you're good, but eh, Mega Man 3, I just have trouble dodging specific things, but this this game was just for me after playing like one through seven, doing Rockman and Forte, Mega Man Base, whatever you want to call it, doing Mega Man X, like that's about it. Huh? As, as, as far as a few like Battle Network things I did, I I definitely say that this this game really stood out in the music. It's like it's it's got this factor about it that's you know that makes it really fun. It's 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 a bit challenging at first if you know you're not used to the robot masters, but 
gets a lot easier if you use the power ups. Like, so hmm, I'd have to as 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 for the gameplay. There, there's some glitches that are kind of cheap, like that can make you fall to your death, which is just ridiculous, like in Snake Man stage. But huh, other than that, huh, aside from all the funny glitches. The good music, the, the storyline, the gameplay, it's it, it holds up to, like, you know, from what the first two, you know, might have failed to do, or... Let's just put it this way, it still holds up, it's... it's. I think it really, I think it really kicked, you know, the Mega Man series, like, up a notch, like, in, in popularity, it really, it really got them going, after mm-hmm. Mega Man 2. It still holds up, in court. Yeah, huh? Yes. Better. <laughs> it's 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 definitely what I'd say definitely one of the best. So I'd I'd have to give this probably nine point five or so. Okay. We got that totally holds up because man, that was a long list discussed, so is it just me? <laughs> <laughs> I was it became ranting. the new me. That's what I used to do. I used to just go on. But Alright, so Mega Man three you yeah, pretty much soundtrack all the... authority. Yes, I give the <laughs> yes soundtrack best part. When have I ever not given the Are you soundtrack the dump or something? best props? No. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> talking. We're here with Archangel Zero. <laughs> How long has he been here? Why do we keep going? Oh yeah, of course music has to be the highest prop because that's just what I give the highest props to. Some of the video game music guy here, but um. Yeah, the, uh, you know, it, Mega Man 3 has its, uh, you know, has its challenging parts, but of course the Nocturne Skull Castle stages are, those were, those are <laughs> interestingly easy. But, yeah. uh, other than that, Theo, the other, uh, Robot Master stages are pretty fun. I liked it. Each having their own awesome music, I would say. Uh, Tahaga, I can't even, I was to say, which is my favorite stage song can't do that can't do that just can't um yeah just pretty much a fun ecw game i pretty much have to agree with all that you've said ron because you're the i don't know it just seems you're the man when it comes to giving the let's discuss on mega man because you pretty much grew up with them right yep yeah and i would pretty much give mega man a nine out of ten it's a great game you know who cares if it's too easy or whatever or just whatever Inafune said. Yeah, Still a great game. About the graphics. For the NES, Nintendo Entertainment System. Join the Nintendo Fan Club today. <laughs> Who composed the music for uh, Mega Man 3? Y- Yuki uh, Fuj... All, all I know is that her nickname is Bun Bun. Like, oh, that's yeah. what her like, little... That's what the yeah the credit name is. Bun Bun. <laughs> Bun oh, okay. Bun. Okay. <laughs> yeah. Or it's Yasuiki Fuji... I, okay, I, can't, I can't even try. I'm not going to try. Fujinami. No. Yeah, uh, all right. Oh yeah, Star Soldier. Oh yeah, baby. I still love Mega Man Three. Maybe and the foodie's just being too hard on himself. Maybe there's some things that could have been put into Mega Man Three that he didn't get a chance to because I heard this game was sort of rushed market. But for a rushed Mega Man game, no pun intended, because of the dog. <laughs> <laughs> well, anyways, uh, yeah, Mega Man Three is still awesome. You can do the new slide move, which makes the gameplay a lot faster. You can actually climb the ladders actually a lot faster, too, (laughs) which actually removes some of the tediousness of the original Mega Man and Mega Man 2. Plus, I don't know, (laughs) the whole ability to go deeper into the storyline, like who is this new character that's always trying to fight you or help you? Yeah, who's this lone (laughs) wolf? Yeah. Dr. Wily is now on your side, or is he? So <laughs> it just feels like the perfect end of a great trilogy and Mega Man's 4 to slight sit and all that on the original Nintendo just felt like they were jumping the shark. Like you got a whole bunch of weird Mega Man characters that didn't need to be in there, like Dust Man or <laughs> Dive Dr. Man Cossack. or yeah. Plant Man, Feral Man, oh, you know, man. names that clearly aren't as cool as the original characters in the, you know, Mega Man 3 history. Like, you got cool ones like, 
and the awesome Snake Man, Gemini yeah. Man, which actually has Parallax Drone in the background. Very yeah. cool for NES game to have. Yeah, so this is a great tribute to Edge Gemini. Oh, yeah, and being a Gemini myself, you know, I can appreciate the game and have, you know, find that cool end boss there. Yeah, so, yeah, in the end, great music, great graphics. Uh, unfortunately, Mega Man 3, unfortunately, suffers from a lot of slowdown in certain places, but, hey, it just goes to show you how much game they actually put into it, how much awesomeness that the game cartridge can't actually contain it because it's so cool. It's slowing down because it's so awesome. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, great music, great sound, great gameplay, still awesome, and great end to the original Mega Man trilogy, 93 out of 100, baby. All Good right. Woo! Yeah. No, I'm just, I'm <laughs> just going to add this real quick. If you're a graphics whore, you better play this game because you won't be a graphics whore after you, after you finish this game. Good. Yeah. Good and that's going to be a good thing. Oh, yeah. You won't judge that. 8 bits. <laughs> just play the game. Yep. Just play it. Just after, after play Mega the Man, game. I mean, after Mega Man 2 came out, I mean, they're thinking, oh, man, Mega Man 3's next? I think I remember seeing the commercial when I was a kid. Oh, Mega Man 3? Yeah, yeah, I believe they did. And uh, I was like, oh, man, that's not awesome. Sure. At first, it was anticlimactic to me because I think it had too much expectations for it because I loved Mega Man 2 so much. But after playing it some more, it really grew on me, and Mega Man 3 became one of my all-time favorites. So, yeah, Mega Man 3 definitely is ECW. And uh, before we sign off, uh, me and Green, who uh, knew X Gemini uh, from years ago, we're going to say a few things about him before we uh, end this tribute. Um, I wish Robbie was still alive today because he would definitely probably be in some commentary with us on SC2K, especially Mega Man games. And uh, he he was uh, well, one of the things I said about him in the uh, description box of the one of the old tribute videos I did um, back in 2008. Um, man, he was a, he was a real nice guy. I remember I never forget around the time I first met him. I was a part of his group. You probably remember Green uh, Gaming Utopia. Um, Somewhat. I think I joined that group right when it, like, ended and became, like, the Mega Man Clubhouse. Oh, no, no. Mega Man Clubhouse was a different group in its own. Um, Game Utopia became classic Game Utopia later on. Um, he, I joined, I think what happened was, yeah, I had left Mega Man's Clubhouse because I didn't really care to talk about Mega Man or any more. It seemed like they all want to talk about the new Mega Man games, which I didn't care about. And I just said, all right, well, I'm leaving this group, guys. If anybody wants to stay in contact with me, email me here, and we'll talk more about Mega Man. And he's like probably the only one <laughs> that uh, emailed me and said, yeah, I'll keep in contact with you. And, and then I ended up joining his group, uh, Game Utopia. And I invited somebody to join the group. And I said, hey, yeah, thanks for joining. And then one of the assistant managers was like being a real douchebag to me, saying, what? This ain't your group? F that. This is our group. And... I started getting to a flame war with him and, and the other assistant manager. Uh, Jim and I was the manager, the founder, and then he had two friends of his that were douchebag assistant managers. And um, basically, they wanted me banned from the group. So I ended up getting banned because Jim and I went by the voting system. That he voted for me, but those two voted against me. And so yeah, he, I guess he honored their vote, and uh, I was banned from, from the group, which I, I didn't care because I eventually came back later on when those two were out of the picture and helped him run the classic game Utopia group. And he pretty much turned the group over to me, I think. Um, or no, I think he was still manager, and then um, I was always, I think I was manager up there with him or assistant manager. And then when he passed on, I kept the group open and alive until MSN decided to screw things up and shut it down. Uh, and, but I'll never forget, though, he was like the only manager in that group who was nice to me when he had douchebag friends that would just... Um, uh, being jerks to me, and he was always nice to me. We never got into an argument. He seemed like he was like one of the nicest guys you ever meet. I never knew him in person. I never talked to him through Skype or anything. I think uh, by the time he passed away, I think Skype was probably barely getting popular. I didn't really know about it. And then, uh, man, he was uh, seemed like a real class act uh, as a person to know, even just online. And so when he passed away, I remember um, the. I mean, one day, I don't think I told too many people this, um, I didn't talk to him for almost a year or so, and then I got an instant message from some sort of unknown nickname, 
uh, it said Gemini something, but I thought it was somebody else. And uh, the message said, funeral arrangements are going to be held on uh, this day and blah, blah, blah. And I'm thinking, okay, whoever you are, you have the wrong person. And I typed, I said, who is this? And he goes, did you know Robbie Nishan? And it hit me. Oh, man, don't tell me he passed away. And then it was, it was his dad that was that had his account, his password, and that's when he's telling everybody online that he passed away. And that freaking sucked. That really hit me hard. And But, man, he's one of the – I'll never forget when he defended me and tried to keep me in the group. He was always a nice person, loved Mega Man. Uh, I wish I would have known him in person. So, yeah. Uh, all right, Green? Well, for me, like – I think you were probably the third person I met when I joined the Mega Man's Clubhouse. And I remember him, you, and someone else were the guys that pretty much helped me out the most when my account got attacked, if you remember. And someone was going around posting as me, or disguised as me, and getting me in trouble with a lot of people. And then I started talking to both of you. Well, uh, Robbie Moore, since I think, how long has it been since we've been on that, in the clubhouse? How many years? Uh, how many years were we on there? Yeah, or like, how long ago was that? I don't even remember. I, I, mean, joined, I, remember. I joined in 2003, I think I joined again later in 2004. So we were okay. there until like, probably the very end when they missed in and shut it down in 2009. Okay, so yeah, it's been a really long time, but... I know I was talking to him more than you were for some reason. And we got along great. And we talked about Mega Man. And he kind of rekindled my life for Mega Man 3. Because at the time when I was much younger, I hated 3 the most. And I was more about uh, Mega Man 2 and 5. But he kind of taught me to give the stuff a chance. So... I ended up playing 3 and enjoying it, and I remember um, getting that message about what happened, and I remember, the only thing I remember was not going to school because, like, it was just a sad moment, and nobody really understood. They were just, like, wondering why I was crying in my room and stuff. Because, you know, a person I had never met that I wanted to meet had passed away. Someone that was really nice to me and helped me out during that whole incident. And it's just like, man, I wish you were still around now. Yeah, me too. But um, at least he, uh, we got to uh, know him. I, I mean... You don't want to get to know him in person. I mean, especially after talking with his parents. He seemed like just a class act kid. I think he was 19 when he died. He was real young. 19 or 20, maybe. He's about to be 20. He's, he's ridiculous. Don, too young. and uh, But, yeah, I mean, those are our fond memories of X Gemini, a.k.a. Robbie Nishin, if I say his name right. Um, and, yeah, so, I mean, rest in peace, Robbie. We still miss you. And, uh we hope you all enjoy this tribute to X Gemini, uh, Mega Man 3 on the S2K channel. I want to thank everybody that joined us, uh, Minecraft Martin or Gen 2, uh, and, and all of us here. I think I don't know who else might have been in it. Me. I think it might have been it. Yeah. <laughs> you everybody, everyone else everybody in this part. part, but I mean, people who are not in this part, I think Gen 2 and Martin. Uh, Martin was going to be in this part, but he opted to get out because uh, he's in that, having problems with it. But, uh, you know, everybody that joined this tribute, um, thank you very much. And, uh, we are out of here. I'm Ron Moore. Uh, and I'm by that? myself, I guess. <laughs> you know, I'm I'm I this is Star Soldier, and thanks for watching. Oh, yeah, baby. Oh, yeah, baby. Over and out. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Green K4, peace out, and I'll see you guys later. Giggity. Yeah, sayonara oh. from the Wii guy. Peace. And I love you, Robbie. Bros. I've met you, but I give you 100 out of 100. Mm -hmm. Rest in peace, man. Definitely.
And welcome to my first time opening an advanced game and the first advanced game on the S2K channel. Let's play Super Mario Advance. This is Ron Moore along with the Wii Guy, Minecraft Martin, and oh yeah, Star Soldier and RGX. Oh yeah, we're doing Mario Advance hey. and Rarity. Yeah, Mario Advance is Mario 2 on steroids. <laughs> oh, it's on the game. Advance. Yeah. It's advanced. <laughs> they look all constipated. <laughs> hey, you were all right. you weren't joking. They pulled the logo right out of the ground. <laughs> yeah, our game is a bunch of words out of the ground. Oh uh, yeah, go back. Uh, yeah, awesome freaking game. I remember when I first got this in 2001, 2002. I had lots of fun with it, and uh, yeah. Oh, and Birdo's even more creepier in this game. Yep, because of the voice acting. They finally made it a girl, finally. <laughs> yeah, really, because we weren't sure. It was just like Pat from Saturday Night Live. You didn't know the man or a woman. Just a hermaphrodite, I don't know. <laughs> Alright, and it just looks a lot like Mario All-Stars. But this is freaking awesome. It's like, what, the third time we played Mario 2 on this channel? Yep, there was, uh... Maybe. I think Bears LP, I don't know. <laughs> I think someone yeah, else. Yeah, All Star. He did the All Stars version. I did the original version. Yeah, you did. And then now it's the, it's wow. So I was two is three times on the channel. How weird. Yeah. Mario Two, ECW. I just love this yeah. game. Doki Doki. Yeah, very underrated yeah, game. I don't know why people hate it so much. Yeah, Jay. <laughs> it's not like Mario. <laughs> it's not like Mario. <laughs> it's Mario in it, but Mario's it's not Mario. Lame, but... You can watch Y'all Star Soldier. I challenge you to another uh, two-player competition in Super Mario Bros. Wii. <laughs> and see how you hold up in two-player mode. So they added a whole bunch of things into this new one, this advanced version. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you can now collect five red coins in each stage to get a one-up. Um, and it's like just Mario World. And you, uh, yeah, you you pick. You know these items right here. That some of them are bigger. Some of the shy guys are are huge. Some of the levels are kind of uh, altered a little bit, uh, maybe I think a little bit different. And there's uh, oh, so voice acting nice. in this version, which is pretty mm -hmm. cool. Oh, Mumia! Here they go. Oh, I, I don't know and what the this whole is new cool score system games. too. You got score system and uh, <laughs> a little one-up uh, mushroom uh, bubble right there. I hate to burst your bubble, but I can't get it. Oh no! Somewhere else. <laughs> yeah. I don't know he if this is new burst in, the in, bubble. in the Mario <laughs> Advance, but like if you get all the. You get all the mushrooms, you can, you, they turn into Yoshi eggs in the next playthrough. Oh, wow. I spoiled it! <laughs> um, <laughs> Such and, an annoying to get. But, you know, Mario Bros. 2, the original, was ECW. And then Mario All-Stars version of Mario 2 is ECW times 2. And so now this version <laughs> of Mario 2 is ECW times 3. Wait, ECW is cute. Lost <laughs> levels of times 4. Yeah, when oh. you said Mario original, do you oh. mean Super Mario original Japan version or the original? Super Mario American? original American version. Yeah, no. I, I never played uh, uh, Dorky Dorky Panic, uh, whatever it's called. <laughs> no, I'm, no, I meant no, like no that Japan version of Super Mario Two. Get the shrooms. Which is I the know lost that's thing. Dorky Dorky Panic. Right? <laughs> no, I'm talking about the lost levels. They might have. Uh, I think too. Just from looking at it right now, I think they might have used Microsoft Paint to put in the new new uh, levels. <laughs> yeah, they did a good job for Paint Microsoft Paint. Yeah, now that yeah we edited it out for this movie maker. <laughs> so hopefully, so no one would notice this crappy game. Now. Hey, not a crappy game. Yeah, it's a great, so game. great game. Yeah, it's, no, it's, great. it's amazing. Yeah, Jay. <laughs> That's it, I'm, I'm calling it 10 out of 10. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. Right. Just got uh, five red coins, I got a one up. Oh, wow, you can actually get five hearts. Uh, on the side of the screen right there, five hearts. Oh, yeah. Zelda? <laughs> hey, yeah. Good job. Right there, the heart power-ups up there. That's pretty cool. Who's the... <laughs> These are on turtles. <laughs> yep, there's the voice acting. And then to its prime. Alex Luger. Oh! 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 <laughs> there you are. Wow. This game got pretty dramatic. <laughs> got pretty beat. <laughs> Ish. Yeah. And right here you can bet, which I'm not sure what that is. I think I've used it before. Just, I guess, bet your chances to get a two or three extra lives. I don't know. I don't really care. Well, I bet oh, for her. a gambling addiction. <laughs> <laughs> I can stop anytime. Just, I need yeah. more money. I need, need more time. You need three stars. 
I don't care about these bonus games. It's forced me to do it, so I mean... Yeah, it does force well, yeah, stars a couple of times. Well, it's already forced me. If I stop getting cherries and everything, I wouldn't be getting the bonus stages. You sure right. you don't burst the ch cherry? Guess. Magic carpet again? <laughs> no, 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 don't burst From the cherry. <laughs> yeah, you, you, yeah, you. <laughs> oh, dang it. What? You said, that sounded like an evil laugh. Get on top. <laughs> Get on go. top. Can't master Luigi, Ron. I should be LPing this. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah, well, how about you... Why don't you? Shut up this. Oh, Phil. Uh-oh. Okay, I might as well end the recording while I'm at it. Alright. <laughs> Alright. Mushroom time. Put on the pipe. Found the pipe. Yeah. yeah, Luigi locks in this game. Or rocks. Yeah. <laughs> What'd you say, locks? <laughs> he locks. He does. He does. Locks. He has the key. I was trying to speak Italian. Who did you want? Go do the jump trick! Ah, oh, man, you ruined it. <laughs> oh, what jump trick? You can, if you get on the, like, uh, the, yeah, the ninja star guys, if you, you know, do, do your super jump, and right when the ninja jumps, you release, and then you'll be able to go over on top of the green, you know, where the door was locked from, and, and you can just skip this whole cave part right here. Oh, okay, I think <laughs> I vaguely remember that. I don't know if I've ever actually done it. I think I've seen someone done it. Seen someone done it. Do it. Whatever. Do it. <laughs> do it. What? Do it. You done did it. You do it. <laughs> oh man, what's, yep. there's a freaking mush. Oh, there it is. Hi. Right. Yeah. There you go. Yeah, the problem is with the Game Boy Advance version, they had to zoom oh, in. The <laughs> yeah. <laughs> That's why they made a bunch of the stuff bigger. <laughs> <laughs> we super size everything. Right. Zoom in even yeah, though. I was, I've always freaking loved Mario 2. It's never gotten old to me. It's aged pretty well. Yeah. Yeah, it's definitely a game you can just sit down and play it and plus you eat everything what about it. Supposed to do? It's not like you stand up and play it. <laughs> well, maybe some up. people do. Just, you know, you probably never see Mario go this route again with their games. Um. Yeah, you're right. <laughs> I don't never know. Happen. I mean. She's pregnant, that's why she needs three hits. I don't I don't remember them ever making another Mario game where you pick pull Just vegetables saying. out the ground. <laughs> she just gave you her egg. No. Of course clear. You could make this its it's... own series though. Yeah, this could be yeah, its really. own series. Huh? This could have been its own Mario series. Right? Well, like, yeah. I mean what other Mario games do you Super Mario well, Hope. who cares about Toad, but I mean, it's still the principle of the thing, you know, play sporting characters, like including Princess Toadstool. I mean, it's pretty cool. Yeah, geez. Oh. Oh, I still got five up. I only got something. Got two cherries. Still got something. Cool is not too bad. Like he's pretty quick. That voice is amazing. I know he's really strong. He's really fast, but he jumps. Well, just when I thought he couldn't get more annoying than in Mario Kart 64. Check him out here. Do it. Do the voice. Hey, Toad is the man. He's he's man. man, that sucks. Yeah, he no, he, he's like the strongest guy. Pulls yeah, but he still sucks. Oh, <laughs> shed a mushroom! Holy crap! <laughs> I mean, he's made a mushroom. <laughs> he's strong at trolling people. I'm sure he's delicious. He's, he's made not, a mushroom. Yeah. That means he doesn't have much for brains. Uh, and a mushroom head. Why is he called Toad? He's a mushroom. He's not a frog. <laughs> Toad stool. <laughs> Yeah, Toadstool. And he doesn't jump like a tadpole either, you know, he just jumps really low. <laughs> Why is it called Princess Toadstool? There's no toads in Mushroom Kingdom. But the, no, but the reason works. he's... He's not in many other games, though, because... Well, Mario the boss is a toad. Sounds like some teenager you, you'd want to drop kick or something. <laughs> <laughs> no, oh, yeah, seriously. Yeah, oh, yeah, I forgot. Wart is a toad. Yeah. <laughs> no, he's a no, frog. <laughs> the forgotten <laughs> end boss. Toad. Yeah, well, he's only been... Oh, toad troll. Oh, ouch. <laughs> the only Mario games ever been in, I think. No. Mario keeps, eat Mario keeps eating his kids. That's why in many other games he hates Mario. <laughs> Ouch! Bro, he just kept killing. Uh, breaking him news. Um, <laughs> Wart, 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 Mario's a serial uh, killer. Breaking news. Outside. Breaking news. Wart will be in the new Smash Brothers Wii U. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> I'm not buying that then. <laughs> <laughs> you just throw vegetables at him. Yeah. Buy the new Toad. game, you'll get wart. Wait, what? Oh my god. <laughs> no, 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 it's a oh character. Oh my god, I got wart. What? You never, Special I know you never heard of him, but it's cool. Yeah, and that's it. 
That's it. Special <laughs> move is disintegrating vegetables. <laughs> <laughs> and of course, watch out for Jason Voorhees. That'd be great if you could play as Jason Voorhees in this game. <laughs> yeah. Jason Voorhees, a jolly good fellow. Voorhees, a jolly good fellow. Fail. Ow, just got shot. Voorhees, a jolly good fail. Oh, ow, oh, yeah, oh, speaking of fail. Oh, oh. Jolly good fail. <laughs> well, I failed right there, big time. Now I was someone cool. That was Death Scream, though. It's pretty, uh... It's actually satisfying to hear him die. <laughs> yeah, really. If Princess Peach don't die now. Well, oh, I don't yeah. know. She dies. She <laughs> yeah. dies, but... She's like, That's right, baby. Not in pits. <laughs> yeah, she's like, Lucky! Lucky! Oh, no! Ah. Uh, why listen is to this right here. <laughs> listen. <laughs> what? She just screams? <laughs> A crystal! Lucky! <laughs> Seriously, she's, why are you playing this? She's turning me on. Stop it. Stop this. The voucher here. <laughs> No, that's what he said. All right, and, um... Jerry, the, uh, did the voiceovers. <laughs> Jerry the mouse on steroids now. What did uh, I tell you about playing with fire, kid? <laughs> he laughs whenever he gets hit. What? What is he, like a freak? He's an old-timer gangster. He's a master whatever. He's, he's a beavis mouse. Yeah. He, li <laughs> he likes to get blown. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. <laughs> Yay, no bonus. Let's get out of here. <laughs> no bonus. Screw you, Nintendo. No. How dare you leave me without a bonus for every level. Alright, Desert Land. Yeah. Gamble every okay. level. Got Mario and his mustache again. Here we go. <laughs> Ron Jeremy now and Desert Land. Oh, okay. <laughs> yes, sir. Ron Jeremy. <laughs> there Ron we go. Jeremy spoke in class today. Now we gotta let Mario play while Peach redoes her hair from getting singed by the bombs. Yeah. <laughs> She's like, ah, you. Somebody set us up the bomb? Yeah. It was Bomb Man from Mega Man 1. Was with Mario pulling oh, I thought it was Hard Man. Turtles out of the talking about Ron Jeremy and stuff? He's going down the pipe, huh? 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 Oh, <laughs> a pipe. Get it? Sex joke! He was the princess's peaches. No oh, man. Yeah. She grew her what? peaches and she ate that heart. Hey, let's keep it clean. We're doing a tribute to Mario here, so... No, I'm just kidding. Oh, no, sorry. Yeah, Mario died many <laughs> years ago. Just tributing to the Mafia. <laughs> he overdosed on mushrooms. Yeah, yeah, let's keep it clean. We're contributing to the Mafia. There was a, a, there was a Newgrounds video where someone did a... Like a, um, a little parody of Mario where they said... Uh, Luigi was giving a documentary about Mario, how he's always on shrooms, and he's not close to his brother anymore. He's a drug addict now. It's funny. <laughs> shrooms make you big. I don't know if it's still up, though. This is back 2003 when I've seen this. Oh, yeah. There's so many of those new guns flashes I used to watch. Oh, my God. I can still remember most of that them. That was yeah. the place to oh, go before YouTube. Oh, hell, my God. Sir, yes. Yeah. I, uh, I have fond memories. We should, oh, that should be a next podcast. New guns memories. I could, talk, I could talk endlessly about it. Oh, yeah. Well, I'll let you host that one. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> Party time. <laughs> yeah. It's the retarded Ferris wheel. <laughs> yeah, it's the Microsoft paint wheel. Ferris, Ferris, Bueller, <laughs> yeah. Ferris wheels, Bueller's day off. I hate fail. this part, seriously, because you can fall off the edge if you're not careful. This is far as you go. This is far as you go. This no, is far as you go. I go for IT, you know. This is far as you go. You yeah. remember? Uh, 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 I'm so, uh, uh, sadly, I like... Birdo better than I do Tingle and Toad. Take off her bow, take off her bow. <laughs> <laughs> well, she's yeah, funny. She's got those funny lines. Yeah. Tingle Street. Oh, it's it's, it's, they finally made it clear that it's a girl this time. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> finally. That screwed me up as a kid. It's a transsexual. Yeah, I'm like, <laughs> oh, oh, yeah, like you knew trannies back in the day. Wait, did you? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, did you? Did you start soldier? you? <laughs> and what do you get for 777? Uh, you go to heaven? It used to be a woman. <laughs> oh, <laughs> no, you get a bit of free... about that? You get a 10% discount at 7-Eleven. <laughs> you get a discount at 7-Eleven? You just don't get a discount. But this ain't Labor Day. Oh, by the way, everyone, if you show, if you take uh, your iPhone to 7-Eleven and show them an SD, SD2K video, they'll give you a discount on hot dogs. 
Yeah, yeah it's just for that entertaining. Uh, go go to our uh, go to the reset button dot net and use the keyword uh, or uh, secret code uh, S2K and you get a free subscription to S2K. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. Yeah. Go to the reset it's button, hit sign up, and then great things will happen. Oh, so I don't have to be paying thirty five ninety nine anymore. No, you do not. You don't have to pay five dollars or GTFO. It is absolutely free. Free. You know, no oh man, $5. come on. Aw, Luigi. Get free this. See, Luigi sucks. He dies. So I'm going to Toad. Because you're not playing him <laughs> right. Toad died, so he sucks. I, I can't. I can't control people's lives. I can't make them jump. When I say jump or whatever, so he messed up, not me. <laughs> you can lead a horse to water, but you can't make it drink. Well, that's why he's never, uh, he's always behind Rock Mario. Just... <laughs> that's why he's always the underdog. And that's why Luigi's Mansion failed. No, I'm <laughs> Great game. I, I never rolling. played that game. Oh, no, no. oh look at, oh, oh. No, no it's oh, it not the Ferris wheel that's retarded, it's that ball. What is that? It's a ball. Ball? Don't you know Dragon it's... ball. Don't you know where'd it come from? Ball? I thought you had some. <laughs> where'd that ball come from? Down there. <laughs> Keep it Bowser. Oh! Ah, oh, come on. Ah, oh, drown. You didn't drown. Brian. Burn, burn. Oh, that's a, what See, a waste. That's... Old Michelangelo again. <laughs> that's not all a waste. He got a heart. Why don't you have a heart and shut up, Phil? Oh, oh no 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 no! Die! Die! Oh! Die! Die! Oh! Oh! Die, die. Whoa, die. Was close. Oh! Ah, come on! All right, watch this. <laughs> uh, was, are those uh, bullets that the snakes are shooting at you? Are they bullets? I guess. Or are they like whoa? Simple stuff. A, a giant ninja again? <laughs> yeah! 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 <laughs> oh man, shut up! Why are you playing this Toad? <laughs> I just want to mix it up here, and you know, each Why character have different voice acting. Game? I just want to go ahead and use all of them, take turns using all of them. Oh, oh, oh. I'll say Toad is not that bad. Yeah, I mean, he's quick. He he's hand agile. Hand. Yeah, he, yeah, but I mean, he's just annoying. <laughs> <laughs> Toad has his What do you mean he's just... annoying? You always talk about levels were designed for people other than Toad. <laughs> I mean, he went. That time he went, shut up. I got mad and slapped him. I mean, he needs to shut up. I think they, I think they uh, slowed down Toad's picking up speed on this game. I remember him being stronger than that. Hmm. I guess Mario advances. Oh no! Another so Mario can't furious wheel. <laughs> no, the shy guy's off. No detail whatsoever. Right Whoever up, dude. Made that thing was having a bad day. I'll tell you what. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Probably just got yelled at by his boss or something and told, make a, make a gear. Yeah. <laughs> make me a beer. <laughs> Don't talk back. I don't like it. <laughs> oh! Don't give me sass. Don't sass me. <laughs> Pick up the giant ninja. Do it, do it, do it. Shut up, you're gonna finish me all. I'll throw this I'll finish giant, you off with this. <laughs> throw this giant ninja at her, watch this. Oh Yeah. Wow, nothing happened. Ah oh, come on, the other way, you idiot. Now she's now this is the kind of uh what's her name, Birdie? Birdie Austral. <laughs> no, this ain't Street Fire One. Oh, you just got flamed. <laughs> she, she's more like a woman here than she is in the earlier parts of the game because she shoots fireballs. <laughs> and women shoot she's fireballs. Fire. Women, women shoot fireballs at you, <laughs> especially when you make them mad. Yeah, it's called her. It's called words. It's yeah. issue, you? Words of storm. Yeah, you. It's called a kick to the crotch. Yeah, I'm not gonna finish that. <laughs> crotch to the balls. The peanut. I think this whole game is about yeah, her development as a woman. <laughs> That's why we don't get many female viewers here on the SC2K. Well, I, love <laughs> I love women. I love them. Women know where they're at. Uh, Heather blocked me, so I don't want to listen to your <laughs> stupid videos again. No, I'm Take me a sandwich. <laughs> <laughs> get back in the kitchen. Nah, I love women. Don't get me wrong. Sandwich? Why can't it be like a pizza? <laughs> I love women. I love women. 
when they're in the kitchen not bugging me. No. Oh, I was gonna say someone. I'm walking Texas Ranger. Someone goes, "You don't like women, do you?" He goes, "I love them when they're in their place." <laughs> the bedroom. No one stand. Did he say that? Did Chuck Norris say that? No. Oh well, he could get away with it if he did. Yeah. Well, he no, he's a good guy, class act, good goody two shoes guy, slash oh, sure. slash badass in that show. He's not gonna say that. <laughs> He's above that. Yeah. Chuck yeah. Norris never does any put. <laughs> Chuck Norris gets like 50 women a night. Hey. <laughs> oh, what, look out. Yeah, he Damn. he gets 50 women <laughs> in a minute. Yeah, 50 it women. Sounds, it sounds like Pe Princess Peach is complaining right now, digging this sand up. Yeah. I was going to say, she sounds like a cat. Well, she like a cat. dug herself in the ditch. Yeah. <laughs> Talk about it. Let's see. Dug yourself a hole. I got to get yourself out. I want to uh, dig in her hole. Oh man, I should have seen that. <laughs> well, I'm sorry. Hey, so there's no room for disgusting <laughs> content on the SC2K. <laughs> I think I think we need to uh, put a disclaimer and warning on this video description box. <laughs> <laughs> for, uh, for, uh, the video boss. gets removed for uh, this is shocking <laughs> and disgusting content. Yeah, and yeah, it's not shiny. appropriate for women, not appropriate for people who are fans <laughs> of the original Japanese game. Oh, yeah. Not appropriate oh, no, for man. anybody. <laughs> I don't not think appropriate it's appropriate for fans of right Toad. Yeah. I don't think it's appropriate for us. We should just stop watching. <laughs> Shank them with it or something. <laughs> yeah. Stop watching the video. It's not appropriate. <laughs> we should we should unsubscribe from ourselves. <laughs> yeah, really. <laughs> I'm gonna unsubscribe from my own channel. <laughs> <laughs> Remember, uh, Skip Rogers got butthurt one day because he posted a bulletin saying, What? It won't let me subscribe to myself? Come on. <laughs> what? But I like myself. I deserve <laughs> to I love myself. myself. How cool. When I think about yeah, I mean, touch myself. You oh, wait, no. <laughs> Who's touching should... themselves? I mean, <laughs> oh, it was close. I almost got hit by that bullet. That's no, my fight. Be good. Oh, this is my favorite boss. It's time to kill the retarded snake. Oh, yeah, that's fight, um, uh... Ox. Ooh, apparently snakes. too much sauce to eat. What? Ah, fail. I never realized the Legos before. Was there Legos in the uh, original version? Nope. Oh, will nope. you rip off the different color of bricks, like Flashman type bricks. They're Legos. Oh, now they are. Legos. You need to play with them. Just let go, go of it. Let go of it. No. Let go of my Legos. What do Legos go my have, have in common? Nothing. Idiot, pick oh. up the freaking stool. What does Ramar and this yeah. game have in common? Just like the Flintstones Both amazing. Pebbles cereal commercial. Oh, oh! Oh, that was close. If you throw mushrooms... That is it! Probably, oh. probably. I am sick of those dates <laughs> in this level. Oh, wait, you already did it. I barely got that one right there. That was tight. <laughs> of course, clear. Alright, and that is it for part one. We'll be seeing part two while we start in... World 3. Until then, God bless and take care. <laughs> oh, yeah, man. Yeah. All right. And welcome to Let's Play Super Mario Advance Part 2. This is Ron Moore, along with Star Soldier and RGX. How is everybody doing? Oh, yeah. Thanks for watching, everybody. Yeah. Let's play some classic Super Mario Bros. 2, but more events on the Super Mario... Yeah! Events! Or what am I saying? Yeah. yeah. That's I more think, events. Let's, I think let's Star play the Star classic Star. game that started off on the on the Nintendo, that, that moved on to the Super Nintendo, and then ended up on the Game Boy Advanced, and it's still awesome to this day. Yeah. Hmm, I, I know think... I kind of bad-talked it on the first part, but it's a good game. I think uh, Star Soldier's mic's cut again. I can't hear him. Oh well, no. I'm just kidding. <laughs> ah, <laughs> that would suck. <laughs> oh man, oh, can you hear me oh, now? Playing with his scissors. Yeah, yeah the same Verizon models. Good. <laughs> can you <hear> me now? <laughs> they, I hated Verizon models. It's the only thing worse. Yeah. Than PCS. <laughs> Metro or Metro BCS, but anyway. They finally I, gave into the iPhone evilness. <laughs> and this is a uh, World Three One here. As I ride the magic carpet of ECW. Oh yeah. yeah. We're climbing up Jack's beanstalk. 
here. Yeah, it's just so <laughs> cool to see this thing. one again. Yeah, really. I is. wish Nintendo would have made some sort of remake. Yeah. Call it Super Mario Bros. 2 and a half. Yeah, this is kind of like, um, you know, that Mario 2 on steroids. And, yeah, when I, when I played this back in 2002 for the GBA, it was, it was real fun. I think a lot of people didn't like yeah. it because, oh, it was the same thing as Mario 2. I mean, yeah, but at the same time, there's different elements to it. Yeah. Yeah, I, I noticed a lot of people when this game came out, a lot of people were like, what were you guys thinking? Mario 1 was awesome. Why'd you have to change the format? <laughs> there's really nothing wrong with this game, really. No. Yeah, I don't know why people didn't. I guess they wanted the original format, but if you think about it, I think we mentioned this in, uh, I forget who mentioned Star Soldier, whoever. Uh, it was like the Japanese version of Mario 1. It yeah. looks pretty much, it's pretty much the same format. I mean, different game and levels and stuff, but pretty much the same format as Mario 1. And but Mario 2 is like t t something totally different. Then Mario 3 is even more different, you know? So it's like, yeah, man, it's, it's different as good if it's done right. I mean, it's like, it's like, think about it this way, would you rather have the Japanese version of Super Mario 2 where the levels are total BS and difficulty later on? <laughs> yeah. I'm not kidding. It's... Believe me, it's not as fun as it sounds. Like, you played the one on the lost levels, and I was very disappointed in it. They're hyping up, oh, this is the one we should have got, but then you play the lost levels, and holy crap, it's yeah, so really. unfair. And it doesn't change anything. Yeah. Well, do you okay. get a different ending? No. Do you get all new enemies to fight? No. No, the Here ending is something new. Bit. They're just like, oh, we're going to make you time jumps right. We're going to make you bounce off stuff just to get across ridiculously large gaps. And if you slip, well, you suck. Yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah and the, the wind levels? Oh, I got yeah. my freaking oh. nerves. <laughs> oh, yeah. I, I, I still have to drop those bombs on myself. Yeah, th those wind levels blew me away. <laughs> They're just nothing but hot air. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> but this game though, freaking ECW. Now as a kid, I freaking loved it. I think a lot of my friends loved it too. Too hot for me to handle. <laughs> yeah. yeah, it had great music, great sound effects. Uh, graphics were nicely improved. It still had the Mario style, but it also had some cool new effects I'd never seen in Nintendo games before. Yeah. Yeah. And I heard Shigeru Miyamoto actually wanted this to be the original Super Mario Bros. 2, but since they had the license to uh, this Doki Doki Panic Fuji TV show, hey, why don't we change that, you know, to make our licensees happy? <laughs> dorky Dorky Panic. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Uh, so I mean, this I mean this game right here, yeah, freaking ECW to say the least, and. Yeah, World yeah, 3. Whoever hated it can suck it. <laughs> it's definitely an underrated game. Yeah. You gotta play Ooh, to find that out. That was yourself. stupid. I just blew myself up. Uh, I also love that you can play you as a princess the because she's hot. I don't think she's hot, but it's cool that she can play. Uh, we can play as her because she floats in the air, has good hang time. Yeah, and she's not pregnant. <laughs> not yet. <laughs> <laughs> oh man. Oh come on! Wait, oh. Dang it! I hate when I do that. I did that in Mario Mario Two LP. <laughs> yeah. But a lot of people were thinking about shrooms when they discovered mushrooms were in secret doors. <laughs> yeah, really. Seriously, how'd they come up with that idea? Hey, let's put mushrooms in the game and it'll make you big. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, and then let's put bonus eggs if you find them all. <laughs> Yeah, that's yeah, weird. It almost seems like it could Ooh. be uh, <laughs> a drug that's doing it. Yeah. yeah. Oh man. Oh, my and stuff. you have you know, different vegetables or different weeds that make you stronger as well when you throw them. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Huh? Oh, look at, take oh. a look at these plants. I mean, how's a piece of grass gonna hurt like this lady? <laughs> ah. Oh. Well, the A can hurt you. You mean that yeah. dude that's throwing eggs at you? <laughs> well, I ended up I ended up with egg in my face. <laughs> yeah, Birdo. He got all scrambled. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Hey, Birdo, you want those eggs over easy? I fell. <laughs> oh, I'm going to finish you yeah, up. Forget about the eggs. Let's cook up Birdo. Oh, man. Don't yeah. waste my Birdo, Birdo or Turdo, 
As I like to call her, it really gets on my nerves and kind of yeah. creepy. Ah, <laughs> she's kicking my butt though. That's embarrassing. It's a he. <laughs> That's the worst part. It's a her hermaphrodite. Or, yeah. I don't know what that is. Tranny. And I also like in this Super Mario Bros. Advanced version that you can actually change your characters in between lives. Yeah, that's pretty cool. <laughs> Before you would just be stuck with Luigi or the princess. But Toad, you know, I like picking him because he's so quick. You can pick up those eggs right away. But yeah, he, his jump is kind of wimpy. I like yeah. Ah, see, he fails. <laughs> it's not Let my me fault. try. I can beat her. <laughs> I can beat him. Okay, here's uh, Princess Star Soldier now. And huh. Gonna take on Birdo. Birdo. I gotta beat up that Birdo. Birdo is creepy, oh, but still not still not as creepy as Tingle from Majora's Mask. Birdo's secretly a pedophile. <laughs> oh, ooh. oh, that oh. was stupid. I keep messing myself up doing that. Oh damn! Wait, no, I can't. No, you run to the eagle. I was gonna go around. I thought you go around, sneak up. You know, try jumping from under the platform, huh? Oh wait, here we go. Oh, oh. all right, oh, now I'm up here. That was epic. How you? Who does it, Birdo? Come on, Ronnie, idiot. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I haven't died yet. Yeah. Oh, whoa! Yeah, that like one See, I did it. <laughs> oh yeah, that's right. Star Soldier did it. <laughs> Star Soldier already did it. With the Birdo. Oh yeah, baby. Me and the princess work well together. Yeah, do you mean together? Oh man. <laughs> I don't I do not want to know what that means, Star Soldier. <laughs> <laughs> We're doing it. No, <laughs> no, <I'm kidding>. exactly. <laughs> what it means is is that they're working together. Alright, world thress thress. Oh yeah. Yeah, I'm gonna uh, Who's the this. boss here? Is it a mouser or two mousers? Or Mouser with, uh, uh it's, more, the, uh, uh, it's Birdo, but a totally different Mouser. Birdo. As the final boss for this world, huh? Uh, I and, uh, I would, in Mario 2 for the NES, I would always, oh, look out, wait, wait, oh, 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 oh. <laughs> hey, that's you, Ronnie. Oh, uh, that was a, no, this is, we got playing now, and, <laughs> oh, clutch is awesome, yeah! Oh yeah, yeah! I love Sunsoft. Oh yeah, <laughs> I love Battle Ass. <laughs> I'm Wee Guy, <laughs> and I like games that suck. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> Target Renegade is the best game ever made. Eleven out of eleven. Well, no, at least at least he has at least he has good taste in music. <laughs> and he's hyperactive a lot of the time. <laughs> yeah. Okay, he That's just cool. he, he just thumbs down. Uh-oh. He just thumbs just down, thumbs the down. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, Mario 2 for the NES, I would always skip this level because I think I always wanted to warp. And uh, I think, I forgot, was it World 1 or 2 in any in NES version? I think on here too, maybe you can warp to World 4 to Iceland and skip World 3. Yeah, I don't blame oh, you. This world, yeah, 1, 3, you can use the warp. Ah, uh, yeah, that's right. So I, I, I always skip this a lot. Uh, but on here, you know, wanted to. I think even when I first played this for the Game Boy Advance back in 2002, I really wanted to. 2001, 2002, whenever I got this, um, I really wanted to play through the whole game, even though it's you know similar to Mario 2 for the NES. There's still some different elements to it, so it was real fun. Plus, it's portable. You get to play Mario 2 portable this time. Yeah. And cool thing about this one is that it actually has a save feature. Yeah, so really. You can yeah. go back to the old levels no problem. Yeah. No, this was kind Before, of... yeah, using the wards was almost mandatory if you wanted to beat it quickly. Yeah. Mm. Yeah, it's doing the whole Wily e. Coyote thing where you're going from one screen to the next. Yeah, really, and now we gotta watch <laughs> out for the Jason Voorhees. Yeah. Jason Voorhees is. Uh-oh. Yeah, not as scary as the Jason Realizations. <laughs> oh, give me back my key. <laughs> oh, <laughs> 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 oh, <laughs> oh, <laughs> Why'd you take it? It's my key. Uh, Can I have it uh, back? Uh, uh, Can I kill you if you don't give it? You need to give me my key, douchebag. <laughs> don't make it fun of me. He's he's like <laughs> he's like face circling around you like Can I have my key back? Can I kill Dang you? It. Dang it, Star uh, Soldier, thanks I a lot. I have more subscribers than you, Star Soldier. Uh, uh, thanks uh, a lot, Star Soldier. I just got a message from uh Jay on Skype. Oh. 
<laughs> Again? <laughs> He's probably saying, Oh yeah, thanks for mentioning me, you guys. You guys rock. Yeah. Hey, hey guys. You guys are awesome. I'm gonna get more views because of this. <laughs> yeah. Alright, and uh, see if we like Jay. If we didn't, we wouldn't talk about him. <laughs> All right, and oh, watch out again. Stupid starfish, move. All right, Get uh, the home block. Oh, yeah. oh, 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 that was cool. Wow. Hey, yeah, I did that on purpose. <laughs> and oh man, oh. pumpkin heads like screw this. I'm out of here. This is a never-ending level. Yeah, this is the worst part of it. Oh, oh yeah, this part so gets pretty difficult. Oh, 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 I got powered up again. <laughs> Yeah, this part gets really nasty once you get up higher. <laughs> yeah. That's why yeah, I use Toad to for this. Start to those jumps and kill those enemies. <sighs> yeah, really. I use Toad for this because Luigi's thing just drags you on too much. <laughs> yeah. It's too hard to deal with the slow jumping. <laughs> Rather jump high, well, low and quick than high and short. I mean, yeah, whatever. <laughs> Yeah, come on. That made no come sense. On. Too much hang time on Luigi. Yeah. yeah. Not NBA hang time. <laughs> right, come, on. come on. Oh, come on, oh. wee guy. Oh, I need Tim Foley music to help me get going. Oh, oh, oh. Is this is Battle Clash. I use my super scope to fly around the screen, shoot enemies, and... Uh. Oh, that is so cheap. Oh, man, yeah. Come on. Fireballs from the sky if I'm in the music game. It's raining fire. <laughs> yeah, really. They can't do that in real life. Johnny Cash and his big balls of fire. <laughs> I'm burning ring up ECW and it burns, burns, <laughs> burns. Like you're belting, you know, the lyrics and the fireballs come down. <laughs> yeah, and watch it. Oh, oh, how do you get past that? <laughs> come on. Yeah, there's right. gonna be your game, you. your, yeah, your turn again, Star Soldier. Okay. <laughs> oh, wait, when we do went I over get for a Never? No. <laughs> <laughs> okay. I think Jay wants a turn. <laughs> can yeah. I have the controller? I can beat ah, it best. come on. Dang it. Star Soldier, you failed. Oh, I hate failing. <laughs> I'm not used to be you like Jason Realization and failing. Oh, well, speaking of no, Jay, I he's playing now. Come on, Jay. Uh, I can do this better. <laughs> he's Look so gonna, me. he's so gonna fly this I video. Dodged. <laughs> Get tired, you guys talk about me. Uh, I always gonna be flattered. And uh, he's, he's happy Jay now. <laughs> if, if he did a hate video on us, we would get noticed because he has lots of subscribers. Yeah. Oh, we probably oh, get a lot of trolls. Hate so, uh, video on him. Okay. <laughs> Come on, Jay, what do you say? <laughs> Nothing, because you can't think of anything to say. <laughs> <laughs> oh, look out. That's how good Jay is. He don't need words. He, his actions speak louder than words. <laughs> Believe me, his actions are not very good. I could have like you. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, um... Finally, got past that part. Oh, I get, Whoa. oh man. It doesn't get any easier. <laughs> And yeah, I got hit. <laughs> oh, I love the bonuses too that it gives you. I remember in the original Super Mario Bros. 2 for the NES, there was no score, but here we got a score finally. Yeah, yeah. that's pretty cool. Even though I, I don't care about points in video games honestly, but they do help you get extra lives. So yeah, yeah extra. And this one you can actually save the high score. Yeah, and. See, they, let, they let Bear get extra mans. <laughs> oh, man. Oh, you gotta time it. Oh, no. Ah. Come, on, come on, Jay. There you go, Jay. Jay's yeah. doing pretty good. I could have made Oh, Jay got, the Jay got past the part. All right. <laughs> it's almost yeah, like, like he's not playing. <laughs> <laughs> oh, come on. You know Jay would have beat this game already. This LP would have been over with. <laughs> I don't think he liked Superman Briars too. I think hey. he played it once. Oh no, there's vegetables in it. I don't like vegetables. <laughs> oh, oh, it's an all new boss. Yeah, the robotic. Yeah, you're right, Robo Birdo. A Mega Man version of of uh, Birdo. I think Ivo Robotnik had something to do with this. Yeah, copyright. He makes robots. 
or Dr. Wally, or yeah. as or as Nick Arcade, whatever his Maybe name they was, teamed up. <laughs> whatever the host name was on Nick Arcade said Dr. Robo Nick. <laughs> Man, just you thought Birdo could get any uglier. Ooh, yeah. I shouldn't have said now that. Now he's really ugly. Yeah. Come on, Jay. Hang in there. <laughs> just when you thought he couldn't get any more metal. Oh, Jay versus Goldsboro. Come on now. Yeah, it's a pretty easy boss. You just gotta, you know, make sure you actually stay on those chains. Yeah. Oh, oh. Well, I hate to pull your chain, but this is a challenging <laughs> boss level right here. Yeah, you know what? It does It does kind of look like a Mega Man boss. It looks like the Guts Dozier, except a more feminine, retarded version of it. <laughs> yeah, really. Oh, seriously. Yeah. <laughs> that he uttered. Yeah. <laughs> Ooh. Calm down. Yeah. <laughs> we didn't mean to make fun of you. Don't get all birdie with me. Yeah, ready. Oh! Oh, oh whoa. That was close. Whoa. I didn't mean it, I swear. Yeah. Wow, how many hits? Dang. Five. That was five. That was four. Oh, what? <laughs> oh, come on, Jay jumped on top of that egg. He eggs you off. All right. All right, come on, we got your turn. Yeah, quit egging him on. Oh, yeah, I'm weak. I, I'm gonna listen to the music as I play. Yeah. <laughs> oh, come on. We got you fell already. It took Jay a while to get hit. I got a strategy. I can use a strategy. Oh, there you go. Oh, ECW. Yeah, this game has an awesome soundtrack too. Uh, the remix version of Mario 2. And the original soundtrack was cool too. Yeah, I like it a lot. I wish they would have a level like this in like new Super Mario Bros. Uh, I still haven't played that one yet. I gotta get it. And the added dialogue is pretty sweet too. Even if it's not much. Yeah, it adds a little bit more. It makes this game worthwhile. I wish they had some more levels to it, though. Yeah. I guess, like a uh, bonus world. I guess they uh, leased the copyrights to uh, Lego, because some of these live right here is made out of Legos. Lego my egg, go. Lego Super Mario Bros. would be so easy, just like <laughs> Lego Star Wars. You could never die. Yeah, that's, that's funny you mention that. Uh, my, the, the Unknown, my low-budget review friend, Gave me Star Wars The Complete Saga for the Wii a few days ago. Oh, nice. Yeah, I haven't played it yet, but look forward to doing it. So, yeah, uh... <sighs> Come on. Yeah, they're actually pretty fun games, and they do spoil a lot of the movie in a <laughs> quick amount of time, but... Yeah. I don't know, there's not really... Ooh, oh, yeah, game. that's right, get boned. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. While you're at it. ECW, we got wins. ECW, lay off the caffeine. <laughs> Remember, All right. kids, this is what happens. And we are finally done with World 3. We will see you in Part 3, where we will be in World 4. Until then, God bless and take care. Oh, yeah. yeah. I feel a little chill because it's going to be woo, cool woo. in World 4. <laughs> All right. Later. Later. And welcome to Let's Play Super Mario Advance Part 3. This is Ron Moore, along with RGX, Star Soldier 1, and Tree. <laughs> yo, 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 what's up, guys? How's everybody doing? We're in the Iceland. And we about to rock it. Yep. We're just chilling here, baby. <laughs> yeah, we're in ECW uh, land. Yeah, I'm freezing my tits off here. <laughs> <laughs> my balls are blue as ever. <laughs> <laughs> Common hair. <laughs> What, what do you say, Jay? Oh, oh yeah, I'm pretty mad at Jay right now. Oh. <laughs> yeah. Uh, uh, now, now wait, wait a minute, RGX. I said Jay, not Angel. 
will steal. Uh, <laughs> well, see, Jay hacked Star Soldier's channel. That's why he's mad right now. Uh, <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. <laughs> this door. You get the mushroom here. All right, now part two got flags. Part two got flags, so we need to stop that because he's gonna flag us again. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. Uh. <laughs> yeah, so world four, the the ice level, pretty cold world to be in. Yeah, ice ice baby. Here's from a cold bastard. Yeah. And dad a lot of laggage on my end, so if I come off, uh, this in this like commentary, you apologize. Oh, it's fine on my side. Yeah. Well, my computer sucks. I don't have anything wrong on my end. Ooh. Okay. Ooh. You got the bubble gun. Yep. <laughs> Alright, we're a 4 1 clear. Yeah, this is a pretty uh, hard stage. I mean, if you're not careful, you can end up in a slippery situation. Oh, you can't gamble. No. Yeah. <laughs> now we pick the annoying brat toad. Well, he's not really annoying, he's just kind of useless to some people. <laughs> yeah. Pick the bone box. Ooh. Mouse. Yeah. <laughs> oh, it's in one up. <laughs> He's just third to stage. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, alright, there we go. Whoa. Don't slip on the ice. Yeah. This level was hard for me though when I was a kid. Of course on the original version. Be careful, Ronnie, you're on thin ice. <laughs> yeah, there it is. What do you say, Tree? I mean Martin? <laughs> oh, I, I think we're, we're getting there just fine. Yeah. No, no, I think we can let the kids play outside today. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> don't don't be barking up the wrong tree. <laughs> yeah, pe people listen don't know why we call them a tree. I don't know either. So... <laughs> oh, yeah. Well, I thought it was your name, Tree. <laughs> <laughs> Minecraft Tree. No. You, you can call me Minecraft oh, Tree. <laughs> dang it, that was stupid. I completely missed the one up. <laughs> you will call me my crash soldier. The toad. Or lawnmower in this case. <laughs> Curiosity killed the toad. Well, lawnmower, whatever. Yeah. <laughs> now we got Peachy. Yep. Yeah. Well, this is an interesting Trying to though. show off her manly <laughs> strength. Wait, she's a, wait, she's a woman? Wait. I don't think I think it's Peachy Keen in this level. <laughs> this man is kind of peachy and a little feminine. Oh man, this commentary has gone down a toilet. <laughs> <laughs> it was like, you suck in this commentary, I want my refund. <laughs> S2K, where commentary sucks. <laughs> ST2K, no refunds, get out. Oh dang it, wow, how about S2K where gameplay sucks? <laughs> I can't believe I just died right there like that. The SD2K, we have low expectations on gaming and our commentary. We sure do. The Uncrowned Rich You Pray, um channel <laughs> the, uh, the channel that oh dang it come on <laughs> well, it's just fun to watch people die i don't know about you guys people die. oh man yeah it's not yeah well, come and watch where uh watch the car crash and that's baby luigi would jinx <laughs> yourself i say i'm lucky you're gonna fall off a pit and die eventually sc2k where uh gamers fail i don't know <laughs> <laughs> oh, that bad. Gamers for the Come channel on, about their skills. We're gonna get through this. Yes, we will. <laughs> yeah, I already attitude. password. You do get through this. Don't worry. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> no. Spoilers. Uh. <laughs> Ooh, oh, oh, here we go. One. Watch out, Casper. The channel where gamers for their skills about save seats and such. Yeah. Ron Moore and we got. <laughs> and Gentoo. Yeah. Red ones are shy guys, right? Yeah, I think. What are the blue ones? Uh, <laughs> bashful guys. Bashful guys. All right. Whatever. I just wanted to know. Oh, dang it! Really? Doing... Oh, come on! <laughs> Jump oh, on top of it, throw them off. <laughs> you hit the light. I think I make it. Oh, I make it. I oh, make it. oh, oh. Man. oh. You should have kept the spatulas in the kitchen. Yeah. <laughs> uh, Alright, Chode, your turn. Oh, come, on, come on, you cholo. Hey, come on, jump on the- Oh, oh come on! <laughs> <laughs> you jumped on at least, but... <laughs> yeah. Oh, man. Yeah, this level was hard for me when I was a kid. I mean, this... 
This one again, Riddick is hard. Happen, then you fall into spikes. Here we go, finally. It, like they were hurting her. Yeah, watch out for Sonic. <laughs> watch out for Sonic look, before the pine. Yep, look, look out what he can do. Sonic the Hedgehog. Yeah. Does anybody like remember that? Alive. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> uh oh. Oh. Yeah. He's not in the bad game, finally. Once again, the mundane battle with Birdo. What? Why doesn't Princess Peach shoot her eggs? Don't let her warm me. Oh! oh. Shit! Oh, who put that there? That was cheap. Oh, yeah. Yeah, really. Oh, I think Bombman put it there. I know he's in this game. Oh, Phil. Come on. Oh. <laughs> I know. How about you throw it at Birdo, not below her? That's the that's the hard thing with Peach. You, you, the jumps, the fact that she floats in the air, it's like hard to land on the eggs properly. <laughs> Yeah. Oh, oh, come on. That was fail. And one more hit. I know. She definitely got her eights over easy. <laughs> yeah. Don't, don't say that. Don't she, say ended that. Up, <laughs> she ended up with an egg on her face. <laughs> she got spoiled eggs. Yeah. Her eggs got scrambled. Okay, that's enough. Um, <laughs> she got scrambled by the eggs. <laughs> <laughs> come on, Mario. She got egged off oh, by the bird. Come on, Mario, you're the star. Win. Uh-oh. Come on, you no, overweight don't. Italian dude. Don't fail us. I'll jump on the fire. Don't fail us like you failed in that movie. <laughs> oh. <laughs> hey, you went saying oh. space. You hit her bow. How's that a hit? Ah, finally. <laughs> she spouted she spout her bubble gum again. Yeah. Teacher caught her. <laughs> Alright, finally we get through World <laughs> 4 2. Yeah, who cares about the bonus? Just get to the next level. I don't care about the bonus before I even see anything. <laughs> just wanna do the next freaking level. <laughs> You're gonna do better this time. No. What? The heck? what? Whoa. Just pulled him out of the ground? <laughs> yeah. Why you killed a fat dude with a weed? What the heck? Yeah. How is that any more <laughs> realistic? <laughs> You threw a potion at it. <laughs> Cure with the love potion. Oh, we're already at the end of the level. There's Birdo. Yep. <laughs> oh, no mushrooms. Nope, you gotta jump on his egg that he shoots at you, or he or she you shoots at you. And... I think. Yeah. There we go. You're riding yeah, up over on Birdo, I threw a bird egg at you. You know who can stand on an egg and fly across the water? It's awesome. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's pretty cool. You can't, hey, you look, can... everyone, we're totally defying the laws of gravity by riding on an egg. Yeah, I mean, who else can do that? It's an object. That birdo is one bad egg. <laughs> oh, Whoa. no, I remember this. Hopefully. It oh, came man. out of nowhere. Whoa. I don't want cotton candy coming after me. I didn't know Kirby was in this game. It looks like yeah. cotton candy. Yeah. <laughs> it's white bat. <laughs> I'm going to pick you up and eat you. <laughs> Ooh, oh, dang it. Watch out for the spikes. I didn't really notice it before, but Luigi kind of sounds like a monkey in this game. Yeah, it sounds like an evil genius when he's laughing, though. Kind of. <laughs> yeah, he, I know. That's how he sounds in Mario Kart 64, also. And we got goes, no, he's not a drag queen. I go, that's how Luigi sounds like. <laughs> well, Mario Kart 64 and on here. Whoa, oh, uh, uh, I'm a Luigi. So I'm my one. <laughs> Give him a banana for Christ. <laughs> yeah. Well, look out. Yeah, for some reason. I don't know, when I was a kid, for the longest time, I thought Mario and Luigi were monkeys. Wow. <laughs> really? I don't know, look at them. I well, mean, they I... can jump really high, and they like bananas. Yeah, and I don't know. This... And Donkey to... Kong is a monkey, and they're part of the Donkey Kong series. I was like, if they're not human, monkeys. then what are they? I guess they are human, they just look half monkey-ish. <laughs> I don't know, let's not monkey around Let's get past this level. Dang it, speaking Chihuahua and the cast over here. And you got the Shy Guys and... Oh, 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 no, 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 ah, dang oh, it, now no. what? Ah, oh, that was smart. <laughs> I told you, he's laughing like a genius. See, the blue one would not, like not fall off, so I can't, I don't know what to do now. The blue guy won't fall uh, you off. Of course. Just throw him on the spikes, and then jump on him, and don't yeah. miss. <laughs> or do that. Yeah. Just let everything fall there, do we're gonna have a good time this time. <laughs> oh, 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 oh
That was stupid. <laughs> Let me pick up the... Do it again. Let me pick up the entry to all of them. So I could fall in the spikes like a complete blithering idiot. It's okay, you just wanted a threesome. Well, and yes. Uh, no. <laughs> no. <laughs> Alright, here we go. Say no to drugs, kids. What about the way stupid retarded... It's okay for us to do drugs, but not you kids. Yeah, we don't need to say no to drugs. Yeah, yeah. we're too mature for it now. Drugs <laughs> say no to us. Because we're the kids that's old enough. <laughs> Wait, we're kids? Yep. Yeah. I know a couple of drugs don't want anything to do with me. Yeah. We're kids at heart. Oh no, it's the evil pumpkin head. Yeah. yeah. I won't dress up as Darth Vader, I swear. I'm sorry. <laughs> mask. No! Come on, hit the freaking cotton it's candy. It's too late for you to wear a mask. Go away, Phantom of the Opera. Oh, look out. I'm surprised nobody has ever worn those kinds of masks to Halloween parties. Oh, I did. And I got arrested. Did, you did? <laughs> yeah, because they, they thought... Get some, the key back! <laughs> some idiot okay, cop... Arrested. Some idiot cop thought I was a real, the real Jason. Oh, no. And oh. got scared. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> that would be horrible. Get arrested. One more and gets arrested. Episode movie. one. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Have your own show about it. Yeah, really. Ron Moore, if I was a cop, I'd arrest you. <laughs> if it makes Ron you feel better. in jail, busted out. Yes, he does. <laughs> Game plays in jail. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> Ron Moore's <laughs> latest escape, the video game of 2012. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Get your copy of Skyrim. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> we're, we're, we're just gonna plaster your face as a pixel, you know? Make your head oversized and crack it. <laughs> An 8-bit image of your face. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Uh oh. Give you like a little toy gun to play with. <laughs> so who's the boss at this stage? Who's Looks the boss? Kind of ugly Bubble Man? He's got a bubbling personality. What is fire? Oh, a star soldier on fire. It's fire, fire. Oh yeah, baby, I got a little fire on you. Oh, I want fire! Oh yeah, oh yeah! This is fire and ice with the Game Boy Vance. <laughs> Spiced up a little bit. What do you say, oh, Chase? Oh yeah, I blow big oh. time. <laughs> I can tell this is just an epic battle of the making of it here. <laughs> yeah, this battle. Oh, oh. Luigi versus Fire Fire Eyes Mask. This battle is a lot harder on the original version. It is. Yeah. It's harder. It's harder. I think he gives you more power ups here. Yeah, that's probably why, because I mean, those once he splits up into like different fireballs. They jump around all over the place, and you think you're safe. Oh yeah, and then just when you think you're safe, they jump at you and you get killed. They hit you from the other side, or you try to throw the, the stools at it, and then you miss, and they jump at you, and it's like, oh, see, like, right here. Let's see if I can survive right here. Don't let them jump you. Oh, come on. Oh, no, 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 no. <laughs> Evil genius laughter for the win. Get Luigi, kill him. Yes, power-ups. Rip his heart out. Wait, whose side am I on? See, they move faster in the original version, I believe. Oh, you pong three at the same time. Oh, no, no. Yeah. Oh, fool. Close. Uh, kill those kids. ECW. Kill the children of the corn. Perfect. <laughs> Nothing corny about that as I kill beat... Kill the flamers of the corn. As I beat Iceland, or whatever it's called. We'll kill see you in fire. World 5. It was pretty hot in there. Well, I forgot what World 5 was. I don't know. Some sort of land. <laughs> Yeah, it pretty much just a remake of the first one. Yep, and we are running out of time, unfortunately. We will see you in part four. Till then, God bless and take care. Peace, guys. Thanks for watching. Woohoo! Welcome to Super Mario Advance Part Four. Here we go. This is Ron Moore, along with Al Hitler, Martin. Some idiot, uh, and J Man, and Wee Guy. Yo! What's up, an idiot? And in the uh, unlisted video here, I've spelled advance wrong. Advance, that's fail. <laughs> Sounds more advanced. Probably the beginning of many fa oh, yep. <laughs> it's, uh, many failures in this video. No, yep. bad. Yep, that's okay. Now we're on the right track. Luigi's you got toad. Oh, it's all Luigi's fault. You're like, screw him. We're on the toad. Now, now I'm playing as bear. Ah, oh, see, <laughs> bear. Getting worse, bear. Now we're just taking toad. Do we, wow, have to take, do we have to take a timeout? And that's the <laughs> let's play. Good night. Wait, 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 w
Now you get a woman to uh, do we it. Got, <laughs> we got further than bear. What? <laughs> oh my god. This is... This is Purple? No, I didn't. No, what happened was I just miscalculated there and. <laughs> I'm like, That's getting big I, I think things don't shoot, I think don't shoot that. I think don't shoot that far, and then I was like, oh, oops, N Miss. there we go. And all right, now. I'm, su I'm surprised you didn't stop recording and then just start again. Make <laughs> yeah, really, yeah. being all awesome. <laughs> yeah, I'm just like. We'll do it live and Texas. <laughs> yeah, we'll do it live. Uh, <laughs> oh, here we go. Leave it to Mario to actually do all the work. <laughs> oh man, always doing. You should have taken the coins. You could have gotten like that spinny thing. You could have gotten enough. Care about the oh, coins. Yeah. Yeah, the, lottery. the coins don't love you either. Well, good. <laughs> I didn't notice he does it back. So. Ah, dang it! Oh, dude. <laughs> oh, <laughs> Cause I thought I thought I'm starting used to the princess and floating, and I thought I was gonna float up there. And... <laughs> I believe I can fly. Um, we need to put like a death counter in the. Yeah, we need yeah. To... just like in forget Shellgate. Death yeah, I mean, counter Shell... should be in this video. <laughs> yeah, really. How many are we up to now? About five. All right, yeah, we got. Come on, we got. All right, super jump. Uh, yeah, you got Luigi, so it's gonna it's gonna be all right now. Yeah. Luigi knows the score. He was Luigi the first time, and he died as a bitch. Shut up. Right. So did everyone else. Oh, oh, everyone just died oh, as a bitch. I was dead there. Oh, come on. Uh, uh oh. Oh, I thought you were, I thought you were going to bite the dust again. Okay. Dang it. Now the video's lagging. The audio's lagging. I told you Damn. this video's just full of fail. <laughs> His bear's in it this time. Bite me. Yep. Oh, why are you pulling them up? What? <laughs> because I didn't get the mushroom on top of there, and so the... the I mean, the, the stool is going to block the mushroom from falling, so that's why I was like, forget stool. it. Stool? <laughs> <laughs> Alright, now we're fighting bear. I'm like, come on. I'm not Peter. a transvestite. Jeez. I'm yeah, it's like... able with both a penis and a vagina. Yeah. It's not like she was having a... Some kind an albino? What? <laughs> it's a white vagina. The only, the only, the only game where you can throw mushrooms at a green dinosaur and has an orgasm. Okay, what? Okay, that's a dinosaur. Is that a dinosaur? No, it's not a dinosaur. It's something. <laughs> yeah, a dinosaur. Dinosaur. Dinosaur that shoots eggs out of its mouth. <laughs> it's a freaky dinosaur. Oh, big shot, guy. He is a big shot. He is a big oh. show. Oh, what show? <laughs> the Super Mario Brothers Super Show! Ooh. No, that show sucked. But it has, uh, what's it, Captain uh, Louie Albano or something? Captain Lou Albano, Dick Wee. Albano? <laughs> I don't know, I don't know those names. You should never remember a name from the TV show, which you watched. I never watched. I what are you talking about? Four all the time. He wasn't even born yet, what are you talking about? Yeah, bear. Oh! Oh! oh yeah. Close. That's got bombed. If, if Nintendo wow. ever released a Mario dildo, yeah. he'd buy it. He'd buy all of them one. All of them. Probably. <laughs> <laughs> you brought it up. I bet you're you right, did. You're right. Hey, you're right. You're right. You're right. You're right. You're right. Ooh, ooh. That was completely out of line. Is that Sonic? Only if it was a uh, yeah. Only if it was a Luigi dildo. Luigi dildo. Back on topic, please. <laughs> Thirty-four percent off. We are on topic. This is about Mario. Ah, oh, dang it! Messed <laughs> <laughs> wow. up. It, it Just fell. gave up. Didn't even feel feel like going there. I don't think it died. I didn't, I, think think... It, I, I didn't think the mushroom was there, then it falls when I go back in the door. Apparently you didn't think anything in the did you? <laughs> <laughs> well, I think it's you Texas. need to shut up. I think Bear needs to say oh. more. Shut up for <laughs> yeah. this guy. Dildo, 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 dildo. Actually, take that back. Bear, say nothing. Pussy, pussy, yeah. dildo. That's not nothing. That's something. Nothing, 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 nothing. You want me to put an F on your report card? Nothing, nothing, nothing. An F for frail? Alright, E it is. <laughs> Oh. Hey, this be good, cool, can I keep my old, my old desk? Sure. Yeah. Take it. I'm taking it home and selling Ooh. it for booze money. What are this these guys called? Like, easier. Come on. Shut up. Quick <laughs> easier. You get one up like every five seconds, which Ronnie needs, obviously. <laughs> what the fuck is that? I, I don't understand why there's points. 
I'm still trying to figure that out. I don't understand well, why because, this weird. I mean, Skip movement. Rogers inspired points in video games. Uh, well, of course, yeah. Skip is the man. Four of them. Oh, yeah. that did a lot. Right? Yeah. yeah, I know. That was a what waste. Was the point of that. <laughs> yeah, come on, let's just know. get to the point. <laughs> come on. I should do a, should do a commentary on the wizard in the movie. No. <laughs> <laughs> Original! Shut up, we guy. No. <laughs> I am not condoning it, I'm just saying. You're just saying... I'm Mexican just saying stuff. that he is falling. You're Mexican. Oh, look out. He's falling, oh. he's falling. Oh, don't oh. tell me you... Oh, Hit the spike! Me. Hit the spike! Man, I hope I learned my lesson from the last Mario 2 playthrough. Yeah. You played oh. it? Oh! Apparently it did. At least you were prepared. <laughs> Yeah, at least I didn't die that time. Yeah, you could have scared yourself. No. Nope. Here we go. <laughs> He's gonna finish us off, who oh, knows? She's gonna finish. I swear this this whole game is a sex cavade. Oh, oh. The sex cavades of Mario's wet dream. <laughs> this is a dream. <laughs> Spoilers! <laughs> Shooting her ovaries at you. It is. Oh, well, like, no. oh, oh god, <laughs> ovaries. <laughs> no. Oh god. Okay, that was overboard. Okay. Channel. Over <laughs> I don't mean Kurt Russell. Uh, Point see, you, you, you would have been able to do the slot machines if you would have gotten some coins. Yes, yeah, I get about the slot machines. Especially there. Oh, oh, <laughs> oh, at least you got big again. You're just starting off every level all wrong. She can't handle big things. <laughs> oh, no, not this part. Oh, oh man. Jump, jump. Oh, what the hell? Get the cherries, get the cherries. Ah. Oh. What? What happened? God, that's what happened. <laughs> yeah, Jamie, what do you have to say about this? I'm happy. Oh, yeah, yeah, I mean, it didn't lag like this when I was recording, but when you play it back, it lags. It's Liar. Kind of for some reason. So stupid. Yeah, really. mm. Stupid Cam Studio. I'm, I just heard... I'm not heard. Movie, movie maker, I don't know. Ah, oh, come <laughs> on, <it's> stupid. <laughs> there it is. Like, like a game. What is this, a joke? <laughs> <laughs> you're the joke. Her. Yeah, you're the joke. It's little Luigi. Unlucky, unlucky, unlucky. This is Luigi's nephew. Yo, Luigi. Oh my god, he's That's like never had a decent game. Yes. Alright. Yeah, oh, go Luigi. Oh my youth. No, bear. How could it happen? I thought I would get into my pants on the first date. Ah, oh, dang oh, it. Wow. They came up right behind you. How did that die? Oh. Premature explosion. <laughs> Uh, <laughs> no comments there. <laughs> Dang it. Of course. Premature, keep your premature explosions to yourself. <laughs> I just can't but it just happened so quickly. <laughs> oh. Go, go, go. Go. Mm. Oh. oh. Kill it. Yeah. There you go. Doing good, oh. doing good. Revenge. Just, just the whole playthrough now. Let's play and we'll be good. <laughs> yeah. That's what happens when you use Luigi. Yeah. Oh! Luigi is my favorite character in this. Oh. Yeah, you, yeah, you're getting farthest with Luigi most of the time. Yeah, but I guess it's not. There's like no way that he can't access. I know. Hey, I was just you're getting the farthest with Luigi, what base are you on? <laughs> what? I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> what base are you on? <laughs> First. <laughs> but who's on second? Oh, jeez, oh, we're gonna get to Abbott and Costello. We're <laughs> going to Abbott and Costello. Wow. Abbott and Stella. That is a giant... Wow. Wild. Wow, that, that oh. hell? This version that was sucks. Bounce. That was bouncy. Yeah, this version sucks. <laughs> oh, here we go. It's too easy. Nice. What was the point of that? Ronnie can play it. But it's on the go! <laughs> what was you the point of that? You can take it anywhere. To be big. Uh-oh. Come on! <laughs> there's the there's the Ronnie we all know. Yeah. <laughs> Back again. Now with the little turd. I mean toad. <laughs> yeah, you'd like to be a little turd, wouldn't you? 
Nobody likes Peter Bad. He's uh, more than Dang it. But Bear. you'd go all Mac That's user. Fair, fair, do better. You'd go the Mac user on him. Makes sense, god dang it. <laughs> What'd I tell you about bringing the name of God into vain in my house, boy? <laughs> oh no. <laughs> What the hell? Oh. It both came out of it. Too many yeah. shy guys in one room for her. We both came at the same I don't know, whatever that means. I am real rusty at this game. Man, he called it a game. Hey, the longer you play it, the harder, or the worse you get. It doesn't get harder. Yeah, <laughs> yeah really. That's the thing about this game. <laughs> the the hearts that don't die. Oh, and... dang it. <laughs> oh. How? Oh, there's three of them. I thought they saw three. Oh, yeah. I guess your heart wasn't oh. wasn't in the right place in that one. <laughs> oh, <laughs> come on. Oh. I think Retchu uh, uh, Retchu Prey is knocking on our door. As if you did this on purpose. Come on. No, I didn't. I really did. <laughs> Retchu Prey feels too bad for us. They can't even let. They can't even retire. Oh. We gotta get past. Yeah, they're like, it's they're they're upload, they're, they're good. They upload the video on the channel. Said we're not even commentate on this. Just watch. <laughs> Are you <laughs> we're so bad that we're too we're too good for them. No. Oh, yeah, I got the coins. There, bear. We can there, trans bear. we can transcribe Happy? everything we said in this video and then just put it on text to speech. <laughs> <laughs> That's what YouTube closed caption is for. <laughs> no, I mean right. text to speech where Microsoft yeah. Sam just does a commentary for us. <laughs> Microsoft Sam is gay. <laughs> <laughs> you think everything's gay? Yeah, he's really gay. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, he came on to me a couple of times. <laughs> you made him say those things. Ah, that's the <laughs> ah, come on. Wow. I tried to get away. I tried to get away and not get blown up. <laughs> Stop getting blown. <laughs> oh, man. It's still not as bad as when I tried to play that, the Super Mario Brothers for the Wii. I played that with my wife. That was really painful. You have a wife? You still have a wife? Yeah, I have a wife. You have a wife? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> well, no. <laughs> I think I have two. I have two Wii's. Wow. Oh, come on. Oh, my God. Yeah, you've been wrong. He doesn't believe that, J-Man. <laughs> <laughs> I got a Japanese Wii. Oh man, what's sad is that the sound is ahead of the video, so you'll know. We already yeah. know that. Yeah, no. know. It's, it's just hard. Pretend. Just pretend. I never playing as Mandy. Okay, I'm pretending. We can turn the sound <laughs> off. Mandy can fly. I've seen her. She can't fly. <laughs> oh. Why did I do Because you said we don't like you. <laughs> fly like an eagle to the sea. Come on, come on, oh, come on, hurry, 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 get up there, yes, all right. Did you space jam today? Oh! <laughs> no, I was just listening to Steve Miller Band, that's all. Fly like Who? eagle. Paul Miller Band. Steve Miller Band. Paul Miller Paul Band. Miller is <laughs> <laughs> the Paul Miller Band, that's his cousin. Steve, Steve Miller <laughs> like. Steve Jaws Band. Oh, well. <laughs> Too soon, Bear. <laughs> yeah, dang it, Bear. Ah, uh, he Too sucked. Soon. Come on. Too soon. Yeah, but... Too soon. And stop buying his products. <laughs> oh, that's why I buy them used. <laughs> so that's still you buying his products. Ooh, turtle power. It doesn't matter, it makes me money. <laughs> yeah, what's wrong with giving real Americans real money, we guy? Exactly. What's as wrong as giving Canadians real money? Nobody wants You're your Hollywood. You're with Kaida, aren't you? Nobody wants I, Hollywood. Kaida? <laughs> Kaida? <laughs> Who? Is that, like, is that like your cousin or something? Is that like karate? You're with El Karate, aren't you? Sweep the leg, Donnie. El Karate. Oh, man. That's all I can oh, that was close. See, it's anyway. very slow that I'm dying. His commentary is anyway. messing me up. It's falling apart. It's slowing down. It can't keep up. Will we act here? Oh, here. oh my god! <laughs> I hate you, Ronnie. <laughs> yeah, I was afraid that bomb was gonna fall down and hit me. What bomb? Uh -oh. Uh oh, something happened. Oh. <laughs> 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 it like didn't advance any further. That was. Okay. 
gonna be this time. Oh, Mario, we you're going. The... Go, yeah, go, one Mario advance. So Mario, you need to advance in this game. He's getting no advancements. Mario doesn't know what he's doing. I'm not time. using Game Genie or ECW mode. Shut up. Finally. Yeah, finally. Give <laughs> me finally. I've only done that never. No. <laughs> Ooh, there we go. Yeah, I'm the day again. <laughs> hey, you totally never did that. Star Tropics. Hey, hey totally no one can beat Star Tropics without you. cheating. Nobody. That's how hard the game is. No. What about well, Skip Rogers? Not that hard. <laughs> Skip never played Star Tropics. There's no point system in it, so what's the point? He can make up his own point system. <laughs> oh, 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 dang it! Come on, oh. really? Oh, God. <laughs> <Stop> over. That's <laughs> right. Oh, 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 That's a good strategy. Oh, there we go. Come yeah. on, Ray. This hey, is hey, I listen to goal. Skip. I listen, I listen to Skip Rogers. If you can't beat it, time to huh? practice. <laughs> quit sucking. Do <laughs> the runaway tactic. I'll quit sucking the day you shut up. I'll stop, I'll stop. I'll stop. I'll stop shutting up when you stop sucking. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. No. I see. Where were they no, at? Where were they Go. This is a. Uh, if there's anything we can learn from this, is that seeing the future is not very good with gaming. <laughs> yeah, terrible. really. Well, I'll try that again in part five. Hopefully, we won't <laughs> fail as much then. Until then, God bless and take care. That's lasagna. That's lasagna. What? Mmm, yummy. Welcome to Let's Play Super Mario Advance Part 5. This is Ron Moore, along with the Wii Guy and the Star Soldier. Oh yeah, yeah. how's everybody doing out there? Doing great. And let's see if uh, I can fail less this time. Yeah, you better oh. do it this time. <laughs> yeah, really. <laughs> Lots of failures in Part 4. Let's see what happens in Part 5. That's alright, we don't got bear here, I think we'll be fine. <laughs> <laughs> I'm always talking shit. It's, it's almost part, sad at this, this point. Part right here's, this part right here is a pain, though. Not for no, me. it's not. <laughs> yeah, no. not for us. <laughs> We're pro. <laughs> yeah, this part actually looks a lot different than the original, at least on the 8-bit Nintendo. It's almost as if the yeah, graphics... The way you got the big trees. <laughs> yeah, I know. Yeah, the giant Goomba is the same. Or not the Goomba, the shiny guy. Yeah, there's no Goombas. This is, <laughs> this is nothing canon to the original Mario. Yeah, Mario? Yeah, the Super Mario Brothers. Mario. Maria? <laughs> or Mario. like we today and say, Mario. Yeah. Mario. Sorry about that, everybody. <laughs> well, I said that when I was a kid, and this kid got on to me about that. He goes, it's, it's Mario, not Mario. And ever since then, I, I said Mario. <laughs> I still say Mario. Yeah. I say screw them. Probably depends on your accent, I guess. Oh. Yeah, it's all accent. Yeah. Oh, Ooh, that was. Oh. That was just super jump right into that. Yeah, we that's a that. real bad death, eh? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I'm gonna yeah, have some maple syrup. Uh, get some Canadian bacon. Uh. <laughs> well, <laughs> have you noticed World One One is the only world. The only level where I got all five red coins. Oh yeah. <laughs> oh yeah. Totally remember that. <laughs> <laughs> well, I mean, it shows on the little level map right there before the stage starts. That star on on the level in the case I got all the red coins. Yeah, I think yeah. you guys had to watch like part twenty-seven of this to actually see all the red coins being. Uh, part twenty-seven. <laughs> How can be part twenty-seven? Not part six yet. <laughs> in well, the know. future. Oh, oh yeah. We'll somehow go <laughs> yeah. back further levels, and then we'll have to start over. <laughs> yeah, in the year 2015. In the year 2000. Hopefully we're still alive. <laughs> that, that, that's you know, that's cheap right there. How are you going to come from the top right there without a warning? It's called memorization. It's called plagiarism. Save state. <laughs> yeah, there you go. Save state. That's how, that's how, you, that's how you get rid of that. Yeah. But I'm a real man. I don't use safe states in my videos. But you're told you can never be a man. What? You're told you can't be a man if you're playing <laughs> oh, the I thought, said, I thought you said in your town you can't be a man. I'm like, what? what? This town ain't big enough for the two of us. Yeah, be the princess and be a real man. <laughs> yeah. 
Oh yeah, that's the. Hey, real I'm the princess. How you doing? <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> Post op. <laughs> you can play. You can play as RuPaul in this game. Oh no, RuPaul would be. That would be much worse. Oh look at. Oh, I remember this. Yeah, one. that's cheap. Oh look at. Oh, don't, ooh, don't blow up on me. Bomb. Yeah. Right. Or as Bear would say, he's, they would blow all over you. <laughs> Man. <laughs> God. <laughs> Dang it, get out there, man. Almost as a joke in itself to make fun of Bear. Yeah. But it's okay. Oh my god. MS Paint Room. <laughs> Alright, nice. You should shut the power. It's not finished yet. Yeah. Oh man. Watch out, watch out. You're gonna hit, you're gonna you're gonna hit, you're gonna get hit. <laughs> Ooh. Pro tip, enemy. Alright. <laughs> it's gonna respawn. <laughs> man, this ain't an NES game, you're not supposed to respawn. Dang it. It's a porn of an NES game, of an advancement of a Super Nintendo game, basically. Yeah. yeah. Alright, I think there's another one up here. It's like they can't make a new game. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Oh, 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 dang it. <laughs> oh, I love it. Oh, look at, oh, oh. Mm -hmm. Okay. Oh, it's gonna be up there. Oh. Oh, no, 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 no. Don't you jump into it. I will oh. laugh so hard. Oh, like hey. this. Oh, there we go. Oh, I actually want him to jump into it. <laughs> it's like Super Pitbull to jump now. into the bird. Yeah, me too. Oh. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> Here we go. Magic carpet ride. Yep. Negative Arabian stereotype. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Ah! Oh! Oh! There we go. A whole new world! It's world! A whole <laughs> new universe and Jasmine is looking pretty hot. <laughs> I don't get why people have that fascination. With the Disney princesses, I don't know! I just don't know. Video game princesses are better. I think. Who? A bird- Birdo! Fighting yeah. Birdo! <laughs> You know, on topic discussion. <laughs> oh, caught you! Ah. <laughs> it's funny that they recently confirmed that Birdo is a guy, but he sounds like a girl. It's fucked up. <laughs> okay, so now we fight this red lobster crab and rock lobster. Rock oh, lobster. Or is it Bubble Man? Hey, I hate to burst your bubble there, pal, but you're about to die. Yeah. Whoa! It does even look that much bigger. It's claw grip. <laughs> All right, this that is kind of a tedious battle. You know. Really? Cause this ah, looks like oh, pfft, oh god. There we go. Oh, oh come on! Yeah, we go. Get him! Get him! Get him! Yes. You want some hard rock? <laughs> oh, oh god! Oh. He's throwing rocks. Dang it! We got to shut the hard rocks. That wouldn't happen. <laughs> you know, I'm not barren talk about hard stuff. He's not here. Yep. Well, someone's got to fill in lobster? for that. Space yeah. lobster? Yeah, how's that Thank song going now? Oh, here we go. Was, wait, we were... Fuck. Rock lobster! <laughs> oh, I, I just discovered that actually woman went. singing like a banshee. Alright, come on Mario. We were all at a beach and we had a fuck why am I even trying? I don't even I don't know the lyrics. It's from the nineteen seventies, so I don't remember. I was like two years old in the seventies. No, all I know and is you guys weren't even born then, so... No, I'm just, uh, you're you're uh, an old man talking about the 70s. <laughs> no, yeah. Come on, you're the man now, dog. You're the man now, dog. Yeah, thank God Sean Connery is even older than I am. Uh, that guy is like... Back with your mother last night, Trebek. <laughs> yes. Now shut up. Ow, 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 ow. Yeah, beat that rock. I was there. Head stop. Ooh, <laughs> nice. Ooh. Haha, <laughs> uh -huh, you could say that that was a clawless battle. Clawless yeah, victory. Flawless. Like, flawless. He's, flawless <laughs> he's got claws. <laughs> Never mind. <laughs> We're gonna have lobster tonight. Yeah. 
finally defeated World 5. Now to World 6. Or cease. Only five more stages to go. Yeah. I like to take the super secret hidden awesome warp. How about no? How about now? How about <laughs> real man don't warp? But they use ECW you? mode. Use a princess then. For what? <laughs> to warp. Oh, I said real man don't warp. She's not mad. Yeah. Oh. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I thought she was. Okay, you use man. turtle to warp. <laughs> oh, ah, oh, come on, Pokey. Quit poking around. This isn't Earthbound. <laughs> <laughs> you got like a, oh, aha, uh -huh, you missed me. Stupid flower. Oh, thanks. Why? What's the point? <laughs> oh, I thought I was gonna get something. No, just really, what's the point of those even being there? If they're just gonna oh. be nothing. Oh, oh dang, I forgot about that. <laughs> you thought nothing was gonna be there? It's gonna be all fine. Yeah. Yeah. I actually it's forgot something. that I was going to be there, too. I didn't. I just didn't want to tell you. Because <laughs> it was pre-recorded! Uh, oh, yeah. <laughs> uh, what do you mean we're actually watching this again? <laughs> yes. <laughs> no. This is live. Even yep. if someone clicks play, a few days later, it's live. It's live We're actually them. playing this right now, honest. Yep. Wow. <laughs> I'm Toad, who just died, Star Soldier kind of Snake, up, and we got the Shy Guy. I am Shy, how'd you shy know? Shy Guy 309. There's no numbers anymore, I'm it's just Shy saying. Guy. The Shy Guy. Hey, his sound. That's not what your YouTube channel says. <laughs> just because the YouTube name is that doesn't mean that that's what I have to be. Uh, in real life, YouTube, your YouTube channel reflects your life. Without YouTube, you would die. I'm a real star soldier. <laughs> you're, you're true, it's true. <laughs> and I'm a real ROM mower. Yeah, I'm a real wee guy. Wee wee. I got some ROMs to mow. <laughs> wee wee, I get it. <laughs> yeah, Peach is pretty much almost the best. I mean, oh, idiot. she can fly, or hover. Yeah. yeah. When pigs fly. Yeah, too bad she's always getting kidnapped. I'm gonna play as her again. Yeah. I wanna play with her. Uh -huh. <laughs> oh yeah. Oh no, let's not no, let's not do this again. <laughs> hey, this last time. again. There are all of them? <laughs> Don't you remember the early part of the video? Do what? Yeah. There's gonna be part six, isn't there? Hmm. No, we're gonna beat the game in set in fourteen minutes. <laughs> oh <Yeah>. what? <laughs> Come on! Oh my god, no way. <laughs> what is that? No way. That's gonna be part seven. How many deaths are going to be in this video? I How many be lives? Part seven. Never since Shadowgate for the NES LP have we had to have a death counter. Okay, we'll have a death counter here. Well, there's not... It's not as easy as in Shadowgate. Dang it, what is that? Oh. It's a big thing. Oh! Yes! Dark, dark. Yes. Really, like, it's really going to even help you here. <laughs> yeah, I don't know which one to go down. Oh, okay, no. Just wasted this, star power. Okay. It's gonna be snake, it's gonna be snake. Oh. No, I'm just trying to get that. Go down that one. And, ah. Uh. Go down the one that has the key. <laughs> <laughs> Which one's that? Maybe this one. The, the right one. Ah. Uh, really? Could be one up. You never know. I don't care. I think there's oh. supposed to be one up in one of them. I want the daggum key. God, oh my god. Yeah. Don't jump, don't, oh shh. Ah, uh, let's go down this one, or? Oh, hey, see? Oh, yeah. right. oh, 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 oh. Ooh. Oh, wait, this is, oh, this is yes. it. You did it. You did it. <laughs> Watch there be there play at the bottom. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> That'd be horrible. That'd be a horrible tease. It'd be funny, though. Oh, it's just that stupid mask. Yeah. Oh, he's not gonna do anything to that. Oh, shit, son. <laughs> Banto! Oh, oh, oh! Yeah. That thing used to freak the hell out of me. I hated yeah. that mask. I mean, here you are, just trying to do your business, and I don't know where this fucking mask just starts coming to... Ugh, God. Scary. It's the mask from Splatterhouse. Yeah. <laughs> it's 
the Jason mask. Is Rick, uh, wherever is... <laughs> oh! I thought you were gonna get hit there. I think oh, he just flew, it actually flew away from me. What? Yeah, I know, I was freaking out. Hit me. That would be cool as a sequel, Super Mario Bros. Vance 2. The mask gets on your face, and you get a whole bunch of 2x4s and kill a whole bunch of mutants. Yeah. Yeah. The best thing we could, the best thing for that is a Flash game. That, yeah. you know, centered around that. Ah! Better not yeah, fuck uh, up. Fan, fan, Fantas- Fanto Mask. What is his name <laughs> of the game? Oh, oh come on! <laughs> oh, God, I predicted it. man. I knew it. What's his name? Phantom Mask? Fanto? Fanto. Maybe a Fanto. Yeah. Fanto's Big Adventure. <laughs> game would suck. It, <laughs> no way. Yeah. It'd be similar to Zombie Nation. Oh. Fanto Nation. I know it's gonna shoot that quick. I thought he wasted... He or she wastes two, three seconds for shooting the first fireball. I guess because it's green, it's a little bit faster. I don't know. Yeah, it's... Um, laws, it's green. My baby mother said I need to, um, shoot faster. Ready for you, Shut up. I'm ready for you, sweetie. <laughs> My name's Beth. And I like to ride horses. <laughs> really? Got 100 now. <laughs> I, I go. I like Beavis. Do, uh, do, 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 do. <laughs> All right, finally two six one. Let's see how it's the woman had to do it. I also team to six two. Here we go. The main man Mario. Oh yeah, I remember this one was pretty tough. Yeah, how tough <laughs> is it? We're gonna die a lot here. Well, Ronnie is uh, not me. I just gotta commentate and stuff. This is easy. <laughs> it's not, it's not easy. <laughs> I don't know what to do. Ah, oh, dang it. Get it, can you get it, can you get it, can you, uh, no, you cannot. Alright. Aw, oh, maybe this part. Aw, oh, man. Yep. This Wrath of the Black Manta part. Really? Yeah. There was a platforming flying bird section? Yeah, you remember? Oh, no. Uh, it's mom. Yeah, where'd you have uh, the kite or something? Yeah, well, that's what I mean. Like, that part, you got flying sky just at night, just reminds me of that part. Oh. Yeah, I was only on one part, which was my first part in that LP, or first time ever on the Testy 2K. Yep. yep. Well, actually, it would have been Dirty Harry, but, yeah, whatever. Yeah. Look out. Doesn't matter. Yeah, it's not worth it. Don't get that. Okay. No one has where they get it. <laughs> face isn't worth it. Oh! You want to be the king of champions? The king of champions. <laughs> <laughs> no. I just want to beat the game. Ooh, God, giant... Oh, 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 oh. Pfft, oh, ah. oh, we still got the Oh, one. you still got one up. Yep. yep. Alright. What the hell's that giant shark guy doing there? Yeah, that's what that's you said. That's what you said last time. Yeah, that's what you said last time. You said last world. That's what I said this last time. Ah, what? Glitches? That? that was weird. Man. Cheating. 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 Oh god, come on, no, 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 Oh! Come on, man! All of that. Man, that's cheating right there, y'all. Saw that? It's a glitch. That's all, yeah, it's all about getting... You just got cheap to there. It's supposed to extinguish the fire when you throw it at it. Come on. Yeah, block extinguishes fire. Good logic. It does. In this game. Yeah, I'm ready for you this time. Come, come under, come under. You should, Don't yeah, start it. Okay. Yay. Do it! Yeah, go, 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 go! Get the other one, get the other one! Oh my god, Ronnie! Don't you fucking die! To emphasize the <laughs> part where you shouldn't fucking die. Shut up, I won't die. <laughs> die, I mean, die, 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 die! Get him! No! <laughs> oh, shit, shit, shit! Oh, oh, nice. oh I mean, congratulations. Yeah, Phantom comes out of nowhere and kills you. <laughs> Congla- congratulations. Nice. Oh! Oh! Oh, <laughs> oh my god, no, oh, I was expecting that you would get killed by that. Ah, uh, yeah, horrible for you, but hilarious for us. <laughs> Remember, right, it's not about you, three. it's about you. <laughs> We're not laughing at you. Uh, well, never mind. 
<laughs> Are you gonna use the shortcut here or? No. Oh. Well, come on, I'm a real man. Hey, he's almost there anyway. Just fuck it. Yeah. Oh. Oh. Dang it! Oh. That was a really good spot. <laughs> You know, as someone with side commentary, or like as in, when you're recording the footage here, you should also record yourself and you should <laughs> hear what you're saying when you're recording. It's like, oh, that was bullshit. It's like, yeah. oh my god, running square. Just commentary within a commentary? Or... No, 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 the commentary is for something separate. Oh. Like, how, what, you, how, what you're saying when you're... Well, that, that's what, that's the whole point of our commentary. Well, I just want to hear what your commentary is. <laughs> well, you are now. <laughs> What's commentary on the commentary? <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Okay, dark screen two one seven. Did he do that? Yeah, I think the commentary of a commentary make fun of their commentary or someone else's commentary. <laughs> commentary section. Yeah, we need to get the rest of play guys on here to see what they say. Yeah. Rest you play? <laughs> yeah, those are yeah. Those see guys are here. Yeah. yeah. Bomb. These guys suck. I can't believe it. Oh my god. Yeah. Why does Star Soldier sounds like he's drunk? <laughs> oh, that's not a surprise. Because he was. Why does Minecraft Martin sound like he's drunk? Oh, wait. Yep. Oh, does J-Man sound like he's drunk? Yeah. Oh, oh, wait. <laughs> and who's this guy? Weed guy? Yeah, why well, is weed? Who's this idiot Ron Blower? Ron Blower? What does he do? Mow Rons? That make no sense. He even not play these games right. He keeps dying every five seconds. Yeah, who's this gay bear 13 guy? These guys, get these guys. Oh. <laughs> Uh, two girls went inside of him. Who, who are these idiots? I feel even bad for them if they saw that one. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Who's and they idiot? say that's not how you play the game, guys. <laughs> Who's this idiot that keeps throwing up here in five seconds? <laughs> <laughs> That'd be hilarious if there was like. It's a, it's a, what, the, what? Oh, I see what you're doing. Wait, what? What, what are you doing? Oh. oh. <laughs> <laughs> Stupid. What? <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> oh my god. No! Oh, yeah. Hey, Craig, my saliva again. What the hell? That's stupid. That right? that was... <laughs> it's like, we're definitely being retro played now. Yeah. Yeah, we're being played with now, this. I'm the one being retro played by my own fellow commentators. Well, you better pray for that. <laughs> let's let's do a live retro play of someone right now. You're not doing it right, Ron Moore. Yeah. <laughs> It's not ever, the way it's supposed to be played. <laughs> That's all, what, what they always do. How do game play? It's not how you play the game. And how do you play the game? It's all about the game and how you play it. All about control and if you can take it. It's all about debt and if you can pay it. Yeah, it's all about yeah, the pain and who's going to get you from playing all these games. Star yeah. Soldier. <laughs> I am the no. game. Well, I don't really play video games. Yeah, I just, I just, I like, just, just collect them. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> just spend That's what money. people do, actually. When they go to my store, they, they just buy games just to buy them, and they don't actually play them. Me? That's so I weird. Mean, at least so That's, I can play through them. That's well, they like to collect, so do I. I like to get games. I mean, I try to play them when I can, but at least once since I bought them. But, I mean, it's like, you just want to have the game, especially a game used to have. And, like, recently I bought Star Wars Shells of the Empire. For 64, I don't think I ever owned that game. I just played it and was like, oh, cool. I mean, I gotta get that. And other games I haven't played in years, like Mario Lemieux Hockey or Joe Montana Sports Talk Football. Like, oh, cool, they have it. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> Mario Lemieux Hockey is good to own, but it's not good to play. <laughs> Blades of Steel's best hockey game. Yeah, that one's I, cool. I, I like when you fight in that game, but I guess you do that in all hockey video games. Break yeah. the pass. Break the pun. I thought he said, uh, yeah, I never knew what he said. I thought he said, break the pun. <laughs> That's what it sounds like to me. Break the pun. We're a great basketball for the second match system. Goes, out of, out of, I was trying to say out of bounds. I said, out of, out of bones. <laughs> out of bones? Oh my god, he needs bones stat. It's hard to do voiceovers in 8-bit games. Well, it's hard wibble to wibble. I'll make him sound good. Yeah. This one is, uh, the adventures of Bayou Billy. But don't play oh, we're 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 <laughs> Oh, make your, make your selection now. Uh. <laughs> and that's your 52 actually sounds like the best one. Yeah, really, that's no, kind no, of no, 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 no. no, dirty. But they got everything else wrong. 
<laughs> oh yeah, Dirty Harry. Dirty Harry had the best one. Yeah. That's the only good thing about that game. Had a pretty decent voiceover. Go ahead, punk. Make my daddy. <laughs> I know what you're punk. This game sucks. <laughs> That'd be funny if you said that. That'd be funny if they may find their own game. <laughs> this game sucks. Go ahead. There, there kinda is a game. Go ahead, punk. Play this game. I know what you're thinking, punk. You thinking that about a good game or a bad game? Well, to tell you the truth, there, I, see Simon, I kind of, lo kind of uh, lost track myself. <laughs> I don't know. My game sucks. Man, this is an 8-bit <laughs> magnum. The most powerful cartridge in the world. It will blow your system clean off. And that's kind of a game like that. Just as in, it doesn't make fun of itself, but there's one. It, it's, I think, I don't know, it's a puzzle game. Like, I think it's... They said it was Clax, and they said at the end, when you reach all the levels, it says, uh, we didn't have an ending for this game, so we never thought someone would make it this far. <laughs> like, 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 they actually uh, put that. They said it was that, Clax. I think they're talking about the game is hard. Yeah, it's one of those puzzle games, so it has like 100 levels. It's one of those games. Anyway, we totally missed the commentary over this battle, but I defeated... Uh, <laughs> Bowser 2. Yeah, Bowser 2. Finally, yeah. the world... Oh, we're finally playing the casino! Yep. yep. And, carry you uh, oh, well. You we'll see you guys in part 6. Until then, God bless and take care. Alright, thank you for watching, y'all. Please I don't love... rush your playlist. <laughs> yes, let's play. We're gonna get, we're gonna support we're gonna get supported by Ooh, yeah. something. Oh yeah, like we're, <laughs> I'm gonna be star shitter. We guys gonna be made fun of for being called weed guy, and yeah. lawnmower is gonna be called I don't know lawnmower. Rumblower. Rumblower. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> right. it's not, these aren't actually not too bad nicknames to be getting. I mean, come on, it could be a, lot, a whole lot worse. Yep. <laughs> oh, don't think of something. <laughs> oh, they, they will. Yeah, comment below if you can think of something worse. <laughs> <laughs> Actually, don't. <laughs> yeah, just put it on our channels. Yeah, lost. Why is this dragging on? <laughs> I don't know. Lost take? No, it's just we got we got to end this. We do? I don't know yeah. why it's to end. Yeah. <laughs> oh, I got nothing else to do, honest. Well, <laughs> <laughs> neither do I. <laughs> okay, well, and then I got nothing else to say now. See you all later. Bye. <laughs>
Force. It's almost like it's a remake. Yeah. <laughs> I'm ready for your fifth time. Uh, uh, as we fight Bear, we're get, let's get out. Oh. Bear's looking pretty with the bow in his head. Yeah. I want to see, uh, forget Star Soldier and Jay, I want to see Bear versus Jay. <laughs> well, that won't turn out well. They'll probably just be tired once they start. <laughs> I don't know. Didn't, didn't that happen in, uh. <laughs> Yeah, you know, Genji set that match up on a um no <laughs> Mercy, 1064. Yeah. Yeah, that'd be a that'd be a ridiculous match. <laughs> <laughs> it would take forever. Nobody wants to make a move. Oh. Yeah. Uh, you Hard. go first. I just want rest in the corner. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so in the corner. Ah uh, yes. Uh, here we go. Seven two. No offense, Jay. <laughs> no offense. Well, he doesn't watch us anymore, so we don't need to say anything <laughs> else. Oh no, we should say more now that he's not watching. <laughs> I think he is. He has to post a comment. No, 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 no I'm different. But you know what? Uh, that's embarrassing. Back before YouTube or Google started cutting back on dead accounts, he posted a comment on my channel saying congratulations on 600 subscribers. But then YouTube got rid of the dead accounts, and now I'm like 577 subscribers. And that comment's still on there saying, congratulations on 600 subscribers. <laughs> yeah, I think I've done to about 500 too myself. <laughs> that was reduced like 100, but that's not too bad. Could be worse, yeah. could have been yeah. worse. Yeah. Oh well. Yeah, so half Skip, of them were my own fake accounts. Skip actually maintains his subscribers somehow, even though he's retired. But anyway, after this game, the final stage. Finally. What? It's not 7-3? <laughs> no, I don't. Oh, it's weird. It's like, it stopped at 7-2 for some reason. Instead of 7-3, but oh well. They ran out of ideas for a final level. Forget the last of the stage. Forget 7-3. Ah! Yeah. They ran out of ideas. <laughs> <laughs> Just caught the last stage. <laughs> oh, man. These yeah, guys get my freaking nerves. You get on my freaking nerves. I'm just kidding. Your face gets on my freaking nerves. Well, you can't even see my face, so... Yeah, yeah I can if I go to uh, your Facebook. <laughs> I don't even have a, my profile picture. -er, see, you so messed me up. Face. Well, do better. Do better. Come on. <laughs> it's okay. I already passed oh! forward. Do better. Oh, that was close. You almost dropped the bomb on that one. Yeah. Well, he threw the bomb, but whatever. <laughs> yeah. yeah, I already passed forward. You complete it. <laughs> <laughs> Spoilers. Oh, the re but, you know, <laughs> I can't say about who's a new. Keep on watching. Oh, the, uh... It's not like they probably have seen this two other times. <laughs> I have to remake the, remade the music on here of the stage. Uh, of these stages. It's been throughout the whole game, but it's pretty cool. Yeah, yeah. It still sounds the same. It still sounds like the Super Nintendo version. Well, yeah, I'm talking about it's a remake of the NES version. Is what I mean. Oh, okay. I thought you were talking about like the Super Nintendo version. Stupid. That's what I'm talking about because that pretty much is like that's that this music that sounds definitely. Oh, you're insane. stupid. I would I wish they had Metallica in here or something. That would have been some awesome remix music. <laughs> James Hetfield. Denny's Mario. Oh, oh to Never Never Land. Yeah. <laughs> this is Never Never, never land. land. This is Dreamland. Yeah. So. Dreamland. Dreamland. Yeah. Not Kirby. Shut up. <laughs> this time, no boss down music. Get the freaking eggs. <sighs> so at least it broke out the boss music. It was just like, oh, it was just cute. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, it's a trainee on a tractor. Oh. A train? <laughs> oh man. A train down the track. Or uh, yeah. a conveyor belt. Yeah. And it's a tractor. <laughs> I don't know. I like I like tractor because it works. A train down oh, the tractor. Yeah. Don't die this time, oh. idiot. Oh. Oh, there we go. There we go. It's over 2,000. <laughs> we need more points. Your score's are actually almost <laughs> over 9,000. Your score is actually so close to not over 9,000, literally. You almost just need 9, 70 000. points. Uh, oh. Oh, oh no! Hold on a second. 
It's over 9,000. You did it. Power up here. There we go. Power up. Oh, Get come up. on. I think it's gonna sue us now. Oh, yeah. Ah, screw him. <laughs> there we go. Oh, Already? they've been screwed for years. Yeah, I was about to say, haven't they been actually been kind of been screwed for years? Yeah, Ever Mario's since kicking their ass. Especially with his sucky Sonic. <laughs> yeah, put the mushroom block on the orb. Oh, That's cool. Oh, God. Ah, oh, idiot. Don't jump on top of it. They gotta fight the eagle's mouth. It's the eagle raptor. It's weird that this was the first Mario you could jump on it. <laughs> yeah. Put your money where your mouth is. There we go. You got a big mouth. Open wide, baby. <laughs> yeah, put your coins where your mouth is. Here we go. <laughs> the final battle in the Lego room. All right, Spout. What? It's not Bowser. It's, it's Pimple. <laughs> I mean, I mean Rash. I mean Zits. No, wait. It's Warp. Oh, moron. Jesus. Isn't that a surprise to Mario people? They're like, oh, I can't wait to fight Bowser. And then you get this guy, and it's like, what the? Just trying to rip off Bubble Man. Oh wait, this game came out first, did it? Yep. Oh yeah, never mind. Ah, oh, what? Come on, Ron, it's the final battle. <laughs> I know, that's why it's the hardest. Oh, yes, finish it off with Luigi. Let Luigi crown the victory. He has He's crown only victories. <laughs> no, he's crowned a lot of victories. I believe he, I'm the secondary character. Well, shut that up, better on them. Uh, I mean, a starter soldier. <laughs> Fail. You both make fun of him, so it doesn't matter. <laughs> oh no, he's going for a what was that yet? Seems all right. I actually enjoyed playing as him in Mario 3 because I guess for a change. <laughs> yeah. See, take that, haters. Oh. Now I like the color green, so. Looks like you're seeing green. Which is me, which is why me and green are good friends. Yeah, that's what I say. It's like green and green, yeah. Long balls. You like me because it's not the same color or Dang something? <laughs> Dang, son. Come on. Yeah. Yeah, remember kids, don't eat your veggies. They're gonna kill you. Yeah. Ooh! Those silly Japanese. <laughs> oh, come on, isn't that five? I think just one more. What is that, like a weight scale back there? It's weird. Yeah, it needs, Ward needs to know how much he weighs. Or it's something. like a, a freaking Olympic stand where Kurt Angle's gonna stand up there in a minute and collect his gold medal. Finally. Yes! It's curtains for him. <laughs> well, I use that joke in Mario 3. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it worked better there because there were actual curtains. Well, there's curtains back there too, that's why I said that. Anyway. Well, it looks like this is. In South the, of Church. Uh, oh. Uh, yeah, that's religious terminology. You can't use that, Nintendo. <laughs> yeah, even though it's just a bunch of square, uh, triangle stuff. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I'm Jewish, and that's very oh, offensive to me. He's, he's actually bleeding? Yep. Yep. Wow, blood, blood and Mario. Alright. Uh, Luigi's the MVP. Yes! Fuck yeah, go Luigi, you're the freaking man! Winning with seven over all those other stupid heads, yeah. Ooh, you still suck, Luigi! It's funny, Toad got the least, ha ha ha. But it was you all in your game, man. Huh? It never happened! It happened in his head. Happened in his dreams. You know, yeah. I'd be... I'd be pretty pissed off too if I dreamt uh, all, all, all that. Well, at least you didn't have a nightmare of the of the movie. If you dreamt oh, the movie, that would be a nightmare. <laughs> what are you talking about? That yeah, movie like Freddy Krueger. I'm gonna get you, Mario. Yeah, really. <laughs> Don't forget the power glove. Nice movie, Mario. <laughs> that would be awesome, Mario Cross um, uh, Nightmare on Elm Street, the Freddy Krueger. <laughs> Yeah. An awesome yeah, problem. Mario's pretty famous, so he should sell out more. <laughs> Just sell out, Mario, come on. Yeah. He's already done it over 200 times or something. Yeah, yeah Jason know. Voorhees, you know, and Freddy versus Mario. And Mario can go all Italian. Yeah. I'm going to blow these guys up. Screw this up. <laughs> what the fuck? Yeah. I saw his... I light your asses on fire. Here's, here's the enemies now. Albatross? Yeah, we start off? 
Spark. That, Spark. That was, that's Spark. his name. Oh, okay. It's Sparkman. Con Sonic. Yeah, I already knew that. I was just waiting for you guys to get it. Pokey. <laughs> He's on Facebook a lot. Also... Earthbound? Damn that bastard. Did they get it right right here, or are they still messed up with Ostro? Nope, it's right. Birdo was actually Birdo, and Ostro was Ostro. Alright, good. So they got it right in the remake about time. That's funny. It, was, uh, it almost seems like they would have just, you know, copy-pasted it and been like, Oh, we're not going to change anything. <laughs> There's someone new, Roberto. <laughs> Roberto was added. But, so on Mario All-Stars, did they correct that mistake? Birdo and Ostro? Nope, I think it's still Birdo and Ostro. Are the, oh. It's still wrong in that version. Well, at least they corrected I on think, here. I think. And Someone convert Ward. that. Let's go back and watch that LP. Oh, wait, it was my bear. Never mind. <laughs> There's Ward. The only time you'll ever see him in a game, to my knowledge. He was also in Link's Awakening. Well, yeah, that was like... <laughs> nobody remembers that. Yeah, I never knew that. <laughs> he's also going to be in the new never Smash Bros. Look for him to him soon. <laughs> I never replay the game, though. But anyway, yeah, so there you go. Now it's time for the Let's Discuss of Super Mario Advance. And what can we say that we haven't said about Mario 2 already? I mean, it's basically Mario 2 on steroids. But uh, the the differences are um, it's just uh, like they, some of the items are big, some of the enemies are huge, and uh, there's even a new boss in the game, Robobert, Roberto, whatever. And so, yeah, I mean, it, and the voice acting is pretty hilarious. It's pretty fun at the time when the Game Boy Advance came out and, you, and uh, they released... Uh, Super Mario Advance, and I seen pictures of it. I think in Nintendo Power magazine at the time, and I was like, "Yeah, I want to, I want to get this game, even though it, it's pretty much Mario 2, but it'd be cool to play on a portable system." And it's not exactly the same. I mean, it's real similar, of course, to the uh, Super NES version of Mario 2 from All Stars, but with a few uh, uh, added cool stuff in it, like you know the voice acting and. And uh, giant items and some of the bonus rooms, even though those are kind of lame. But anyway, um, yeah, and so, I mean, it's still a fun fun game. I, I got I bought the actual cartridge, uh, I think a few months ago, at a local game store. So, yeah, Super Mario Advance, still pretty awesome. I have to give it maybe an 8.5 out of 10. We got? All right. Yeah, I pretty much have to pretty much agree with all you said, you know. What have, I mean, we've pretty much spoken about Mario 2 already, you know, two times already, but, of course, this is the steroid version where everything is bigger. And that's true. Everything's a lot bigger. <laughs> Maybe it's because it's on that uh, small Game Boy screen and stuff, and they have to zoom in stuff. But, um, yeah, I mean, just it, pretty much the cool thing about it is that you can play Mario 2 on the go, and there's that extra stuff at the end where you can find all the uh, Yoshi eggs, right? Oh, yeah. yeah extra the, I forgot about that. There were red coins. I forgot to mention that. Oh, yeah. It's those. Wait, did you say coins? Well, yeah, that's what they are. The red, those giant red coins. You got to collect five of them each level. Oh, oh, no, 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 no. Yeah, those are what you... Those big coins. Yeah, you already... You already do that, but after you beat the game, you have to collect Yoshi eggs, actual Yoshi eggs. You use the, you know, lamp or the magic potion, and you find them. Uh, oh. And there's, like, three in each level. I never knew that. Yeah. I mean, I thought, I mean, haven't you had it and beat the game, and you found that out? Because then afterwards on the top screen, there's, like, a shit, there's a Yoshi egg just moving around, and then there's this extra, like, quest to find all the eggs. I don't think I played it after I had beaten it. I don't think I played it again, so oh, wow. I don't know. Either that, I just don't remember. I have to go check that out. Well, there is that, so that's, like, the cool added thing about it, and um, just how it also includes Mario, the original Mario Bros. Uh, arc, uh, arcade yeah. game, or it's it's in, you know, it's ported into the GBA, but uh, still, yeah. that's cool. And, um, yeah, I mean, it's it's Mario 2, and it's cool. It's on the go. It's, it's pretty neat, and I probably have to give it a, um, I think I've, Given the previous ones about like an eight out of ten, you know, and it's, it's a great game, still good on the go. GBA, Star Soldier. <laughs> All right, yeah, it's great to see this one back in action again. I love the crisp new colors and they added sound effects and you know, Berno talking at all. It's pretty cool. <laughs> it's pretty much the same game though. You still got the twenty levels from the original. Just some things are we worth and all, or you get I don't know giant. Uh, have items you can throw, you get a new point system, and there's the red coins to collect for add replay value, but it's pretty much the same game with a new coat of paint. I would love to see like more levels too, like instead of like the original 20 levels, hey, we get you 20 extra levels too. 
But no, it's pretty much the same game. Just more stuff added on to it, but still great game overall. If you missed the original on the uh, on the original 8-bit Nintendo, here's a you know great place to start, especially with the add save feature and more goodies to find. And that's why I give it about an 81 out of 100. If you love your Super Mario Bros. and <laughs> you thought Super Mario Bros. 2 was kind of underrated, here's a good way to relive that experience all over again. But uh, be warned, it is a re-release and not a full-fledged new game. Like this, isn't, this isn't Super Mario Vance Dash 2 up Hyper Edition fighting or anything like that. This <laughs> is a remake. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Almost seems like yep. it, because it's Super Mario Advanced. <laughs> yeah. Okay. But you would think it would be called Super Mario Bros. 2 Advanced or something. Yeah, and I think the other, the yeah, other games that follow were like Super Mario Bros. Uh, 3, Yoshi's Island, or so, I don't know. They, they... Yeah, there was Super Mario Advanced 2, Super Mario World, and then Yoshi's Island for the third one, and Super Mario Bros. 3 for the I'm third one. I'm chronologically confused. <laughs> it's only four. It's not that hard to get them out of order. Yeah, that's <laughs> Nintendo for you. Let's forget about making a new game room. We release old ones. It's in money. Yeah. But it's great. But they're but they're all great, you know. Mario 2, Mario World, Yoshi's Island, Super Mario 3. I mean, come on. That's a perfect, <laughs> yeah, they're, it's a nice little... They're cool them. games and all, but I just love to see Earthbound 2 one these days. <laughs> At least they're making... <laughs> Me one too. Oh, Me too. Yeah. They say they made... made uh... <laughs> Number 3 is like Earthbound 2, except, of course, not. it wasn't released here, so... Yeah. Kind of doesn't have that. No. And didn't they make... Uh... Japan doesn't count. <laughs> <laughs> no offense. <laughs> <laughs> didn't they just uh, make a sequel or whatever to Kid Icarus? Yep. Yeah, Kid Icarus Uprising. Ooh. Yay. Yeah. Oh, time. What about Down Sinking, I feel? Um, yeah, Kid Icarus Down Sinking. That's going to be the yeah. prequel. I still never played Kid Icarus to this day. I just heard about it. Never even nope. played it. What's wrong with you? Well, go, a lot go of play things it. Is wrong with me, play so it. I can't help Warren, it. It's a very tough game. Like, oh, PS anyway, uh, all right. So <laughs> that is it for Super Mario Advance, and we out of here. I'm Ron Moore. Sweet guy. Star Soldier One, baby. Oh yeah. God bless and take care. Oh. Yeah. Welcome to Let's Play Street Fighter 2 The World Warrior. This is Ron Moore along with Star Soldier 1. Oh yeah, baby! We're gonna do some more street fighting here because, yeah, we're fighting streets. And who doesn't want to do that? Especially twice. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah it's weird. It's like there was almost never a Street Fighter 1, but here we got part 2. Yeah, I really didn't <laughs> hear about Street Fighter until Street Fighter 2 came out. Yeah. Yeah, that's a weird thing. Street Fighter 1 sucked so much that. <laughs> Nobody remembers it. Yeah. Kind of like Mega Man 1, hey? No, I'm kidding. Uh, all right. Mega Man 1 was a hit, though. <laughs> you know, I, I would admit, it is be probably better than Street Fighter 1. Yeah. yeah, so we got Ryu or Ryu against Chun-Li or Chun-Li, however you want to say it. Against, <laughs> so Ryu against Wiga. Yeah, I had a crush on her when I was 13. Who did it? Like, right. <laughs> I like playing it around the Super Nintendo because now you can pause. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, really. Even though you pause, it goes, it goes, ha, ha, la, 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 Yeah, she's like way too hot to be like a street fighter. Yeah. But, you know, all the girls are in Hatcom games. Yeah. It's almost like a requirement that you have to have like, I don't know. <laughs> Uh, limited amount of clothes, good amount of cleavage, and yeah. Yeah, right here, it was a big deal for her to be in this game because she was the only woman fighter in this game, and at the time, you know, a woman in the tournament fighting game, I guess, was rare. And then Mortal Kombat came after Street Fighter, so uh, there's only one woman in that one, and so it's kind of kind of a rare, like, whoa, a woman's in this one, and, you know, uh, at the time, it just seemed like not that female characters were rare at the time, because I think that really started up until Metroid, I think. But we're funny. Yeah, it's kind of like a weird thing, too. Okay, yeah, Lemon's Women's Lib 
Yeah, you put women in a fighting game. <laughs> but, yeah. you know, we're putting a chick in a fighting game to get beat up. Like, it's right and it's so wrong. <laughs> yeah. Well, she was tight, though, in this game. And... Oh, yeah. And, and Blanca. Blanca's pretty cool, too. Not right here, though, because I've worked him real quick. Yeah. Yeah, I well, wanted yeah, to be a two-player... He's so vicious because he's so fast. Yeah. I wanted this to be a two-player just... LP. Oh. Yeah, I wanted this to be a two-player LP, but it, uh... Just, uh, I couldn't find a body to play two player with me, so I'm just facing the CPU. Okay. Oh man, yep. wait a minute. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, the CPU is pretty tough. Yeah, this game is harder than the later ones that came out. Especially later on when you know how to juggle like combos and all that, you can get infinite hits. Here yeah. you've got really tiny shots. Oh, that was shocking that I lost. Oh. <laughs> this is an awesome stage of music, though. Yeah. Round three. Yeah, it's weird, though. We get a Brazilian fighter in here, but, and he's all green and monster-like. Yeah. <laughs> and, I mean, on here, uh, well, yeah, we don't have Brazilian Jiu-Jitsu or Capoeira <laughs> represented. Yeah. No. yeah. Just have a guy, you know, who looks all monsters. Yeah. He looks like a mutated Ultimate Warrior. Yeah. Yeah, how does he do it? I went to the mountaintops, and I went to the caverns to see the destiny that lies before me and the warriors. And that's where you fly through the cockpit door. Hulk Hogan. Round one. Hulk Hogan. All right, here's a... Uh, to the might of the warriors. Uh, here's the... There's a... Uh, it's Mr. T's illegitimate son. <laughs> Yeah, yeah because Dang everybody it. in Russia is bad back then. <laughs> yeah, and this guy was awesome. He like wrestled uh, bears and stuff. Yeah, I remember that was his storyline. Yeah, Even though he's like 300 pounds and all, but if you wrestle a bear, you're, you know, you're gonna be screwed either way. Yeah, I don't care how big you are. Of course, in Street Fighter logic, everybody has to have a like a crazy storyline. Yeah. Like, Chun Li can do flips like 50 feet in the air. Ryu can throw magical fireballs. Yeah. <laughs> Everybody has to be extreme. Yeah, and I love the stage music in this stage as well. And I, back then I would call him Zangief or Zangief, whatever. I didn't know what was the right one. I would call him Zangief or something. Yeah. yeah, they all had such weird names, but it was cool back then. Because yeah, really. You're people from around the world and whoa those are some crazy names we got in here and cool I get to play as them too yeah I remember in the original Street Fighter you just played as Ryu and Ken yeah which was lame I mean yeah, only two characters lame. come on especially when you get to fight all these characters around the world but you can't play as them yeah now oh, yeah. facing uh, <laughs> a blonde version music. of Rambo yeah, I love this music too. It goes great with everything. Yeah. <laughs> Ask Skip Rogers. Oh. He was so... Guy was such an awesome character, but... I don't know, admittedly, he's not too much different from Ryo or Ken. Like, he has a fireball, anti-air attack. But I guess his standard, like, punches of kids are slower, but stronger. Yeah. And on here he don't flip. He didn't do that to a turbo. Oh, you mean like uh, his air flip? Yeah, oh. when he jumps. See, I notice on here when he jumps, he don't flip. Oh, you mean his flash kick? No, this is jump. His jump. He don't oh. flip. Oh, yeah, you mean there's like flip in the air when he does that kick to the head right yeah pretty much everybody said uh, the bison don't flip on here just like you know his jump pattern yeah. he don't flip I just noticed he, he don't do that neither is bison um, I don't think that started until turbo or special champion edition or champion edition which I'm confused there's champion edition and special champion edition like what's the difference <laughs> special champion ship edition is like turbo where they add a whole bunch of new moves to the standard roster list 
where Championship Edition that you play as the bosses. Okay. Yeah, there's so many re revisions out there, it's hard to keep track. Yeah, there's like 10 Street Fighter 2s. And only one crappy Street Fighter 1. Yeah. Oh, I copy the nerd again. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, the bonus stage now. Let me break these bricks or concretes, whatever. Yeah, I remember this is a cool new feature in the Super Nintendo release. This wasn't in the arcade. Yeah. But, yeah, the Super Nintendo version also took some stuff out. Like the Sits Elephants and Dalsim stage and... I don't know, the graphics also look a bit worse too. <laughs> but still, back then, it was awesome. Yeah. The Super Nintendo, you know, not as, uh... You know, not as... What do you call it? Advanced as the arcade cabinet. No. Capcom was using some very fancy shit back then. <laughs> yeah, they were always first in having the yeah, highest had megabit of video games. Yeah. Oh, you creamed them. Yeah, they, I never liked Dalsim, but back then I called him Dalsim. Never liked him. Yeah, he's so relaxed, you know? And you, know, uh, you want to play a more extreme character. You want to be the, you know, the Sitsi Chung Lee, who's the, you know, he's an acrobatics or the big Russian with massive amount of power. You're, you're this guy's a yoga instructor. Well, at the time, I, I, I liked him as a beginner because he stretched his legs and arms out, and I think yeah. for beginners, he's pretty cool, but other than that, when you get used to Street Fighter, he's more uh, good with it. I don't know, I just didn't like him, but any character's good if you know how to use it. <laughs> yeah, once you master his style, use his long limbs and his distance, and, you know, he's a very cool character. Yeah. You just have to play him smart because he's also super slow. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, how'd you like that? You can... <laughs> That's Gandhi's brother. Well, what was that? Round oh. one. Hello? Oh. Oh. Sorry, you cut in and out right there. <laughs> How's your yoga techniques going to... <laughs> That's late. Yeah. Hello. Alright, we apologize for the audio cutting in and out. I don't apologize. You guys should have been paying attention. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> right. I'm, I'm kidding. I love you guys. Hey, e Honda, pretty cool. Fights in the bathroom or a sauna. Yeah. That's weird. We got two Japanese characters in here. This... Oh yeah. <laughs> it's cool. You know, we got two Japanese characters fighting it out. Yeah, it's pretty cool. <laughs> All right, come on. Oh. Just nail them. Yeah. That's weird, you know. <laughs> if you get somebody who's good with fireballs, you know, you can really damage E Honda and Zangi. Yeah. Because they don't have project projectiles. Yeah. But he does. Unless you're somebody who's very good at jumping, you know, you're pretty much a sit and duck. Yeah. It wasn't to like later revisions where they sort of even that out. Yeah. Ryu and Ken now. Pretty much the same except Ken's quicker. And Ryu's more powerful. Wait. Wait who's who? <laughs> not the same. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I think uh, Ken was originally supposed to be Japanese, but they figured I don't know, he looks I don't know, American now, so we'll just Oh, yeah, because Ken is also a Japanese name. Um, yeah, I know someone named Ken, a uh, friend of mine. So, like, he met him a long time ago, and yeah, he, Ryu and Ken. I mean, a lot of complained that he was uh, that they both that's stupid. They're both the same. They had the same moves. And, I mean, back then when I was a kid, I didn't care, you know. Yeah. Just as long as not all the fighters were the same. But back then, Ken was hard to me, though, as a kid, and especially, I think, in Champion Edition. Uh, I think you can get away with using Psycho Crusher a lot with Bison, but Ken would, like, jump up and block it with his feet. It was weird. Yeah, Ken, I think he likes to be very cheap, like, where Ryu will be all strategic and stand back and wait for you to hit him. Ken will just rush it. Yeah. 
Uh, uh, now the bosses in this game are real hard. Some are cheap. Oh, yeah. Some of them, where there's only especially special. in the original. Yeah, and they, they're harder on this game than they are in the later versions. I think Capcom dumbed down the challenge a little bit. Yeah, I think Barak he can like hit you in just a few hits. Yeah. Or the original M. Bison for you Japanese players out there. <laughs> yeah, really. I think they did that because of Mike Tyson. You could probably sue him or something. Yeah. I don't know. Stupid. Yeah, I think, yeah, M. Bison just sounds too similar to Mike Tyson. Yeah. <laughs> it does. Yeah. Mike Tyson, I don't agree with your uh, impressment of, you know, putting me in the game without playing me Rockies. <laughs> yeah. I gotta eat your children. I'm very ecstatic. Uh oh. I think yep. made him mad. I think he heard heard you. Yep. And look at the girls, they're actually wearing one piece bathing suits. Yeah. Before they were in bikinis and well, I'm such I a pervert turbo. that I knew that. <laughs> yeah. They might change that in turbo. Yeah. Another bonus stage. Yeah, we get the part. <laughs> I meant the car finally. We get the part finally. <laughs> <laughs> All right, um, oh, come on, what? You can't hit it standing up like that. Yeah. Well, realistically, <laughs> you would be damaging your toes, but yeah. Again, it goes to the whole extremeness of Street Fighter. Yeah. Oh, these characters are so extreme; they're <laughs> they can destroy a car with their bare hands and fists. Yeah. Oh man, come on! How are you gonna lose a bonus stage? <laughs> I just use like medium strikes and that's good enough because if you use stronger strikes it's a bit too slow. Yeah. Oh, and I hate this guy. Oh man. And now this guy fights cheap. Yeah. Ball rock here. I, oh, I mean that guy here. He's just... <laughs> Look at that, he, that. That kick. That jump kick is cheap. I know. And that's the problem with the bosses is that... They know exactly what you're gonna do. Yeah. And that's my hate. This is stupid. They know your move list. Okay, you're jumping, I gonna counter with a kick. Yeah. Alright, come on. No. Oh, dragon punch you idiot. There we go, now you do it. Oh, I hate to do the dragon punch in this game at first because <laughs> it's a forward then a quarter circle. Yeah. I got good at this game by uh, button mashing on Special Champion Edition, then I figured out how to do it. Oh, you gotta do it fast. Yeah, I wish it was a bit more simpler, like, I don't know, the Hurricane Kick and the uh, Fireball itself. Yeah. The Dragon Punch, I think, I don't know, it was kind of aggravating when I was younger, but... Yeah. Now, it's only mildly aggravating. <laughs> yeah. All right, here we go. Ah, dang it. <laughs> oh, this is going to be close. Oh, man. Oh, ah, come on. Yeah, he's cheap. Yeah. Whoa, he took off his mask. We got to see his mask. <laughs> I mean, his face. And he does not look Spanish. Yeah. Well, Ryu don't look Japanese either. No. And Chunny Ken actually Chunny. doesn't look American. Yeah. <laughs> Uh, I think the only one that looks like who they are is E-Honda, Dalsim, maybe Zanga. Yeah. Leica looks Brazilian. Yeah. <laughs> no. Alright, now we got uh, someone different. Ken. <laughs> yeah. Oh my god. It's like uh, two different people. Oh man. <laughs> oh. I think it got some advantage in this stage because he gets to climb the fence back there. Oh, got him. Ah, that's a big kick. Yeah, I could be cheaper than nice. that too. <laughs> it's so weird how they took out the cages in the later stage so you can play as them now. And he yeah. just jumps up in the air. Yeah. Well, if we still could climb the background and climb on thin air because it's a glitch in the game that we got to edit. <laughs> it takes away some of the tension. Yeah. 
I just came back there and said, man, this boss is freaking hard. Oh. Yeah, about then, they're really trying to eat your quarters. Yeah. But nowadays, <laughs> you can just buy the game and they said, okay, we'll go easy on you now. Yeah. You dropped the sissy butts. And yeah. now we're only going to rape you if you download the content. Get new costume for five dollars. <laughs> Mega Man is fat now. <laughs> yeah. No oh, man, I can't believe that. That's not Mega Man. I don't care what Capcom says. Yeah. <laughs> He's holding the pistol, and they may have looked like Mega Man One. Nice. Yeah, that's so stupid. But even the cover art on Mega Man One, he was still thin. Yeah. He let himself go over the years, and I've seen his ending. His ending makes no sense. <laughs> I think Capcom just did that to mess with the fans. Yeah. Hey, you want Big Man? Well, this is what you get. Well, they crapped. They crapped on the fans recently, canceling Mega Man Legends 3 and then messing up Street Fighter Cross Tekken and bringing a fat Mega Man. Yeah. One, fight, fight. Oh, and I just up a lot as late. Yeah, this is back then when Capcom was cool right here. Oh yeah, I love the Mega Man Net series on Super Nintendo. Yeah. Yep. Oh, back then, I love Capcom. I love Capcom. I love the original Mega Man. I love Street Fighter. Yeah, I love them. Yeah. And they were even making good Disney games. I love the Magical Quest. You know, Darkwing Duck on the original Nintendo was awesome. Yeah. And DuckTales. DuckTales. Yeah. Yeah. They were so great back then, but then they lost in the Pony. Yeah, I guess they lost yeah, the original uh, creator of Mega Man, yeah. Yeah, I think they lost oh, cool staff members. I know you know him, but maybe some people who don't know his name. Yeah. I'm sure we got those composers for the music. Yeah. Losers. <laughs> no, there are some really talented people. And Sega is so much more easier. I know he's easier on here than Vega was. The problem is he leaves himself open. Yeah. Yeah, you know, throw the fireball, okay, jump over. Yeah. For Vega, we'll just wait for you to move and then, oops, counter. Yeah. Alright, and here we got the end boss. Uh, Bison. Yeah. Or Vega. Yeah. Round one. Such a cool look. so freaking hard on this game. Yeah. Ah, uh, look at that already. I blocked that, come on. <laughs> he did like three moves in like succession. Yeah. Very cheap. And he just flies all over the place. Yeah. Oh, man. Come on. Dang, man. He just murdered me right here. Oh. Yeah, I wonder why he doesn't, like, murder you right here. Oh, well, of course, we have to wait for the rounds and stuff. Yeah. <laughs> if this was a movie, they took out all the rounds. Hey, now, of course, if this was a movie, it would totally suck. Yeah. Now, I thought we were in uh, Thailand, not Philadelphia. I got the Liberty Bell back there, or... Oh, wait, yeah. no, it's not cracked. Oh! That's just a big bell. Uh, <laughs> and some old lady is screaming in the background, Hey, what are you guys doing? Yeah. Oh! I could come from behind there. Yeah, here's a cheap kick, also. Yeah, look at the woman is just down there and then she's just screaming at you. Hey, what are you guys doing? Yeah, yeah, really. <laughs> Some of that. I don't know, if I saw M. Bison fighting, you know, I would do more than scream, you know. Hey, that's a drug dealer, you know. <laughs> yeah. Oh man. Uh oh. Look at that. That is super cheap. That it's is not cheap. even letting you do a move. Yeah, look at that's cheap. Hey, come on. Really? Oh, <laughs> See? What the heck? <laughs> yeah, I don't think there's anything you can do out in that situation. Yeah, really. I can't compare with your cheapness. Alright, someone different. The Ultimate Warrior. Yeah. <laughs> Come on, nobody beats the Ultimate Warrior. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you. 
Blanca. Oh. Come on. <laughs> spam, spam. Yeah, the problem with using Blanca, he only has like two special moves. The roll and the electricity. Yeah. But he gets a lot better in later versions, especially super. Yeah. Oh, there we go. Ah. Ooh. Oh. Oh. oh, come on now, I scratch so him. I was going to buy oh. him right there. He's breaks for you. Come on. Yeah, just one second. He yeah. had one bite on him, and boom, he's out. Yeah. What difficulty are you playing on? This is normal. Whoa. Yeah. <laughs> Imagine how hard. Uh-oh. Now we got J-Man versus Bison. Round one. Haircut versus, you know, Derby Hat. <laughs> yeah, there we go. It's cool with the storyline too because Gaio actually really hates it, Bison. Yeah. Oh, perfect. Yeah. Nice. He's combing his hair. Okay. Yeah. Wait, say, wait, say that again. You're cutting out. It's not. It's like right now, him so much. Oh no, I'm just gonna let him out for round. Oh, Tubbs can stand right here. <laughs> He's just gonna stand there and comb his hair. Yo, when? Oh, can you hear me now? Yeah. Yo, when? Perfect. Conic boom! Conic boom! Oh, now he's being cheap again. Yeah, come on. Oh, I think I made him mad. I beat him perfect. <laughs> oh, almost there. Oh, nice. Yes. Don't comb your hair. <laughs> That's your mortal enemy. <laughs> oh. <laughs> I remember you, Kyle. You're not the one you were then. Go ahead. Get over with. Nothing is over. <laughs> it's M. Bison's wife. <laughs> Jane? I first seen this ending on Special Champion Edition, I believe. Yeah. Yeah, I think the wife looks a bit different than the original one. Oh, yeah, I forgot he had a daughter, too. Yeah. Don't worry, honey, I'll just kill Bison right here. Yeah. <laughs> and now, ironically, Gao goes home to be a family man. Yeah. I remember in later editions, like, the wife was, like, baking cookies and all that. Hmm. I don't know if I'm, I remember one version where he's sitting on a couch in normal clothes, yeah. smoking, or sitting next to a fireplace, or there's a dog playing or something. <laughs> yeah, a bit more stereotypical. Or this one's kind of basic. Yeah. It's like playing a uh, family music right there, and all of a sudden, da -da -da -da, place for play, presented by Capcom. <laughs> oh, look at that, ECW number one. Yeah, he didn't even get a trophy or anything. Yeah. <laughs> I guess just like Ryu, ceremony means nothing to him. <laughs> um, anyway, I don't yeah. care, I want my damn trophy. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> his family's getting his family back as his trophy. Uh, anyway. <laughs> no, that's good. <laughs> Anyway, Street Fighter 2, The World Warrior, uh, one of the greatest fighting games of all time. The first Street Fighter game to be released on the SNES. Um, Street Fighter 2 was real crazy popular in the arcades. It was a real quarter muncher. And so I remember f first playing this game back then, really getting into Street Fighter back in like 93, and playing this game for the SNES. I mean, even though at, at first you couldn't play as the bosses until later, this game was still awesome, and I loved it. Uh... It's, it's harder than the later versions. I think Capcom just realized the challenge is too stiff, so they decided to dumb down the challenge a little bit with Turbo and, and then Super Street Fighter. But yeah, this game is just so fun. I mean, the characters, the soundtrack, uh, good controls. Capcom was real good with the video game controls back then. And this game was just so fun and very addictive. Um, yeah, so this Capcom really did an awesome job 
with Street Fighter, and this one in particular, Street Fighter 2, The World Warrior. So many fun memories with this one. I remember going to my friend's house and wanting to play it all the time. It's real popular to go over someone's house and play two-player with. Uh, so, yeah, I give this game a 9 out of 10. All right, yeah, Street Fighter 2, going back to 1992 again. Yeah, it's very exciting for me. First year of the Super Nintendo, and seeing this awesome game in action, almost carbon copy of the arcade original that everybody was talking about, it was huge. It was so awesome. Instead of playing as, you know, one character and trying to finish the game, you know, boring, who wants to do that? No, you got eight different characters, each with their own unique fine styles and storylines. It was so cool. Plus, you had Sid Spuns to work with. All different types of, you know, moves you can use, you know, fast punches, slow kicks, special moves, regular moves, mix it up, do combos, you know, fight the end bosses. Yeah, they were tough back then, but it was such a cool challenge because it was so exciting once you saw their slow motion bodies go, oh, <laughs> yeah. and you do your little victory pose, yeah. And you won. It was yeah. a great feeling. Ah, so the original Street Fighter Two, the World Warrior here on the Super Nintendo. Great conversion. Eighty sits out hundred. Yeah, we're kinda of spoiled now with the air versions of Street Fighter Four, which is pretty much uh, another version of Street Fighter Two since it pretty much pretty much has the same cast anyways. <laughs> but still it's awesome. And yeah, this is awesome. And it's great reliving it again. Yeah. So I'd like it. Yeah, it's an awesome game. Definitely a classic. I think I have the cartridge somewhere where it shows uh, Chun-Li uh, kicking. Uh, you know, you see the cover right here on, on the video, with the cover box. I have the cartridge and Chun-Li kicking Blanc, who's coming after her and his roll attack. Yeah, Rue really sure just to... got his butt kicked. <laughs> He's yeah. just flying out. Oh! <laughs> and there's no way. Look at that. Look at that picture right there. You know Chun Li's not going to stop that big roll uh, with a kick. Come on! I don't know. It I looks think... like she's doing better than Ryu. Yeah, yeah. But th <laughs> this cover though is this cover art is better than the Street Fighter Two Turbo cover art though. Yeah, that looks a weird way. Saiga is just leaning back like he's on the couch or something. And... <laughs> but yeah, anyway, there you go for our let's play of Street Fighter Two: The World Warrior. I'm Ron Moore. I'm Stars Order 1, baby. God bless and take care. Ooh. Welcome to Let's Play Nightmare on Elm Street for the NES. <laughs> this is Brom Moore, along with Dracula, <laughs> RGX, the Wii Guy, That's and me. Star Soldier. Oh yeah, baby! Take a look at this! Yeah! <laughs> Nightmare on <laughs> Street. There's actually an error in the, in the title. It's, just, it's supposed to say Nightmare on Elmo Street, but they changed it because they're idiots. No, I'm just kidding. Elmo Street. <laughs> Nightmare on Elmo Street. Yeah, yeah we're going to make a difference. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Now, how come he's not wearing his gloves right here? That looks weird. Yeah, he forgot the power glove. I want you yeah. to see where my blades got chopped off. See, what I think I have an explanation for this. In Nightmare Part 2... Nah, they just messed up. How could you do that, yeah, LJN? So Freddy can just be anything he wants. Like, I don't know why he doesn't get like a new face or something, since he can dream up anything. Yeah. yeah. This is a dream, and I'm still alive, so I don't... <laughs> yeah, why is he, he yeah. has to be a chef with those knives? He could do some good slicing and dicing. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Uh, this game has cool soundtrack though, thanks to David Wise. Yes, thank you, D D W. Yeah, Darkwing Duck. Oh, yeah, D W from Arthur. What? <laughs> <laughs> okay, now I figure out which house to go into first. Oh, okay. Here we go. The house that's open. The house of the, the house of E C W. And they're trying to scare you with flies. I know. Yeah. I'm so scared. Flies and giant spiders that are not very scary looking. <laughs> yeah, they look like they're ice skating. They would be scary looking real life. Yeah. yeah if they were nearly as big as you, I mean, wah. 
Oh, so I mean, we're, we're like the size of a thumbtack, and they're like a huge marble coming after us. Oh yeah, that's really. Yeah, they only got like two frames of animation. One is just happily ju jumping up in the air, like it's nothing. Look at yeah. me, I'm on trampoline. Now I'm a spider. <laughs> <laughs> wee, wee, wee! I'm gonna kill you, wee! So he plays a character <laughs> named Wee Guy. Oh, oh yeah, that's me. I'm in this game. <laughs> Sweet. There's also four players. So the other players, Viper. And, uh... You and, uh... Ryan. <laughs> or yes. Oh, trippy man. <laughs> yes. Uh, Ooh, totally. Where's the Doritos? Oh, wait, this... back to <laughs> Doritos? This game... Doritos? This game becomes cool when you fall asleep. Go into the dream zone. Yeah, as you fight... Cool when you turn the lights off. As you fight the ghost of Count Chocolate sure. cereal. <laughs> oh, I love that cereal. Yeah. Yeah, lucky well, I love Count Chocolate too. Yeah. Well, I'm going to suck your... I don't know because I'm a chocolatey vampire. <laughs> I'm going to kill you chocolate. and feed you some chocolate. <laughs> I want to suck your chocolate. Alright, so we're about to fight the first incarnation of Freddy. Well, that'll be a black guy. Anyway. <laughs> <laughs> for those of you who remember... For those of you who remember, I did a... Uh, I think it was a let's check out of this... Uh, game back in 2010 on the, the Rommore channel. Oh yeah. No, oh, that was so like two years ago. <laughs> so? Let's get turned on by Nightmare on Elm Street. No, like two years ago, Ron. Like, it's now 2012. And so? So it's hot stuff coming through. <gasps> well, make no bones about it. What Here's that? Freddy. Sounds Don't like he's get gonna a be... Bone speaking down. of things that like balls, look Don't at that hand. What the heck? It's... That <laughs> really is kind of stupid, but oh well. He's doing it wrong. He's not giant claw. Whoa! It's supposed to grab life by the balls, not have arm balls. <laughs> well, does Don't he? Don't get all ballsy about it. You trip on them balls. What does he rule with an iron fist? <laughs> no, he rules with a disfigured, melted, flaming fist. He rules yeah. with a rotten hand and, and unclipped nails. By the looks of it. When I first played this game, I know you can like. Transform in, in the night world. So I was trying to punch the freaking fist. It was hard. Yeah, punch a fist. Yeah, those sound effects are <laughs> totally David Wise and rare. I'm floating in midair. Look at me, we. <laughs> Alright, so which house are going to next? Way too cartoonish. <laughs> uh, let's not go in any house. Let's just listen to the nice Elm Street. Such though. a happy tune for such yeah. a creepy game. It should be more creepy music, but. It does I turn remember it in movies, yeah, they were horrifying. Don't remember yeah. that girl in the underwear that got ripped to pieces? Oh yeah. Yeah, yeah but... Just, that's the scene and all, but... Yeah, see, this scene is like, your wish. Now the music's darker. Like, everywhere. You can't show that on NES. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it'd be, it'd be still, That made the game much better. <laughs> yeah, well, the soundtrack is still pretty ECW. Well, yeah, best part about the game, really. It's ECW. Yeah, makes you happy that you're gonna get killed. All right, house number two. Now it's BCW. No, so. Why does he have the Nightmare on Elm Street title on top of the screen? We know what game we're playing. <laughs> well, I don't never know, know. Yeah. Lots of things, you'll never know. <laughs> yeah. That's like generic platformer number 12. Excellent. No, we're playing Nightmare on Elm Street number nine. So we're playing the ninth movie. Yeah. Said so, no. <laughs> <laughs> Said well, so by the bones. That's LJN for you. What, what does that mean? Laughing... Uh, jokers. Joking numb nuts. <laughs> oh, RS. No, lame, lame, joking nunchucks. Nah, no, fail. <laughs> what? Ah, yes. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> That's so trippy. That. And it's the best fact in the game, but you only see it a few times. Ah, oh, come on. Ooh, I love that effect. Yeah. How do they yeah. do that? It's awesome. Ah, man. <laughs> Straight to death. Well, how many of the good guys actually win in not on Elm Street movies? I don't know. Well, um, there was that one chick that defeated Freddy in the first movie. Yeah, she Nancy or something? Pop. Yeah, Nancy. Yeah, yeah Nancy. Then, she got, then she got killed. But they the all died the end anyways. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So, so I mean... I know, I know that uh, Freddy's daughter survived. And he has a daughter? 
Yeah. Shit, I need to watch the movies. <laughs> I've only seen up to four, I think. Uh, and, uh, yeah. I think my- and then the girl from Freddy vs. Jason survived. I just gotta ask, why was that last area playing like a love theme when someone's out to kill you? Yeah, I was no. about to say, like, that, that was a strange little theme there. It was cool, yeah, but... It, was, it, it, it sounds cool, but at first then you get stupid. <laughs> Maybe that's the theme we play when we collect all the bones. It's like, you collected all the bones! <laughs> <laughs> you collected all the bones, now prepare to die. Look at this. I can't... I gotta switch to wow, normal that's a bone. mode, and then get that. That's stupid. No, that's Nightmare on Elm Street. <laughs> no, that's shut up. Oh yes. <laughs> oh, here comes Freddy. Freddy the bat. E C double U. Oh my God. Uh oh, could it be? One, two, Freddy's coming for you. Three, four. Yep. <laughs> I know. I know it, but I'm not gonna sing it. <laughs> I don't One, remember it. Two, e C W. Yeah, that's what I should have done. <laughs> Freddy's coming. Freddy's Freddy coming. trademark is coming yes. again. Yeah, Freddy's just <laughs> fierce. Hey, this church. reminds me of Home yeah. Alone. Like, yeah, I can't bars. believe it. The name Freddy is trademarked. Yeah, Freddy's trademark is coming. <laughs> yeah. So anybody named Freddy can't <laughs> has to pay royalties to LJN. Yeah, that's stupid. Screw that. I've got that annoying so if, you, if you were born Freddy, you better change your name or you're gonna have to pay your royalties. That's you annoying. Hopefully friend. LJN is out of business right now. <laughs> oh yeah, they, 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 they have been. Oh, yeah. Maybe they they came back as an existing company, Whoa. but we don't we don't know that yet. They're THQ. No. <laughs> yes, anything three letters. No, the only three letter company that's worth people is ECW. He's coming. He's coming. Oh, damn, oh, wait, ruined no. them too. Huh. They did. I thought it was a claim. I claim that they ruined them. I claim. <laughs> <laughs> I thought that uh... claim and the LJM were actually friends. Okay. Because <laughs> they both made wrestling Dude. games for Fish on Nintendo. Wow, Freddy's and giving me a ton of the LJM ads in the back of some <laughs> LJM claim games, believe it or not. Well, Freddy's giving me a tongue lashing here. Yeah, really. It's As we defeated Dalsim or Uncle Fester, whoever that was, and <laughs> yeah, now back outside on the street. Yeah, you know that's strange. Like that, that ball effect. That's the same thing used in Battletoads and Double Dragon when the ball with the hand came out. It's the same kind of effect. Or kind of crap. <laughs> I don't even remember that. Rare, you're unoriginal. Actually, you're not. You're awesome. But LJN ruined you here. Now, hey, now listen to this. Yeah, this song right here. Yeah, pretty good song. I love I it. Emo. Yeah, I you know, don't know what to do. Yeah, really, I say LGM really ruined most of this, because it says on top screen that Rare programmed, or it says program and audiovisuals by Rare, and then it says manufactured by LGN. So they yeah. manufactured the shit that this kind, this game kind of is. And it's not that bad, but it's the reason to blame for the bad parts. Yeah. Yeah, the game could have been good. Like, in fact, there's actually a few decent spots in here, but... Yeah. I think uh, LGN, they said, rush it to market. Yeah, I should have been out for this. Not me on Elm Street, it'll sell. Which you probably did, but. I mean. Maybe not. I mean, who who's the target demographic? Kids? I mean, they. Oh, I guess it's the best, next best thing because they probably weren't allowed to watch it. It's like, oh, can I at least get the game? Yeah. Well, it is yes, rated. You can. Well, I'm a horrible mother. Well, back then there was no rating system, but I'm sure, like NES, you know, N Nintendo's not going to allow a bloody gory NES game to come out, so. Yeah. 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 No, they're games so that are capitation. <laughs> well, yeah, there was a game, that's right. Yeah, there are games that have been around that, actually, that are licensed. Like Monster Jeez. Party, Goggle 13, and Mafia Conspiracy. See, how did, how did, did, how did, did this one work? Well, see, how did uh, Atari get away with having those porn games, but Nintendo couldn't have any anything bad on their system? <laughs> those were licensed. Those were unlicensed. unlicensed. No, there's unlicensed games on the NES as well. Yeah, well, yeah but and there's, there's some porn games on the original Nintendo as well. No, I never heard they of that. Nintendo was... permission. Yeah. No, 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 they totally wanted the license Bubble Bath Babes. You know it. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, I forgot about that. Well, I guess today, I don't know, I, I, I didn't think that was possible on the NES. Uh, Nintendo wouldn't allow that, but I forgot they're unlicensed. 
NES games. I don't, I don't know about how companies get away with that. If it's not licensed, how they get away legally with putting the game out? <laughs> they got around something. They just with many games, like Tenju, whatever those games are. Tenjin. <laughs> Tenjin, yeah, Tengu Man, Tenjin Man, whatever. Uh, Tenjin Man. <laughs> yeah, yeah. They just figure out a way out of the lockout chip. Yeah, because kind of in a way, it, I mean, it's not licensed, but yet it is. They just went around, you know, the lockout chip. That's pretty much all they did. Yeah. All right, now. Yeah, if you want a real horrifying game, just play Splatterhouse. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Now it's over to Team Plug. <laughs> Check out Low Budget Review, Splatterhouse, a birthday present for Green, Shameless Plug. Um, I have nothing Splatterhouse related, so, um, just, just keep watching this video. <laughs> <Yeah>. Okay. Okay. <laughs> All right, uh, Nightmare so World now. Now okay, we're ACW Ninja. World. Uh, yes. Yeah, get the ninja. Play is Ryu Hayabusa. All right. I love ninja game. Yeah, Gaiden. <laughs> yeah. You know, I really want to know who you're playing as. Like, seriously. Is it one of the characters from the movie? I think so, because in these, those tokens you collect where you can transform to different, uh, different characters, like the ninja or whatever, I think so that's, someone a reference, from the, that's a reference to part three. Yeah, so it's someone from the third movie then. Well, they just use that because it was all like, well, we can't really do much from the first and second. Let's just take all the stuff from the third. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> you know, the coolest parts of that movie. Hey, now you're fighting a flying fist. Flying Talk fist, about fist of fury. <laughs> you actually did something with it this time. It moves. I'm like the last one. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Yeah, the last one you could just stay to the left. Boom, you're safe. Yeah, and you can so, like save spot the whole time. So, this is where Master Hand made his debut, and... <laughs> Master Hand Sorry. regret. <laughs> you should Dr. not get Claw. fisted. <laughs> Ooh. Don't, okay. don't let this hand come after you at night. Alright, where's the punchline? Um... Mm, I got one. Oh wait, no. I know. No, this hand, this hand this should be. Uh, yeah. I think, I think you need a hand. Good job. No. Uh, <laughs> let's give him a hand. <laughs> Literally. <laughs> or actually, an arm. That's what he needs. And these balls, actually, because that's like basically what is made of the other ones. <laughs> God, it's so erratic. It's hard to prepare for. Here, let me hand you something. <laughs> There we go. All right, there we go. Let's get out of that hoose into the next hoose. That stupid snake move. Yeah, get out of that whorehouse. <laughs> move, Jake the snake. All right. <laughs> yeah. So these stones just fall from out of nowhere. I love how you can't even see the bats because of the bricks. <laughs> yeah. Can't see nothing. Uh, uh, something hit me. It's probably my. I don't know. One of my favorite track in the game is probably this one right here. That's not too bad. No, it is one. Of, it's more. It's one of the most recognized of, from the game, pretty much. Yeah. Too bad. It sounds off like the movie, though. <laughs> yeah. Well, well. David Wise is good enough to make his own soundtrack from just anything. Yeah. You know. Yeah. How oh, cool would it have, you know, be to have those kids, you know, doing that one song. Well, I mean, that song is actually is in here, you know, David Weiss did that song, the dun 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 so that song is from the movie in the game here. Yeah, and the opening, uh... It barely sounds like it, though. No, it pretty much sounds pretty much just like it, really. I mean, there's not much to the, uh, the original. I mean, you can even hum it and know what it is. <laughs> you know, hum it, hum it, hum it. Well, we're... Man, had they had the girls, though, it would add more effect to it. Yeah, the digitized voice samplings of the girls' voices. That would have made this yeah. more creepy. Night track <laughs> on Elm Street. Yeah, night track. Track. Yeah, that should, they should release the CD. On Elm Street. That would have been the CD. Night trap. No, I said night trap. Night trap on Elm Street. Aw. 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 Man. <laughs> Alright, here's the next place. The junkyard dog. I mean, the, the junkyard. Junk He's free to find the junkyard dog, rest in peace. <laughs> Uh, it's the junkyard. Right. And welcome to Let's Play the Goonies. Oh. <laughs> the junkyard. This is where we found the game. <laughs> <laughs> no, we found it on an emulator. <laughs> Whoa! Hey, Dirty Harry from the video game is in here. Oh wait. 
I think I'm hallucinating. I just saw two Frankensteins. All right, here we go. Yes. Monster. I am messed up. They changed. The Samus Quest skeletons now. Seriously, who brings ice cream trucks here and puts them to the junkyard? I mean, I would, I would, I'd, I'd rob one. Seriously. Well, maybe you're, you know, craving an ice cream. You never know. Why are there uh, ice cream? Uh, you scream, we all scream. Because it's rare. <laughs> they made battle toads. I mean, it's come all on. they know. I thought Trey West made battle toads. No, they published that. Yeah. God, what is? I'm confused about published, but manufactured, but developed, but created by. Like, oh, who's responsible for making no. the game? It's pretty much all. Trey West, like, they did nothing. Yeah, they just it's just <laughs> Trey West presents, and it's like a rare production. So you know, like, okay, rare production. There's something rare. Was more involved in the I was confused by Mortal Kombat. I thought a claim made it, but no, Midway did. I'm like, what did the claim do? Why can't Midway publish? Why do you need a publisher? Just publish your own you stuff. Why can't you be like Sunsoft? Come on. In books, I understand, like, author Mick Foley, but WWE is a publisher. But video games? <laughs> it's confusing. McFly? Uh, what? That's why I'm taking all the credit for this. <laughs> <laughs> you guys help, but I'm taking all the credit. Yeah. No offense. <laughs> it's okay. I gotta say though, I'm really digging the junkyard uh, theme here. Don't hit the radio. Pretty cool. Even though it's cool music, also. Do, do, yeah, do, do. I love this junkyard theme though. Keep playing it. That's alright. It's not as epic as uh, the street song. Oh yeah, uh -oh. but it's pretty good. I mean, come on. Uh oh. All these freaking tires. I'm getting tired of this level. It is a pretty long level. Yeah. Is Freddy uh -oh. coming? Well, I find Freddy one way or the other. Yep. Lamest boss yet. <laughs> yeah, really, what the hell is that? <laughs> yeah. Looks like Freddy even looks like he has wings. He looks like he's flying with two pieces of baloney. He looks like he could be a mini boss in Castlevania or something. Yeah, probably, I know, I think that's an insult to Castlevania. <laughs> yeah, sorry Konami. Oh, great, now this video has been third party by Konami because it got butt hurt. <laughs> oh, Konami. You know, they can make AdSense money, but we can't. But anyway, I digress. And. Yeah, let's get rid of this lame boss. Alright. And that is the end of Nightmare on Elm Street Part 1. We will see you in Part Dulce. Until then, God bless and take care. <laughs> we'll see you if you dare. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, don't forget the power glove. Oh yeah, baby! Welcome to part two of Let's Play Nightmare on ECW Street. This is Ron Moore, along with the Wee Guy and the Star Soldier. That's us. Oh yeah, I'm pretty sure I'm still a Star Soldier. But am I Star Soldier in this stream? Ah! What? I'll see, I'm um, Super oh, Star Soldier. Oh, okay. I thought you said Star Soldier in the street. I go, okay. <laughs> uh, now, we are in the graveyard. Again? Oh, oh no, ah. we were in the junkyard before. <laughs> oh! Alright, and... Now, you were in the junkyard before, now it's the graveyard? Yeah, what it looks like that? we're... Sperm! <laughs> That's <laughs> all <I can> think <laughs> of. <laughs> no, Race it looks like even more of like a typical platformer. Yeah. You got green grass, get rocks. Yeah. Got, okay, you know, there are some grave sites, but <laughs> yeah, I can't believe yeah, it's like a game. R.I.P. on the tombstones. When I was a kid, I was like, "What does rip mean?" <laughs> really didn't know what that meant. No. <laughs> hey, rip. I'm like, what is rip? I think it's people who are lazy and <laughs> yeah. Just a uh, rest in peace, rip. Yeah. <laughs> you know, it's You're definitely. Dead. Well, you know, it costs money to write on those stooms. Tombs. <laughs> stooms. Okay, now we're in Bold Man stage or Wave Man stage. Oh, wait. Oh! Yeah. <laughs> I'm a bubble bubble. Oh! Yeah, it'd be bubble bubble. Yeah. yeah. Alright, I collected all the bones! Hooray! Alright, more combat! All right. Yeah. Well, not in Mario World. Oh wait. Uh oh, Mario World Fortress or something. All right. Whoa, Uncle Fester. Sorry. Oh, yeah.
<laughs> oh, God. Oh, no. Ooh, look. A ghost. <laughs> Ooh, a ghost. It's not even transparent. Yeah. Oh, this is Freddy's nightmare. He can do whatever he wants. <laughs> He's not doing a lot. He's right, just now. flying up and down. Yeah. Ooh, ooh. Beware my predictable patterns. <laughs> All right, now playing is Ryu Hayabusa. Yeah. I would say Ninja Spear, but nobody cares about Ninja Spear. Never heard of that game. They should though. <laughs> well, Ninja Warriors, because it's the Dream Warriors, Ninja yeah. Warriors. Ninja Warriors yeah. is also awesome. There you go. <laughs> or is it Shinobi? No. No, it's Ninja Warriors. Um, he is awesome too. Listen to this theme. Sounds like you're saying, ECW, ECW. No. Such terrible music. But it goes no, with not. the pattern of the boss. It's a terrible oh. boss, so you get yeah. terrible music. <laughs> Repetitive. This... Hey, come on, David Wise. It's not a fit. Come on, can't blame him. Well, this there track, this track ain't that good, but this one right here is good. Yeah. Looks like our Freddy is in another castle. <laughs> yep. <laughs> How many of his stupid bones do we got? I've... Yeah, Freddy has We must have like over 200 now bones. Yeah, of Freddy's. That's quite a boner. Uh oh. Is this <laughs> Freddy's house or the or the 1401 Elm Street or whatever the house is? Ah. It's the death okay. house. Yeah, really. It kind of looks like the first house we needed to. Well, this one's all. In the first up, let's play. Yeah. This one's all. It might be, I don't know, but now Freddy's theme is playing, or not the theme, but the Nightmare on Elm Street theme. Yeah, tile screen. Yeah. Uh oh, we're gonna get the trademark signal. Easy freaking up on you. What's that? How is water gonna hurt you? Come on. Uh, wait. <laughs> <laughs> it hurts you in all video games for some reason. Yeah. I move dirty Harry for any Just be thankful. Just be thankful you're not Simon Belmont who will die if he touches water. Yeah. yeah. Oh, this, this, kind of, this kind of reminds me of Castlevania. It's all spooky. Okay, it's not spooky, spooky. It's like, ooh, haunted house, spooky. Yeah. <laughs> Nothing too it's much. Almost like variety. it's like Simon's Quest. Like you're collecting all the bones. Yeah. What a shit little fuck. <laughs> Dear God, we found the inspiration for this game. Yeah. yeah. Rare just wanted to make a Castlevania ripoff. Yeah. What a cowbunga piece of shit. What a bunch of cockadoogie. Yeah. Yes. Hey, when is that movie coming out anyways? Come on, AVGN. Hurry up. Should be soon. <laughs> Alright. <laughs> I gotta see him in July. He's coming down to Com Bravo, by the way. Oh, cool. So it's well, a Bravo. for me to rip him off. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you're nowhere close as a rip-off. You're like a, like a rip-on. Yeah. If that makes uh -huh. any sense. Oh, I was trying to rip him off, though. I think I'm you're a, I think I'm you're a rip off a gamer. I admit it. You're a rip off of Jay. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh, look out! Here we go. Oh, there we go. Oh, now I can see why blood hurts you. It's like the Mega Man drops. Yeah, I was gonna say the Mega Man two drops here. Oh, idiot. Okay. The blood <laughs> drips. Oh no, it seems like they steal everything from every Nintendo game, but <laughs> they don't steal anything from the movies. <laughs> yeah. Well, I wouldn't be stealing, that would be doing something accurate. <laughs> and that's not the LJN way. Yeah. Let's make this yeah, as bad as possible. Dude, make, make this video this game. Yeah. We got okay. license, how we make game. Make oh, game man. Bad. Game over? Game over. Uh, <laughs> Forget that. I got ECW mode. Oh yeah, Cheater. Cool wizard. Yeah, forget the powers of Freddy. Party. We got <laughs> ECW mode. <laughs> wizard! It's like Wizards and Warriors. Yeah. It's a rare Come on, game. Harry Potter. Yeah, I was about to say, now you're playing as We Got Potter. <laughs> why, why me? I don't... Well, he looks like... Oh, you got Potter. Oh, yeah, he kind of does. And no Potter. <laughs> I just, I just better get in no nice, Potter. smooth, silky, sexy robe, and then, ooh. <laughs> Wizard. Oh. oh. Come on. This is my dream. I should be able to do what I want. Let's play a different game. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. 
Kirby Streamland. Yeah, Kirby not Maryland. Believe me, it's a lot better than this. Kirby versus <laughs> Freddy. Or we can play Kirby and Nightmare in Dreamland. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. That's an actual game. That is a remake of the for Kirby's Adventure. Nightmare on Dream Street. Nightmare in Dreamland. <laughs> that would be... Like, that would be stupid. Yeah, that would be funny. You see Kirby, he's happy, he's smiling, and then he kills a whole bunch of people for no reason. Yeah. <laughs> Kirby's like the equivalent of Freddy in those games. He just kills everything. All cute. Yeah. Kirby's a yeah, monster. If you think about Kirby is a maniac. He just swallows people, steals their ability, and I don't know, gets rid of the corpses. Uh -oh, That's why he does Super Smash Brothers. Yeah, they well, say it's E-rated, but we know all, all know Kirby's an asshole. <laughs> oh, it looks like Freddy's coming for you. Yep. You see this? You. Oh yeah, that stupid music again. What one, two. Aw. I say we create a new theme for this. It's like one. Aw, oh, damn it. <laughs> <laughs> Freddy's trademark coming. Yeah. <laughs> oh, what a fight. Copyright 1991. Seriously, LJ got lazy right here. I mean, like, Freddy's just swatting at you like he's blind. Like, come on. I mean, Rare got lazy. I know you want to blame LJN because, you know. Well, fuck them. Rare and LJN got lazy. Wait, is it LJN? They call the shots, right? Like, no, we don't want this to happen. We want this to happen. So maybe Rare did make it good, but LJN said, no, let's make it suck. <laughs> yeah, I mean, you've seen the quality of, you know, Rare's titles, you know, and they had good publishers when they made those games. Yeah. And come LJN, it's like, oh. Oh, yeah? What well, about Perfect Dark Zero? What well, I'm in on yes. I'm in the NES. Not, not further. Well, we all know what happened. Nuts and bolts. Yeah, we all know what happened to Rare after they acquired by Microsoft. I mean, that's on That's the equivalent of LGN. What about like, Rare by the Gooby? <laughs> yeah, that that all sucked. They 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 sucked right after they went at, they went away from Nintendo. Yeah. Cause even here, oh, I mean. Jet Force Gemini. Oh wait, that was good. Yeah, I mean, even even like with tile like this, you know, you could be like, well, you know, it's. It's got something good about it, you know, good music and all, but, uh, of course, we can't, you can't, you can't forgive Rare for what they've done lately. Just can't. Damn you, Microsoft, for ruining their... Yeah, they haven't done anything lately. And they're sitting yeah. on some, you know, big money franchises. Killer Instinct, Battletoads, Wizards and Warriors. Yeah, really. I'd love to see some of those classes come back. Yeah. But no. <laughs> They yes, have to give us Diva Piñata or something. Yeah, something stupid like yeah. that. No, I, I could say that Microsoft is kind of like the new LJM for them, except it's called LJM for yeah. F, Microsoft. Laugh and joke and... Microsoft. Microsoft. Laugh and joke. Yeah, Mike and joke <laughs> Microsoft. Oh, I'm ruining it. Come on. <laughs> yeah, each time you load up an LJM, it crashes. Yeah. Get the... The <laughs> blue screen of the red ring of death. Yeah, oh yeah. <laughs> yes, they're gonna make a nightmare in Elm Street 2. Oh man. <laughs> well, yeah, uh, have even forced rubber spiders. Yeah. Man. <laughs> <laughs> uh, don't jump over it. No! Oh. Idiot! Yes, got to hear the uh, rock music. <laughs> that is pretty cool music, I got me. Yeah, yeah. At least we got to do that cool music. It is pretty cool. Unlike in Thomas Quest, where it just transitions to silence. That's a horrible, horrible night to have the curse. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> More horrible night to have WCW fail. I think that's a, I think that's that's a stand that's a standard thing anyway. Yeah. Oh. Ah. That's yeah, weird how. It's yeah, you know, so much of this is copied by you know, Simon's Quest and all that. I think I said that already, but still, <laughs> it's weird. Yeah. <laughs> oh, wait, don't hey forget guys, to throw you the whole spider. Ah, come on! I'm in trouble with this. Why don't you just punch and kill the spider? Okay. Because it's yucky. Well, you're yucky. So? <laughs> Well, I, and if the uh, was the same size as me, I wouldn't uh, be much. Yeah, really? <laughs> oh, look out. I thought it was Beetlejuice, I eat it. 
What? Come on. What is this, Battle Toads? Come on. Jump on the platform and go through it. Ah. <laughs> Well, remember, Battletoads had good, you know, controls. <laughs> yeah, but you still go through the freaking platforms. Well, that's different. That's a different circumstance. But you know what's different? This battle right here. Another incarnation of Frey. This time it's a face and a claw. Ooh. <laughs> Ooh, scary. Look at us as we go in a repetitive pattern. Yeah. yeah. That's yeah. time you're going to be finding the ghost. They ran out of ideas here, I guess. Yeah. Well, they never had any ideas, but... <laughs> Here, let's throw two on screen, they'll never know. Yeah. They'll be too distracted dying. So he's fighting an evil Doc Brown and Freddy's, uh, claw. Great Scott! Yeah, the giant catcher's mitt. Or oh, Uncle Fester. Yeah. Great Scott! Yeah. Marty, we only got it sending four gigawatts, 88 pounds, or 88 pounds per hour. <laughs> electric storm. <laughs> <laughs> ah! <laughs> All right, well, that is the end of part two. We will see you guys in part three. God bless and take care. Sweet dreams. <laughs> the nightmare has just begun. Welcome to part three, or let's play Discuss. Nightmare on ECW Cheat the Street. This is Ron Moore, along with J-Man, the Wii Guy, and the Rock uh, Star Gamer Extreme. <coughs> Woo! I was about to say the Rock Star Soldier. <laughs> yes, the Rock Star Soldier here. No, you, no, you have to be. Hey, everybody! This is the Rock Star Soldier here. <laughs> okay, and, yeah, and, uh, and uh, yeah, we're filming already at this game. <laughs> oh, come on! You, s I landed on that. The leap of faith. Come on, we got you can do better. I mean, uh, whatever character's name is. Hey, you're doing this. You're doing the cheat street here. You use your fancy well, it, words. It don't protect me against uh, pitfalls. Well, yeah, I don't. But at least I uh, have infinite lives, or nine lives, which indicates infinite lives. Yeah, oh, my cat. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Come Pretty on, much. we got jump, jump. We got. Oh, there you go. Jump. Oh yeah, I apologize. Jump. Audio. The first half of this video, audio and video is out of sync. Thanks, Camp Camp Studio. Um, tell a, few, a second ahead of time when I'm when I die. Should you use unregistered Hypercam too? Yeah. Ah, I got unregistered Camp Studio one or whatever it is. <laughs> Negative one. Yeah. <laughs> ah, come on, jump! Seriously, on the very edge. And yeah, I just quick cut through that because I had enough. So, oh, good thing you had the infinite lives. Yeah. That's ridiculous. The jumping controls kind of suck. Okay, that was stupid. I'm trying to figure out <laughs> stuff of God. Should have gotten when I was over there, and I saw it just now. I'm trying to. Oh, dang! You see what I try to do there? I forgot that dying is funny. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah. Ooh, Next. lockers! Again, water? Really? Come on. Well, that guy's that water. That's trapping water. <laughs> or dropping it, whatever. Alright, yes, time to go to sleep. In the spikes! I wanna see AVGN LP this game. <laughs> that'd be oh. interesting. Welcome to AVGN LPs. Yeah. Nostalgia Critic versus AVGN. Battle of the LPers. They're not even LPs. <laughs> battle of battle of their LPs because they're not LPs, but yeah. <laughs> All right. Well, Avengers hasn't even done an LP. I mean, Sajika has, but yeah, you know, man, whatever. <laughs> this is the only way I want to get across that pit is use the Harry Potter. Float, wizard, float. One, yes. Ah. Oh man. Look at that! Come on! Jump! Jump, you stupid <laughs> idiot! You're on battle the very toad. edge! Yeah, it's the Sorry, battle toads mother. effect. You respawn right at the edge. This this may be the game that's gonna make me curse. Too late. Yeah, yeah but, but I love not being on Elm Street. Yeah, but too late. Sure, too late. Hey, Funky Kong. Alright, uh... Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> can't remember. Can't get funky. 
Okay, now blood I can understand hurting in the nightmare world, but not water. Bloody tears. Ah, come on. This game's gonna make you cry bloody tears. Yeah, really. And you'll be screaming bloody murder by the time you're done with this game. Here he comes. One, two, ECW. Three, four. I don't want any more. I don't know. Five, six, um... I don't know. Can't think of anything else. One, two, um, yeah, you, I fail. One, two, fuck Oh, man. Well, Freddy's <laughs> coming, he's gonna fail. Freddy, trademark coming. Knock your ass on the floor. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no, not the trademark. Once again, the, uh, lame, lazy battle. Seriously, the LGN really made Freddy look stupid right here. Hey, we've, seen, we've seen Freddy fight Jason. He can do more moves than that. Did he have, like, dementia or something? I mean... What was that? <laughs> oh no, that was stupid. Alright, now we got all the bones in this area. Whoa, how did that happen? I don't know. <laughs> but I love this music. Easy dub. Easy dub. It fits, certainly fits the atmosphere. That's the good thing about this awesome soundtrack. This track right here... It, it sounds depressing at first and it gets all happy. I like the first part of this, like this right here. It sounds cool. Oh, oh dang cool. it! Now we can't listen to it because it's got not the freaking radio. I got the awesome radio video theme. Yeah, it's cool. I like this depressing emo thing better. When I'm, ha when I'm having a bad day, I just crank this on full blast in my car and just run down everybody. I'm just kidding. Really? Listen, in yes, music in the car. I thought that was the only one. Awesome! I thought I was the only one. One more with roll rage. I wonder what ha happened. I should really like burn this on the CD. Just yeah, I do. Bounce track and just turn up full blast, going down the street, and with my uh, car uh, bouncing up and down hydraulics and. <laughs> yeah, you kids all got your whap, but listen to this. <laughs> yeah. These platforms look like uh, like high school lockers or something. I don't know. But they are. This is not. Uh, this is Elm Street High. Yeah. <laughs> That just reminds me, though, that platform you were that was floating up and down, it just looks it looks like tofu for some reason, wrapped in seaweed. I don't know why. <laughs> I'm just starting to think of what it looks like. See, I see, it doesn't look like... It looks like... I, it, was it, was this an episode of Weeds, or what? Yeah, it is. Uh, welcome, to, uh, welcome to another episode of Weeds. I don't know why. It kind of sounded like Star Soldier there for a minute. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah, baby! <laughs> me and Jay has a kite. <laughs> what do you say, Jay? Uh, it still sound the same. <laughs> <laughs> no, Jay, Jay, Jay would be the Jay would be the relaxed high. Yeah, he'd be even more. If he gets more relaxed, he's 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 gone. It'd be Jason. Probably yeah, comatosation. I don't know. What? Uh, Comatose uh, or so I don't know. Douchebag. You don't be using your fancy school book learning words on here. Yeah, just because we're in Elm Street High, don't mean you can use your little textbook words. Uh, I must graduate from high school though. Yeah. <laughs> GED. GED. <laughs> um. How about the ECW diploma? Extreme. Extra credit. Dick. Extra credit. World. I fail. Alright, extra yeah. credit wrestling. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Oh, I knew that was gonna happen. <laughs> I knew it, so I did it anyway. Yeah. Again. <laughs> I was gonna jump because it. Okay, yeah. Ready? Jump off the edge. There we go. Moron. Alright. Moron. I got the Mortal Kombat symbol now. Can I do some finishing moves? Just a good turn into some Liu Kangness. Yeah. Ah, uh, and hold on. Shocker. Do the, do the bicycle kick. Yeah. Yes. Alright. Well, this theme's getting intense. Yeah. You must be nearing the end. Oh, yes. Falling asleep. You know, you think it would be a bad thing if you fell asleep. Yep. But it's not. But no, you are uh, powerful yeah. in your dreams. And yes, now the video and audio is in sync. Amazing. <laughs> from day two, from sleep to awake, the video is in sync. 
And then you get a 10 second window that pops up. Yeah. Whoa, 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 yes. whoa, whoa. Yes, and... Yes. Ah, doing some fancy bound toads like ni trickness. I wouldn't say that. Uh, I don't know. Uh, so you have to do that bound toads. You have to jump for platform. And all that jazz. Uh, I can't do it. Freaking I thing sucks. Easy. We'll cast many of skeletons. Uh, I spawn. You got two looking Yes. Guys. Sticks and stones might break my bones, but this game can never kill me because I have ECW mode. <laughs> <laughs> I like that. And then you die. Yeah. Well, I'm back. <laughs> what do you say about that, Jay? You, you're a douchebag. Yeah, you cheats. You can't beat games like me. Or me. <laughs> Alright. Uh, 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 Almost there. Don't die. Well, if it don't matter, I got anything to continue. Use. <laughs> oh, <laughs> it even matters. Oh dear. <laughs> and it took me a while to figure out Freddy's down here. All right, so there you go. Oh dear goodness. Now we gotta do a gauntlet. It's gonna be fun. Fighting all. That's, oh, that's a good game. Yeah, fighting all Freddy's incarnations again. Hmm, no, sounds like another gauntlet. game. Uh, Gauntlet 10 or whatever sequels there are. First, the hand on balls. <laughs> yeah. Destroyed. Guess when the right. sewers of uh, Elm Street High. Where's Groundskeeper Willie? Oh wait, that's Springfield High. Yeah. Groundskeeper Freddy. They fight. Get out of my sewer. They all seen his head on a bunch of balls. Those are like pieces of chicken. There's his tongue. Yep. Down there. Yeah. Kentucky Fried Freddy. Or Kentucky yeah. Freddy Chicken. This is dousing, because he can stretch. Kentucky Freddy Chicken. Yeah. Okay. Hey, you can't use the word Freddy, it's trademark. Oh, my bad. I'll pay real quick. Ooh. Oh. Flying Fist of Fury. Should, you should have a fistful of dollars. <laughs> yeah. I don't know why, but I'm thinking of fist jokes. Yeah. He'll give you a fisting. Wait. I'm thinking of jokes. That would hurt. But it's I don't want to hear about that. I don't want to hear about that. <laughs> yeah. I just love how the music keeps just repeating. <laughs> yes, we. <laughs> All right. Um. Now we got um. Can... Whoa! Yeah, you have to turn to a bat. You know what? On chances that we have more bats in the screen. <laughs> yeah, but no, not, not better audio. Right. <laughs> Say, when did Freddy ever turn into a bat? <laughs> no, that bad. he can. He can. <laughs> but I don't remember that in the movies. I only have seen up to three you though. You don't remember Freddy vs. Batman? <laughs> I am the night. Well, I am nightmare, bitch. <laughs> Freddy. <laughs> yeah, I am the nightmare. Right. That's what he would be. Yeah. Take two more to go. I stop at the entrance and restart the music every time we find a new, a new incarnation. This one's just silly. Come on, really? Yeah, Uncle so Fester. What's his vacuum cleaner at? He sucks. <laughs> oh no, it's Freddy's quest. Yeah. By the way. Yeah. Right. Yeah. What Fester's? Yeah. Freddy's quest. How, how appropriate for that game, by the way. Fester's quest. It has a vacuum cleaner. I guess they're trying to tell us this game. <laughs> it literally sucks. sucks. <laughs> it's a festering quest. Yeah. It's a festering, festering, cluster fist. Oh, <laughs> like Ronnie said. Yeah. Wow, just it's imagine trying count to count chocolate them. cereal characters over here attacking me. Right. Yeah, just try, just try and do this without cheats or yeah, without. Yeah, forget locked. that. Yeah, who would want to? I mean, seriously. Yeah, me. <laughs> okay, do it. On your channel. Like I said. <laughs> I, gotta the I gotta find the card first and then I'll do uh, it. I don't wanna hear it. Um... <laughs> I don't wanna hear it, you'll do it too. <laughs> Alright, now... Doc Brown and his fist... We're reaching up to 88 miles per hour. 
Yeah. My well, wife started, started to say 88 pounds per hour. <laughs> oh yeah, 88 pounds. <laughs> Ooh, I was a little drunk there. <laughs> I hung out with J-Man for a while. <laughs> hey, I represent that statement. <laughs> I bet you do. <laughs> All right, come on. I'm, I'm not trying, as you can see, and why should I? I mean, because you have a you have a reputation to protect. Come on. Yeah, and at least I admit it. Um, <laughs> and yeah, I'm not. Yeah, just like Eddie Guerrero said, God rest his soul. If you're not cheating, you're not trying. Cheat to win. <laughs> All right, okay, finally. Oh, watch out! The intense final battle we've all been waiting for. I wonder what this is gonna look like. He's gonna go into the incinerator. <laughs> well, I mean, it looks like he already jumped in there, but... Yeah. I guess it's <laughs> that jump. And oh. that's it. <laughs> hey, this is Rip of Castlevania 2. <laughs> I love this rendi rendition right here of, of Nightmare on Elm Street, this, this music. Much better than the beginning of the game. But yeah, that's it. I mean, what a weak final battle. It's just the same thing he does when you fight him. Look at that. Trey tra yeah. Trademark is dead, and the nightmare is ended. No, not the trademark. His LP has ended. Well, yeah, I mean... Or has it? Well, no, yes, it has, because this game has ended. So, yes, the nightmare has ended. Yes, thank God, it's, it's and... for part two on the <laughs> Super Nintendo. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, the ColecoVision, not uh <laughs> Okay, nope. and... So that is the end of Nightmare on Elm Street for the NES. Um, as some of you know, and I stated this before, I did this video, or did this series um, in 2010, the Let's Check Out version. And I had to because J-Man did me a favor by recording Survival Arts, so I had to live up my end of the deal and do Nightmare on Elm Street on the Raw More channel. Um, and yeah, and I actually did this in 2007, but I took it down because it really sucked. And... Uh, yeah, so this game is uh, is not that horrible. Yeah, it, it sucks, and it is really frustrating, but there's a lot worse games than this. I mean, this game is mediocre, um, but the soundtrack is freaking awesome. And, I mean, it is an NES game, so he, you can't really expect it to be gory and bloody like uh, the movies are. But, I mean, it was it was... I think it was made by Rare, but published by LGN, so that re pretty much ruined it right there. Rare had its had its way, and LGN was totally out of the picture. Uh, this game probably would have been much better. Um, and so, I mean, it it, it did. It was a four player game. You had to have a four player multi tap or something, which I never heard of until I saw ABGN's review. Um, so it might have been kind of fun with four players. I don't know. It's really fun when you cheat because you can't die. And there is a, uh, a let's play on YouTube where someone did a beat this game with Game Genie with four players, or no, two players actually. But uh, it'd be fun to see four players. I'm sure it's out there. It's actually uh, another guy, different color than two females, which have no names. This is we guy, we girl, and no. I don't know. <laughs> anyway, um, yeah. So this game though is not that bad. Uh, it could have been done much better. It's kind of poorly executed. Um, the best thing about this game is the soundtrack. I mean, David Wise did an excellent job in the soundtrack, uh, especially the theme where you're running around down Elm Street, and uh, some of the things in the houses are pretty good. And the rendition of uh, the Nightmare on Elm Street theme at the very end of the game was pretty cool. And also Freddy's theme when he's coming after you, that, that's pretty cool too. And that, that's, that's one cool part about the game, one of the very, very few cool things about the game. It's like you're playing the game, and then all of a sudden you hear that theme in the, in the dream world. So, I mean, some kids, when they play that during the time, they're probably thinking, oh, shoot, what, what is this? Does it mean Freddy's coming? And then all of a sudden you see that cheesy screen with Freddy trademark, Freddy's trademark coming, or Freddy trademark's coming. Uh, and that was pretty cool, though. The Freddy theme, which means he's coming after you, and, yeah, you get that kind of a creepy feel. Uh, if you were a kid and you saw the movies and played this game. Uh, but I didn't get to experience that because I never played this game as a kid. But the best thing about this game, the soundtrack, overall gameplay, graphics, uh, mediocre. Graphics aren't too bad. The controls are all right, except the freaking platformer controls you try to jump. It's ridiculous. But overall, I mean, 
I have to give this game probably a five out of ten. We got. All right, sweet. My turn. So yeah, um, yeah. I don't think the game is too bad either. Definitely. Um, if of course if LJ wasn't a part of the picture, I think Rare could have done a good job making it a very good, you know, uh, movie to game licensed just game. And just, I realize that you have to take, like, these kind of games with a grain of salt, because, of course, the game isn't going to be just like the movie. I mean, just look at pretty much any other, you know, movie to game, you know, game. I mean, maybe you could say Batman's pretty close, but even still, I mean, what did Batman have? It had Batman the Joker and, like, the Batmobile. That was it. Didn't have much from the movie. I don't see people complaining, like, about certain people, you know, appearing, but basically they just did a good job, Sunsoft doing a good job, just making it a fun game to play, and I think... You know, Rare did that too, just LGM messed up something. But you definitely um, you definitely uh, said uh, said what I would have said about the music, best part, and David White did a good job making the, uh, you know, great, you know, subject for the atmosphere of this game. And I, I haven't played it yet, actually. I need to definitely, I need to find the game and see how the controls are. They seem pretty tight, just certain, you know, platforming sections and just cheap, kind of repetitive boss fights with the Freddy incarnations, and yeah, I don't think this, I don't think this game is too bad, it's, it seems pretty good, you know, just as a game itself, minus it, if you don't think of it as part of Nightmare on the Sheet, you know, I think it's still just a good game, you know, it looks, it looks good too, because Rare is good at doing graphics too, but i will probably give it a 6 out of 10, just a little higher score than yours, because... I don't know, I think I would, you know, enjoy it just because, I mean, just look at all the other games I've played and given scores to. Are you really that surprised? No. <laughs> yeah, exactly. So, so yeah, I don't think it's a bad game. Pretty good. Um, J-Man. Uh, isn't Ronnie supposed to uh, say Yeah, that? yeah, we got to let me pass it on. So, okay. J-Man, go ahead. J-Man? <laughs> <laughs> okay, first of all, I think you guys are... Uh, being very nice to this game. Um, wow. But okay, I'm going to give my rating first. I'm going to give it a 3 out of 10. And it's simply because this is a, a horrible, horrible rip-off title to great, great movies. Okay. It just it, it it there's really nothing that links this to Nightmare on Elm Street besides Straight out. <laughs> trademark. I mean in 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 uh in high school teenagers. I mean there's there's really nothing else there. Music wise, awesome. Um yeah, it's 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 fun to play, but it's it's not a, a fun game to play for a long time. I don't see the interest in anyone trying to, to beat the entire game without using like ECW mode. You know, I really don't see it. Right. So um, yeah, three out of ten. I mean, it just like after a certain point, it, the game just like repeats itself. You know. Like, uh, you know, like the boss rush, which yeah. has happened on quite a few games. Yep. Yeah, no, I, I can't, like, like say that's, a, like, a good part of the game at all. I mean, yeah, three out of ten. That. Fuck this game. All, right. all, the, all the angry AVGN shit that he said at the end of it. Yeah, there we go. Throw that in there, and three out of ten. All right, RGX. Hmm. Well, I kind of came in not really knowing what to expect, you know, from this game. Since I'll admit it, I don't, I don't, I, don't, I didn't even know who Freddy Krueger was. I was. I'm, I'm not that big on horror movies. I mean, I only just barely got into this, so, so, it's a lot like what Ronnie said. The, the music is. The music's not bad. I mean, I've heard better, but it's it's, def, it's definitely definitely found a few tracks catchy. And as for the platforming, it, the controls kind of look a little agitating to work with. Like, yeah, 
they 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 they, they really remind me of Kid Icarus of how slippery it is <laughs> and how unstable. Yeah. Hmm. Let me see here, and, and I couldn't really follow anything like as as opposed to the storyline, what are, what what all the bosses were, and so hmm. hmm. I think I'm just gonna have to give this probably like a, a four because I don't really know exactly <laughs> what to make of it. All right, all right. So there you go. There's my opinion of Nightmare on Elm Street. Treat street our treat. our opinion. <laughs> it's our, it's, You're starting to sound like me. Come on, now. It, it's, me. It's, it's our opinion, and we're not sticking to it. No, uh, Damn. it's our facts, <laughs> and we're sticking to it. Uh, okay, so that's it. We're out of here. I'm Ron Moore, and this is the J Man, the Wee Guy, and the Rock Star. Star Star. Oh, 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 ah. God bless. Take care. Peace. Peace. I could use a Rock Star energy drink. <laughs> Monster's better. Rebel sure, Monster. Monster. Sorry, I'm with Jamie on this one. Monster is. <laughs> Blue Bull. <laughs>
The video that Ronnie does. <laughs> Super Metroid sucks. No, she can't. <laughs> now we got the lamp. Andrew has been ejected. The what? I said Andrew has been ejected. Oh. <laughs> Check out the superior state of the art grainy graphics right here. <laughs> Which is weird. Usually don't look this bad. I don't know what's going on with Cam Studio these days. Yeah. It's Ronnie's computer. I don't know, it might be Cam Studio because his computer is trolling him. Well, it might be my computer too, because the higher the graphics of a game, the more harder it is for me to record it on this computer. Mm. Even though I can record Ocarina of Time as grainy as it is, Mario Kart 64 could not. Oh yeah. As grainy as a freaking what, uh, what polygonal was, I guess. Too many polygons for my computer. It was polygonally confused. Yeah. Alright, so now I found a hit, hidden way to get into the castle. And there's Link's uncle. <laughs> Venom 22 is dying right here. Why did right you here. take my sword from me? I was playing with it in bed. <laughs> Zelda is your dot dot dot. Some people are saying Zelda is your sister, which I don't think so. <laughs> yeah, like we're gonna believe that. <laughs> this game didn't start in Kentucky. Yeah. <laughs> That's my Zelda is your princess, but then again, duh. Zelda is your mother. <laughs> okay, now, we're inside the uh, courtyard or whatever castle grounds. <laughs> that was after just throwing a bush at him. <laughs> yeah. I don't beat around That's the bush scary. in this game. Uh, he bushed him in two hits. Now we're inside the castle. I still like how you can hear the rain on top of the roof. It's pretty cool. Mm, I like the I like the overhead view of this. Like, I mean, I know they had it in like a, a few other games, but yeah, I like the original Zelda. Yeah. Huh? I like the music. I just, in this I just like I like like how um the amount of trouble they went to with all the graphics, you know? Well, yeah. Gotta the... explain that. Nintendo, they gotta represent. Yeah. You can't do that on Sega. Yep. You can't do this on the Genesis Super Nintendo does? <laughs> what Nintendo don't? Nintendo does what Jenna don't fail. Fail. Who's Jenna? Is she hot? <laughs> Gen Jenna Bush? Yeah, I guess. Nintendo does what Jenna sucks at. <laughs> win, win, win. ECW. 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 I sound like old nanny right now. So you, uh, are you like a pacifist? Who, me? No, Ronnie. <laughs> what are you talking about? He's giving all the enemies. What are you talking about? He's well, why, why kill him? It's just like in Metal Gear, it's not necessary. Yeah, but it's, it's fun. Do as little yeah. work as possible, right? <laughs> right, make it simple, stupid. Make it simple, stupid, stupid. Make it stupid, simple. <laughs> Make it yeah. stupidly simple, because it's stupid. <laughs> yeah. I could have gotten in a tongue twister with that. How stupid are you? <laughs> oh, save you, let me throw this barrel at the door. Oh, wait. There's a guard. Yeah. Yeah. Fucking bionic commando. <laughs> so, hey, let me borrow that chain. Let me whip that thing open. <laughs> You got the big key. <laughs> oh, your key is so big! So now rescue Princess Zelda. <laughs> wow. Ronnie, I had a feeling we were getting close. <laughs> and Zelda's theme, I think, makes its debut right here. Or Zelda's lullaby. 
<laughs> Zelda's interest interest music. Let me romance yeah. you with my lullaby. <laughs> Coming down the aisle. Zelda. Do, do, do. So now I gotta take Zelda out of the castle. Get her into the uh, underground sanctuary. Yeah, get her down there. <laughs> and this that screen right there seems like a waste of time. I was like, really? But this right here, I guess just to add more to the game, I don't know. It's like in some Mega Man stages for the NES, some stages don't have no enemies, nothing in them, it's just passing through. Yeah, <laughs> like just a bunch of gaps and you jump over and avoid some spikes. Gameplay experience. Yeah. It's like in Mega Man 2 where you all you have is those like drops that can hurt you, and then you just face the final boss and that's it. <laughs> yeah. Watch out for the spikes. <laughs> Pass the spikes. You know, she should help fight. Yeah, she has power, according to Archimedia Tom. Right. Here, yeah. use your magic, I'll use my sword. <laughs> yeah. Use the force. Go up the stairs to go down the stairs. Yeah. I'm going up the stairs and I'm going down the stairs. I'm going up the stairs and I'm going down the stairs. Oh my. Fail. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> Big time. Baseball. Hey, what are you standing there for, you Brad? Come and help me push this. Yeah. Right. Princess. Excuse me, princess. <laughs> Excuse me, princess. I'm doing all the hard work here. Why don't you come and push something for me? I always wonder what that green bar is, like, really. I'm a total noob at this. It's the magic meter. Oh, alright. Or no, actually it's the, the oil in your candle. It's the, uh, yeah. It's got left. Oh, cool. This is weird, because yeah, it's, it's usually, it's really the magic meter for most of the game, but like, the oil lantern, that's not magic, it's just a lantern. So you're not really using magic yeah you're right now so right now it's just an oil meter it is magic Tony. do you believe in magic no ronald mcdonald i don't <laughs> you believe in fairies do you believe in ecw fairies yeah no mm. blast i believe in emulators <laughs> in what emulators <laughs> yeah <laughs> Only you can romulate. <laughs> Leave me ECW states. Exactly. <laughs> Be careful. So now in the uh, Hyrule Castle sewer system. Dang, yep. I just I just had a good phrase for ECW, but the W just made it made it all messy. <laughs> Emulate, capture, and can't think of something for the W. Wrestling. <laughs> right. Um, I was gonna say now on, on this set, uh there's not a cap to like how many rupees you can get, or it's probably like nine ninety nine. Yeah, nine ninety nine. Yeah. Oh yeah. Reno, you well. Can the NFL got butt hurt and said you need to start having a salary cap, so they put 999 on there instead of unlimited. Yeah, I I, I have that problem now because I stole items from the store. <laughs> yeah. See, I there's mean, a uh, looks like you can bomb there, but you don't have bombs yet, so you, you can't return back to this part of the game. I don't think later on. So, well, I think I think you can. I guess I don't know. I never tried that. Then I guess you use a bomb then when you get a bomb later on. It's just a big tease. Yeah. Oh, you teeth. Hot <laughs> stuff coming through. Oh, you're <gasps> yeah, I pulled the wrong switch before because it don't tell you which one to go to. It just says over there. <laughs> you pull the wrong switch, bomb is coming down. 
Yeah, you have to grab one and run real quick. Yeah. 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 That's the only way. All right, now we're in church. Yeah, I know, right? <laughs> uh, uh, and this week's week sermon, week this week's sermon, how to beat Zelda. The player's God is your Bible. No. <laughs> And this is the preacher, whatever his name is. I don't know if he had a name. I don't know. Just uh, steal whatever's in that treasure chest. Yeah, don't no, steal on church. That's yeah, that's wrong. <laughs> it's the holy thing. It's sad. I actually had a friend that would steal in church. I'm like that's <laughs> that's lame. May God have mercy mercy on your soul. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, literally. Actually, no, I was wrong. He was. He would steal, but then he was pressured to steal him from church. He's like, no, that's wrong. It's wrong enough to steal, but to steal in church? What is wrong with you? Anyway, move out the way. And I am going to steal because I'm a hypocrite. And... <laughs> yeah. Alright, so that is the end of part one, Link to the Post. See you in part dos. God bless Make you. Make sure you for part two or else. Uh-huh. Peace. Yep. And let's save state. The Legend of Zelda, A Link to the Past for the SNES. This is Ron Moore along with the Wii Guy and the Jinchu. Yo! <clears throat> now I'm on to uh, Kiriko Village to interrogate yes. some people. Yes, Kakariko Village! Yeah, when I was a kid I was like, what is that? Kakakaka Village? What? <laughs> like, okay. Chicago. Are you supposed to find Shasha 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 Shasha? What are those guys? Shasha 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 Wanted! This is the criminal who kidnapped Zelda. Please, I, please, capture him. <laughs> okay, here's Mae Young, and I'm talking to her for a bit. I can do voice acting. I can be like, oh, it's you, Ronnie! Of the draw. What Rasta sword? Well, I don't remember the details exactly. <laughs> I don't know. Long ago, a prosperous visit. What the hell? It's <laughs> amazing. Well, at least she's in the kitchen. <laughs> her whole the room kitchen? is a. It's her whole room is a bathhouse, kitchen, living room thing. <laughs> yeah, it's all one room. Exactly. There must Back be then, someone it... in the village who know who knows where he is. Uh... <laughs> yeah, back, back then they didn't have kitchens, they just had house. Get back in yeah. the house. <laughs> and you can freely go into people's houses without knocking on the doors. There you go, bedroom. Right. Well, they leave them wide open, or unlocked. Yep. Whatever. It's a house. Now let's go to this jail cell. That's quite, um... Yeah. <laughs> I don't know, I mean... They don't seem to have that much burglary, or anything. Yeah. I think. Well, that's why Link just turned himself into this jail. He's been breaking and entering. I shot the sheriff, but I did not shoot the deputy. I shot the cuddy. But I did not shoot... The stuff? I don't know. I don't know either. I'm, I'm trying to think. I'm not good with par parodies. ECW! ECW! I can listen to that forever. <laughs> yeah. da, 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 da. Like, like imagine everything you did that happened. Just open the door. Da, yeah. da, da, da. Turn in the test. Well, remember da, 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 last year? Da, da, da. Yeah, that would have happened. That would have been awesome if last year when I discovered the spiritual stone of ECW, if it said that. Yeah. What? Da, 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 da. <laughs> yeah. ECW. You, sir. All was separated to make life complete. I've got one on sale right now for the low, low price of 100 rupees. What do you say? Interested? I don't know why I am... This, uh... <laughs> anguage. I have a bottle. Is it you? Oh, it's a magic bottle. You yeah, it's, it's magic. Be hard as a leather pouch. You want a bottle? <laughs> the same old lady, what the heck? 
You have a twin? Yep, all the twins back with here. the turban wrapped head thing. I don't know. Why do they look like that? No, it's hard. Tell me, Nintendo. Space chicken. <laughs> space chicken? Yes. Oh. Hey, don't hit the space. Down here, they can't attack you. Can't hit the cocks. <laughs> They'll come after you. What is that butthurt guy's problem? <laughs> eh, leave me alone. Eh. Hey, here's a uh, viper. I'm sick. <laughs> it's kind of true. But yeah, they're coming down off the mountain. Sniff, sniff. I mean, this is my bug hitching net. I'll use it when I'm better. But for now, I'm into you. You see that meow? And by lending, he'll just give it to him because he never gets back. Link's a dick. Yeah. <laughs> that was a picture of Mario. Where? Oh, what the what heck? Oh, the that is. Coming out? He just humped the Mario poster. <laughs> you, why, why, why'd you hump his face? Well, what this music... This, this music is cool, yeah, it's depressing. Don't change the subject! No, I'm just kidding. Space Did you see that Oh, wow, another magic bottle. Alright. I'm a genie in a magic bottle. I Wait. guess you could say that that bottle was a message in a bottle, but in a, it was in a text box. Never mind. <laughs> Don't keep your emotions bottled up in this game. Well, I'll hit you with a bottle. <laughs> oh, wait a minute. Let me go in this outhouse here and buy some bombs. Bombs? You? Why can't you just That's go find bombs? It's the the hilly and uh, porta potty. <laughs> Those are not there bombs, are. Ronnie. Oh no! Hi, Ronnie. Alright, so this is the guy who's actually found this where Sahasrila is. Actually, this is Skip Rogers because he just marked his position on the map. Don't forget to bring a map. Yep. So well, now we go to you, uh, yeah. Now we go to the eastern part of Hyrule to talk to Sahasrila or Sean Connery or whoever he is. The day is mine. Now that I got bombs, I'm going here and bomb that wall to get some more ECW monies. Yes. I'll take uh, I'll take famous titties for five hundred. <laughs> what? Stuff that he said in the right. Jeopardy parody. <laughs> I, right, love that. I love that. I love that. Three, two, one. Play. ECW it is mine. Oh, dang it! He didn't play the ECW. <laughs> <thing>. <laughs> he went WCW. He went WCW. It went ding 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 ding. No, because that's just a piece of ECW. It's not the whole ECW. Yeah, yeah, the piece of ECW. You not you gotta, you gotta get four pieces to get one ECW. You see, you see, you can't get the whole ECW until you get four ECWs. That makes four. You can't have your ECW eat it too. You can't have your ECW for breakfast because you gotta eat your your uh, corn puffs, corn flakes. There we go. Yeah. Mario just paid Link money to hump his face. Link's a prostitute. He's a man whore. Oh, shoot. Oh no, whatever shall I do? One guard is sent after me. One, uh, yeah. How could they play the Streets of Rage boss battle there? Because that was epic. <laughs> because they wouldn't want to use Genesis type games in their Super Nintendo game? <laughs> well, no, the music, but well, not the game. Sick. Yeah, anyway, here's... Here's Magus, um, okay, and... Hey, hey guys, here. Zoran. This is like swimming. Zoran's at the source of the river. And the treasure of Zora can turn to people to fish, and they're pretty cool, 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 cool. Give a shout out to Zora, and that guy's Magus out. <laughs> oh, Magus. He was cool. He was cool. It's a good thing Sergeant Slaughter didn't beat him. Listen up, you worm, you Magus, you scum. I oh, fail. It's Magus, not Magus. <laughs> you Magus. <laughs> that actually kind of works. Alright. Oh, what was your solstice? Oh. I wish. Tim Fallen music for the win. Probably the only good thing about that game, but anyway. Oh, yeah, we got good graphics, you know, no, no, interesting no, gameplay, no, you know, for the time, you know? Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> You're right, Jay. <laughs> it's like a super soldier. Yeah. Like, like, Jay got lost in the Google, can't find him, so I can't make the sword. <laughs> 
it's, it's like a breed of Star Soldier and Beavis. Uh, I'm gonna yeah. go play in traffic now. <laughs> yeah, you see, uh, we get this game a uh, hundred, uh, fifty out of a hundred. Uh, <laughs> 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 oh yeah! <laughs> I don't even know. Okay, here's here's the Long John Silver or the Captain from the Simpsons or whatever he is. The old man of river. It's oh, she blows, drunk. mate. We got the drunk. No, nah, she's blowing. <laughs> why, why would they? Why? I, I don't get C language. I also don't get D language or B language. Are you seal language because you're just silly? Why don't you seal your mouth shut? <laughs> oh. Right. Looks like I sealed the deal on that one. <laughs> Ooh. Open the chest. No, it's, it's a trap. Wait, no, no. Oh, that was good music. Yeah, but it's a trap. And before Rob Martin. It's a freaking W. It's a W. Watch next episode. He's Whoa. Keanu Reeves. Oh my, my, uh, yeah. <laughs> um, the baby brother sealed the door to the room. <laughs> Is that the Elvis twins? Who are the heck? Yeah, I'm just gonna blow up your wall if you don't mind, sir. <laughs> yeah, I hope you don't mind if I blow this uh, wall in your house. Yeah, seriously, yeah, he goes. I still, yeah, I still, I still the door to my brother's room, and they just blows it up without even asking. What an asshole! Ah, oh, dang it, forget that. I gotta have the Pegasus boots before I can win that race. Actually, I once won that without the Pegasus boots. Oh, you can't, you have to have the Pegasus boots get through there. Oh, no, well, no, you see, oh, well, like, you second just really mark to get the with your sweet oh, sword wings and... Sword wings? What? I don't, I don't even know. <laughs> yeah, sword swing. Swing! Hey, you just mumble? Um... Uh, this is, uh... Just a position, uh, I don't know. <laughs> Alright, now, I'm gonna go to the, uh, Sahashala hut. <laughs> Sahashala what? what? Sahashala's hut. Sahashala's hut! Job of the hut. Whatever. <laughs> oh, not fat Albert! <laughs> <laughs> wow, good what? job. Yeah, doesn't know his cartoons. John has not even a cartoon, he's just a big fat fuck. <laughs> and hey, they both have that deep voice thing, so shut up. Jawa just went, oh, 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 I just happened to say hey, so shut up. Alright, let's make sure to make a mape. Uh, a mape? Uh, is it like an ape? <laughs> <Mean map. laughs> Alright. We well, already we had the map, we just had it marked down because the Skip Rogers help us. Yeah, we'll make it again. Nintendo knew about Skip and they implemented him into every it. single game they ever made. Watch the Tom. Um... Love this classic uh, high roll music. I was just about to say that, you know. You can't go wrong with this classic theme by Koji Kondo. Yeah. Koji Condominium. <laughs> Good one. <laughs> I haven't heard that before. <laughs> ah, dang it. Oh, 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 oh. Need the power glove for that. These cinnamon roll trees. Get the heck out the way. Oh, I need it. I must be hungry. Oh, look out. Those things just scare the shit out of me. It's just like, why is he coming to life? Oh my god! Ah. And here, Sahashala. I indeed, Sahashala. The village, uh, the, the descendant of the seven Sah wise women. Sahashala. Oh, really? Hey, oh, how do you know my. How, how did this game know my name? That's weird. Because you put your name in there. Durr. I can, what? I, I didn't even hear you. Well, said, could you put your name in there? Do you want to find it? Oh. <laughs> Sahashla says, please speak up, Gentu. Your volume on your Skype is low. <laughs> hey, he can't help, man. Hey. Help. What's it? What happened? Can't help that. 
It's... Shut up. Uh, ECW! Oh, look, a bomb. ECW! ECW. Yeah, it's that's the ECW! Sounds like the Fester's quest theme now. Oh, let's talk about a cool game, like A Lincoln Past. Anyway. Cool game like well, you know, Fester's Quest was made by Sunsoft in uh, 1989. It was a pretty good game, you know. It's uh, pretty good. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> That's right, Jay. <laughs> it's, it's a good game because you know it's actually not because you know people say it's bad, and, but it's not really. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Better on the Genesis. Wasn't even on the Genesis. Exactly. Well, why don't you take your Genesis sayings? and put it in the Genesis book and take it off the sea. Uh, Genesis does what Nintendo didn't. Genesis does what the Bible did? What? Stop making the consoles. Genesis does what would Jesus <laughs> do. <laughs> no. Jesus does what... Wait, said Genesis, Genesis does what Jesus does. Or, I don't know. <laughs> That's actually a good little, uh, little thing to link there. A link to the past! <laughs> I hate myself. Dang it, I forgot how to get over there. That's embarrassing. But Genesis makes shitty. How many times have you played this game? <laughs> I don't. It's been a while. Shut up. I played this, I played this, this ever-living shit out of this Actually, game. Actually, this, this is a blind run. I don't know what I'm doing here. That's how good I am. I'm getting this far on the very first time ever playing it. Wait, Just you're kidding. playing blindfolded? What? Yep. This is your first time? And I will also play part three. Blindfolded in the Eastern Palace. Until then, God bless and take care. Hey, how can you tell if it's Eastern Palace if you're playing it blindfolded? Batista Palace, what? Batista? Who's I that? like fish sticks. Welcome to part three of Let's Play The Legend of Zelda A Link to the Past. This is Ramoa, I love the Wii guy. And the J-Man. Hello. Boy. And Good day yes, to you, Governor. The... <laughs> we are in the first dungeon, which is the Eastern Palace. Oh, oh, this palace looks very dangerous. You gotta watch out for the balls, or they will hurt you very badly. Try oh. Please stop. All right. And we gotta <laughs> obtain the uh, pendant of EC. I mean, uh, courage. Well, what's so special about these pendants anyway? Uh, they are pretty. Oh. <laughs> hey, okay. you skeletons! Come on, jump back! Fight like a man! Jump back! Okay. Get busy with the facts. Right. Love the music in the dungeon right here. Yeah, it's definitely it's definitely a great like I guess like um was it, I was gonna update to like the original labyrinth theme because it kind of does have that feel of the do -le 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 -le. that ambient atmosphere. Yeah. And um, I hate I hate those uh they're not here right now but those uh they just show those flying things that have fireballs around and they take your energy away. Yeah, it's oh, great. Magic, yeah, some of the, some fanboy. You don't know the names of those. Those are called rippers, and I. Yeah, I was about to say someone's gonna come and say those are called rippers. I'm dare you don't know the names. It's one of the greatest, best games of all time, and you don't even know anything about it. Yeah, you don't know what those little things are called that no one remembers really. Dang, yeah, what Pop out of nowhere. Dang it, stop playing Star Tropics now. Yeah, right. Quick, uh, dip the water in the letter. Uh, the water in the letter, damn it. <laughs> the letter in the water. <laughs> I have to explain that one where you are. <laughs> Quiet. You got the compass. I think I'll pass. <laughs> compass bank? Ah, uh, here's a payphone, I guess, to Hashala. He's talking to you telepathically. Dude, that's what we need. Telepathic payphones. <laughs> Yeah. The drive window. Payphones still exist today? No. They're obsolete, basically. They do, if it's telepathic. 
What about pay iPhones? I feel. Yeah, you I mean, pay for them, right? <laughs> <laughs> Dang it. Yeah, jump from that. Don't you eyeball me, son. <laughs> well, would you look at that, boy? That's a Stone Cold playing Simon's Quest. Those flying <laughs> eyeballs come at you. You eyeball me, son? Don't you eyeball me, boy? Ah, it's dark. Quick, light the room with the foyer. But I want the real man sees in the dark. What? Never mind. Anyway. I was gonna say, like, didn't he have Navi? No, he doesn't. No. No Navi or freaking Tinkle in, in this game. <laughs> tinkle. Wow. I haven't, I haven't heard that before. He said thank. <laughs> I had a friend of mine that laughed about that one time. <laughs> Did you slap the hell out of him? <laughs> and he got killed. No, I'm just no. <laughs> I wonder why. <laughs> he loved Tingle? <laughs> you don't go to East Waco and tell people that. Yeah, you oh. don't. Yeah. Uh, yeah, come on. Alright. Ah, uh, no. Hate those things. Oh! Yes, here we go. Here you got the, uh, the big key. You got the big key! I'm just gonna use it! What about the treasure? Get the treasure! Oh, I'm down here. Yeah. I'm impatient. <laughs> you gotta collect all the rupees. Yeah. Remember some fanboy on the, on the old Zelda MSN group? I think, I go, well, I mean, you can't use rupees in real life. And, Apparently you can in India or whatever, and someone goes, There are two rupees in my life! They're in India! <laughs> wow. Seriously, people, you fanboys. <laughs> I mean, how wonder you get beat up every day. Alright, and... Oh, yeah, now I got the arrow. Or I had arrows, I, I got the bow. Yeah, looks like he took an arrow to the eye. <laughs> well, I thought that was an arrow to the knee. No, because I'm trying to be actually creative. Well, I was trying to be creative. I was trying to be creative, but then I took an arrow to the knee and. Oh, oh, great! Now we're gonna get. Hey, this video is gonna get flamed and flagged. <laughs> <laughs> these guys are the SUK. They use an overused meme and they suck. Nobody's gonna watch this. Come on. I know, right? Really? Except for one person who uh didn't like our Shadowgate Part One video and thought we're stupid Americans it's not that funny and we use satire and we laugh at our own jokes but other than that I mean oh well <laughs> hey I take offense to stupid Americans <laughs> it's, it's retarded Americans for the most part <laughs> not us get it right get the name right <laughs> yeah. yeah you stupid stop using comedy in your video and stop laughing yeah this isn't a sitcom. Yeah. Or Jay Leno. <laughs> yeah. Our videos save people's lives, not just Skip Rogers. Yeah. Now, don't laugh, Jamie. Don't laugh at their own jokes. We'll get flagged. <laughs> oh, man, there we go. Your videos are removed because you laugh at your own jokes. You see, cause it's funny because it's a joke and it's funny and you're supposed to laugh. Yeah. <laughs> Tell it, I want your job. <laughs> <laughs> Me too. <laughs> yeah. Get rid of Max Weinberg. <laughs> All right, now we get ready to fight the boost. The boost. The boost. Ah. Oh. He has oh. these freaking knights that just bounce around. Yep. It's like choreographed dancing. I wonder if they used to be bouncers at a bar. Get it? Because they bounce. Wow, Phil. Yeah. Oh yeah, back in the day I thought what they were holding were like... I actually thought they were beer bottles. I thought they were holding beer. <laughs> oh god. <laughs> I don't know why, just in my mind that's what it looks like. Oh. Uh, it's so satisfying when you kill them. Yeah. Come on, come on. <laughs> oh! 
Yeah, that's yes. like, that was like pop or something. Yes. Oh, caught it because it hits the ground and breaks. No. Uh. Yep. All right, now we got the pin in the BCW. Yes. And that is uh, it's the prelude for the April Fool's show for 2013, where uh, X1 Sane will edit ECW on this part right here, where I collect the pin in of ECW. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> yep, we're going back in time. Yeah. We're going to the past. Back in time. Da, 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 da. Link, I must take you back to the past. I have to tell you about the past. Oh, you got the pen of ECW. Now I'll tell you more of the legend of Paul Heyman. Legendary ECW owner. Oh, I'd like to know about that. <laughs> Unfortunately, they went bankrupt in 2001 and were bought out by Vince McMahon. You must stop Vince McMahon or Dorf. Wow, well, fail. <laughs> so that Paul Heyman can get his kingdom back. Make you ECW cool pay. again. And then sell them on eBay. You got the uh, legendary wrestler's boots. Now you must go be extreme. Extreme. I remember sold on a WCW where Hulk Hogan let Dave Sullivan wear his wrestling boots that he body slammed Andre the Giant with. He goes, "Who are the magic slippers, brother? Now go out there and face Ric Flair." <laughs> That's got to be on wrestle crap somewhere. So now we are going back to. Kakaka Village or whatever it's called. <laughs> Kaka Village. Yeah. Crackhead Village. Chicago. Uh, yeah, we got like a painted item there before we get to the next uh, palace. Uh, and the journey begins. Why don't you use your damn Pegasus boots? Because I'm a real man, and real man don't run. Real men get hit and die. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I got an arrow too now. What? Huh? Arrow yeah, stuff. and you seem to use them well though. <laughs> oh, dang it. <laughs> oh, multitasking. Up oh, one left. Yep. This is your last arrow. Make it count. Well, I'm not the Scorpion King, but I'll try. <laughs> nice. I'm not Arrow Smith, but I'll try. <laughs> arrow. Ah, well. They suck. Yep. Okay, arrow to the Smith and. Uh, <laughs> yeah, bro, there you go. Will Smith <laughs> took an arrow to the knee. <laughs> we get, we get another comment. You guys suck and are annoying, stupid jokes. Thanks for watching. Um, yeah, yeah, thanks for, uh, you know, being an idiot and not turning off the video yourself or something. I mean, we should, you know, Thanks yeah. for caring enough to actually post a comment. Or, post, or send us a private. Yeah. Down. Dang it. Oh, Freaking Friday, thirteenth uh, map. No, I'm just kidding. It's my fault. Uh, <laughs> Craig, you must fight Jason. Yeah, or uh, Jason Dorf. No. Jason Dorf. <laughs> okay, now I go to the Elvis twins' room, and so I get to that maze and get the heart piece. Looks like uh, Spark. Spark. Please. Yeah. This is boring. Kikariko village music again. It's not boring, it's Actually, just... It's kind of relaxing, it's kind of relaxing. Hey, yeah, stop. Yeah. It's kind of like... Uh, uh, no. No, the kid I used to make fun of it to my... Uh, 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 Mrs. Adams... Uh, 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 you rang... Oh, uh, yeah, totally better in Ocarina Time. Uh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right, I got a piece of ECW. Wow. You got a heart, honey. Yeah. I got heart. What about Wayne He's Walker? Yeah, you uh, fill my heart. <laughs> you took half my heart. I'm I'm sorry, J Man. You see that? Yeah, I didn't need it. No. <laughs> oh, ooh. I didn't need it. It was gone. Uh, you got yeah. the Holy Bible. Oh wait, oh, Book of Medora. Yeah, total Bible reference. Seriously, damn you! It's helping religious the. We get flagged. The Westboro Baptist Church. No, in school. <laughs> cool story from the Medora book, bro. Horrible story, sis. Hot story, sis. Whoa. Hot tail, hey, brother. I don't oh. know. Hey there, Peter Pan. Where are you going? 
Whoa, what the heck? Oh, this is Back to the Future. Wow. <laughs> he disappeared. Oh, yeah. He disappeared. <laughs> He's an yeah. asshole. Yeah. There you go. You no, know, Biff Tannen and Ganondorf have some things in common. <laughs> They both, they go back in time and change the <laughs> past for the future. Whatever. What the heck is Gandorf said butthead? Yeah. He finds his old self. That's oh, you, you, yeah. yeah, that's not how you beat Link. Who are you telling how to beat Link, you butthead? Yeah. Calls him a chicken. Why don't you make like a tree and get out of here? <laughs> get the hell off my horse, old man. That's leave. You idiot. Make like a tree and leave. It's not like a dumb fool when you say it wrong. Now listen, here's the almanac with the player's god. Use it and you're not a bit yeah. link and take over the future. Yeah, well that was totally worth something. You <laughs> gotta be. I just wanted to showcase the many talents and usefulness of the bug catcher net. Yeah, it's like a game inside of itself, really. Yeah. I mean how many people can catch a bee in a video game? I don't know, but what? I believe you. Yep. Alright, uh, come here. Oh, come on! Uh, oh, that's a beach. A bee each. What? Bee itch. There we go. Bee itch. Damn it. <laughs> a bee itch? Yeah, bee itch. Is that where you itch from a bee? Yeah. Yeah. Come on. Uh huh. Uh, boom! Chicken, move! You blew the chicken. How you dare you? <laughs> Alright. Arrows. Haha, <laughs> totally worth it. <laughs> Shot to the knee, and you're to blame. Wait, oh, look out. Come on, get him. Yes. They kidnapped Zelda. You got, like, your sword in his ass, pretty much. Yeah. Oh, not there. Mm. Porno and video games. It's <laughs> my bum. Oh, this is Atari. That was kind of cool. Oh yeah, we're being a the foot tree. Isn't that nice? Yeah. I thought they there were are rupees and trees in the life. Yeah, climb and show you. Find some money in there. Go ahead. Do it, kids. Do it. Yeah. Money grows on trees. What are they doing, Zelda? Well, rupees. Yeah, they fall out of trees. I don't know yeah, why I like, and like that. they fall out of tre trees and stuff, and uh, <laughs> that's pretty much what he would do. All right, using a boomerang. Where's Eddie Murphy at? Well, oh. Phil, the Phil reference. Uh, <laughs> I get it, because he was in a movie yeah. called Boomerang. Yeah, he was in a movie yeah. called Boomerang. I yeah. saw that movie. And I see one daggum boomerang. Paul Hogan was pissed. No. Oh god. Not hold well, well, you better. Well, you better just hurry up and save Zilla because you have 48 hours. Yep. Yeah, because mm -hmm. that movie was in the movie called 48 well, Hours. The past, part 73. This is Ron Moore, May 14, 2014, and we're finally here in the final castle. <laughs> yeah, right. It won't be as long as the ongoing Ocarina of Time. Yeah, I was about to say, yeah. like, I think you're. <laughs> For part 15 of Ocarina of Time. Yeah. Coming in 2015. Yeah. I haven't given up on that, but I don't care. <laughs> I have to take my freaking time. <laughs> nice, you did it again. <laughs> yeah, I messed up right there. I was trying to actually get past it that time. Well, wow, that's like elementary school shit to move stuff out of the way like that. Well, I'm not good at Tetris. <laughs> not Tetris. <laughs> Never mind. <laughs> this is level 9 stuff here. It sucks. Ah, oh. oh, dang it. Wrong one. <laughs> <laughs> Making all the wrong moves. Alright. We got Edith Bunker now in the commentary. <laughs> Archie, how was your day? Day with me again! I don't know. <laughs> I feel like... <laughs> something, I don't know. Edith, shut up and get me a beer. <laughs> <laughs> Edith, ECW in the family? <laughs> yeah. Yeah, but, uh, ooh. This is a mystery. That sounds delightful. What, you dumb? Oh, yeah, he is. He can't speak. Dom. Let's go to the Dom. Where did you take my sign? It says leave it alone. I did. I didn't read it. <laughs> I just picked it up. Is that supposed to be like a Mario? Oh. I guess, but I 
Cheech Marin keeps on chasing me, so I cannot go inside a cave with uh, with him chasing me. So I got to get rid of him, and somehow when you yeah. do that, it magically disappears. It's like born in East LA. <laughs> Here we go. Oh boy. That was pointless, pretty much. Don't, dude, that was hot. <laughs> Getting your healthy pills, she says she'll soothe and relax you. Yeah. What the heck? <laughs> oh, damn what? Japanese. Swamp thing. More like desert thing. Yeah, fail. No, really, I mean, it's in the desert, come on! Yeah, but... Okay. Fail. Success! <laughs> <laughs> No. Hey, 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 yeah. It's a hostel I get here. He has a twin brother. Ah. Uh, brother. He has a twin brothel. I mean brother. <laughs> What's in her? There's two guys inside yeah. of her. What? Damn it. <laughs> Mess it up. <laughs> well, like, I could do it any worse. <laughs> two girls inside of it. <laughs> <laughs> Mm, two ECWs went inside of them. <laughs> if that did, would that make it WCW? Oh, wow. Yeah, that would be fail. Yep. Ah. Run, Link! Get to the Desert Temple! You must use the Dura book! It's not the Desert Temple. Temple. It's not the Desert Temple, it's called the Western Palace. Get, oh, I can't believe you don't know that. Yeah. I can't believe you couldn't read that without the book and the door. Yeah, I already had it translated. Yeah, I went to Babel translation on the internet and I can read it. Uh oh. Alright. So now we are going to enter the Western Palace to get the uh, pendant of something I forgot. Courage, we'll you in, power. We'll see you in part quattro. Let's take care. Um. Yeah. Bye. Welcome to part four of Let's Play The Legend of Zelda, A Link to the Past. This is Ron Moore, along with the J-Man and the Green. Hey, yo. Hi, everybody. Man, Green, we haven't heard from you in a long time. Uh, no one's heard from me in a long time, including me. Yeah. <laughs> Lost. <laughs> hey, All right, it's, so. it's nice to be back in the classic trio, at least. Oh, yeah. yeah. And now we are in Eastern Palace. Eastside? Uh, that's the eastern or western? No. This is the western palace. Uh, I call it desert palace. Okay. Desert dungeon, whatever. All right, well, west side? <laughs> Stage two. There's also the northern palace and the southern palace. No, I'm just kidding. I know. That make me very angry. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> the compass palaces. Yeah. What is this, tremors? I don't know, but you're getting pwned. Kevin... Uh, <laughs> you just you got Kevin Bacon. Uh. Oh. All oh, right, that's how you do that. I was so confused for a second. It's been so long since I played this. Yeah. The classic dungeon music that I love. Where are them random pitfalls at? Right. Ah, <laughs> uh, the same right. L gear. Yeah, right. I got pwned right there. I hate those freaking... I forgot what they were called. They're also an Ocarina of Time. Yeah, you got a, you got a blast in the ass there. Yeah. Oh, well, got a... Can't get that chest the up here. Can't get the big key. Yep. And... Oh, damn it. <laughs> I expect this one to instantly kill you, but then again, I'd be asking you too much. Hey, this is not Super Mario Bros. 3. Come on. Oh, okay. Yeah. <laughs> so he walks into a door, falls into a pit, just dies. Back yeah. outside. Yeah. Okay, what is that in there? Forgot. It's the... Compass! Worthless thing. Yeah, the worthless thing. You should <laughs> make, make a compass. 
Well, it's not worth this when you first get to this dungeon, the first time ever. <laughs> mm -hmm. Ah, and I'm yes! The game. Oh. That's the big key. Wait, you're done already? <laughs> yeah, this dungeon seems pretty short. Seems pretty short. Yeah, Eastern say, Palace for some reason. That's what she said. Yes. Yes, it is. <laughs> wait, you like have the weapon that you find here and everything? Yeah. Oh, damn. Yeah, this, I think this is the shortest palace in the game. That's what um, he said. Oh, okay. <laughs> Dang it, wrong way, idiot. That's what Ronnie said. <laughs> All right, now we got the power club. It's so bad. Yeah. And now you're playing with real power. Yeah. It's so we got. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Or the gauntlet, as it's called. Oh, what? Man, come nice on. Nice shot. The we got that Metroid syndrome going on. Yeah. Do I have to get ECW mode in here? Uh huh. I think you might have to, but not yet. Now, okay, with the power glove, you're able to pick it, uh, pick up the uh, big rocks now, right? Yeah, as well as the uh, little stones too. Right. Yeah, the ones that have like an eight on them. Mm, the eight balls. Yeah. The, yeah. the the lighter shaded so, stones. Yeah. You got to pick up the eight balls. Yeah. Oh yeah, this game had all those dungeons where you had to enter through different places. Yeah. Get away from my heart piece. You just slap the bird, didn't do anything? Yeah, like it stands there in midair, and then it flies at you. Pwned again. Yep. Now, yeah, there's the, uh, there's the eight balls. Yeah. Okay. Alright, now the second part of the dungeon. Ooh, look out, look out. There we go. Oh, A1, Cuddy. Oh man, I hate this. Flying tiles come after you. Ouch. Star Tropic. Yeah, ready. Mm, that Star Tropics. Good times. Good times. <laughs> too soon. Too, no, I'm just kidding. Too late. <laughs> yeah. Yep, too late now. Oh, oh, we got saved by the statue. Or the bell. Whatever. Yeah. It's a medieval version I of Saved by the Bell. You, yeah. I can't open those. You're running around with the book still. Yeah. I think about like you're not abusing the mirror or anything. I don't have the mirror yet. All oh, right, right. Oh. I forgot. Oh. I'm thinking too far ahead of the game. Now I get close to the boss. Ah, uh -oh. oh, come on. Oh. What a psycho you man don't need throw that. the towels. Mm -hmm. All right. That's something I should do for an ST2K thing. Metal Gear. Yeah. Amazing. Oh man, I'm trapped. What should I do? You should go back to your uncle's house and then just go back to sleep. Yeah, really. Is this that stupid worm thing? That oh wait no, that's I'm thinking the wrong temple. Wow, I'm confusing temples now. Hey, yeah. all I gotta say, ain't nobody falling asleep because Jeff ain't here. Yeah. Uh, yeah. <laughs> and we are playing Tremors for the SNES, who plays Kevin Bacon. Ooh, Tremors was a hilarious movie. I think this boss is stupid. <laughs> what makes them hard, kind of hard, is the freaking rocks that fly after you after they come up from the ground. Especially Don't they shoot more? Like, the, the last one does. Down to one. Okay. That was almost dying. Yeah. Yep, I think it's that guy. Put a head out. <laughs> yes, I'll put a head out for the person who kills Link. Or the Dang one. it! Try to use the arrow, I had Dang. a flame selected. Oh man. Oh, you flamer. <laughs> oh, headshot. Yeah. Ah. Oh. Oh, come on. Really? Yeah, really. Uh, All right, let's try this again. You better use the fast gummy mode this time. You know what? I don't know why I didn't think about this at first. I'll use the arrow then. ECW mode. 
Well, see, I mean, I didn't, I didn't know what to do right here, so I took an arrow to the knee, and so I used the arrow, and my opponent fell. Wow, yeah. So the worm took an arrow to the head. <laughs> this boss bound music could have been better. All it is is. Dun, 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 dun. I think it was just like the Super Nintendo. We can make whatever we want and people will love it. Yeah, pretty much. Oh, he got that arrow hat going on? <laughs> yeah. Hey, it's better than uh, Back to the Future. Yeah. Mm. Or any LJN game. <laughs> uh, you do some of those for Halloween, what? it'll be like a horror week. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. oh, nice, yeah, good. It has been defeated. Yep. Yeah, see right there, no, if you didn't catch it, it would have fell, hit the ground, shattered, and it started to file all over again. And you guys... That, uh, see, I was just going to say something like that. You got the, uh, the second nut sack of power. Oh, man. <laughs> okay. You got the second of three Christmas ornaments. Go find the third one. <laughs> yeah. All right, we are done with the Western Palace. Now let's go do something else. Run! Yeah. That was a great idea. What are we in Texas? No, that's that blue thing. No. Not yet. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. Well, I know we could, we could take that dude's sign. Yeah, I did before. Oh, you did that dog and it's following me. So stalking you? Yeah. Hey, that guy gives you money. <laughs> okay, thanks. Oh wait, no, this ain't the right one. Yeah, that's someone else. He goes, uh, here, take it. Just don't tell anybody or something. I forgot. Yeah, it's a secret to everybody, but not really. <laughs> that, well, that sounds like the original. Yeah. <laughs> it's dangerous out there. Please take this. Yeah. <laughs> take this rock to the head. <laughs> Don't hit the old man. If you hit, if you hit the old man, he'll shoot fireballs at you. Yeah. And now he died. Oh wait. <laughs> okay, and now I'm supposed to be making my way to the uh, Tower of Hera, but I want to play around first and discover some other secrets. That's a secret to everybody. Oh, you just want to blow shit up. Exactly. Some bomb oh, arrows. almost took an arrow to the knee there. Uh, you want to you wanna be sued. Ah, oh, dang it. I see. <laughs> dang it, Heather makes an appearance. Thanks for the energy. Okay. <laughs> yeah, one and a half hearts. Yeah. Alright. You should get them Zora flippers. I'm pretty sure you have more than enough. Yeah, they are 500 rupees. Yeah, 501. You're more than set. Yeah. Right, and you don't have to find a um, a bigger wallet in this game. Yeah, really. They did that on purpose on later games. Remember, all Korea time, you had to rescue the that family that was cursed by the Skullchillas, and then right. when you do that, your reward is a bigger wallet or something like that. Like, really? You get all 100 Skullchillas, and that's the reward? No! No, not the, uh, okay. Well, you get the bigger wallet, um, from the guy that's, like, running around. Yeah. The, the courier. Um, yeah, but then you get, like, the ultimate one. Yeah. Yeah, I was like, that's not working. Still told us, I don't know. Somebody's gonna correct me on that. They're gonna be like, um, oh, actually, uh... Yeah. But, yeah. <laughs> well, according to Lynch of Truth, Lynch of Truth is, is pronounced Skulltula. Which I didn't know that until I seen his LP of Majora's Mask. We're we're gonna get corrected, either way. Yeah, Danny Probably. and Heather are gonna Danny. make you idiots. You don't know nothing about Zelda. No, I'm just kidding. They're not like that. They're not one of those butthurt fan fanboys and girls. Oh, that damn J man, gay man, and that <laughs> dumb asshole Ronnie guy. Ron Blower and Green yeah, Ron and Italian <laughs> Mafia, uh, yeah. Jersey Shore guy. Yep. Yeah, you put a hit on out on me. Yeah. <laughs> uh, and like, well, it sucks to be you. You left a comment. <laughs> yeah. No. <laughs> <laughs> and then they just delete the comment after we see it. 
Yeah. Uh, but we have an email notification. <laughs> Alright, yeah, so I am going to go ahead and get the flippers. Because they are ECW. And don't you need them? Yeah. I don't think you need them to beat the Tower of Hera, though, do you? Uh, that would be amazing, though, is that like you start swimming over pits. I know you need them for the, I think, second temple in the Dark World, if I'm not mistaken. It will not save you in the uh, Castle of Graceful. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> oh, dang it. Oh, here we go, Skull Castle. Oh. Nice. Okay. I think. Nope. Dang it. You gotta hit. You gotta find the uh, the whirlpool. Damn it! I can't say that word. But whatever. No, no. He's he's over here. On one of these paths. Yes. And here he is. Yo. All right. Star Soldier. Woo hoo! Ha ha ha! What do you want, oh, oh, man? Okay. <laughs> That's bear. Right yeah, here. Yeah, <laughs> uh, I just dropped by. Okay, but I'm out of here. <laughs> yeah. You guys suck. All right then, we're out of here. And wait a minute. <laughs> Why are you going back to Bear for? Damn it, Ronnie. What those flippers? <laughs> give him, give him his Canadian money so he can get our flippers and go. Right. Yeah. It's like eight hundred, five hundred dollars, uh, five hundred dollars, uh, Hillian. Uh, money, but eight hundred dollars Canadian. Right. Like, oh damn! It. Yeah, so he can go to uh, Tim Hortons and, and get some ten bits. <laughs> All right, so okay. now we've got the ECW flippers. Oh yeah, that's right, eh? Oh totally. Hey, where's the other one? You bastard! Yeah, I only got one. You got to pay five hundred dollars each one. Rip off. Going down her. Where to now, Captain? Somewhere. Ah. <laughs> to this heart piece. Yeah. Are you have to go under the under a bridge or something? I think so. Yeah. I forgot. Yeah, any Zelda game with a bridge, try to go over it if you can. There's always something there. Yeah. You have to go under a bridge to be a bridge. Yeah. Yes. A Link to the Past, the yeah, bridge version. Yep. Oh, God. Hey. I went the wrong way. No. No, really. No. No way. Alright, oh, pixelation. No. no. <laughs> Yeah, since when has Ron Moore made a mistake in video? I know. I always make a map. You always know where to go. Yeah. <laughs> ah, here we go. Up the waterfall. So ah. Metroid. Ah, yes. Let's see, I'm trying to remember what to throw in. Yeah, the boomerang. Yeah, I was going to say the amazing fairy fountain is in the dark world. Yeah. <laughs> oh wait, no, this ain't Ocarina of Tom. <laughs> uh -huh, no sound effects here. Alright, the magical boomerang, that now did. I can go across the screen. I think, that's, I think I got another item I can throw in there, I think, right? Let me see. Uh... No, I don't think so, because the sword wait. and the... Wait, ah, the shield. I think the shield. We have to get the level two shield. Yeah. Yep. Oh, you're right. Nice. All right, All right now I got oh, yeah. to defend myself against fireballs. Mm-hmm. Still not lasers though. Yeah. You gotta wait till. Where the hell do you get the mirror shield again? You get that in Turtle Rock. Oh, yeah. I think so. The Turtle Rock. Yeah. Place is stupid. <laughs> oh, look out! Whoa.
hate those freaking things. Oh, oh, walking fuck. jelly beans or whatever they are. Or something. Wow. <laughs> what the hell kind of jump was that? Yeah, let me charge forward. No, I changed my mind. I'm going to jump backwards off a cliff. Yeah, really. Dang it, watch out, Whirlpool. Your wash machine suck. No. Hey! Hey! <laughs> no, I don't know. I don't think they do. I just want to make a pun. Well, that was not punny. <laughs> punny Very yeah. punny. That was a waste of time. Thanks for the nice decoration outside the cave. Maybe think it's some real important place. Well, it kind of is if you have money, but I don't, so. Alright. I guess I will go ahead and head to the uh, to Death Mountain now. Yeah, but I sure can't affect yeah. rocks. Yeah. <laughs> I watch it. Freaking love this game. This game is uh game is pretty challenging. It's real. ECW? Yeah, really ECW and real hard when I was a uh, young teenager playing it the first time. Yes, yeah, it's, it's freaking awesome. That, this, I think this is Super Metroid I was playing around the same time. Yeah, Super Metroid. Yeah, I mean, these, those games are three years apart, but I didn't play Link to the Past till late. Uh, speaking of three years apart, remember uh, We Guys Sweet 16? Oh, yeah. <laughs> Metroid. Is that ready three years ago? Yeah. Wow. <laughs> I have a sweet 16 Wii guy. <laughs> I remember that. That was funny. Wait, I don't, don't for girls. Is this? That's for girls only. Lols. Alright. Uh, now, now for Life, Life Mountain. I said Life. Uh, I got Life and Death mixed up. Life Mountain and Dive. Oh, no, fail. Dire Straits? Yeah. Mm. Dive, dike, wait, wait, whoa. Dike, whoa. Anyway. Whoa. Wrong words here. Yeah. Whoa, wrong path there. Yeah, uh, tone it down there, uh, Dr. Asshole. Whoa, there's the Quaker Oat, I mean, uh, Quaker Oatmeal guy, Dick Fell, whatever his actor's name was. Uh, Wilford Grimley? I think so, the Oatmeal guy? Yeah, the diabetes guy. Yeah, he, yeah, he, 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 he played, yeah. Uh, he played a TV show called Something house? Uh, that was a long time ago. Anyway. Um, full house? No. No. That was Bob Saget. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Lowell's house? And he falls down the pit. Damn it. <laughs> wah, wah, wah. And that guy can move fast all of a sudden. <laughs> this song right here, this this cave song, sounds like someone's trying to come at you with a knife. Ree, 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 ree. Mm -hmm. Awesome. Ah, here we are, Death Mountain. What was that Three Ninjas movie it was called? Death on Mega Mountain, the one with Hulk Hogan in it. I forgot. Oh God. <laughs> anyway, change the subject real quick. There's the best response. Yeah. All right. So now, now we get the mirror. You got the mirror of time, or the mirror of. Now start using it. It's blue, clear, and beautiful. Yeah. And you can abuse it for all sorts of stuff. Yeah. Well, too bad it's not purple. Oh, <laughs> did I? Say that out loud? Okay. Balls. Hmm. All right. Now he tells us more stuff. And then gives you drugs. Well, right here, he usually fills your energy up. I already have full energy, so let's move on. Was that Mr. Wizard there? <laughs> yeah. All right. That bat is dead because it took a pot to the face. Yeah. That was really cheap. You should start killing those um, things with the one eye that run at you um, with pots, because that kills them faster than arrows. The wombats? The what? The wombats? You can't uh, wombats. You can only make them freeze. That's oh, all. okay. Ah, oh, dang it. You can't you know. put it out on them. You can't do that. Yeah. <laughs> Ha <laughs> ha. 
<laughs> stupid rocks, watch out. Rolling, rolling rock? Rolling rocks. Get it? Rolling rock? Fail. Shameless plug. Yeah. Ah, it's down here. I got worms. Crickets. Cheep, 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 cheep. <laughs> Dang man, I'm about to die already. Really? Okay. I looked away for only like a few seconds and now you're dying. What happened? It's your your fault. If you would keep your eye on the game, I had better better luck. Well actually if he would send like his mod contacts to help you out in the game, then it'd be all good. Yeah. Supply him with the right. supply him with the red potions. Yeah. Wait, speak of potions, don't you have a bottle at this point? Yeah, I do. So why didn't you use the bug catching net? Catch a hey, fairy. I didn't think of it. Hey, he, oh, has, okay. he has a bomb, but not a car bomb. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> well, I, have, I don't have contacts to fairies like you do, uh, Green. <laughs> wow, I thought you no, missed that jump. You should say that to Bear, actually. I mean, I don't know... I don't know everything like where Jimmy Hoffa is buried, like you do, Green, so... <laughs> <laughs> hey, we don't talk about that. Hey, oh, hey, yeah. we don't talk about that. <laughs> I want to hear that. Uh, here's the Hasha, Lala. You must somehow make your way on top of Spectacle Rock. From there, you can reach the tower up here uh, on top of Death Mountain. Okay, so... All right. Oh. I was wondering why you fell. Yeah, I did on purpose. Oh. I don't know why. I always think there's something else. Dang, what is this? Centipede? No. Get out of here. It's millipede. Yeah. All right, let's climb up the top of the ladder again. And this time we're gonna go the right way. Yeah. Well, no, he's gonna use the mirror. Right. Yeah. Wait a minute. Ah, that's the same oh, area. Oh, that's for later. Well, <laughs> now, here we go. Yes. Oh, look at little kitty pool. I'm go swimming. Whoa! What happened? Oh God, I'm pink. <laughs> well, the weird side, would it? Silly rabbit Silly tricks rabbit for kids. Tricks are for kids. <laughs> That was bullshit. You want that heart piece, don't you? <laughs> That's what you're really after. Yeah, forget the gold. Forget the uh, whatever the heck I'm looking for. The golden power. Oh, you fucking e beggar! I'll tell you. So why is Kirby in this game? Oh. Wait. I don't understand how a pearl from the moon can keep you normal in another dimension. Um, because it's from Uranus. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Alright. Oh, no, wait. Oh, that did nothing? Yeah. <laughs> I'm going oh, tower. Can't you not do this yet? Oh, wait, no, I'm thinking. Up. You've got to read from the uh, tombstone. Oh. Use the book. Use it. Use it good. Hold up the master sword, and you will get the magic of ether. Oh dang it! Nope. Ain't got the master sword yet. Okay, forget that. Uh. Yep, you can't get drunk yet. Yeah. So I'll enter now the Tower of Hera. Well, we will continue that in part five. Until then, God bless and take care. Peace out. Have a good one. Welcome to part 5 of Let's Play The Legend of Zelda A Link to the Past. This is Ron Moore, along with the Wii Guy and Star Soldier. Oh yeah, we just load the save state, I mean uh, upload the video, and here we are talking about this awesome game again. Woohoo! Yep. One of the best for Super Nintendo, baby. Oh yeah. It's overrated! <laughs> <laughs> no. Of course it's overrated. 
Yeah, of course. Okay. That's okay. Cash, yeah, it's overrated. <laughs> it totally is. Oh. <laughs> so now I am in uh, Tower of Hera. Yep. I call it the Death Hi. Mountain Castle. Yeah. Or the I didn't know it was called that. The tower. What? I hate those freaking things right there. Uh, jellyfish or something? I don't know. They look like fake switches, you know? They look just like the switches. You go attack them, you know? <laughs> yeah. They change the, I don't know, patterns on the floor. Oh, no, they're enemies! Yeah. That's what's real cool about this, uh, this castle. Those switches and these holes in the floor and then... Huh, good job. Yo. <laughs> I meant to do Which that. is very advanced back in the day, like, not so much now. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, it's 3D. Woo. Yeah. yeah. Then it, then it happened in any 3D Zelda games, did it, where you hit those switches and then fall in the holes? That'd have been pretty cool. I don't think so. I think it just did naturally, you know, since the whole game isn't 3D. <laughs> That would be so weird though to drop down and go somewhere different. It did that a lot in the water temple though. <laughs> oh man, you had that, to bad track. that temple got my nerves. I was drowning in anger. <laughs> yeah. But the later levels get, you know, pretty hard in this one too. <laughs> yeah. This part right here gets my nerves. You gotta wait for these tiles to uh, get through coming after you and they come through yeah. the and for where you gotta wait for the uh, for all of them to come at you so the door opens so you can move on. Yeah, right almost up. like Home Depot is after you. Yeah. There was one time where I think in low budget review, uh, I was waiting for all these tiles to stop coming after me, but then I realized I had a key. I could have gone through a door and I skipped it. <laughs> Yeah, this stage gets very confusing sometimes. Yeah, it took me a long time to beat this stage. It took me a long time to figure out how to get the Moon Pearl. <laughs> There's just so many factors to it. Okay, where do I drop? Okay, what switch do I hit? Oh no, do I have to like this area? Did I miss something? Did I miss a key? Ah! Yeah. <laughs> but it's uh, the last dungeon in the normal world, so I guess it has to be somewhat difficult. Yeah. It's a, it's a good challenge. Challenging yeah. your mind. Yeah. My knee challenge for better improvement. Well, this game is not as challenging as Battle Clash. <laughs> You're just That's being mean now. <laughs> <laughs> trolling we guy. You mad? Kind of late. Kind of late if you're trolling me with Battle Clash at this late. <laughs> You said that, that was like that was like six months ago. <laughs> Should have done it earlier. You're too late. Too late. Well, but but I like Battle Clash. Well, still too late. He, he's the only one who likes it. You're too late. I'm not the only one. You're okay. the only. I'm the only one that you personally know who likes it. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Everybody, leave a comment if you love Battle Clash. <laughs> if you like it. Or just go watch my LP. I'll do that. Comment on there. Don't even comment on this video. <laughs> yeah. I'm sure, sure you get thousands and thousands of comments. I'll thousands get. Thousands. I'll get three. <laughs> I'll get three. Yeah. Those three will be people that They'll have. They'll be all be from you. I'm weak. I and <laughs> I love Battle Clash. Yeah, I'm I am weak. I can. I love Battle Clash. Hey, they're all from this. We got three or nine user though. <laughs> This guy's trying to trick us. And what happened to We Got 1003? Oh, uh, he died along. He was the beta. Oh. And then We Got 39. It's still the We Guy, except you know, just the name. It's just the name change. That's all. Uh. The original We Guy died. Well, now he was we even got floor panels here. Yeah. <laughs> it's so confusing. Just yeah. panels of fun. I don't know how that makes sense. <laughs> Uh, well, let's do a, uh, a panel where we talk about how lame Battle Clash is. No, I'm just kidding. Yeah, why do we have to talk about Battle Clash when we got this awesome Zelda game here? Yeah, because Momo has nothing <laughs> to say about the game. 
Yeah, dude, look, oh, a compass. You're oh, 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 a compass, oh. It's harsh, right? I remember getting here and being so enthralled because it almost feels like it's part of the game. You're about to get the last pendant. You're very close to the Master Sword. And, yeah, you know you're gonna fight that end boss pretty soon. Or at least you think you're gonna fight him. <laughs> yeah. It's anticipation. Then the game throws the curveball at you. But yep, yep. I don't want to spoil it too much since we're still in the middle of it. Yeah, this game, <laughs> yeah, this game, was, just, this game was just released. Let's not spoil it. Not. <laughs> <laughs> if you don't even... If you're watching this and you don't even know this game, then... Um, well... Hey, it down, for well, Christ's sake. Well, maybe they're 12 years yeah. old. Maybe they just got into gaming. Well, then they suck. They should. They have. They need better people to give them gaming advice. Yeah, <laughs> but still, don't play the next Call of Duty. Play this. <laughs> yeah. Call, Call of Zelda. Zelda. Not fail. <laughs> cause. Sounds better. But yeah, cause. they should modernize Zelda. Legend yeah. of Zelda: Modern Warfare. Yeah, right now I'm trying to remember. Which you floor panel to hit to get to the moon portal? I think it's this one right here. Ah! You got that from John John Soul Kill Star. them! Yes. Oh wait, hold on. We got the moon pearl! I didn't even know what they did. I was just all like, ooh, it's a moon pearl. Okay. I love the glitch. There's a glitch where you bomb yourself over there without having to fall through from the ceiling to, to get to the moon pearl. Yeah. I think I don't know if I got from ABGN, Mike Matei's Zelda glitches or what? I forgot. Who? <laughs> Mike Matei. Yeah. Yeah, he's friends with James Rowe. He's the other guy. No, who he is. I was I was beat. No, I was doing... didn't. No, you didn't. No, no, no. <laughs> home, home, home. Uh -oh, he's the guy home. with the guitar. Oh, dang uh, it. What? Ha! Ha ha! How'd get safe, killed? Safe. <laughs> uh, freaking, uh, uh, thing. Alright, well, anyway. You suck. It looks like it took two hearts off, too. Yeah, I did. That was lame. Yeah. Don't tell me I'm gonna die again. Please die again. <laughs> Hilarious! Please shut up again. Yeah, let's make this a 40 minute long video. Yeah. <laughs> Come on, man! Can we do that? I know it says like 25 right now, but maybe we can make it longer somehow. Yes, yeah, make it longer. <laughs> she said! <laughs> you know what he oh, said? Yeah, I had to do it. Here's what he said, back to uh, uh, the top of the tower now. To the future. Ah! Ah! <laughs> Good job. Didn't you already get the moon pearl? Do you have to get I'm, it again? I'm, try I'm trying to hit that switch because you know, all them uh, all them hearts at the one area on the top floor. Not the top, top floor, but the whatever oh. floor we're on. The where all, them, all them pots are. Because I need to power up before I find that giant worm. Because I always get hit a lot by that giant worm. Oh, we're going to the fifth world. Floor. <laughs> yeah, the, this floor right here, all these pots over here. I'm trying to find a switch so I can get to those pots to get all the hearts. Isn't there like a switch at the bottom left? I swear, it's like... It's... Ah, forget it. I'm just going to fight like a man. Oh, wait. Oh, like somehow I magically got some hearts now. All right, here we go. <laughs> <laughs> it's the upstairs trick. All right. <laughs> now to fight Centipede for the NES. Oh, wait. Or like, I don't know. I don't even know. I'm. I was like, <laughs> this thing what was like, this? what the what hell? I don't even. My brain is full of fuck. Oh. I don't know. It looks like a testicle or something. <laughs> oh, <laughs> oh, 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 oh! Made well, of I was down my fight this boss as a kid. I know. I, you pull a beat him, and he just knocks you off. Oh. He got so one I, more hit, and then he knocks you off. He got to start all over. That's yeah. insult to injury. Yeah. And his health bar goes up to, you know, Matt's one too. Yeah, alright, here we go. One more hit. For the motherland! Don't fall. Don't fall. Watch me explode! Ah, there we go. Now watch him explode. Ooh. Ah. <laughs> That'd be so cool if I died and I actually exploded. <laughs> yeah. Well, this ain't Mega Man X. I don't know, I don't want your entrails all over me. <laughs> yes, I got the pendant of... ECW? Oh, it's out. Very pendant. Not courage, that's the first one I think. Is it wisdom that's, or This is power. Wisdom, yep, wisdom. Yeah, shoot. I don't know my zone. You got some jewelry. <laughs> yep. Alright. Now oh, we'll do Tower Hera. Ah, uh, what a good game. Actually a great game. Excellent. Masterpiece. Super Nintendo best all time. 
Now we're gonna go get the Master, Master Sword. Oh, that would so break your kneecaps. I know, right? It's like a Mario 64. You must have that not leg breaking technology from Portal. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> mode, mode, mode 8, where you can land, jump as far uh, as, it, as you want and not break your kneecaps. I'll break your kneecaps <laughs> for making that terrible joke. Mode 8. Yeah. <laughs> Oh wait, there is a mode 8. It's called 3D! Really? Yo, if you don't send me enough loopies, I'm gonna break your kneecaps. <laughs> <laughs> uh, he'll do it. Do you, have you seen Star Soldier? Have you yeah. seen what he'll do? I've seen Jay's son. Watch out. <laughs> oh god. And I apologize for that. <laughs> that was so last a long time ago. <laughs> I only hit children. <laughs> <laughs> See, I'm not such a bad guy after all. See, I don't hit my own kind, I just hit little children. Yeah. Every people's children. Yeah. This is, this is totally not... <laughs> <laughs> what? Oh, I, I just, I'm trying to make, I'm trying to make like... Just anyway, try. here's the... I can't even... Woods. I'm about to see the, the found forest or whatever it's called. Looks like Cheat and Chong's basement are outside. I love the music right here in this part of the game. Nice. Nice oh, and oh, whimsical. Oh, we found that already. <laughs> no. Oh, no. <laughs> no it's... It's hey, you replica. can find that Master Sword. Whoa, I love shrooms. Hey, dude. I'm totally tripping out. <laughs> uh, mushrooms. Uh, <laughs> we got any Doritos? Uh... <laughs> oh no, Doritos, not Doritos. Ginger's gonna be all over this. <laughs> yeah. More minerals. We require minerals. Oh, look at all the school pets, kill them. <laughs> yep. <laughs> oh, this, it's still in Japanese. Come on, Nintendo, translate your games. Oh, here, here we, we go. go. The book of ECW translates to English. Good. English Championship Wrestling. <laughs> Is William Rigo going to be the champion? Ah, here we go. E-C-W Oh yeah, baby. We got the second best sword in the game. Yes, yeah. yeah, second best. It's supposed <laughs> to be the master of them all, but it's not. Yeah, really. No. Well, the next one is the Supreme Sword. No. <laughs> it doesn't get a flashy oh. <laughs> thing like this. Yeah. Here it's well, like the sword in the stone we're ripping off, but hey, you got the Nets great sword or the best sword in the not, game. So that's a sword in the this is sword in the pistol, man. This is different. <laughs> well, this isn't as good as Biggerin sword. Biggeron sword. Biggerin. Biggerin. That's how you pronounce it, though. Biggerin. It's put yeah. Together. Totally. Plug Shut convenience. Up. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> I. Hey, hey, hey. Thanks, Ray. Yeah. All right, now let's go to sanctuary. Now you gotta hurry up and make it on time to rescue. The... <laughs> no, not really, but uh, yeah, it's like, oh, you're a second too late every time you get there. Oh, you're a second too late, no matter how fast uh, you go. Oh, oh come Sonic on! Sonic would have done it. Yeah, well, it was if you would have put a, a hack in this game where you play a Sonic, you still would have said you're a second too late. <laughs> you're too slow. You just put safe states, bam! You're a second too late. <laughs> cheated too. I had to check the map because Skipper Rogers is gonna post a message. You need to check the map. You don't need. Why would I you ever hurt? start tagging everybody on Facebook with the high road map because I didn't mention it in the last part. Dang it, Skip. Skip's getting hurt. Yeah. <laughs> All right. I hope I made it in time. All right. Back to the church with that awesome music. And oh. <laughs> Ah, oh, dang it. See? You're a second <laughs> too late. It's cheating. Okay, the program will tell you're making it on time. Stupid. Alright, so the <laughs> preacher is dying. He goes to heaven, and... This game is really fast, boys. <laughs> so now we're going back to Hyrule Castle. Yay! <laughs> Again. <laughs> we were just there. At least yeah. at the beginning. Now we gotta go back. <laughs> yeah, because that was so, like, just like 10 minutes ago. It's right, Star Soldier. Yeah. 
I was, uh, I was actually watching the first part. <gasps> so you yeah, were the sequence. <laughs> <laughs> he likes to watch it backwards. <laughs> it's like Memento, the legend of Memento. Ow. <laughs> Move. Out of my way, I'm here to save the princess. Get out of my way. All right. Uh, now, is the princess our sister in this one, or I don't know, no, is our lover? Oh, no, this is not Star Wars. This is <laughs> she's not really in it. Okay, and wait a minute. Oh, no, not this way. Oh, oh. oh we are at the beginning of the game again. <laughs> yep. Yeah. Oh yeah. <laughs> oh God. Wait. Oh yeah, I gotta go outside the castle and around and oh yeah. Up and around and down and back again. Oh yeah. What was that from? <laughs> I just made that up. <laughs> okay. Up and that around. sounds sort of like that old Zelda commercial where the guy goes, Oh, down! And he's in a black leotard and up, it up, made down, no down. sense. <laughs> right. Yay, yeah, start! You got yeah, the Zelda you kids code. probably don't remember what I'm talking about. <laughs> you do, I mean... You young whippersnappers just... don't know what we're talking about. Well, back in my day, <laughs> Zelda day, games... We only had these ridiculous uh, 3D PS3 games online. All we had is a controller and a joystick. Yep. No, no, because they didn't have joysticks yet. That didn't come until the 64. <laughs> no, uh, Atari? That doesn't yeah. count because it's a, that's not that's a fuck. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> I actually know you're right because in uh, 64 it was an analog stick. Aha! Uh -huh. There we go. That's what I meant. I said yeah. joystick. Shut yeah. Up. Oh, our controllers were wired and <laughs> <laughs> we had to plug them onto the TV. Dang, yeah. I'm getting pulled by this. We had no internet connection. Yeah, really. Well, that was we the next. We didn't thing. have we didn't we didn't have Wi-Fi. Why? Bah. <laughs> Okay. All we had was a stick in our imagination. Wait, whoa. Okay. Okay, anyway, uh... Stick? Yeah, I'll stick it in your imagination, alright? <laughs> Ew! <laughs> <laughs> yeah, what's that company called? Imagine Entertainment? Wait. <laughs> Never mind. I imagine that they don't exist. <laughs> Easy. They're, like, they're not a good company. <laughs> alright, at least I think. Yeah, I always thought that was a cool thing about Zelda 3 here, is the light feature. The light? Yeah, the way you can, you know, light the lanterns. Oh, that. Okay. Well, I guess Nintendo saw the light the room. and decided to do that. Yeah. I I miss when you can have the magic come out of your sword. Like, why don't they implement that in the, new 3D, in the 3D Zeldas? Like, you know, when you have full hearts, you can release a magic beam from your sword. I miss that. That was so cool. Yeah, really. That's a, that's a good point. They should bring that back. You guys have too much yeah. to do in 3D. <laughs> It'd be cool if you do a scoured sword. <laughs> and use your Wiimote and then power comes out and really it, gets your TV. Oh, that kind of is <laughs> when you charge up your sword. That's kind of like, that's like the next best thing to the full hearts magic from your sword. Is the the skyward charge. Like, that's the next best thing. What if like you really did to where an actual charge, an actual light came out of your Wiimote and went, a light sensor went to the TV and you saw the light go in the TV? and hit the Emmy <laughs> on the game, that'd be pretty cool. <laughs> but then yeah. you hit the in the room accidentally kill him, and yeah, it's not good. <laughs> no, no the like, game would be like $2,000. Yeah, yeah, that'd be like yeah. some 3 That'd be some 3 <laughs> shit there, man. Maybe you could that'd do that like, on the Wii U. I don't know. The 3DS shit something, I don't know. Yeah. Please do not use this game on the president. <laughs> that would be like a nuclear weapon. <laughs> the Nintendos would be outcasted. Maybe you can see the terrorism. Now cast. I'm oh, sorry, yeah. Miss Jackson. Oh, I am for you. <laughs> all right, we're almost there. Yeah, it's like it's like a gauntlet here. You have to go through all these multiple levels, fighting all these enemies. Yeah. Yeah, it tells you that you, your master sword is actually useless against the end boss. Yeah. Or Arcanum or Aganum or name? yeah, Aganum or Aganum. Something like that. Yeah, something like that. Like a name? <laughs> I have no idea. Yeah. It's not like it's Ganon or somebody. 
I thought that was the fi real final boss was that guy. I was like, where's Ganon? Oh, well, I guess we're finding this. Oh, wait a minute. It's kind of like Dr. Wally. It's kind of like, like Dr. Wally in Mega Man games. You know he's going to be the final boss. You thought he was just some asshole. Well, we already thought that anyway. <laughs> yeah. Asshole. Dr. Asshole. Dr. Butthole. <laughs> That's, that sounds like a really bad porno. <laughs> Yeah. Dr. Butthole. <laughs> <laughs> oh god, no. Dr. Proctologist. Uh, let me take you to my secret lair. Uh, you know, the Amazon woman. <laughs> Need to take your temperature. <laughs> <laughs> Watch where I stick this one on it. Uh. What, there was a wrestler named the Proctologist or something? His finishing move is called the Cavity Surge. He, <laughs> instead of the mandible, mankind's mandible claw, he uses plastic glove and never mind. <laughs> and oh my God. that would not be that wouldn't be that wouldn't be wrestling. That would be something else. Yeah, really. <laughs> well, actually, so, that kind of happened. Remember, remember, Star Soldier Steve Austin shoved that thing up Vincent Man's butt in the hospital room. <laughs> yeah, Paige and Doctor Austin. Yeah. Though I would say Both if they didn't have here, nurse, so they didn't actually <laughs> show anything. But anyway. Yeah. Here we go. Now oh, we have yeah. reached Aghanim and Zelda. Haha, <laughs> I've been waiting for you. <laughs> oh, really? I guess that's why he didn't start doing it and doing the thing until we got here. Okay, Link, you know, I'll just go and stab him right now. Yeah, I was like, why don't you just okay. go? Come on, Link. Stab him. Princess Zelda, she's up in the air. Well, and you don't do it. You Looks lazy like asshole! Ho ho ho! Merry Christmas! I mean, wait, this. Ho <laughs> <laughs> oh, ho! Oh. Oh, ho oh, oh. ho! It's easy! Ho oh, oh. ho! What? You've never. The power of gold. <laughs> wait, what? Power wait, of gold? I think it was the power of gods originally, but they had to censor that out because of religion. Can't mention God in a video game. Ooh. I'm ever church, right? Ah. Uh, uh. Anyway, we're saying Castlevania. Can't make Christian references. Now, um, sure they right. can. Now, with the intense battle with Aganim. Yeah, you can see, use your bug net also instead of the sword. <laughs> which I didn't at first. I thought that was the only thing you can use against Aganim was the bug net. What? Yeah, I didn't even think you could use a master sword. A master sword is useless. The, the yeah, years, years later. Oh, use me for That's amazing. You <laughs> first game. Oh my god, better start using my bug net. <laughs> yeah, it worked. That's how I beat him. First yeah, time. yeah, that's like it. Yeah, it worked, but it's like that's such a uh, some. How? Why would you think that would be the first thing to go to instead of just trying your sword, the main weapon you have? He said uh, reflect his power against him. I think the sword would do it. I thought he had to use another item. Because the sword is too, like, oh, well, just use your sword? Because usually, you know, Zelda Dungeons or Mega Man games, you use a different weapon besides the regular one. So I guess I was thinking I had to use something else, and, well, I can, but it's yeah, not the easy. Yeah, you can, but... <laughs> yeah. So you're trying to capture his power. Yeah. Yeah, 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 that, that, that's what I was trying to do, yeah, yeah. I was trying to do that. I didn't really think you could beat him. Uh, the only way you could beat him was bug catcher man. I'm going to catch his power in this net and put it in a bottle. <laughs> That's why I was uh, trying to make it a mission to get the bug catcher and ask, I gotta get that thing or I can't beat a Gundam. <laughs> All right, we finished the game. All right, Thank well. you everybody for watching. I give Zelda a... Oh wait, what's going on? Yeah, I actually kind of thought this is the end or almost the end. And then I found out, no, you got a whole nother game to play here. What the... F <laughs> That's bull crap, holy. Really? <laughs> I was disappointed by this scene. Why? Here we get the so this man telling us... Oh no, you didn't do it quite yet. <laughs> you have to do more errands for me. No, no, it's yeah. good, because you wouldn't want the game to be as short as that. Like, that would be the worst Zelda game ever if it was that short. Well, yeah, it's true, but the time, we... So some of us took so long to get to that point, and doing all these errands, secret bombing the walls, and find all these secrets and stuff, and then finally beating all three castles, and then finding a Ghanim, and then it's like, oh, right, the end, and then, oh, whoa, we got seven more freaking castles to go? Yeah. So at the time awesome. I was thinking, man, this is a long play. freaking game. But, but now yeah. looking back, it's like, oh yeah, I'm glad. I'm glad. Uh, you know, we have a whole other world to do because that hey. would be a short game. <laughs> like, man, I've done enough already. Hey, get your money's <laughs> worth, man. Come on, this is back in 1990s. Yeah. Yeah.
All right, so that is it for part five. We will see you in part six for our adventure through the dark world. Till then, God bless you. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Welcome to part six of Let's Play The Legend of Zelda. I'm into the past. Part six. Did I mention this is part six? Nope. Along with part six, I mean Wee Guy and Dark Jinchu. Hey, don't do what I did. Hi, I'm back! Yeah, so we are now in the dark world. And I am trying to look for the first dungeon. Uh, it'll be to your left. Lols. Oh, wait. Left is right in this world. It's yeah. the dark world. It's opposite. Hey, look, oh, Yoda. shoot. I've been going the wrong way the whole time, even though the direction is right. On the map, it's left. Hey, look, Yoda's everywhere. Yeah. Hey, look, yeah. there's the monkey thingy. Get the yeah. Triforce, you will. I love the music in the Dark World. Yeah, it's oh, classic. Oh. Hey, I no see, running in I the hallways. <laughs> there's no hallways anywhere. Shut your mouth. <laughs> it's almost a ripoff of Mario 3 Dark Land. Except it's Dark Land, not Dark World. But anyway, here's a broccoli. Whoa, <laughs> <laughs> I'm tripping out, dude. Broccoli talking, run! Yeah, this is a trippy world. I told you, man. It's that moonstone. <laughs> Got a whack. Is it the spiritual stone of ECW? No. That comes in oot. Mm. So, if you're in the dark world, if, if I guess if I, Ron Moore, was in the dark world, uh, my shape would change to the ECW logo. I don't know. Mm -hmm. No, it'd be the WCW 2001 logo. <laughs> no way. Yeah. I just become a furry. <laughs> we got <laughs> we winged. It came uh, he came a rabbit. Yeah. We got become Chun Li. <laughs> we got would be a woman. Yeah. <laughs> well, you'd be a uh, you you'd be gummy. Jamie yes, uh, Jamie would be Mr. Leahy. I guess I would be the I would be Pinkie Pie's uh pet crocodile or reptile. Yes, it, yeah, totally. Miss away for J Man. <laughs> J Man, what do you give this world? Uh, six out of ten. Yeah. <laughs> An angel will just be a pile of vomit. <laughs> <laughs> what about J Star uh, Star Soldier's friend? What shape would he be? Uh. What game are we playing again to give it a 10 out of 100? <laughs> <laughs> he still be him. He just he just don't want to know what's going on. Yeah, he'll, he'll be a scale with numbers on it, like 1 to 10. And Chuck Norris will just be Chuck Norris. Yeah. Oh, stuck in here. This little maze right here gets to my nerves. I know, I was well, confused. I was like, follow the dots. Yeah, and then I kind of go, whoa! What is this, my butt? It's a monkey! It's a monkey business here, and... Well, hey, Chinese food following you. Yeah. Is that the ancient from Kung Fu? The legend continues. <laughs> Uki, Uki, Uki. Oh, no, he goes Kiki. Oki. It's not, it's not the monkeys from Rhythm Man. This video is pwned by Okie Doki Harry Carey Wii U Productions. <laughs> that actually sounds like a that actually sounds like a fun one. Okie Doki Productions. That actually sounds Harry, like a funny. Harry, Harry. No, Naoki Kadoki Productions. <laughs> Alright, so you have to pay this monkey 100 uh, rupees in order to get inside the first dungeon in the dark world. What the fuck that? I climb up there myself and get it. If you say no, yeah. I think you'll just leave and you gotta go get him again, that maze. Then you gotta pay another 110. Yeah. Well, thanks, you monkey fuck. <laughs> <laughs> and we guys, Jimmy's were rustled. Because he lost 100 rupees. <laughs> no! So here's the first dungeon in the Dark World. Uh, and then we get the awesome Dark World dungeon music, because it's different. Yeah, but I, I like the Light World dungeon music better, honestly. I don't know, I like this. Well, yeah, it's a tour. It's a, it's a, it's tough for me, but I would definitely say I like the Dark World Overworld music better than the High World theme. It just, it overshadows it and <laughs> overshadow Dark World. Anyway, <laughs> it's just a much better, I just think it's a much better, more memorable theme. There we go. Not much better, it's memorable. See, more memorable. The dungeon dark world themes, though. All it is is. The mood. I I'm oh, I was. I remember as a kid. I was just like, I'm, I don't like this music. It's I, as in like it's you know, eerie. Yeah. Hey, it's a key. 
Yeah, but so is the light world, but uh, yeah, no, I think it's better. Beyond, it's a leather pouch! <laughs> you have to make a map. It's a leather leather key. Hmm. What is this I thing right here? I'm calling animal cruelty, you just killed that animal. Yeah, that little, uh, yeah. Alright, going to... Like a beetle. Rescue, Rescue Inc. is about to come catch you. Whoa, this mud puddle. This... Transported me somewhere. Ah, here's the... The uh, Hillian, uh, payphone. <laughs> Whoa, your name's in the game, Ronnie. Cool. Whoa. Whoa. What's this? Programmer's name must be Ronnie. You can trick a little kid doing that with the name. Whoa, we got your name in here. Oh, cool. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Uh, all snap jellyfish time. You jellyfish? You are jellyfishy. I think you could dash to those. The wall? Yeah, that part you can you can dash on those instead of blowing them up. Huh? Because they don't have the regular. This is like a circular area. The regular gun. Hmm. <laughs> Map. <laughs> Uh, mm. See those cracks in the wall? I think when I first got here a long time ago, when I first Wasting played it, I was, trying to, uh, I was trying to bomb them. I was like, what? Yeah, some would do uh, easier to bomb, and some you could just dash through them with saving a bomb. Yeah. Oh, oh ouch. Tomfoolery there with those fake cracks. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh, God. Skip, man. Where's Skip at? Skip, yeah. Ro Skip Rogers, where? Skip's in the call. Way to go! You got the map! <laughs> oh no. Oh, yeah, so, uh, Skip Rogers is actually undercover and uh, Majora's Mask, he's Tingle. Oh dear goodness. <laughs> no, he's, ting he's Tingle in the Wind Waker as well. Get, get a map! <laughs> <laughs> That's pretty much how he sounds like. <laughs> can't stand it. Tingle that. That's, cool. the, That's the only video game character I hate more than Toad. <laughs> well, he's not in. He's he's like, but at least the Toad's like in every game. He's like, what? He's in Majora's Mask, Wind Waker. Um, yeah. And, uh, I, I think the Minish, you no know, Four Swords Adventure. And, like that's about it. Yeah, but still, he's still worse than Toad. Cause Link drowned him after uh, Wind Waker. <laughs> that's cruel shit, man. No, it's no, not. It's he deserved it. True story. He was also on to catch a predator. Freaking creep. <laughs> What, just you, so what, get... what, what was your plan today? I'm gonna just sell maps to little kids, and that's all. <laughs> well, why don't you take a seat? So, so you, you decided to find a 14-year-old girl online and just decided to travel down and set her a map. Yeah, that's all. <laughs> well, let me read some text transcripts here. I want to draw a map to your vagina. <laughs> oh, I didn't make one. It's just a joke. <laughs> <laughs> that would so be a great pair. <laughs> How to catch are a team? We, are we like the discussing fanfics now? Yeah. <laughs> fanfics. The tingle Skip Roger fanfics or something. <laughs> and it says here, I want to tingle all over you with a golden shower. Are you serious? The oh. golden, no, the golden power. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, he's talking about the golden sword. You no, get the golden sword in this game. <laughs> no, he, she wants tingle to squirt with like golden power or something like that. Yeah. <laughs> I give this fanfic a 10 out of 100. <laughs> <laughs> Watch out for the Sonic Furries. No, oh, God. Okay, I think I'm supposed to go over here next. This dungeon was kind of uh, hard to me. It seems like it's harder than some of the other dungeons in the Dark World for some reason. It's the most boring one, honestly. Definitely a complete. Yeah. It bores me. One and two were boring. The other ones were actually fun. Yeah. When was the second one? Wasn't that in the... It's the water temple. Oh, second one was at Walmart. Oh, is it Walmart? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, wa water don't, mark. Don't spoil it, wee guy. Yeah. You asshole. <laughs> those oh, yeah. This game yet. Yeah, because everyone who's watching this has totally not played this game. Yeah. Well, it could be. See, it could be someone out there who actually hasn't watched it yet, but I played it yet, cousin. but oh well. Oh, wait. I would say my little cousin, but he has it on the Game Boy Advance. Whoops. <laughs> <laughs> well, still, it's not that much of a spoiler. I mean... Come on. Oh, here's a spoiler. You rescue Zelda in the end. Oops! Um, wait. Ain't that like every Zelda game? Well, except for, uh... Wanda Gamalion, or whatever. Wanda Gamalon? Yeah. Wanda Gamma? Those are spin-offs. Those don't count. Yeah. You're a spin-off. Yeah, they do. They're called Zelda. 
Um, but it's not the legend, so your argument's invalid. Yeah, but that's like saying your dad banged your mom. You can't argue with that. And, and uh, well, that, you know, well, that is well. <laughs> honestly, that is true. So that makes we like, so you, my you're not, dad. You don't care for me. You, you're not my father. I banged your mother. You can't argue with that. Suddenly goes Darth Vader goes, I that thing I fucked your mom. Like, I can't argue with that. <laughs> Didn't know you were a necro, wee guy. Oh. Where where did that come into play? <laughs> we're just talking about, uh, you know. What what do you think about? We're talking about Necro from Third Strike. Oh yeah, he's one of the best characters. And let's stay on topic, sure. <laughs> Get out of my way! Anime. Well, like you said, this is the most boring dungeon, so I thought you wouldn't mind going off topic. Yeah. I don't know, I think it's interesting, because it's the first dungeon, you know? It's like, oh, here we are, woohoo, yeah! Adventure here in the Dark World, in the first dungeon. <laughs> um, not well, really he, he, typically he, the first uh, dungeon. He left YouTube now, so he's not going to comment on this. <laughs> Aww. Sad face. Stupid AdSense. It makes no AdSense. Yeah. Google, Google, Google. no sense. No. No Google 2012. Yeah. Yeah, fuck the people. <laughs> Alright, now we got the big key. Why don't you put the big key in the... Yeah, big why don't you use the big key? Okay. Or suddenly, Google's account gets hacked and uploads porn like they did the Sesame Street channel. You serious? Yeah, that happened a few... What? You don't remember Months that? Ago? I never heard of that. Yeah, that was hilarious. They were just teaching about, you know, they were sex education, come on. They're talking about the big birds and the whatever. Big bees. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know the big birds, the little bees. I don't even. I don't even. I don't even know what's going on. Yeah, what the hell is going on? Oh wait. Obviously, Vomer's not doing a good job making a map to where he needs to go. <laughs> I don't have a map. Oh, did I get a? Yeah, I did. Get yeah, you map. got the map. Skip would be on your ass if he didn't. Yeah. Turtle. Turtle power. No, I don't think that's a... Oh, yeah, that is a turtle. The doggy. Mmm, <laughs> no. No, no, no! Why no doggy? Why don't you dash attack those when you, like, jump off that arrow and dash? And I think it brings you back to the arrow. Really? I think. Why don't you take the arrow up the... I like Aerosmith. Cut it out! I know. I hate these jellyfish. Or what? What are they? They look like squiddy. Jelly turtle fish? I don't know. Annoying little fuckers. <laughs> yeah. Ah, oh, dang it, that was stupid. Yep. Hey, you telling me? Oh wait. No, you hit it. You hit it so that the blue is go. up and the red is down. Oh, no one thought that. Out. No, you yeah. did. Why would you use a bomb? Or that? Oh yeah, you can do that too. That works. <laughs> I forgot, I didn't remember. Run! Here we go. I'm not scared, I'm a real man. Ow ouch. Well. Good yeah, job. I'm like a real idiot right there. Totally. Here we go. Magically appears again. Alright. Why don't you run? There you go. Get out of my way! And suddenly, third strike appears out of nowhere. Yeah. Oh, look. A treasure chest. Oh, I wonder what that has in it. Oh, uh, that's a... Cake? <laughs> Alright, compass. Oh, I got compass! Hey, look, money. Behold, it's blue money! <laughs> Money's. Oh. oh, good job. Oh, I just noticed that. Good job for doing a me. Doing hey, a look, Wii guy. Look, you recorded making... a bit of the emulator. <laughs> Wait, hey, look, you're making more than uh, Google AdSense. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> Screw you, YouTube. Look what I'm making. Making 150 rupees. What is that? 20 cents? Yeah. <laughs> More than probably made on Blip, at least. <laughs> no, we're getting... Yeah, no, this is the real reason why you lost your AdSense, is that you recorded a bit of the emulator on the right side of the screen. Yeah. Nope. I file a claim that these people do not know how to record. They can't perfectly censor the recording on the emulator. And they're using emulators anyway, so that makes some fags. <laughs> Chuck Norris? So oh, wait, um... <laughs> um, um... Wait... Um, 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 a Norella? Space Lobster? 
Lingy diggy ding dong? I don't space know. Space No, no, uh, space chicken, there we go. You need a key, Dang Ronnie. It. You need the key! Yeah, that's what I was thinking. Oh, man, I'm going in circles here. See, I'd really get lost in this dungeon, especially when it's been years since I played it. Oh, nice circle. <laughs> yeah. I meant to do that, because you get it, the life is about the circle of life. And you... Okay, I failed. Ain't that song by Phil Collins? Who? Phil Collins. Phil Collins is by Phil Collins? No, the song Circle of Life. From, like, The Lion King? The Circle... I don't fucking know. There's an episode of Walker Texas Ranger called Circle of Life. Yeah, it's just basically, um... Uh... A circle around life. No, it's the circle of diameter of a wind Chuck Norris does a roundhouse kick. <laughs> yeah, the oh, circumference. Okay. Yeah. There you go. Yeah, there you go. There you go. Now you Ow. know where you're going, Ronnie. Ouch. We got pissed in the electrical fence again. <laughs> <laughs> they say Tommy Boy. <laughs> we did it before Tommy Boy was cool. That guy in a little coat. We got was four when Tommy Boy came out. And I watched it when I was no, four. No, I think it was two, actually. Yeah, two. It came out in 95. Yeah, I think I, I saw it when I was young. I saw it thing when I was like 10 or 11. And I was like, oh, this is the best movie ever. And it still is. It's a funny movie. Yep. Classic movie with amazing quotes. You need something. Okay. So was Black Sheep. Now. There you go. Uh, there you go. First key uh, the bomb. I'll we'll go over here and paint. Uh, power up. Power Ranger Ho. Why don't you find the key to my heart? <laughs> you caught a fairy. Oh, fairy. Yeah. Fairy funny. <laughs> Why did you say that? I spelled fairy wrong. <laughs> I just said that. Oh, that's why you were saying it. I just thought you were just pronouncing it wrong anyway and not paying attention to that it was spelled wrong. Never mind. <laughs> oh, yeah. I forgot. <laughs> yes. Got the ECW key. Wait, you already got the ECW key. That's the big key. Oh, yes. This is the, uh... WCW, WCW key. Oh, no, new age WWE key. TNA key. Nah, TNA's not in this game. Yeah. I heard that game sucked. Anyway. It did. <laughs> Especially the Wii version. Oh, wow, there's a Wii version. Of course, everything's on the Wii. Oh. Except for the games that can't be on the Wii. Um. Yeah, just use the exactly. internet channel. And no, it's easy. Just go to the internet channel. Go to YouTube. Type in uh, like. Modern Warfare 2, and there, you got Modern Warfare 2 on the Wii. Problem we got? Idiot. Not playing it! You mad, bro? Yeah, I'm playing the internet channel, Call of Duty 2 on the internet channel on the Wii. Fuck that, it doesn't matter, it got with them having fever, no game can beat that. That's like, new fanboy game of mine now. Uh, Rhythm Heaven for DS? Beat that. All the, the whole trilogy, man, don't matter, I'll fuck y'all. <laughs> Wait, I don't know. <laughs> what? There's a third one? Yeah, Fever is the third one. How about the third Zelda, the one we're playing right here, anyway? What? No, it's not. In the chronological order, this game is actually the last in the series. <laughs> That's why it's called Link to the Past. <laughs> oh, really? You didn't blow it? Oh, there you go. <laughs> I don't know. Yeah. Uh, what? I, I don't fuck shit. Uh, uh. <laughs> I don't even I don't even know yeah. what's going on, man. This is so Ooh, confusing. Oh. Alright. Ooh, it's dark. Yep, well it's dark world. Yep, it's the dark world. This is the dark world. Ow. Dinosaur! Oh wait. Yeah. Freaking Pokemon. Yeah, Pokemon's always cool. Is there even dinosaur type Pokemon? I don't I can't it's even Aerodactyl. That's that's not dinosaur. That's like a dragon. Oh wait, never mind. Aerodactyl. It's like a. Pair. Never mind. Never mind. Retard. Don't know Pokemon. Shut the fuck up. You're an idiot. You, you have shut the freak up. You have Pokemon Yellow, we guy. I think, don't you? Silver. Oh. Nothing is silver. Nothing. 
Nothing yeah. rhymes with silver. Nothing. <laughs> huh? Liver. Here we go. Yes. Silver, li liver, silver. Silver, liver. It doesn't rhyme. Er, liver, <laughs> it silver. Count. It can't be All the right. end of it. Time to, uh, lay the hammer down, I feel. Time to be the lord of time. Time. Stop. Hammer time. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> Suck if you were the time lord. That game ain't good. <laughs> time lord? What? Time lord. Oh, was it? Yes. Oh, that now, The game by Rare, who made your favorite game, Captain Skyhawk. Man. And Shadowgate 64. Shut your mouth. They make that union. They did now. What they, uh, they put down the Wii, man, like, as far as, like, uh, buy it from the, uh, Wii shop. console, oh, man. They should make a new Shadowgate for the Wii, but yeah. it might be better because it's, you know, not yes. 64. <laughs> now with more sleep-inducing gameplay. Yeah. <sighs> Seriously, they should have made Shadowgate, Super Shadowgate, that would have been awesome. That's what, uh, Beyond Shadowgate basically is. No, no, Beyond Shadowgate is, like, too... Past 16 bit, is it? Out. Oh wait, oh it's Turbo it's Graphics. Actually, it's, it's beyond 8 bit. It's actually 8 bit. Uh, yeah, honestly. but what, what I mean, like, still in a uh, point and click style for Super Nintendo. Uh, That'd been awesome. If done right. Well, they done fucked up. They done goofed. <laughs> Why do you still have the mushroom and not the magic powder? Because I forgot to get it. Because you'd rather do shrooms than powder. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Alright, well, I'm lost again. You know where to go. You got the hammer, you know where to go now. To go to where you, uh... Oh, I know where you, yeah. You, oh, you know yeah, where you yeah, yeah, that's right. Hit the switch and then go through that door and then... Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> yep, I'm gonna blip now. <laughs> Good <one> sucks. <laughs> yeah, yeah. What, when have they not sucked? Yeah. When have they not just ruined one of the... What used to be a great site? Video sharing yeah. site. Yeah, really. Here you go, little J. What do you think about Google? Uh, I kind of like it. What's that? <laughs> <laughs> Shut up, hey, little brat. <laughs> What's your dad gonna do? Huh? <laughs> you should hit my son. I already thought, when I saw that, I already thought Jay had a son. <laughs> <laughs> Everyone did. <laughs> Alright, now I know it's stupid. Watch, yeah, you just cut you to the chase. Yeah. <laughs> we guy and them puns. I, I can't help it, I'm the pun master. I just can't help it. <laughs> pun man. Big so pun, is he a rapper? There's, so there's like a bread, yeah, he's dead. He actually died. So we guy, guess what bread company makes bread? Wonder Bread! <laughs> No, Bimbo. Bimbo bread? Yeah, Bimbo. No, a Wonder Bread is a brand of just bread. It's the whitest bread you can buy. No, the whitest bread is, uh, Clorox. <laughs> you bleach it. <laughs> bleach. Bleach flowers on whatever, I don't know. Bleach, please. Ha! That show, I thought that show was about Clorox. Nugget, please. I don't know. <laughs> Nugget. Ted. Yeah, please. Chicken nugget, please. Yummy. Hello? Alright, destroy all the turtles. Turtle power, motherfucker. <laughs> all your turtles are dying, Jintu. So? Oh, you're <laughs> you don't even give a shit. I killed a turtle. Yeah, exactly. You killed a turtle anyway. True. But, um... You need fire. Oh. kind of need a fire. Whoa. There we go. Double getting... quad quadra kill. C -c -c combo. Here we go. There, thirteen. The first Halloween. boss, which actually is the best part of this dungeon. Yeah. Just the music. <laughs> the, the... No, but look at him. He was cool. It's like, oh my shit! Ah, oh, dang it! Really? Oh, and you died. Face. Link's like. Oh, wait a minute. Link. Link's like this commentary is bad. Then the fairy goes like, you have to survive more, we're almost done. And he goes like, fuck. <laughs> that tail is... Ooh, ouch. Uh, this, uh, uh, what? this, uh... 
I can't I can't do it. There's no words there. Oh. That's the boss's name, do it. Uh, no, his name is Teddy. Oh. Ted. Yeah, no. Teddy. Minor audio laggage here. Oh. Yeah, really. Well, when do we not always have that? Oh shit, son. Oh shit, son. Oh, oh shit. Oh, no! oh my god! Fire. Fire! Oh god, kill him! Oh, ah, come on. Ah. Shut up, Wega. Yeah, Wega. Oh, wait a minute! Oh, he, he will has not die! He won't die, King! Ah! Magic missile. Well, what do you know? He killed yes. him. Here. Oh, it's so satisfying when you kill that bosses. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Happy Fourth of July. Yeah. It's Fourth of July when this is uploaded, or close to. Yeah. It hurt if you actually let that hit the ground. It shatters, and you gotta start the dungeon again. Ouch. Oh, that's the master quest mode. <laughs> No, that's the, um... What is it? Uh... Second request? Well, wait a minute, it's coming to life and there's somebody inside! Looks like she's, uh... Crystal. <laughs> what? She's inside a crystal! Yeah. Just like Star Fox Adventures. Could you be crystal clear on the subject? No, I'm taking crystal math. Web has Basic to... Basically, Web she escaped the kitchen and she got encased in a crystal. So Link has to go rescue the people to, uh, basically, because he wants a sandwich and he needs one really bad. And so this is why this happens. Don't forget to get the Wonder okay. Bread. Okay, so, you remember, uh, Crystal Pepsi? Yeah. What? Who? We got wasn't born yet, I don't think. <laughs> I don't think so. Crystal Pepsi was awesome. Yeah. What happened to it? Uh, discontinued. Nobody liked it. That was the same thing, just Crystal. Yeah, exactly. Clear. Alright, so that's the end of part six. We'll see you in part seven. Till then, God bless. Take care. Yay! Oh, oh yeah, Link to the Past. It's a great game. The Super Nintendo. No. Ah, I forgot to hit the record button. Welcome to Let's Play The Legend of Zelda, A Link to the Past, Part 7, Ete, Way, K, S, A. This is Ron Moore, along with Jintu, Wee Guy, and the J-Man. Um, I don't want to do any more essays. Uh, I'm tired of that from, from school. <laughs> yeah, we got, we got did an essay in his senior year and got pregnant. Whoa. It was True. pretty hard. <laughs> <laughs> and then it was on MTV. True life. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, and we are uh, now back outside into the dark world. But it's not dark. It seems pretty light. It's dim. More like a dim world. I don't know. It's Some, out of world. Well, where are we going to next, Jin? J. Ron Moore? <laughs> Dang it. We are going to do some fun grinding. Yay! Women lessons. No. Not any hardcore grinding, because I'm going to be editing the all that stuff out. Just not finally find something. Yeah, grind editing. <laughs> yeah, grind editing. Yeah, not the full-fledged grinding. Oh, yes, you, uh, you said it's... grinding as if you grinded to somebody. <laughs> Alright, Bear. It's grinding. Yeah. <laughs> I'm glad Bear is in You said hardcore grinding. <laughs> oh, shut <laughs> up. Oh. <laughs> Alright, I got another bottle. I'm sure. I wish... Uh, Hey, what's his name? Mr. Lee, he was playing this game. Oh, I need a bottle of bottle, bud. I'm gonna pour it full of liquor, bud. <laughs> I get all those bottles. <laughs> yeah. Now he needs one more. I love the music in, in the Dark World. It's tight. Yeah, pretty tight. That is Super Nintendo's chip. It's working pretty good. It's tight, dog. It's a little cream and onion. <laughs> what? <laughs> What was that? The chips. Oh, it's so cool, Ranch Doritos. Oh, <laughs> that'd be yum. Yes. Oh, the weeds. Yeah, that's gonna be in the next episode. <laughs> what? Oh, 
Jamin said that's new that's next week. All these chips we're talking about. Oh. How about the super FX chip? That'll be the next weed. <laughs> that's stupid. <laughs> it's coming, get it? Oh Hi Bear. Uh, Bear's he... retired from Mesa 2K, I guess, so yeah. Oh, oh shut up. <laughs> no, no, I'm just I'm just like busy and stuff. <laughs> I'm a communist. <sighs> hey mom, this guy's a commie! Well, call me a commie. What's your <laughs> reference? Comic-Con? What? Comma, 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 chameleon? With a girl, Jorge, or whatever? Oh, I mean, boy, boy George, whatever his name is. <laughs> Jorge. Uh, Bjork? Um, girl... Charlie? Hey, hey, that's Bjork, Jin oh. 2. Uh, oh, yeah, Bjorky Dork. <laughs> Bjorky Dorky Pan. Okay, no. that's trying too hard. Jerky Boys, what? Big Jerky? Oh, you talking about that, that, uh, that mother that, like, uh, tan so hard that she became Beef Jerky? Yeah, really? Said, um, snap to a slim gym. She was tranning very hard. Oh, she's, she's a tranny? What? Yeah, she's training for tranning. That rat's like... So she's training to be a tranny in her training bra. Wow. This is it's coming game, in second. Game Super 1? Let's go We should get run over by a tran. Train, tran. Damn it. Uh, fail. <laughs> That's the whole point. It's supposed to fail. Otherwise, it wouldn't be SE2 gay. K. <laughs> How dare we guy? How dare you? Oh hi, oh hi bear. Oh. Oh, hi. Help. <laughs> it's bullshit. I didn't ask for we guy to be in this call. I did not. Oh hi J man. Good to see you again. Here we are. We're grinding and sing to the past. Ha 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 ha. Oh hi to medic. Oh. Okay, this here is a sure sign of that I need to do something. I fail. <laughs> well, uh, scores. And so you throw something in the inner circle of stones, inner circle of life, and this weird uh, mutated fish pops up, and uh, he would give you the uh, something medallion. I forgot. Let's see what it is. Quake medallion. You get a golden coin. Collect 100, and you get an extra life. Yeah. <laughs> Well, how come in Mario Land 2 you only had to collect six? Um, six just the six coins. golden coins. Yeah. Yep. And plus you're not in world, so... Six golden coins, four turtle does Oh, fail. <laughs> what happened to five? <laughs> I don't know. Can't count. Um, they don't count. Get it? Huh? Six golden coins, 18 Link, link games. <laughs> 127 Eight Mega Man games. And three on the Philips CDI. <laughs> Did you say Philips or Philips? Uh, I said. Oh, actually. <laughs> Zelda Zelda Dungeon.net actually, uh, think does a walkthrough of those games too. Oh, I am chronologically confused. Ah, dang! I thought there was a secret waterfall right there. I guess not. Two, no, two packs of beers and please let's stay on topic. <laughs> <laughs> okay. ST2K on topic? No. ST2K on topic where? Down there. <laughs> Whoa. Hmm. We're gonna have to give Link a new name because he's dashing all the time. We're gonna call him Link Dash. <laughs> or, um, what about Dink? Hmm. Well, it's the Hamburger Helper logo. Uh oh. Hey guys, uh, that's Master Hand. I told you, uh, Master Hand goes, hey, uh, you guys need to stay on topic. I'm tired of <laughs> off topic stuff in this video. <laughs> no, it's the Hamburger Helper logo. No, nope, it's crazy. <laughs> yeah. No, Put it's crazy it's... hand down. You do not. Good. Good. No, he goes, hey, uh, how long is the partner at the light crazy. world? Crazy hand? So when you do that, then they get back together, and in the ending credits, they're reviewing video games together again. Yep. And then, um, Dr. Asshole comes out. 
No, and then the butt hurt flows when the newest enemy controller throwers is released. Yeah. Oh, watch out for the spikes. <laughs> and then, and then, yeah, I have to comment on it. <laughs> yeah. And then you get blocked. Yep. Ouch. Oh man, wait. You know, Skip's gonna be posting a comment later. Watch out for spikes. Yeah, you're gonna be butt hurt. The fourth level's always tough. Yeah. Ooh, the bomb shop is this way, which is, I believe, the house. Bomb shop! Bomb shop, bomb shop. <laughs> oh, it's a Dargan. Who? Dragon. We got, remember Dragon Dragon, the wrestler? Where they're in the dragon suit wrestling? Yeah, totally. <laughs> I I this is so bad. Whoa, oh, holy cow, a tree! <laughs> you never talked to a tree before? Ron Moore's talking to Mo Minecraft Martin. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah. <laughs> I kind of still butt hurt because he's seen the hamburger helper slash uh, crazy hand and thought it was the power glove. Yeah. <laughs> Well, he was like, oh, right, power glove. He was like, oh, talking power glove. Ah, runs away. <laughs> it's so bad. Dang it. Really, YouTube? Thanks for lagging big time right when we start the commentary. No. Well, it's not too bad. Well, it's Treason. lagging bad on my end. Hey, look, it's a deer. Is that a viper? Like, is that a deer? Or is, is that, that like a viper? <laughs> It's a Pokemon, we gotta catch it. <laughs> Go masturbate ball. <laughs> masturbate? I, I, I put the bait in the ball and then it's a masturbate ball. In the master God, I I I get out of it. Right. I'm gonna go. We're trying to be, uh, we're trying to be master got... we're trying to be master chef. Oh. Where you told that, you told that uh, failed chef. He goes, uh, this is master cook or master chef, not master bait. I know, but we, we talked about this to we Guy. No masturbating during commentary. Yeah. Yeah, we got no fishing. I blame Jintu. What are you blaming me, dude? I'm fishing. All right, look. Can you dig it? I am digging for the flute. There we go. You can't dig it, sucker. <laughs> it sounds like a fluke. Can you, can you cut? You just picked up a giant nose. <laughs> <laughs> There's the ocarina of time. Yeah. <laughs> He's about to blow the nose. <laughs> yeah, he's about to blow something. <laughs> he's gonna blow that deer's flute. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, play the uh, yeah the Temple of Time song. <laughs> yeah. Whoa. I like the serenity of water. Whoa, what happened? I think we uh, Street up. power, activate! Wow. Whoa. Somehow the game transformed ahead of time. Skip Rogers. Oh, is oh my god! <laughs> oh, look, a rabbit. Uh, whoa. Looks well, like we went back to the past, I think. Yeah. To play the sorry games that suck butt. What the fail? Good job, we got. That's just, that's just, that's nasty. I know, you're right, Jintu. We guy, we talked about this. Not during commentary. But listen, guys, ECW! <laughs> ECW! Yeah. Yeah, we're gonna, need a, we're gonna need a medic. More comments yeah. gonna, uh, appear. What's ECW? Um, Extreme Crunchy Waffles. Yeah. <laughs> what, WCW? We got Shamit your wrestling. Yeah, we has championship wrestling. That is my ultimate wrestling right there. Yeah, it's, not, it, it's nothing but a bunch of male strippers now. We got fired all the women. We haven't had much uh, it's 2 kcw wrestling matches in a while. Uh, yeah, I forgot about oh, that. Oh, died. Should probably start hey. doing it again? Oh, come oh. on, really? You gonna die from those bombers? Oh, wait a minute! <laughs> Looks like you got bombed. kamikaze -ed. I mean, one of oh. my... Iraq or Afghanistan? Stop bombing me! Dang. Yeah. <laughs> God damn it, Geraldo. Yeah. Thanks, Geraldo, for telling my location, dumbass. <laughs> uh, <laughs> Extra confusing Wii guy. ECW. 
Yes, and I can definitely be like that, so yeah, that works. Extra confused ah, me. Dang it. Stupid stone, move out the way. <laughs> Ron Moore got stoned. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yep. Man, that must have went up your butt. That must have hurt. <laughs> yeah, imagine transforming like that in real life onto something. Like, what if you trans like transform or transfer whatever right into a sword? And the next word that's dead. Um, we guy, um, explain. <laughs> I don't know. I, 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 I don't even what? I wouldn't want to know how do you transform how you get transformed onto a sword. You have to be in some kind of weird place in order for oh, that to happen. Oh shoot. Again, man. Good we job, guy, you know you know all about snakes. A solid snake? Ooh, it's a snake. <laughs> what we guy said. Dang, those soldiers are fast. Hey, we got, <laughs> did you know there's a uh, voice chat in this game? Bill, 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 Bill. Nah, the science guy. No. Oh, you messed it up. <laughs> that's my, that's my, that's my purpose. Wouldn't be me if I wasn't messing shit up. All right, now I'm getting the uh, bomb the terrorist medallion. medallion. Terrorist medallion. <laughs> Explosions everywhere. That's like the medallion. Wow. Oh, now you can kill uh, Bin Laden. Oh, dude, shit, shit just got religious up in this place. Yeah, shit just got. Doctor Wiley, Mister Leahy. Oh yeah, Doctor Wiley. <laughs> yeah, or Doctor Wiley. Doctor Wiley, yeah. Yeah, Doctor Leahy. Right on. <laughs> Doctor Leahy. Uh, what y'all making, man? Look out, bud. He only gives you like six out of ten health. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. yeah. Speaking of another bill, awesome sauce. <laughs> Philly. Yeah, Philly oh, Mitchell. Yeah. Yeah. Bimmy Mitchell. I miss Bill. He should come back. All right. Well, Billy Mitchell versus Skip Rogers, Matt rematch. <laughs> <laughs> Lately, he's only been liking Wee Guy videos for some reason. <laughs> after that loss, he just loved me. I guess I'm honored. I can't help it. I don't know why. Oh, right now, that cage match he lost to uh, Skip Rogers. Now can Did transform to different parts of Hyrule. Nigga, please. Or teleport, or whatever, or fly. Best part, that's Coming the best for you, nigga. That's the best breakfast cereal yep. ever. <laughs> now I'll get, give her the uh, mushroom so I can get some uh, bath salts later. Give her the shroom? <laughs> yeah. Bath salts. Hey, hey Ronnie. call it shower peppers. Why's it gotta be bath salts? I don't know, but Ronnie's coming for you, nigga. <laughs> um, you said the N-word. It's like the teacher did. I said, nigga. Sit down, nigga. <laughs> mm. All stop. Hammer time. Ooh. Yeah. Not like the band hammer on somebody. No, you can't touch this. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. I'm having, like, crazy oh, come on. I swear we have watched this before. We did. Oh, yeah, because you fucked up. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> We're going back to the past. Yep. We are. Just tell Ronnie that he sucks at He'd rather have a buffalo... Wild wing. <laughs> instead of him. <laughs> no, I said buffalo hey, wild wing. Ron Moore forgot something. What? Uh, you forgot to do something back in the future. Hmm. What could that be? Uh... Your kids! Your kids! <laughs> Simultaneously, both worlds was... Oh, dang it! Yeah, That's he right. Forgot to, he forgot to pee in the river. Yeah. He forgot to get into the uh, DeLorean. What, you, you can't piss in the electrical fence, but you can pee in the river? Come on, Gen 2. It's true, though. You don't die from the river, but you can die from the electrical fence. Someone drink that pee that they put got in the river, man. That ain't gonna be nice. Uh, who drinks... Question, who the, hell, who the hell drinks in a river? I do. Okay, then. Problem well, solved. A horse does. <laughs> well, okay, that's okay, because... Ronnie lives in a van down by the river. Yeah. <laughs> that means Ron Moore is now Bear, Gr Bear Grylls. I'm just waiting for the motivational speech. What? I thought it was Matt Foley. <laughs> Stop you Skip Rogers is the motivator. You gotta make it, no. map. Turn the van. Oh, I know, I know. 
I know who could be the successor to Matt Foley. Tim Foley. <laughs> <laughs> oh, speaking of Tim Foley, that's the end of this part. Wait, that segment had nothing to do with Tim Foley. Anyway, we will see you guys in part eight. Till then, God bless and take care, dog. Peace out. Peace. Oh, no. I am so sorry. Welcome to Let's Play The Legend of Zelda, A Link to the Past, Part 8, or Ultra. This is Ron Moore, along with we the Wii Guy and Tree. I mean, Minecraft Martin. <laughs> Lols. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know which name to go by anymore. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, and now I'm in the second dungeon in the Dark World, the Water Dungeon. Dang, I hate no, it. not Water Dungeons. <laughs> Freaking hate water levels, period. This one wasn't so bad. <laughs> Oh um, yeah. This well, one... maybe it was. I don't know. Does it have currents? <laughs> well, ow! Come on, I have my shield right there. Man. Ow! This is bad. <laughs> Getting pwned already. Not even a minute to the video. Oh, I forgot about the crap that bounces around. That's it's annoying. Yeah, <laughs> this dungeon's still not as hard as the freaking water temple in Ocarina of Time. It's just like the uh, insane asylum of Zelda. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Ooh. Ah, man. I remember this dungeon being this... Uh, just leave it to Nintendo to make these hard water dungeons. Yeah. Actually, the more I'm looking at it, the more... It, yeah, this one was pretty annoying. I take it back. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh, sw oh, yeah, you have to... All the stupid switches. Yeah. Get you, they get you every time, man, I'm telling you. Yeah. <laughs> Come on! Oh, there we go. What are those things, groundhogs, bouncing up and down right there? I, I honestly don't know. I don't know what those are. <laughs> they might be assholes. <laughs> This is the, those are the biggest assholes I've ever seen. <laughs> you, do have, you, have, you do have to walk them in the head, so it might be like those arcade games. Yeah. Oh, uh, the Crocodile ones, I don't know. Crocodile Dundee ones? <laughs> I think I recall him hitting crocodiles with a hammer. Yeah. <laughs> oh! I was, always, I was always glad those only took one hit. <laughs> oh! Ah, come on! Damn! Yep, oh. that's how it be going. Yep. <laughs> Why are those things right here? Whoa! <clears throat> Big uh, water bugs, I guess. Man, either, either it's just me or is there is there lag? I'm getting lag. Lag <laughs> for what? My, my computer sucks. I'll just I'll just say that. Just say my computer sucks. Anyway. <laughs> yeah, your computer sucks. It it does. There was lag in my part, but not now. Let's just go to Walmart and buy a new one. <laughs> <laughs> the best deals. Let's go to Walgreens. Slashing prices to, like Link slashes water things. <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> Trying to keep it on topic. <laughs> We're slashing prices. Oh, and that's a fat Jack. <laughs> now, buy, now buy something. Oh, I'm gonna slash you. <laughs> oh, if Walmart. Points for a uh, Conan O'Brien reference. <laughs> if Walmart had monsters that you had to kill while you shop, that'd be pretty cool. Yeah. <laughs> I'd go there every day. That makes yeah. Walmart more. <laughs> that makes Walmart more. more. No, that makes Walmart more of a dangerous place than it already is. <laughs> the monsters of Walmart.com. Well, some of the people that go there look like monsters, I guess. Yeah, yeah really. The, the people <laughs> Walmart are the monsters of Walmart. Walmart. <laughs> We've successfully turned this into a Walmart topic. <laughs> Let's play The Legend of Walmart Part 8. <laughs> Wait, I bought my Zelda at Walmart. No, I didn't. <laughs> I bought mine at... I forgot, I think Target. <laughs> this game, specifically? Yeah. I got no, it. Not this one, I mean, this is the ROM. But that, you know, <laughs> <kind of like laughs> that 
<laughs> we all bought this game one point in time or another, so. Yeah. <laughs> I had the original cartridge that I bought at Target back in 97. Really? Yep. That's good stuff right there. Yeah, these switches, I don't like them. Yeah. I don't like these switches. You gotta, like, switch them. Yeah. Well, they, they keep trying to confuse you, like, I gotta hit that one. And then you go to the next room and say, oh, I shouldn't have hit that one. You know? <laughs> Remember, yeah. switches are bitches. <laughs> we should call them. <laughs> Hate that. That's annoying. That nah, nah, nah. I know I'm, I'm about to die. You have to constantly remind me of that. Just beep a few times, just like in Ninja Turtles. Oh. Oh, yeah. Dee -dee -dee -dee. Dee -dee -dee. Yeah, and then it stops. They don't keep beeping. Oh, they don't keep beeping. Like, did, forever. Did, have you guys played the new Zelda? Yeah. yeah. Did, they, finished, did, but... did, did, did they keep the beeping? It's it's very low. It's not it's not it's not a dee -dee. it's just like doom oh. It's like a faint heartbeat. <laughs> just like right. just like the hearts you got. <laughs> <laughs> it's not as annoying. They they've gone better, but still it's like Yeah. That's the news though, the the Legend of Zelda faint heartbeat. Fail. Faint heart. But not for the faint of heart. Kingdom not Hearts. For, not for Brent Hart. <laughs> The Legend uh, of Zelda and the Heart of the Crystal Skull. Wait. Sounds better than the Indiana Jones movie. <laughs> Sounds better already. You Indiana Jones fanboy. This is this Dude. is Link. He can he can fall seventy feet and not feel a thing, but he can get ran over by a piece of water. Yeah. <laughs> and get yeah. a heart monitor. <laughs> yeah. Wait, wait. Oh, okay. I was saying, didn't you say Indiana Jones was Link or something? No. I wish. I wish Actually, he was. Yeah, Simon Belmont would fit more for that, because he has the whip. Yeah, he if would. It, if it was uh, Indiana Jones, he would probably grab Gand or, uh, Ganondorf by the shirt and shake him around and punch him. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> or he would uh, speak in tongues while uh, grabbing one of these stones of the Temple of Doom, I feel. Oh, it looks like you gotta go switch the switch. Yeah, it sucks, man. Actually, uh, now that I think about it, Indiana Jones, he did have the uh, Triforce in um, Temple of Doom, didn't he? <laughs> really? That's what, they're, that's, yeah. what they're, that's what they're getting. He had the Sacred Stones of Double Dragon 3. Yeah. Which is like a reiteration of the Triforce. Where, uh, Dalsim was the villain of the movie. <laughs> <laughs> and, and I think Zangief was in there too, and he got crushed by that rock crusher. Anyway. Yeah. Triforce. Everybody wants a piece. <laughs> How did Link open the door? Zelda said Triforce. Huh? Huh? <laughs> <laughs> That's so funny. I forgot to laugh. Even though I did laugh. So that's oh, dang it. Come on. It, it couldn't blow it up just because it ended the next room. In real life, you put a bomb next to something. <laughs> so this is in real life, Ronnie. Yeah, but come on. Keep it real, Cuddy. I think Game it was design. a. Uh, I think I think it's more of a modular issue. I'm not more sure. Of a, more of a suckage issue. Game doesn't have enough memory to do that, man. Yeah, well, I have the memory to do it in real life, so if I can do it, a video game should. <laughs> so you're saying you're better than a video game? Shut up, you fanboy, fanboy. <laughs> yeah, it's not nice. Actually, there's a movie called Fanboy, so I'm a fanboy of that oh, movie. Oh yeah. <laughs> And what's the uh, picture on his uh, shield? Is that a V? It's a picture of something that means something that I don't know what it means. He's, on, he's part of the Vendetta. Maybe it's a bird. A for Vendetta. Wait. <laughs> what? <laughs> oh, Jesus. Stupid Mario Brothers <laughs> one fire sticks over here. Uh oh. You got your heart. You got your heart rate going again. Here we go. Yeah. Yeah, really. <laughs> oh, well, <laughs> I thought I was going somewhere. No, but trust me, you are. Oh, okay. Let's try it. Yeah, there you go. All right. Now that's good. Sure. Yep. Ready to rock and roll. We got the big key. Once it's done, it's all over. Yep. <laughs> we got this in the. We got this by the ass, man. What do you What do you get in this level? You get the uh, the hook shop. Yep. Hook shop makes its debut in the series. Yeah, it is the first game to have it, huh? Yep. I thought it might have shown up in the Game Boy versions, but... 
Oh, well, I, I, don't, I, don't, I, don't, I don't know. Maybe yeah, I, don't. Never, I never played Link's Awakening, so maybe you're right. I don't know. I've never played it either, so I'm talking on my ass. <laughs> there it is. The Silver Arrow! Wait! Oh, wait. <laughs> the first word you get when you get the hookshot in the first Zelda game is boing. Boing? <laughs> <laughs> All right. Ah, come on. Why couldn't Big Keys just open regular doors? Oh, yes. There you go, Cuddy. Yep. That solves that problem. Yeah, we're done. hitting them. Oh, no, 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 no. Smart. You idiot. Uh -oh. <laughs> <laughs> Imagine how Link feels. He's He has no choice but to keep walking down those stairs once he starts. Yeah. I think it's more fatal. Controlling me. No. Ah! I think it's more fatal that time just stops when you go down the stairs. Like the enemy should just keep moving as you go down. But nope, just time has to stop. Yeah, in real life, if I move down the stairs, you know, other things still move. So why can't the game do it? No second chance, Zelda. Uh, well, at least the beeping stops. So I, I'm kind of glad I died. Yeah. <laughs> yeah I'm tired of hearing the sound. <laughs> it's almost like a marketing tactic. Gives you something you hate, but yeah. you take some shit and you feel better <laughs> about taking shit. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> I would feel better about taking the shit. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, people, Minecraft Barton is sober this time. No, I'm... <laughs> <laughs> nope. Oh, a little... No, I, I, get, I can't... I, he's he's can't so say. sober that he's drunk. About three quarters of a giant bottle of wine. Maybe, no, not that much. Maybe half a bottle of giant Come wine. Come on, Martin. Want, go over there and dig this hole for me now. Come on. <laughs> dig a hole. So. You want to dig a hole? <laughs> What's this thing over here, Martin? What's this red thing? That? That's a pain in the ass right there. Dig a hole right here. Where's your <laughs> shovel? What you got earlier in the game? I don't have a shovel. Get the shovel to get the flute, remember? Do you? <laughs> yep, that's why. Uh, remember the part where you get the shovel and you dig for the flute, and then but once you get the flute, then your shovel disappears because you don't need a shovel anymore because you found a flute. Well, what if I wanted to dig around? Come on, game. Uh, well, you're not the Macho Man. You can't dig it, Phil. <laughs> well, yeah, those uh, those red guys, electricity. Those are some. Oh, I hate those guys probably more than most of them. Yeah, those are female and, dogs. Those and the uh, the stone turtles that you gotta flip on their bellies. Oh yeah. I felt bad for them when they start on their backs, but they're suckers. <laughs> yeah. Freaking out. Oh, Koopa, Koopa Trooper rejects. Yeah, well, they shouldn't have been rejects because they they're worse here than they are in Mario Land. Yeah. No, they're all part of Nintendo. It's all Shigeru Miyamoto's ideas. <laughs> well, Nintendo sucks. What have they done? How many millions of copies have they sold of games and and how? How many years have they been around, and how many fun memories have they gave us in our childhood? Not enough. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what else to say. Wait a minute, Jeff is with us. Man, I link to the past, we bear on the Genesis. Right then, you're stuck in the past then. <laughs> <laughs> Why go to the next level? We can go a lot years beyond. Is it Link in the past or Link to the past? To the past. Is it Link that it's his name Link, or is it Link yeah, that he's cool. linked, or this game is a link to the past? I think it's like a double meaning. It's a double meaning, like his name is Link, and then it's a link to the past because you do go uh, back Connection, to the yeah. past, or no, you don't go back to the past, you, like in a parallel world, but it has something to do with uh, yeah. the link. ancestors yeah. of the Golden Power, or something like that. It's a cool game, think, just enjoy it. <laughs> I think... Uh, Link has, he's probably the gaming time traveler of the century. I mean, there's Chrono Trigger where they time travel a lot, but Link, in every, every game, he's traveling in time. No, yeah, but get, it's actually, uh, only Ocarina in this one. He's, really? he's always, I think he's always reincarnated, except maybe it's not clear of what the timeline is. Ocarina of Time could be the first in the series, and some people say Minish Cap. People say Scoured Sword, so we can only yeah, and, uh, yeah, yeah. speculate. Yeah, he really only time travels in... Well, actually, really, he only time travels in Ocarina. And in this one, he just travels, like, to another dimension. I mean, it's... Well, yeah. Link, it can... Oh, I don't know. That could... It could be going the way. And he's, same the, with, he's the, uh... Dr. Sam Beckett of video games, I guess. 
Yeah, well, he did the same in Twilight Princess. He went to the Shadow Realm or whatever, so that was like another, you know, dimension type thing. Yeah. You're oh, traveling, dang, oh. idiot! <laughs> I hit, I hit, uh, I hit, uh, <laughs> up. By mistake, I meant to go, you know, down. I guess I hit up, you know, at the same time. Idiot! All right, here we go. Yeah, <laughs> we we've all done it. Yeah, I, I have. I'm, I'm perfect. No. <laughs> Yeah. Well, besides, oh, that's uh, why you never died in uh, I want to be the guy and Donkey Kong Country. What? I died a lot. Of you you mean I didn't die in Fester's Quest, Silver Surfer, you know those games? Yeah, Game Genie. Fester's Quest. We need to see more of Fester. This I always thought he was the guy from Adam's Family, or is he? He was. Yeah. That, yeah. Yeah. Chris really? Boyd. That's the weirdest spin-off game I've ever seen. Yeah, J Man <laughs> did it. Yes. <laughs> J-Man's in it? Yeah. <laughs> That's you, awesome. You rang that. <laughs> yeah, that is quite strange. So, of all the ideas for, especially Sunsoft to make, it's like, really Adam's Family? I mean, there were Adam's Family games, but it's like, wait, wasn't that the first one, though? I think that was the first one, Adam's Family game that was ever made, was Special Quest. Did y'all play, uh, Fresh Prince for the NES? Fresh Prince? I would think more for Super Nintendo. <laughs> I think it would be more for the Super. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Back to the Future, I bet you that'd be a cool game if they made- oh, wait. Hmm. A Japanese version, maybe. Wait they a minute. Should, uh... Super Famicom only released? Yeah. For the second one? If they ever make a movie out of Zelda, I hope they pick Will Smith to be Link. <laughs> <laughs> I'm serious, he- <laughs> He'd be like, oh, again! <laughs> yeah, he'd have, his, like, he'd have his, like, Men in Black personality, but he'd just be Link. <laughs> Oh yeah. Christian Slater is Link. Uh, maybe uh, the Joker is Ganondorf. No. <laughs> if you say Heath Ledger, I'd be like too too soon or too late. I don't know. Jack Nicholson as Ganon. No. Oh, they could have they could have a uh, Will Sasso from Mad TV as Ganon. Oh, this sucks. You can't hit him. What? Yeah. Just jump, just jump. You got plenty of life. <laughs> You're poking this him game, with a <laughs> This game is satanic. Look how many rupees I have. Well. Oh jeez. Oh, here we go. Ron, the game's trying to tell you something. Yeah. Maybe it's like Mario 3, hidden satanic messages, I don't know. Hmm. Ask What's ABGN. The game of hell? So what the hell? <laughs> what the HE double hockey sticks? Actually, what would make it perfect is you had, you had 66 rupees, you had 6 bombs, and then 66 uh -oh. Six <laughs> oh, here we go. Oh shit. Ah. Oh, snap, Sean! It's the, uh... Uh, octopus popcorn shrimp boss. Yeah, it's a yeah. cotton ball popcorn shrimp. <laughs> yeah. I think these are his herpes. Ew. <laughs> oh yeah, baby. Herpes. <laughs> you said herpes. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, herpes, herpes. Herpes. <laughs> Shut up, but why? <laughs> Oh, this... I don't know what this thing does. It does kind of look like popcorn chicken. Yeah. I'm hungry now. That's <laughs> pretty easy. It's freaky though, I mean, it's like he has all these sh herpes around him, and then he's just like this big giant eyeball, and it's like, what the what? Why? Yeah. I, I could see Pringles doing a, uh, um, an ad insert here with just make them all Pringle chips. We're not going to get ad sponsors, we got our Google Sense disabled. <laughs> <laughs> Prinkle chips. Snap into it. I don't know. <laughs> I was like oh. say Prinkle. Like pre is a new brand? Prinkle? Prinkles. <laughs> I just that is sound very tasty. <laughs> I gotta try these new Prinkles, man. So I'm telling you this is the insane asylum insane asylum. Okay, yo, I can't I can't gain more rupees because when Google AdSense takes your AdSense account away. You also can't gain any more rupees in whatever video game you're playing on YouTube. It's freaking lame, man. Can't gain any currency in general. Nothing. No, no hearts in Simon's Quest, nothing. You can't buy nothing in Metroid either. Wait. Alright. Yes, here we go. Got the second emerald of the Dark World to rescue, to, to, rescue, to rescue the second maiden. We're gonna wreck Ganon. We're wrecking your Ganon! To rescue the second Iron Maiden. Fail. Ooh, I love that band. What about, uh, Bronze... Uh... Uh, fail. Okay, and... Bronze Chastity? 
Bronze Chastity. <laughs> yeah. That could work. Bronze Damsel. Okay, um. So yeah, we're resting the second second maiden maiden maiden. The heck. <laughs> I think I think uh I'm the one that's drunk. <laughs> yeah, really. <laughs> <laughs> uh, me and Minecraft Martin have switched roles tonight. Uh. I'm J-Man. Ma yeah, Magical yeah. powers. Yeah. <laughs> All right, so now we learn of uh. Death Mountain and two worlds and evils hidden in a dog. dog two worlds went inside of him. Wait, what? <laughs> Points for reference. <laughs> Ganondorf. Next. Now this is where they first mentioned Ganondorf light, and, and then in Ocarina of Time it was called Ganondorf. So this also indication of hmm, maybe Ocarina of Time was first, or at least before this one in the timeline. Oh, who knows? They screwed up everything. <laughs> <laughs> so that's Could the end of be. part eight. We see you in part nueve, if that's how you say nine in Spanish. Until then, yeah. Until then, God bless and take care. <laughs> Adios, muchachos. <laughs> bye bye. Welcome uh, to Let's Play The Legend of Zelda: A Link to the Past Part Nine, where we are back from the dead here on SC2K. This is Ron Moore, along with the Wii Guy and Alpha Six Two One. Hey guys! It's what good up? to be back. Yeah. And Alpha 621 is back. Uh, last time, the one and only time Alpha was with us was in Simon's Quest uh, about a year ago. Oh, that's when he was with us. I figured. Actually, I had no idea. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, and now I'm heading towards the third dungeon in the Dark World. Yes, which is in the Lost Woods. Yes, it is. Which is in that Lost. Can't get that Lost in it. Yeah. Whoa, I have 666 six, six rupees. Oh, wait. Oh, good. Change it to 66. Six. Okay, my quality is terrible. I think it's 668 six, or 669. Six, yeah, uh, yeah, the same is going for me, but I can still read it. Yeah. But yeah, I think you got out of that because, well, you don't want 666 six, six of anything. Yeah, and Halloween is over, so let's get away from that, and... Alright. I'm gonna do a little grinding first, though, before I get to the dungeon. Grinding? This isn't an RPG, Ronnie. What are you doing? <laughs> you gotta get ready for those freaking dungeons. I guess. Yeah. <laughs> oh, by grinding for hard pieces? Yes, I got you now. Yes. Get him, um, get him, um, um, all the rupees, oh, I'm so good. <laughs> Were you the rupee gonna... monster? Yeah, I'm a like-like. I like a lot of rupees. <laughs> <laughs> well, how about you like-like my Facebook status? No. I'll like, like this video, when, whoa, what now? Yeah. I'll like everything. Yeah. And off he goes. Oh, yeah, I just remembered you went back into the real world. Yeah. So we're not in the dark world in forest or lost woods. Yeah, we don't want to leave our viewers in the dark, so... Uh -huh. uh. Uh. <laughs> oh, who's that, Star Soldier? What do you say, Jay? Oh, wait. Oh, nope. <laughs> <laughs> wait, what do you say, Alva? Oh, oh, or yeah, <laughs> <laughs> Alright, get the freaking... Ah, d dang it! <laughs> It touched me, I didn't get to grab the fur. <laughs> it, it touched me! <laughs> now we're in the dark world, get ready for the third dungeon as we enter a Contra rib cage. It's a, it's a, it's a rib. Yeah. <laughs> I was thinking of a terrible joke, but I, I can't do it. I just can't do them. I just, there's no, there's no words there. I just can't do it anymore. Despite all my rage, I'm still just Nicolas Cage. No. <laughs> oh, I got it. Because it was <laughs> reference to Night's Band that I wasn't even alive for. <laughs> or whatever. <laughs> yeah, and hey, yeah, stop bringing up Halloween stuff, the Smashing Pumpkins. We don't do that anymore. Yeah. It's over. It's over. 
Nothing is over! Well, when is it? Uh... Never, I guess. <laughs> exactly. You never specify that first blood. Well, uh, Rainbow oh, says... That's when the fat lady sings, I guess. I don't know. <laughs> there we go. When the bear sings. <laughs> oh. <laughs> I'm just kidding. <laughs> There's not a lady. Do you look like a lady? Alright, and so we have to go in, like, what? The, uh, the, the, the pre-dungeon? Because that's what you do. Yeah, really, it's, it's like, this is part of the third dungeon right here. We're in basement one now. It's the, it's the basement of the dungeon. Yeah, so now we are technically in Dungeon 3, The Dark World. Not one of my favorite dungeons in the, in the game, honestly. Yeah, so, it's quite a... I don't know, there's something about it that just it doesn't it didn't stick out. Yeah. Besides, like, the disappearing floor is, like, that's all I can remember. Yeah. And the and the rod, of course. You got you gotta love that flame rod. Yep. Spoilers. <laughs> <laughs> you never played this game. You better or you get flamed. Just like in the game, the spinning stick. <laughs> <laughs> what do you say, Alf? Oh, well, I didn't know Alf from his hit team, so Alf was here. <laughs> yeah, what do you say, Alf from the plant mill back? <laughs> yeah, right. Let's play Alf for the S2K. I don't see that happening anytime soon. Oh, I can. <laughs> it will be the best thing ever for this channel. <laughs> check out my list. Check out of. Oh, let's check out Alf. Shame is blood. There we go. So let's check Alf. <laughs> Considering that game, it's more like shameful plug. <laughs> yeah, really. I actually got fired from my job for doing that because the boss is like, we can't have idiots working for us reviewing stupid games like this. No, I'm just kidding. So sorry. <laughs> Dang, I just bought myself from that door, idiot. Yeah, I, I saw that. I was like, you're supposed to put it in backwards. Yeah. How, how often do you hear that? <laughs> put it in backwards. Because <laughs> that's how you get through the door. And we apologize because we lost Alpha for good, I guess. Yeah. I just made his big return and then <laughs> Oh I already oh, got the big key. Fire rod. Fire rod. Fire away! Yeah. That was so cool though. That was probably the best part is when you did that to enter the dungeon. Yeah. Oh yeah, maybe I'm I'm kinda thinking of like actually the Game Boy Advance version because when you enter a dungeon it'll say level three blah dungeon. It actually, like, showed a text that showed what dungeon it was. Huh. Yeah. I remember that. That's, like, one of the minor differences between this one and, uh, the Game of Ants. Oh, and every time you swing, of course, Link makes sounds from the Ocarina of Time Link. Because he goes, ah, ah, and all that. Yeah, he actually, like, screams when he falls and stuff. Just that sound effect where it goes, pew! Yeah. Okay, I just went over there for nothing. Go back up here. Hey, get out of there. Get out of there, you crazy... Whoa. Crazy person. Ah, all these floors. All these, uh, floor switches. Oh, they're not that bad. It's, it's an... It's an ah, I get to recognize my pattern. <laughs> Sorry, in my footage, you almost got caught by, uh... By a hand. Yeah. I was like, whoa, I'm scared for Ronnie. <laughs> yeah. Well, come on, let's give him a hand. Uh, uh, I remember you could, like, barely get across, like, the little, like, edges. Yeah. Like, you could, like, kind of break through the game. Yeah. <laughs> or whatever. Like, you don't have to hit the switches, you just kind of make sure you're on the corners. Yeah. They don't fall off. Yeah. I think I did that before. Oh, I got the hand. That was cool.
Okay, now I feel like I'm playing Star Tropics now. Maybe you are in Star Tropics. Oh yeah, wrong video. Yeah, it's Star Tropics 3. Zoda's Re Revenge. <laughs> yeah. Ah, oh, dang it, the hand got me. Ah, oh, here we are. Okay, now about to fall through that hole. Oh wait, maybe that's another thing, is that this dungeon felt really short. Yeah. And now like you're already at the boss now. Now you fight Batman. Or no, it's Morph off? Oh, wrong game. Moth how. Mothra. Mothra. Oh, okay, nice. <laughs> oh wow, good job. <laughs> hey, let's get, continue right back from the boss. Yep. With minimal magic power. Yeah, really. Use the flame! Use the flame! I thought you could. I thought I tried to do that. It didn't work. It does. You can hit him. Oh, I guess I didn't do it right. Yoga fire! Oh. Hey, this part was hard. All these things come at you at the same time, and, and the floor's moving, and... Oh, man. Yeah, that, that's kind of... That's quite complex. I guess developers are like, Oh, this dungeon is too short. Uh, let's make boss really hard. Yeah, really? Ah. Oh. Mmm, gosh. Oh, man. Watch out for the spikes. Ah. Uh. Oh, man. Good job. <laughs> Round three. Five. Oh, full power now. Ooh. Oh, come on. Beat him. Beat him. Oh, getting your ass beat. Yeah, really. Yeah, that's what I did. I just like spammed the fire rod, and he usually he went down pretty quick because you know he's a bug, fire, yeah. it's like Pokemon. Yeah. Ah, oh. oh. man. Round four. Wow. <laughs> but seriously, how many hits does freaking take to beat this thing, man? It's ridiculous. It takes quite a lot. Stupid. It's, it's, he's, he's so stupid that you could say that he's... A stupid. Yeah. <laughs> stupid moth. Oh, yes. Oh, there you go. That's a good Ronnie. Being the moth. Alright. Finally done with Dungeon 3 of the Dark World. Thank goodness. What a return! Yeah. Okay, now we rescue the third maiden of the dark world, or the uh, seven wise men descendants. Oh, Riley, thank you. Props to the great cataclysm. Yeah. Do you know the prophecy? Alone, you must face the great cataclysm who began ah oh, whatever cataclysm <laughs> even cares all I know is that this world is bad and you must kill Ganon that's all we that's all I remember back yeah. as a kid it's not like <laughs> kill kill <laughs> it's like a young beavis or whatever yeah Stab. <laughs> bloodline when I first heard of Castlevania bloodlines I thought it thought it meant blood I know it meant generational thing <laughs> Yeah, really. <laughs> the lines of blood. Oh, I don't understand this guy. He must be crazy. Yeah. Well, that's the end of uh, part nine of Ocarina. I mean, dang it. A Link to the Past. <laughs> I forgot I'm still doing Ocarina Time two years later. And no. see you hopefully in less than a year's time in part ten of a Link to the Past. Thanks for joining oh. us, Alpha. Hopefully next time you'll be able to stay with us. And see. Until then, God bless and take care. Uh, see ya. Welcome to part 10 of Let's Play The Legend of Zelda A Link to the Past. This is Ron Moore, along with the Wii Guy. Yo, everybody. So, yeah, I got done with this dungeon, but I gotta go through here to get around to the other side and get that guy out of here, I forgot. So, yes. I'm trying to get to the fourth Dark World dungeon and Emo Kakeriko Village. Yeah, Dark World Kakeriko Village, uh, Kakeriko Village, as it's pronounced. Oh, really? I thought it was Kakeriko. Yeah, me too. I used to call it Kakakiriko or whatever. Oh, I used to say, like, oh, you got yeah. stuck in a bush, yeah, you stupid that. idiot. <laughs> <laughs> it's cool, though, to, like, just get stuck in, like, certain parts and then be transported back. 
Yeah, if you saw the game glitches video of, from Mike Matei, it's pretty awesome. Oh yeah, of course. Actually, I've seen that glitch before in previous videos, so I already knew about it. Yeah. Somebody already did it. Yeah. <laughs> Alright, so right. trying to make my way into the K K K Kariko village, whatever you say. Yeah, or as a, I think it's called Thief Town now in the Dark World. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Alright, East V Village. Here we go. Yeah. So let me uh, pull on the Gargoyle's pitchfork and go inside. I never knew that. I was stuck here as a kid. I was just like, what do I do? And then you just pull for like three seconds. I forgot I found out. But, uh,. <laughs> Yes, I think it's in-game clue on I don't remember. All right. Clue? Huh? Say clue? It's a good yeah. movie. In game, yeah. Um Oh there's a clue in the game. <laughs> I get it. Yeah. Yeah, I never read things as a kid. Just slash slash slash. Yeah, I didn't either. <laughs> That's why for the longest time I didn't like Zelda at first. I didn't really care for it and then I got hooked onto it. You got it's all about Mario on. Brothers or Contra or Double Dragon. Yeah, no speed, no no talking, just punching and beating. Yeah, or Mega Man. Yeah, I like I liked Mega Man also back then. ECW. Yeah, it's totally true that we're most violent as kids. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> all right, so yeah, this dungeon right here, uh, pretty I think it's a pretty short dungeon. So it re it is relative to the other dungeons. Yeah. It's certainly the easiest, actually, to me. Just yeah. easy to get through. It's relatively smooth. Yeah. I think the third dungeon to me was probably well, it's longer, but I think it, it was it. It seemed actually shorter to me, actually. Maybe now that I think about it. Uh, yeah, sure. I forgot. It. Well, I think these two are about the same in, in length. I don't know. It's kind of hard to tell which one's harder. These two are kind of, like three and four are kind of like the same. I said part in third dungeon you can enter the dungeon in different ways. <laughs> Dif different yeah, entrance points and, and well, the main difference is Oh yeah. yeah. Oh it's cut to get to the big key, of course. Yeah. See I got it, it didn't take me ten minutes. <laughs> oh no. Ah oh, dang it. <laughs> oh my. Silly rabbit. Silly rabbit. Links are for Zelda. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. That was lame. Yeah. No, it was actually it was lame but funny. Funny uh, lame. Ah. Uh, it lame. was it is quite jarring to get like the the boss key like at the very beginning of the level pretty much. Yeah. Those you off like Oh god already? Hmm. Oh, this is easy dungeon. Yeah. But nope. Just tricks you. Yeah. That's actually what I quite like a lot about Link to the yeah. Past. It yeah. just does that. Well long as the game is not BS cryptic like freaking Hide lied. Hide lied. Hide lied. <laughs> <laughs> Got Viva DeMilo coming in. Yeah. It's like AVGN says, sounds like a guy free flex or something. Hide lied. I don't know what name is. <laughs> but anyway. Ooh. Yeah, oh, watch out for the pink goop. I hate those goops. Here we go. No, ah. Uh, Goopy goopers. Yeah. Those, those are assholes. Hoopers. Those are hoopers. No. <laughs> those are hoopers. Oh, dude, that freaking jelly bean jumped over me. Well, hot diggity jelly bean. <laughs> okay, so you can say those are Mexican jumping beans. Wait, what? Yeah. They're just jumping beans. That's all I wanted to say. That's all I'm trying to get at. Freaking green cockroaches, whatever they are. Green. Balls. <laughs> He's crawling around, a green lizard. I'm gonna stay here, 21 roaches. Uh, I'm a baby roach, and I fail. <laughs> My papa roach? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Win. Okay. I guess <laughs> bombs here. Of course, you need one bomb for right here. This is relevant to uh, the boss fight. Yeah, I was, I was questioning. I was like, God, why did I do all these things? What does this even mean? And it's like, oh, now I see. Yeah. Man, you'd be doing a lot of cuts. Yeah, because I know you've done a lot of time. Because I forgot how to. First time, a long time been here. <laughs> long time, no forget. <laughs> yeah, unlike in Super Mario 3. 
Yeah, swim over three is not that hard to get. Oh, the last is the in the past. Yeah. Oh god, don't die. Oh jeez, Ronnie, Ronnie. Uh, Did you no. even get the magic sack of powder? <laughs> no. You should have gone that, cause then you could spray well, it on those. This freaking witch is taking forever to make the powder. It's being a go so, there. She's freaking. Oh, come back soon, Sunny. <laughs> when? Really, all, all I remember is like giving it to her when I first found it, and then like beating one of the dungeons, and then it was ready. I feel like three of them still not ready. Really? Did you give her the mushroom? Maybe she needs more. She needs mushrooms. Oh, so, it says hey, come back to, to the shop soon. So that means I'll give it to her. Well, that's BS. But anyway, I don't need it. <laughs> I don't need it. I'm a man. I don't need no fairy dust. Real man. Even though I hate yeah, that real... annoying beeping sound. It's like you don't need to do it the entire time. I know I'm in danger. At least Ninja Turtles 1, you can just freaking beeps like four times. Like, dun, 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 dun. It was like every 20 seconds or so. Yeah. No, no, I just beat like first few seconds. Oh, okay, I thought you said every 20 seconds, never mind. Yeah, it's 20 seconds. But, uh. Jeez, by that 20 seconds, you be hope you better have gotten more life. Oh, here's, I guess. Who is this? It's probably like one of the maidens you rescue. Oh, yeah. Yeah, this dungeon was definitely. The most jarring is just like, wow, I get the key, I gotta save the prince already? Man, no boss fight? Jeez, this is simple. Yeah, really. It really throws you for a loop. Yeah. And the loop-de-loop. -loop. Loops on the NES. Zoop? No, loops. Oh. Better not be hoops for NES. Why not? Why not, Zion? Is that a good game? No. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> Alright, now I got the gold mitt. I got the golden power glove, that's sweet. Okay, I had a hunch to take her to the light, and yeah, just as I suspected when I first played this game. That's blocked. <sighs> so bright! And one of the in-game clues earlier in the light world, uh, you know, smart me up to this, like, hmm, could this be blind? Can you first take her, or monster, and outside the dungeon? It er, I don't like bright light, please don't take me out there. And I'm like, wait a minute. Oh yeah, I remember that. Yeah, and... Oh. And, well, she's kicking my butt. Or he, whatever, the devil God, woman. Oh, jeez. Bear 13 possessed just killed me. Reminds me of the freaking pumpkin from Monster Party for some reason. Oh, shut up. Yeah. Boss battle music makes me laugh. Why, it's good boss battle music. Dun, 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 dun. You That's all it is. Dun, 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 dun. But it's good. It's a good, like, repeat, uh, repetitious composition. Does that make sense? Yeah. Ah, well, it's not helping. Did I die again? Man, this boss is hard. I forgot. This boss it's is easy. Strategy. <laughs> yeah. I like that sound when you hit him. I want to hear that sound. Yeah, that's my favorite. Oh, man. Really? It's so Jeez. satisfying. You're getting your butt kicked, man. Come on, Thompson. Man, I forgot the strategy how to beat him. Come on, one, two. Yes, I hit him. Hit him. What? I think it's just you need to have that a lot of yes. I hit him right there. You saw that. Probably I hit should... him right there the third time. It's a bunch probably of should have a lot of health. Probably have more hearts. Find more heart pieces. And I just remember wailing on him. That's really all. I just wailed, wailed until he died. And I had like at least three hearts left or something. Well, he's wailing on me. Come on. It's gonna roll. <laughs> Snake rattle and roll. <laughs> One, two, come on. Oh. Stand still. Wait, the badge. Oh god, white cloak. Yes. There you go. Man. Boom shakalaka. NBA jam. You got the got crystal. Fourth crystal. You got the fourth crystal. <laughs> Yeah, the fourth crystal. Oh, the fourth crystal is tough. Yeah, so that that part right there, I had a feeling that was blind. That was uh. You were blind running. <laughs> well, this is yeah. a blind. This is a blind run. And yeah, because remember the clue in the light world said blind uh, used to be in this jail cell or whatever I forgot. And, and then just, yeah. I just had a hunch that that was blind. That that was the uh, in disguise. And then you, when you bomb that floor, then the light shines through it. Then yeah, that made me think, yeah, this is probably 
blonde. A simple process of determination. Uh, process of determination. Process of limit. Uh, uh, process of elimination. There we go. <laughs> yeah. Process of lulls. It is a process of determination for you to figure it out. Yeah, really. So we didn't pay attention to what this maiden just said, but we just beat the fourth dungeon. Pretty simple. So, I would actually like to say that this was the shortest dungeon. Yeah. Yeah, it was. And uh, pretty cool how, how you find the boss. It was pretty cool. Very. Yeah, and so we will see you in part 11. Until then, God bless and take care. Mm, see ya? <laughs> that was lame. Welcome to part 11 of Let's Play The Legend of Zelda, A Link to the Past. This is Ron Moore, along with the Wii Guy, and the ECW Gamer Extreme Championship Wrestling. Yeah, what he said. Yeah, and what I said. We're watching 2013 because comments are so cool and well. The dislike of is just as bad as Justin Bieber. Anyways, um... Yeah, so now... What? <laughs> I was confused there. You ran through the wing. Now I am uh, talking to, I guess, a frog? Yeah. Is there a frog here? He wants me to take him back to his partner. Hmm, who could that be? Um, Frogger. Um, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Frogger's little sister. Yeah. Wait, what? There's only a little baby dragon. Oh, to the, to the light world. Transforming back in time. Yeah. Right. So here's his partner. He lost locksmith or locksmith, a blacksmith, whatever. <laughs> yeah, I think it's a blacksmith. A locksmith is lock exclusive. Blacksmith is swords and other stuff. Yeah. All right. So now he's found his partner again. I got the hell out of our house. <laughs> Nice to see That's them good. back together. Oh, Well, what the heck? Man, those locksmiths are assholes. They're, they're just like, all right, thanks for helping us now get out of our house. Yeah. Okay, so I got to take this thing with me that's oh. somehow following me. Apparently the key is locked inside, so... <laughs> see, the purpose of this thing, but I guess I got to drag it with me. Looks like you're dragging dead weight. Yeah, really. You're like dead chest weight. You know, for the longest time, I never knew what to do with that chest. I just, I never knew. Until I looked up online and stuff. And apparently you can't dash with it. That's freaking lame. Well, it's just a chest. Like, how can it keep up, man? It doesn't have any legs. It just slides along. Yeah, which explains why it's magically moving. Yeah. It doesn't have any legs yet, it can follow you. Oh snap. Nintendo's trolling us. He goes dashing away again. Yeah. Who are you? Who do you think you're a dash yeah. galaxy in the alien asylum? Dashing yeah. through the snow. Ah, oh, Phil. Dashing through the high Dashing. fields. Ooh. And um, the past say, Oh, the fields we go. Oh, smashing in the way. Oh, crap. We're recording. I'll shut up. Oh, you dummy. That's right, shut up and commentate. Yeah. What's this thing quit following me? Uh, uh, Gee, uh, if only there was a person I could give it to or something that has an expertise in opening chests that the keys are inside with. Whoa, Viper? No, that's me. That's me and when I'm in my hobo, um, you know, what? Oh, <laughs> wow. I just he like opened brain for it. So now I have a fourth bottle. ECW. Mm, what are you going to do with that bottle? I'm going to put something in it. Hey, you. <laughs> yes, put something sword. in it. Hey, you. <laughs> sword tempered. Sword oh. will now explode pissed off. <laughs> uh, okay. I'll come Boy. back later then. Wow, only ten rupees? Boy. Yeah, really. Well, I Pretty found cheap. his partner, so I deserve Wait. a discount. Yeah, just... Ah, dang it. Just don't get the temper over it. Okay, temper tantrum. Well... Damn it. 
All we gotta do is just save the game and then come back and they should have it ready. Start at Rombor's house. I should die for a sec, honestly. <laughs> Alright. Oh, ooh, I forgot I had the sword. Bumping into the bushes. I'm doing nothing for a few hours. We're going right. into the middle of nowhere again. Alright, let's go back here. This should have it ready now. Yes. Your sword is tempered up. You got people get pissed off and sword. people and it is much stronger. ECW Rage Sword. <laughs> see if they could temper my sword again. Hmm. Well, they the point oh. up. Dang it. Well, can you put a bigger temper? Can you? It's worth a try. Don't give me my temper. Oh, jeez. Look at all these jump cuts we're doing. Yeah. Well, would this you rather have me walk everywhere and... Yeah. Because <laughs> the, then we get the real experience, man. Oh, okay, because it's a walkthrough, I guess. Uh, yeah. Eat the medallion yeah, that I will never use, but anyway. Well, except for one. I think you use it and once, it. I think. Somewhere. Yeah. Oh, this must be the side quest edition of the Let's Play. <laughs> yeah, now this is what I was talking about. I messed up. I thought she's supposed to give it to you right here. Oh, but it's inside. No, you gotta go inside the shop. You dummy. Well, I forgot. Shut up. The right. shrooms were you smoking? <laughs> well, that's your powder, I guess. Well, no, it couldn't be, because I didn't have it yet. The angel well, I'm does. Here. I'm gonna, uh, I Star Soldier, I guess, sell, sells you the stuff. <laughs> Thanks for buying the mess. <laughs> Stop on my flea market. <laughs> yeah. Why am I speaking? <laughs> Got all kinds of potions. Red, green, and blue. <laughs> blue for turbo graphics. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> well, well, I found a buyer for uh, my powder, so... Okay, let me go visit. <laughs> yeah. Speaking in code. Why do we Yeah, he's he about bought, he bought my powder. Yeah, that was a good movie. What, yeah, white powder? It. Powder, yeah. Well, who's that with? Uh, I don't know. <laughs> anyway. That movie up. <laughs> Alright, so you throw the powder on the red jewel or something and Batman appears or Dracula or someone. I thought it was tomato soup. The schizophrenic bat that talks to you. I will get my revenge on you. Well, oh, right, get ready for it. Oh, is that okay with you? Yes, sir. What? Seriously, I have no idea. when you punish, don't you? Aren't you not supposed to ask their permission? You're supposed to just do it and not oh, really ask for their permission. <laughs> that's Star Soldier. <laughs> Congrats, congratulations. <laughs> uh, I'm you ready. Uh, Alright, so now my magic's reduced by one half. Alright. Ah, now to, whoa, go in someone's grave. That's pretty messed up. Oh, dear. It's a big grave. Oh, in your grave. <gasps> da -da -da -da! Magic cape. Ooh, that was one of my favorites when I found this. I was like, oh my god, I can be invisible? Sweet. Yeah, really. My god, I'm a Dementor. Suck it, Harry Potter. The cloak of invisibility was here first, apparently. Yeah, I guess the magic cloak. Tee, <laughs> I'm invisible. <laughs> really Ooh, no it point mean? to it, actually. <laughs> huh? There's really no point to it, actually. Yeah, it is. It's to be invisible so people can't see you. Oh, what do you think you are, the invisible man? Bear would get that reference. Yeah, I'm I'm as the, I went as the invisible man for Halloween. <laughs> No one gave me any candy. It was pretty cool. Well, they can hear me. You just see a floating bucket in front of them. Uh, oh yeah. my god! Anyway. There's a tree in the background that just jumps it out at them. Look out, immigration. Oh, wait. I'm good. <laughs> Watch out, Venom, Angel, or whoever would be suited for that joke. <laughs> That's why Venom's no longer with us. Immigration took him away. <laughs> Damn it. Aww. Oh, I think we can low-budget reviews from Mexico, Spanish edition. <laughs> what the heck will we play? Okay, well... Total, yeah, throw money in the fountain. Yeah, well, I want to be happier, so... Alright, a little luck. Hey, let's you luck know what? Mean you're kicked. <laughs> I wonder if this part of the game actually has anything to do 
with anything. I know, right? No, I, I, I think, actually, I do. I think if you throw, put in at least, like, a hundred uh, rupees, you can extend uh, your bomb or arrows, I think. So basically, you know, a larger quiver of arrows and a larger bomb bag, basically. Hmm. Right, well, I might try that later. Right now, I want to go ahead and enter the fifth dungeon, the ice dungeon. <gasps> All right, we're finally going to get somewhere. Awesome. I knew this episode would lead us to somewhere. Yeah, right. too bad it ends right you here. So Wait, we'll what? see you. You lied to me. And part twelve. I didn't lie to you. What are you talking about? I didn't say we were going to you. You told me this video was going to be twenty minutes long. We'll see you in part of twelve. Twelve T A T. Or however you say twelve in Spanish. Well, where I would venture through the ice dungeon. And <laughs> yeah, that level's pretty cold. Anyway, it's gonna be chilling. Till then, God bless. Take care. We be chilling. Welcome to part twelve of Let's Play The Legend of Zelda: A Link to the Past. This is Ron Moore, along with Star Soldier 1 and the returning Lens of Truth, 1689. How's it going? Hey, how's everybody? Yeah. Yeah, so now I am in the Ice Palace. Ooh. And have been in this dungeon in a long time. I remember it being very difficult. <laughs> yeah, this or is where the... the water one? Uh, probably thinking the Water Temple on Ocarina of Time. <laughs> This is the proverbial water, uh, Ocarina of Time water temple. Yeah. Yeah, the programmers in this game must have been pretty cold to do something like this. Uh. <laughs> I was telling them, chill out on the difficulty. Yeah. <laughs> Every time freaking... I try to play this place, my game freezes. Uh. <laughs> yeah, I gotta destroy all the J's. I mean, the Pentagators. <laughs> Peng pe penguin, penguin gators, whatever they are. Yeah, don't be such a penguin instigator. <laughs> <laughs> no wonder we lose the scrappers. No, um. <laughs> yeah, Jay unsubscribed to me a long time ago. <laughs> Tired of you and Ronnie making fun of me. Well, it's been a long time. I can't remember the last time we had Lens of Truth and S2 gate commentary, maybe except for, uh, Chrome Trigger, it's probably the last time. That's because I got lost. Oh, <laughs> got lost? Yeah. Where? I couldn't find my way past my driveway. Oh, yeah. That's I tough. I thought you meant like this dungeon. <laughs> oh, yeah, I remember how tricky this <laughs> level got, especially from the multiple floors that you had to experiment with. Yeah, really. Oh, wow, that was shocking. Ah. Hopefully he actually fell on that part that I didn't really look stupid in that video. <laughs> Sometimes well, we can get out of sync. It depends how we film it. Yeah. For some reason, a long time ago, right, right here, you're supposed to use the sword and then destroy the, the skeleton, so Skeletor, whoever, with the bomb. And for the longest time, because, you know, right here, Sahashrila gives me the clue, you must not destroy with the sword alone. And so, I thought use the hammer next, so I kept using the hammer five times until he finally died. <laughs> Jump for the shadows. This ain't the Shadow Temple, then you get out of here. You're in the wrong game. Oh man, it's the Mario Brothers fire sticks. <laughs> Little blobs now. <laughs> Those look like, <laughs> I guess the same blobs from the very first Zelda, except they're slimmer and green. Yeah. Yeah, I think blobs are almost in every Zelda game. Yeah, really? Well... Yeah, those are what blobs should be like in a video game, not freaking Delhi Towers blobs. Yeah. That takes like 50 hits a kill. <laughs> yeah, really? <laughs> it's almost a Nintendo made this game. Yeah, those... 
those statue ice angels right there. Yeah, they're creepy. You gotta watch out for them. They take a lot of hits off too. <laughs> that would so break your spine or your knees. Yeah, not Link. He's, he's the hero of time. Yeah. Well, not in this game. He's just he's a hero yeah. of something. Yeah. This guy is, is a parachute. Yeah, that's why he don't die when he falls. You know, Ocarina of Time, it does hurt him. But in the older Zelda games, it don't. At least on here, I don't think you fall 50 feet in the old Zelda. I hate that part right there. Always fall right there. And try, <laughs> try to avoid that fire. Yeah, you really have to get used to the slippery controls here. <laughs> yeah, really. Well, what's, what's worse, broken controls or slippery controls? I don't know, slippery controls suck. <laughs> yeah, I didn't mean like, like a pun, but yeah, they really do suck. <laughs> <laughs> I hate slippery controls because they're so loose. Huh? Yeah. <laughs> so what's your uh, fondest <clears throat> memories of this dungeon, uh, Danny? My fondest memories of this dungeon? Oh gosh! <laughs> is there like any fond memories? That's like asking what your fondest memory of going to the dentist is. <laughs> when it was over? <laughs> yeah. And right there, it took me a long time to figure out how to get to that treasure chest. Whoa! Those black shadow things are creepy. They pop out of nowhere practically. Yeah. Well, you do see them coming, but they're so quick too. Yeah. I think Whoa. the scariest thing is if they all run in unison. Yeah, really. I'm gonna find myself going in circles through this dungeon, like, for the longest time. <laughs> I mean, I forgot how to beat this dungeon. I had to look on YouTube and look at a walkthrough. Yeah, I looked at this video for help. Yeah. <laughs> now people can look at my video for help now. Hey. Yeah. Oh, look, another payphone. Well, yeah, I know that. <laughs> well, as Gandalf gives me another tip, let me go in this room down here. And... Use your medicine to reveal your health. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I hate those electrical floating balls. Electric jellyfish or something. Yeah. As I told, as I told we got before, I don't like this dungeon music. I like the dungeon music in the light world better. Yeah, this one is almost like too repetitive. Yeah. Did you have to bomb that one part of the wall or no? No, you can't. Unless you got that big bomb at the end. Oh. <laughs> but you can't get to this part by then. Oh, I guess you could, no. I think you can. <laughs> That'd be a cool secret. Use the big bomb in the end to get to Ganon. To use that to bomb the, the walls you usually can't bomb in the game. <laughs> yeah, that's super bomb. Yeah. <laughs> I feel kind of awkward pulling on some demon's tongue, or whatever that is. Oh yeah, it's kind of gross. <laughs> Thank God, it's just a tongue. Yeah, or that's not really wet. Here, let me pull on this. Let's see what happens. Yeah, ah! <laughs> and now I got the big key. <laughs> I'm a big boy now. Yeah, just make everything super. Oh no, you don't need a key. You need a super key. Yeah. <laughs> oh no, you need a super bomb, not a regular bomb. Yeah. <laughs> they do that in Metroid too. Oh, you don't need the regular missiles, you need the super missiles. And you don't need the regular bomb, you need the power bomb. Yeah. And then which Vader was suing for that. Yeah. Oh no, you need the power glove. It's so bad. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> At least they don't make you buy the super scope and like <laughs> the power pad just to play this Ooh. game. 
Yeah, really. <laughs> Man, I got pumped. See that? How much damage they did? Man. They hit hard. They're like iron knuckles. Yeah. And that's where you bomb the floor. Because I think I bombed part of that floor before and it didn't work, so I figured, oh, we can't bomb it. Now I get the blue mail. I got the big key, and now I got the. I guess the big boy's closed now. <laughs> I forget, does it take less damage off? Yeah, or does it, it only. Yeah. I think, uh, I forgot what you said. About, about one half, or. I forgot. It reduces damage. Okay, that's cool. We got the freaking way, man. Really? It matches your hair. That's its usefulness. Yeah. Or it would match your hair if your hair wasn't pink. <laughs> pink. It even changes your hat too. <laughs> yeah. Oh man, stupid thing! Hide behind that. Oh man. <laughs> oh. I thought the crystal would block it. You stupid Western crystal, do the job. I think that Nintendo is just trying to, like, laugh at us. Because everyone's like, well, the palette for, for Link doesn't have yellow. There's no yellow in the game. And they're like, guess what? Blue mail. Yeah. You got blue mail. <laughs> Take a punch oh. of giant ashtray. Yes. See, that's like a 40-foot drop and he just lands okay. Yeah. Oh, nice. Remember his hat's a parachute. Aw, <laughs> oh, dang it. Alright. At least I'm full. Come on, get into the mud puddle. Alright. Here we go. Do a quick cut, because it took me a long time to figure out where to go and what to do next. So, thank God for Windows Movie Maker and quick cuts. Dang it, watch out. Stat Childs now? Stat Childs are ahead of their time here. <laughs> ah, oh. <laughs> that was ah, forgot about that. Gotta lay that hammer down some people. I heard MC Hammer tried to sue this, not to sue Nintendo because it had the hammer. I'm like, are you kidding me? No, not really. Um, I think he tried to sue everybody just to make some cash. <laughs> well, let's see if he can sue this. Oh, fail, fail segue, but here's the boss of the... <laughs> Dungeon, uh, Ice Monster. Do, 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 I guess it didn't work as fast as I thought it would. The flame, uh, I know it worked, to, you know, to break the ice, but I guess not to kill the boss faster in this part. There we go. It's not like Jay moaning. <laughs> oh, man, he's yeah, not to kill. He's not watching. Oh, yeah, he never watches this new one thing. Yes, I do, douchebag. Shut up. Oh, I just got a long text message now on Skype from him. We love you, Jay. <laughs> I don't. That's what Bear would say. We love you, Jay. <laughs> <laughs> okay, now we saving that random girl. Yep, one of the seven maidens. The fifth one. But back, when you first played this game, this right here was kind of helpful. and kind of gives you... Uh, I don't know if it's super helpful, but it kind of helps you understand what's really going on and... Uh, stuff. So when you first, you know, rescue the maidens, it's like, oh, oh, this is interesting. Oh, wow. His name is Ganondorf? Not Ganon? And right now, now you play it over and over again. It's like, yeah, yeah, blah, blah, blah. Take me to the next, uh, take me out of this dungeon so I can move on. Then, you, then for some reason, like, you accidentally hit not at all, and then you hit the, <laughs> the whole thing again. Yeah. She's just like a pre-recorded message. Yeah, really. Alright, so that's the end of part 12. We'll see you in part 13.
Until then, God bless and take care. May Thank the you all for watching. Lead to the Triforce. Yeah. ECW. Welcome to part 13 of Let's Play The Legend of Zelda A Link to the Past. This is Ron Moore, along with the Wee Guy and the Green. Hi. Yo, yo, yo. So now I'm at the Swamp Palace. Swamp Palace, or isn't it called Misery Mire or some crap? Yeah, something yeah. like in that. The, uh, in the Game Boy Advance version, they named uh, all the levels. I forgot what this one was called. I think it might be Misery Mire. Hmm. Misery! Misery! Exactly. <laughs> like the exact same thing. Wow. That was so planned. Yeah. You, I, I, man, you love Megadeth 2? Oh, that's Metallica. <laughs> no, that was the joke. Was like, <laughs> never mind. <laughs> okay. I failed at getting the failed purpose, purposely failed joke, and I failed at even saying that. And I'm talking about it. It does it all the time. Anyway. This dungeon is harder than the, in some ways than the last one. This dungeon is harder than Octorox. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Dongos. I can't wait to boss into Dongos. I can't remember anything from this dungeon. It's like Birdo <laughs> trying to do that. Yeah. Oh no, the freaking... Wizards. Yeah, Wizards. K-Mex from Mario Brothers or whatever they are. Douchey. <laughs> That's what they are. Yeah. They're from the original Zelda. Yeah, and they're annoying as hell. I hated those guys. Yeah. At least they're not as stupid to get rid of this back then. Yeah, they're harder. Uh, in the original Zelda, they're harder because uh, they move around, actually. In the original. Yeah, that too. Ow, ow, ow. What's a chest there? What a douche. Yeah, really. It's just like in uh, X-Men, uh, I mean Wolverine for the NES. Put a freaking burger on top of the propeller. That's messed up. Oh, that's well, good. I can get that burger. I got that burger without taking damage. If you watch the LP, I know that. But still, it still shouldn't have to be there. That's a douchebag move by the programmers. Now, of course, because you know ahead of time, you saw EVGN's review. Of course, you saw it ahead of time. Yeah. <laughs> what? Well, Safe because crying. you know about it. Just because you know about it doesn't mean that you can get it like without getting hit. It took me a few tries, but in that that's run, I got exactly. It. Who's gonna not get hit the first time? me but i did so <laughs> it's like in a uh, star evil and action 52 who's gonna dodge that the very first time they play it <laughs> nobody unless you are accidentally holding right the whole time yeah they always go right automatically so oh, just hold it exactly yeah so i missed out on the ice dungeon and i am so angry at you running because i had so many ice puns ready for that episode and I just got denied without even knowing. Well post them under the comment section of the video. <laughs> <That's> <laughs> right. Get ready for 10 comments then. Dude, and I'll put them all in the comment. <laughs> yeah, this is the Wii Guy and I'm here to do an ice dungeon run and this <laughs> the pun run. That's what should we call the pun run. The pun run. Yes, yeah, makes perfect run. sense. Yeah. Ooh, another treasure chest or chest. Ooh, the chest. I finally got the compass! My life is now complete! Your life is now complete, please. Oh my god, no, why? <laughs> that was sure really bad. Go. Don't go to Compass Bank. I oh, fail. Is that a real bank? Yeah. It's my bank. Oh, it's your bank. Oh. Oh my. <laughs> Surprise! I be banking. <laughs> Not really. I like you be... In this game, I'm banking. I got 822 rupees. I like you be bombing. This bomb's going after you. Yeah. I hope I don't bomb in this game. This dungeon's kind of challenging. Oh, this mm -hmm. game is the bomb. What are you talking about? Dot com? Yep. Yeah. Oh, is somebody... the Star Tropics enemies now coming out of here? Mm hmm I'm just looking at this. I'm just like, I've never seen these rooms before, but I'm so used to seeing speedruns of this that you don't even see a lot of the dungeons. Yeah, really? You know a game like this so many times, you just like seeing those speedruns and just however anyone can exploit the game. Mm-hmm, and it's fun. I'm um, watching one of my friends, I told him, like, oh, I'm gonna play casually, you should help me. He's like, half of these rooms I haven't been to in years. Yeah. Okay, and... Yeah, mine's been that glitch where you can beat the game in five minutes. <laughs> oh, yes, that 
That is hilarious. Okay. Oh yeah. Plus, move these out of the way. Ah, oh, dang it! You idiot. Oops. Yeah. Let me leave the room and come back. Maybe be back to normal. What? Nope. How are you gonna? I gotta leave this floor in order to get it back to normal. That's so stupid. That was so good. These programs knew what they were doing. <sighs> You're kidding uh -huh. me. Fine, I'll just leave the floor and come back. <laughs> so good. Reset. I mean, just kidding. <laughs> That's where we have the reset button. Check out the description for that forum. <laughs> <laughs> shameless plug? Nah, Here we go. It's not shameless. <laughs> we'll call it shameful. Yeah. It can't be, because you can reset. So it never happened. What about the power button? Nah. Wow. So we're still. Get the power. Nintendo power. They're, They're gone. Not around anymore. Too soon, Ronnie. Too soon. Oh yeah. Hey, I love Nintendo power. Yeah, well, too soon. You're too soon. All right, now the uh, as we lit the torches, the uh, wall starts to move out of the way. We got to deal with this earthquake for about 20 minutes. Yeah, I was about to say. I always thought it was an earthquake. I was like, oh my god, what's happening? Yeah. Expected a game. monster to drop. It's a glitch in the game. The boss just comes out knowing to like surprise Ganon's here. Yeah. I'll just uh, go past him without him seeing you and it's like in the glitch. Mm -hmm. The glitch is so good. I'm just like, y you can't even use that as a legitimate speed run because it's yeah. too cheap. Yeah, really. Too cheap. Five cents. Mm hmm. Even, even less than that. It's not even less, it's less than a penny? Wow. It's, it's okay, free. now. What? Oh, yeah. oh, yeah, I forgot. You can actually fall through the floor. I forgot about that. Wait, well, that floor didn't have, like, a... You couldn't... You know, like most most floors you fall through, you can see the the next floor. Yeah, there's, like, a little... That, that one was totally dark, so I forgot you can actually fall now. That's up to your gamer instinct yeah. to figure that out. Yeah, I should have known that, because that's... Why would the hole be there after the wall opened up? Duh. I saw that about everything. Oh, the hole be there after the wall what? showed up. Yeah. Good thing you got oh. the magic powder. Oh wait, I was there when you got that. Yeah. Why would the spikes be there too? Well, Why you know, not? for danger. Yeah, we can touch the spikes and skip and be wrong for once. <gasps> and then I'd start laughing because it happened. Yeah. Alright, get- Whoa! Whoa! There we go. Alright. Say, I don't think you even need that key because you have the master big key now. Oh wait, no, because the small door key holes. Never mind, I am not. Um, yeah. yeah. Someone is tired. I'm not <laughs> tired, tired. I just didn't think. think. That's all. There's a difference um, between these two things. Oh, um, let's think. My let's new, my new, run. my new philosophical series on my channel. Yeah. <laughs> let's think. The philosophical guy. The Phil. I'll be Phil guy. <laughs> yeah. I am Phil. Well, not really, but I'm the philosophical guy. <laughs> I'm just too lazy to say all of it. Yeah. Ah, I am dang. very soft. I forgot I have the dungeon item for this part. Oh, I love this item. Too bad you don't have it, you stupid Ed. <laughs> yeah. Still throwing insults. When did you get it? Don't you know how to play the game? It's oh. easy! Oh. Oh, oh, I thought there was, there was an obstacle in my way. Hmm. <laughs> You're the really got that reference. I never saw you beat this game, so... You're not even good at this game. Go back to Zelda 2. Zelda 2. <laughs> right. Back to side-scrolling. Oh! I just accidentally figured that out. I didn't know the fairy dust would work for those spinning, spiral, shining things. Yeah. New technology. Cool. More like magic technology. Yeah. Magical yeah. technology. Your face technology. That's not, oh, oh, hey, you're not supposed to reveal that yet. Oh yeah. It's gonna be shown at the new E3 to 2013. Does it connect scan your face? Yes, and then you use the PlayStation Move to ca uh, calibrate yourself while using the Wii U tablet to stand on. Stop, the, stop. No, you don't do that. <laughs> Hell. As you use you the, said, the, why not just use the balance board for all that? I was about to say, I meant to say the balance board, not the... But I had it connected to the Wii U, even though it can't use it. Oh, whatever. And then you use the NES Zapper. No. 
Then you Indian, you Jones, your way to the cane of Samaria. Samaria. No, Samaria. Uh, some who? Maria. <laughs> yeah. Maria and Gonzalez, or Marina. Not related to Victor Gonzalez. Sugar mm -hmm. cane? Yes. Lol. Touch the spikes, it'll give you health. <laughs> Touch the fairy, it'll give you health. <laughs> they won't do it. Those of you just joined us in progress, we are in. <laughs> yeah, they just skip ahead to the 10 minute mark and just like, oh, I wonder what I missed. <laughs> yeah. This is a live stream. <laughs> oh my god, he's splicing frames. This is all Photoshop. Yeah, wow. Technically, this is a live stream, but only for us three. <laughs> yeah, everybody else exactly. recorded. Uh -huh. Secret stream. Oh, super secret SC2K live stream, and everyone else gets to view it afterwards. Yeah. Exactly. When it's not live. The perks of the job. The power of the secret stream. Yeah. Now, you don't want to burn any bridges right here. Sure you can. You can do it after you leave. I've used that pun like I don't know how many times. <laughs> I'm running out of puns. No, you won't. By the time you get to Ganon, you'll have a few. Yeah. Make a nope, freestyle rap. Was... Watch out for a Ganon. Shoot him with a cannon. And if you don't, then watch us play John Madden. <laughs> Fail. <laughs> oh my god. I'll let Jay. Uh, I'll leave the freestyle rapping to Jay. He can do it better. Okay, As now. Hey, man. No, Jay. I didn't know Jay could rap. Yeah. Him and Star Soldier used to freestyle together. They were uh, 8 Mile 2. It's pretty good. I missed miss that. Yeah. How do you miss a lot of things? <laughs> I, just, I don't read the sign. I'm sorry. <laughs> I saw the sign. Ah, ah. <laughs> That's perfect. I'm good at this game. <laughs> I'm a game, game master. Is, oh. Game is for 13 year olds. Uh. Yeah. <laughs> Wait. Games for adolescent teens who know how to play. <laughs> Rocky and Bullwinkers for ages four to seven. More like, more like ages no one to nobody. <laughs> Dang man, I'm failing right here. This pop section. Dang it. So good at it. I'm pretty sure you could just use the Pegasus boots and crash into it. But you can just keep using your bombs because it makes you look cool. I forgot you can actually run to some walls like that with the Pegasus boots. I forgot about that. I don't know if it's those walls, but there are some that you can Forget, I was going through the door. <laughs> ah, well, that was well worth it. There's only rupees, what are you going to use with them anyway? Because, I mean, you bought everything oh, yeah. that you need, right? I forgot what's in there. I didn't see the door right. Well, I did. I, for some reason, I assumed going the, through the wall. and It's been a while. Shut up. <laughs> it's been a while, Leo. Yeah, it's wall been a wall. That is my southern draw, by the way. However you say it. It's been a wall. Hey y'all, what's at this wall, y'all? Max girlfriend made fun of my accent. She was Filipino. She goes, hold on, for a wall. For a wall. So wait, now that I think about is this 100%? No. Yes. Because <laughs> Ronnie does all his LPs 100%. I mean, you've seen him, right? No yeah. ECW mode or anything? <laughs> Metroid? No. No, I was just thinking about it because you have all the bottles and all this other stuff. I don't know, how. maybe he's it's, getting everything. It's 70%, is that good enough? No. It's easy to get though, all the, everything 100%. Ah, this game it. is pretty streamlined. Yeah. It's, it's no... Stupid crystal ball. Majora's Mask or anything. Yeah, I'll oh, forget that. Even then, it's not even that hard. Twilight Princess is very... Like, go and find everything! And I'm like, okay, because I love you. I will. <laughs> That's in the game. I love the game. I love you, baby. <laughs> okay, okay, and stop. as we ignore that, we get into the boss's room, and now we fight. Oh no, it's eight eyes! Ah, oh, no, it's uh. Hold on, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. It's ten eyes. Ah, the sequel to Eight Eyes. No, no. Not really ten. I just freaking said it. Oh, look out! Stop there. Ah. You have the blue mail. It's not like you're gonna take like ridiculous damage. Oh, is that noise? Yes. What? <laughs> I really was. Not okay, time. Okay, hold on. I gotta keep an eye out on this. I gotta keep focused. Looks like we just sh shifted to Ocarina of Time, apparently. <laughs> yeah, yeah, we sure did. Oh, oh. Ocarina of Time, the fan project. He just got hit by lightning that he broke, that he had a million years to avoid. No, no, oh, here we go. What is the easy part? To, uh, Ronnie's uh, playthrough or whatever on his channel. Yep, I'm just watching it right now on the side. 
This boss wow. is actually not that hard. Yeah, really. Look at you. ECW. It's like you gave him a sore eye. Yeah. <laughs> get that get that guy from Furious Mio's Day Off who does that eye drop commercial. Yeah. What, the cl that clear eyes thing? Ben that dude Steve is monotone as fuck? What's his name? Ben Steiner? Yeah, something like ben, that. Ben Stein? Yeah, something like that. Ben Stein. Steiner. Not the ben Steiner brothers. Ben Einstein? Alright, um, well, I won this level, and... No, you didn't. We rescued yeah, another maiden. <laughs> yeah, I'm maiden. So funny. <laughs> Because Thank you. That was a good try. But as you go. <laughs> but your princess is in another castle. Jokes on you. Yeah. Well, there is another princess in another castle. Oh, After no. breaking the seal with our powers, he sealed us inside of these crystals. He was all like, "Fuck you, getting a crystal." But Ganon didn't plan on you getting this far. And plan on your getting this far. On your getting this far. It said on your getting. This game is so good with translation. It's so good, so spot on. I oh, can't. This is Nintendo. Nintendo can have part 13. We will see you in part 14, where we will enter Ninja Turtle Rock. Until then, God bless. Take care. Peace out. We'll see you on your. N Bye. Welcome to part 14 of Let's Play The Legend of Zelda, A Link to the Past. This is Ron Moore, along with the Wii guy to the past. Fail. Yeah, the one and only. Alright, I'm heading to Ninja Turtle Rock. Yeah, Spectacle Rock as I- wait. That was the original name of, uh, I think, like, in the original Legend of Zelda, the last place was called Spectacle Rock. Yeah. And I think they- I don't know if they renamed it that here, in this game, but something reminds me of Spectacle Rock. I think it was, it was in the light world. It was called Spectacle Rock, and or something was, I don't know, anyway. I don't know what's called Rock, but I think it is Turtle Rock. That's what it's called, Turtle Rock. Well, the rocks. It, it does rock, it's like, it's like a rocker. Yeah. Alright, so I had to... To get some more rupees as if I really need them. But yeah, and uh, do a little, you know, a little bit of grinding here before I head to, to Ninja Turtle Rock. Well, you're, we are almost done here, or you're almost done, so might as well. Yeah, well, I actually need to pick up the Ice Rod first, so I won't be able to beat Turtle Rock. But you never even, oh wow, I should have known that you didn't have it, but I thought you got it way earlier. Yeah, I totally forgot. At least it's not that necessary until the last uh, dungeon. Yeah, it's no worse feeling than getting to the boss battle and realize, oh wait. <laughs> I, I haven't known anyone to do that. Like, in a game, like, go to a part or miss, like, an item that you need. Ah, I've never known anyone to do that. Except yeah. for me right now. Okay, well, I mean, like, that. actually went to the boss or whatever. Yeah. All right, yeah, and uh, I am going to need the medicine and magic to get through Turtle Rock. Yeah, that's the magic drawer. That's where the magic red cane comes into play. Yes. How's it called? The cane of solstice or something? Cane of Somalia. Uh, I don't know. Somalia. Samoa. Yeah. I think the right. w last thing you're missing is the blue rod, which gives you brief invincibility. Yeah, which I don't really need, but anyway. It, it's, yeah. If, if I it's wanted not that it, tough to get, it's just, yeah. Well, if I wanted to, you're, I could have got, 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 got the uh, black cane, the cane of ECW for ECW mode, but I want to try to beat this game uh, legit. Oh, whoa, the black cane. Yeah, well, I don't know, ECW just, I don't know, I'm thinking black for some reason. If Bear was here, he'd be like, why did it have to be black? <laughs> black oh, that's... Black is awesome. It's bad. Black. It's yeah, so it's bad. bad. Well, black is black, actually. And white is just... I don't know, WCW? <laughs> I guess. Oh, well, here we are. We can... Oh, we can get the rod right now! <laughs> I forgot where to get the rod, actually. Actually, you just drop down on one of the edges, um, wherever where you just were in the dark world, and y you find this, uh, uh, like, cave that has, like, a lot of spikes on the ground, and then you're supposed to, like, get through it. 
Oh yeah, for the cape, or I could just walk through it if you have enough energy. Yeah. Oh yeah, maybe does the cape? I don't think cape gives invincibility. Just or does it? I'm not sure. Oh no, it, no, it no, it it don't. I don't think for the spikes it does. I forgot. Hmm. And I, I apologize for so. my uh, sickle fan whispering commentary because it's two in the morning and I have other people in the house and I can't talk loud. That's the same to me. Oh okay. <laughs> Somebody told me at work. I like your mighty final fight videos. Pretty good. But use more enthusiasm. <laughs> I'm like, yeah, okay, that's the downfall. You. For roommates or like with me uh, still living with parents or at least just people. Because that's really what it is. It's just people and I can't really be all loud and wee guy -y. Yeah. Can't be star surgery. I wish. I wish. Oh, oh Who lives by himself and can yell all the time and be shirtless and wear a Rey Mysterio mask. <laughs> that is true. I can still do all those things except, you know, no one would, no one sees it. And then your mom would ground you. <laughs> oh, my mother walked to the room because my baby sister was crying. <laughs> she saw the, she saw the horror. Yeah. <laughs> that I was doing. <laughs> yeah. Okay, now I'm trying to get uh, a little heart piece before I head toward uh, into Turtle Rock. I'm not sure if I have three of them already, if this one will give me an extra heart, but oh well. Yeah, this was a this was a bit of a bitch just because it's kind of maze-like. You're just like, oh, where do I need to go to do the thing? Yeah, what's the price of the end of the road? Oh, a heart piece, and I just have one. <laughs> You know, walking up the stairs. Ugh. Yeah. Man, I... I remember... playing Link to the Past and being stuck in Turtle Rock. Yeah. And it sucked, because I think I forgot the Quake medal. Or one of the three, like, you know... Uh, what, are they medals? I don't know. I forgot what they were. Medallions? Yeah, medallions. I forgot the Quake one, which you need to open Turtle Rock. And for the longest time, I didn't know. You had to go to the Dark World, and you go to that place in the upper right hand corner and you throw a thing into that little pond and then that fish gives it to you. I never figured that out. Had no Nintendo power, had no internet, had no clue. <laughs> I figured it out by just roaming around and the sign said, I think it said throw something in or don't throw something in. And I went ahead and threw it in and then yeah, uh, that weird octopus, whatever it was, gave me the quake medallion. Yeah, I don't think I read that sign or I didn't even understand it. I was just like, yeah, whatever. Yeah. Well, but now I know better. Because I'm ECW, and I can beat Silver Surfer and Fester's Quest and all without getting hit once or dying, that is. Yeah. Alright, now. I'm a pro. Over here. Ah, the dark web. Well, dang it. I think you're fine. Just just go into one of the caves that are nearby. This is the I'm not one there. What? Nope. Come on. I feel like I'm playing Indiana Jones and in Temple of Doom right here. This screen is is it overhead or not? This is a bird's eye view. I just it's just a hybrid. I would I would like something like that where it's actually sort of like climbing on a mountain. Yeah. That's kind of looked like in the Temple of Doom. But even then, the, the graphics are subjective. I mean, it just looks how you make it look. You gotta use your imagination. Well, well if only we had Bear, because we all know he has quite a wicked imagination. Yeah. Oh, shut up, guys. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Never gets old. <laughs> yeah. You're old. <laughs> no, you're... I'm getting too old for this. Oh, yeah. <laughs> you know, I kind of forgot that you were referencing the quote in the movie, and I thought you were just getting too old of commenting on game, <laughs> bad uh, games. Oh. <laughs> Why? Because you're just like, ah, oh, I'm too... Because you already did, like, comment on Crash Dummies, and... Actually, I think that's all you commented on. <laughs> Oh, like on, on soundtracks I hated, or don't or games you don't like. 
the sound oh, yeah. you know the soundtrack's good of course but the game itself is like bleh. i didn't like the crash dummy soundtrack really at all but the target renegade one is, is okay oh of course it's, it's amazing yeah. Oh, that's something I've mentioned here. Right here, we had to cross. I never knew it was invisible. I just walked. I should. Well, I should have known when I walked like the first three steps, and I was all like, "Huh, it seems to be invisible here." And I was all like, "I, I, was, I was just a stupid kid." <laughs> I know. Yeah. How stupid are you? I know. I, I was very stupid. I was like, I don't know, eight. I didn't know. Oh, that's alright. I made some dumb mistakes in Ocarina of Time when I first played it at age what, 17 or 18. Really? I never had that much trouble. It was pretty streamlined for me. I just did things where I made one little mistake and it made me think, oh, well, I don't know what I'm doing. And then I realized, oh, oh, I was doing, oh, yes, full heart. Uh, yeah, I just made dumb mistakes. <laughs> Ocarina of Time where you, Talon falls asleep, you have pushed the milk crate to the hole in order to sneak in to talk to Princess Zelda in the courtyard. Freaking crate wouldn't push all the way. I realized I didn't push it all the way to the left, and uh, I can't really explain. I didn't push it right, so I thought there was no way to do it. So I just like, well, how do you get through there? And Venom's like, man, I figured that out my first day. You do this. I'm like, I did do that. Oh, I need to push it a little bit further to the right in order for it to fit perfectly. Oh, I didn't notice that. <laughs> Looks like you were in crate peril back then. Yeah, I should have just done that in my LP just to show. The, the mistake I'd made a long time ago for the lols. Yeah, probably. All right. One, two, three, yes. See, I didn't do that. I didn't do those in order at first, and I realized what the heck. The cut? I didn't even notice. Yeah. And now I use the ECW medallion to get inside Turtle Rock. Whoa, 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 it's frustrating when you see that quick medallion symbol and you realize you don't have it. So you gotta go back and get it. Yeah, that's what me. I was like, oh, I don't, I don't have that. Where do I get it? Yeah. I don't know where to get well, it. I knew where to get it, but I, I forgot to get it and I had to fly the bird back to the freaking area. No, no, it's in the dark world. And that's right. And then, yeah. Ugh. I forgot we get the quick. I think was that the circle stones? I forgot. Yeah, yeah, the circle stones. Just yeah. talked about that. The, the, uh, yes, right. The ether one is on top of, uh, right next to the tower in the light world, I think. But anyway, now we're inside Turtle Rock, and yep. this dungeon is a female dog. It is, yep, it is, since it is pretty much the last, it is the bitchiest of them all. It is a bear. I mean, oh, oh, oh that was stupid. <laughs> I'm, I, hey, or here, I, let me hook you in. <laughs> no, I, I thought I had, I thought I had the cane to equip, is what happened. You don't have the cane of Samaria. Yeah. A Samaria. It sounds like, sounds like Samari, that uh, Samaria. Sonic I think NES what, hawk rack. I think hawk that's what my rack? friend Laura said. He's a big Zelda fan. She goes, Cane of Samaria? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Sorry, I was just focusing on how dumb I was because I said something about rock. I said rock hack when I meant to say that Samali Samaria sounds like Samari, which is the Mario Sonic ROM hack. Gosh. Oh. <laughs> I can't speak. That's why I got a C minus in English. <laughs> Improper. Freaking uh, giant uh, bakery rolls with spikes. I oh, fail. Jeez. What kind of cookies are they making? What do you call those things? The rollers? What are they called? Rolling pins? That you make dough? Roll the dough with? Yeah, rolling pins. Oh, okay. Pins? There's pins in them? Anyway. Well, there's pins in these, it looks like. I just got ran over. There'll be a pinhead. I'm not freaking Pillsbury Doughboy. <laughs> uh huh? What? What was that? That was not like you were whimpering like... Uh, that's a Pillsbury Doughboy you put... What was it? The commercial you poke your stomach goes... <laughs> yeah, he goes... Hoo! It's like a Mickey Mouse. That sounded... That just yeah. sounded wrong. That was creepy. Anyway. That was. That was a bear moment. <laughs> yeah. This dungeon was so hard when I first got here. Hey, it's it's still kind of hard now. Actually, I don't think it was for me because I never played it because I think I gave up and then like years later when I was actually kind of like around 2009 yeah. when I actually re-got this game, played it again. Wow, that's kind of embarrassing to think about that. <laughs> that's when I finally finished this game where I actually, you know, got, got past where I got stuck as a kid. <laughs> re-got the game? 
Yeah, we got <laughs> Retro Gamer Expo. I got right. We got it. Retro Gamer Three Expo. Pretty much. <laughs> okay, now I saw some giant vacuum cleaner ducks or something. I don't know. Not dynamite ducks for the second master system. That duck sounds like it was ducked up. <laughs> yeah, that's yeah. I'll ask a happy console gamer. Anyway, I do have him on the friends list. I'm gonna ask him. Hey freaking, Johnny, what do you think about it? Man, freaking bouncing pumpkin things. What are they? Remind me of Pokies from Mario. Except they're yeah angrier. Yeah. Freaking star, stop chasing me. But you're the superstar, Ronnie. Yeah, but that ah, oh, now that's not basically where you're right there. You come back. <laughs> this game has good memory. It remembers exactly where it was. It just waited for you. It preyed on you. Yeah. Ah, uh, let me go back in here. Ah, uh, the lava down there is pretty cool. It is. Well, pretty much on a volcano and all. With liquid and magma. So, yeah. only natural this turtle rock was pretty much infested with lava. Yeah. Maybe like almost like a 16 bit fire dungeon. Yeah. Oh just... man. I forgot those eyes shoot lasers at you. Well, it looks like he's got his eye on you. Yeah, really. He Don't has a keen no... eye. Make no bones about it, like the skeleton. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I love puns. They're punny. Okay, now you, you know what to do, Ronnie. Oh, oh, okay, yeah, do that. <laughs> yeah. I think there's another point where you have to do the trick where if you get to it, I'll say it. I won't spoil it for the, like, one person who doesn't know it. <laughs> yeah. You already know it, then I don't have to explain it to you. I think I know it. Anyway. Do you some it no so know it? Dot fail. <laughs> so know it, Joe? Fail. Ah, oh. Oh, you missed oh, this sucks. You get the bombs. Why don't you get yeah. the bombs? There's eight of them. I am the bomb, so therefore I don't need it. Did you used to pronounce Bob -om, Bob Om like Bob Om? Bob Om. I didn't. Everyone said Bob 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 instead no, of I, Bob. I, call, Bob. I said Bob Bob. Bob away. Why do they call it Bob Bob? It's, it's Bob Bob. Yeah, Bob Bob. It's it's just hard. If you just don't bother, you're just like Bob Bob. It's Bob, easier Bob, when you're speaking Bob, fast. Bob Oblong. With a bomb. Bob Bob. Bob Bob. Bob 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 Bob. That Bob. was an awesome show. I loved all one seasons. <laughs> wow. <laughs> So like, yeah, Definitely one of the most underrated uh, shows of all time. What seasons? No, Oblongs. Oblongs. Sorry, I got confused with all the talk of uh, whatever we were talking about. You pull on some creature's tongue and you know, all these rubies, even though I'm already maxed out, pretty much. Yeah, what's the point? Yeah. What's well, a cool thing to show people that may not know that? <laughs> yeah, people that may not know that. Well, there are, but it's... Well, you never know, there might be... No, there, there, there are, it just... Uh, yeah, uh, yeah. You know what people you know, and all. You don't think... <laughs> you know. You just don't know, because you're around people that don't know it, and if you come across with someone who doesn't know, you're just like, well, why, why did you know it? Yeah. That was j -Lo moment. To the oh, yeah. oh no! Oh shoot! Whoa. Oh, I'm freaking oh, stuck. My God, I have never seen Dang, I was anyone get away. do that. I was trying to get away from the rolling pin, and then I threw the bomb over there so I can get through the door. I would have said just taking the, the hit. I'm, so now I got to start over. Use the mirror. Start from the beginning, and now a quick cut back to here. <laughs> wow, sure. that is amazing. Oh, that was epic fail. Oh, oh, epic, awesome! Oh, man, I'm getting pwned. Man, dodge the eyeballs. Well, I say, looks can't kill. 
the, the, those looks can kill. I mean, did you even see how many lasers they were firing at you? They gave me the evil eye. There was a good thing there wasn't eight of them. Oh, yeah. Uh, looks like there was more than that. No, it looks like there was six, I think. I think six there was six. Six uh -huh. eyes. I'm like the prequel. Hmm, yeah. this doesn't seem familiar. I don't remember this part. Yeah, I actually just discovered this from a uh, playthrough. This this oh Burko, or something, this Burko channel does oh pretty good uh, Zelda walkthroughs. Wow, I never knew that. Wow. Yeah, you learn something new every day. See, there's some people that don't know. Uh, uh. This is the classic case with even these kind of games that you grew up with. You played, well, I didn't play this one to like a major extent, but still, I never knew that. Wow. Wow. Yeah, Simon's Quest is a game I've played all my life, and there were some things I didn't know about, like the endings. And, but here, yeah. something I knew, uh, the Mirror Shield, which is pretty epic. Yeah, I love, love that Mirror Shield. It's so golden and awesome and big. God, look at it. Here's what I hate. This part right here. Uh-oh. This one, I got this part down. They really wanted bitch. to troll us with this right here. Ah oh, man. Ah. Uh. Don't be a troller, otherwise you're gonna get a ro roller I on the older. I don't know. I'm thinking about the dia right here. Ouch. Don't die. Oh, great. Should have gotten some. Um, some of the uh, healing potion back at that potion place. Yeah. Ah. Oh. Ah. Oh. Oh. oh, but wait a minute. He's got a furry! <sighs> this is very good. <laughs> oh, my, oh my, good job, Ronnie. Good job. <laughs> wow. Oh man. It's like you got the heart to continue on. Oh, you do have some magic potion. Or healing potion. Magic medicine. Oh, medicine as it's called. Go. I love how they call it medicine. They don't just they don't just say health potion or something. Yeah. They actually say medicine. Kinda of funny. Yeah. Jeez. He didn't, he didn't take his meds today. <laughs> hey, tell me. Oh, oh, I failed. You can't look him in the eye. You know what they say, don't look a gift. Eye on the wall in the eye. Ah, yeah. Or you'll get pwned. There we go. Yeah, now that's awesome. Just like, oh, just use a shield. Just don't block me. Yeah. Nope. The other way, Ronnie. The other way. Oops. So your shield's facing right. No. <laughs> Do it game design. Ah, oh, stupid purple jellyfish cake thing. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> That's awesome. Yes. What's in there? A key! Don't like walk backwards. You could have right there. You just hold your... Ooh. 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 Yeah. This dungeon just goes on and on. Ah. Well, it's supposed to be the the last one, so you know the longest. I mean, why would you want like a dungeon in the last five minutes? Yeah, really. All right, I got another fairy. And a fairy and a bottle. Is that like whiskey? Uh, no, no, it's a points for reference music. I was about to say no. It's yeah, it's a reference. I forgot which reference. It's a fairy, a message in a bottle, of course. How can I forget? It's like oh, the it's only genie. other no genie in a bottle. No, n no, I think, no, I think you're messing with me, Ronnie. <laughs> Christina Aguilera? Oh, that's even more, it's, I wouldn't know. <laughs> more like, Christina, are you glaring at her? Oh, fuck, oh, God, just, for, just forget it. The just, most failed just, attempt. Just for cut a, all this a, audio, I just should be silent. To the ELP now. <laughs> you got a five minute LP to be silent? Actually, I could have worked out. You'll be uh, over by then. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Probably. <laughs> Dang it, what? Come on! Just use the hook shot. You can't fit through the freaking hole. Come on. Yeah. Fair. How pathetic uh, is that? Uh, 
Well, apparently very pathetic to you. <laughs> That's pathetic, Ron. <laughs> Looks like that that path is pathetic. Stop it. Just give up for the night. <laughs> <laughs> That's good. I just like how you're like, oh, stop it. Yeah. Jesus. Here we go, Skull Castle. Oh. Oh, here we go. Skull Dungeon. Turtle Rock. <laughs> Skull Dungeon. Oh. Here we go, Gans Castle. Oh, wait, not yet. And here oh we my go, god. Giant three headed tortoise. Oh my. Looks like Ronnie's getting, uh, using some ECW coding right here. Yeah. No, or not something. coding. I'm ECW strategy. Except I'm not doing it as epically. Epic. What the heck? How can you put your head back there? A turtle cheated. It's not like Jay. Ouch. Oh, this Ouch. <laughs> but wait a minute. What? He's got another one. All right. But now, watch out! It's fire and ice time on the NES. Uh, I'm playing. You're not. Uh. uh. Yeah. It's certainly not that LP on the original channel that started this whole thing. This yeah. channel that. Oh, what was I even talking about? Oh, nothing, nothing. W Fanboys Inc. Oh, wait. Exactly. Uh, here we go. We did it, we beat him! Not quite. What? Oh, wait, now we're playing Snake. Yeah. Ow. Ah, I think you're gonna die. Did you get another fairy? I totally forgot. Come on, Wolf. Jeez. I think, th is this your last? Oh my yes. goodness. Ronnie, you are the ECW master. Barely. Doing it on one heart. Yeah, really. Doing one Bret heart. Oh, I did get killed. I just got revived by a fairy. Well, still, I mean, you didn't have to start over then. Yeah. Da -da -da, you got the last crystal. That song was better. <laughs> <laughs> and now, this is actually Zelda. Zelda. That was a good try. Thank you. <laughs> As far as you go. <laughs> no, really, this isn't the last dungeon. <laughs> Again, it's right outside. Best of the gate thing to two worlds, Cuddy. Once again, he enters the light world. It isn't likely that anyone can stop him. Oh. <laughs> you can find him wherever he runs. Yeah. Yeah, obviously. <laughs> combined powers with our powers combined, we form Captain Link. Captain Link, he's a he won't boy blink. man. Captain Link, he won't blink, and he also doesn't stink. Oh, fail. Well, I'll tell you what uh, doesn't stink is uh, part 15. Well, we'll be in Ganon's Tower. Until then, God bless and take care. Welcome to Let's Play The Legend of Zelda A Link to the Past Part 15. This is Ron Moore along with Laura. Hello. I'm not sure if you want a nickname or, or just Laura or some sort of Zelda nickname or whatever. <laughs> I don't have a Zelda nickname but I should I should think of one for sure. <laughs> and so, what the heck? These little sphinxes, lions, uh, whatever they are. lion things are so hard. Yeah. So now I am heading towards Ganon's Tower. This should be fun. That's another one of those. So yeah, again, this tower's, uh, I remember back then it was so challenging, and I wonder how many, or how long it's going to take for me to get through this time. Oh, yeah. <clears throat> I just played this game with my brother, um, over Christmas, and we're so bad at it, we, it took us forever. Yeah. There's been times where I had to look through a walkthrough on YouTube because mm -hmm. I forgot where to go oh, or sure. what to do. So yeah, here we go. This is Ganon's Tower, the final dungeon in the game. Thankfully. <laughs> so yeah, I believe I go in this door first. Yeah. The first key there. I remember I realized don't use the key on that door yet. You're pretty much wasting it. I don't remember what's behind that door. Um, I think it's like 
Well, you don't really need a key to go through there because you eventually work your way around to there. Oh, okay. So it's best to save your key, not the. Huh. Makes sense. Not the waste your key and then wonder where the other key is. It's like the water temple. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Good yeah, old that, water temple. Yeah, that's still to come. Yeah. But uh, surprisingly, uh, the Ganis Tower is easier than the water temple, uh, at least to me. Not to me because I haven't played this game nearly as much as. Ocarina of Time. Yeah. Freaking skull, skull kids or whatever these things are that get my nerves, especially the ones that jump back and shoot bones at you. I know, there's some that'll throw bones at you and others won't. Ah. Yeah, the blue ones. Yeah. Well, make no bones about it, this dungeon's pretty hard. <laughs> oh, well, I fell. I remember I first played this dungeon, I failed a lot. <laughs> but the, I think the the uh, Ganon's dungeon and the original Zelda was longer than this one. That is definitely more challenging to me. And yeah, that, that one, the, the original Zelda was the hardest one to me even to this day. I still haven't beaten it without cheating. Oh yeah. I don't know if I've played that game. On like the very original one? Yeah, the very first one that came out in 86. I don't, I don't know if I've played that one. Yeah, pretty good game, but man, it's hard. Yeah. Even with Game Genie or Infinite Lives, trying to remember where to go and what to do. Oh, man! What? <laughs> okay, I blew up both of them. That's how they get you. Come on, get through there. Oh, <laughs> come on. There's a split second more. I actually got stuck on those before, and I think you... Oh, yeah. I don't you know have you... to, like, use the mirror to get out. Get out. It's annoying. Yeah. By well, that time on Turtle Rock, I got stuck behind one, but this one time I got stuck on one. <laughs> and I think I eventually got out, or I forgot what happened, but thank goodness for the mirror. I know. Oh, there we go. It took me forever to figure that out. Oh, yeah. God. I was so frustrating in Turtle Rock when I got stuck behind the, the blue blocks and had to start over. Oh, yeah, I bet. That's never happened to me before. That was funny but frustrating at the same time. Yeah. Okay, now this is frustrating to see if I remember which one or which order to go into. It's just a giant maze. Yeah, you go in these freaking mud puddles here and transport you to, to God knows where. and <laughs> Well, not there. And I, I do this a lot, it gets annoying. It's gonna be echoing in my head all day. Oh, no. What if that were real life? Like, what if there were those weird portals in real life? I think that'd be cool. Yeah, it'd be scary though at the same time. If you're a little kid and you get lost, you wander in a portal and. I know. I don't know where the heck you are. <laughs> Um, reminds, me game, <laughs> reminds me of that game Out of This World, Sega Genesis, that was, uh, was creepy. Yeah. Oh, come on, you can't oh. sneak past there. That probably reminds you every time you fall through a pit, it reminds you what floor you're on. See, look. Yeah, I oh, know yeah. first floor. First floor. Because sometimes you can fall through and it takes you somewhere else, I guess, but... Yeah. It's just like rubbing it in your face, kind of. When you, you, you fell. It's just a pit, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Ah, there we go. Oh, man. Oh, man, yeah, this is the fun part where I gotta figure out uh, where to yeah. go. I can use the ether to look where I'm at. Mm-hmm, for sure. First time I played, I made the mistake of killing those little guys, but yeah. they actually help you, like, see where the hidden path is. Yeah. Aw, oh, man. Ah. Just all over over here. The first floor. <laughs> Ooh, there we go. Wasting my magic. I'm not really wasting it, but kind of feel like I'm wasting it on this. I see where I'm going. I think the Lens of Truth is in this game, is it? The symbol is. I don't think the actual item. I don't think it is. Lens of Truth doesn't waste that much magic. 
uh, there was a little lamp right there. I could have used the uh, fire staff to lit it up, and that would have lit the the, the path. I forgot about. Oh, that. what is? Uh, anti fairies are the bane of my existence. I'm yeah. not good at changing them. I did not know until I saw someone's playthrough recently. You can use the powder. Yeah. At, I don't think I even knew what the powder was really used for, except for to get the uh, your magic uh, reduced by one half or whatever. Yeah. But that weird little bat guy. <laughs> yeah. A schizophrenic bat, whatever he yeah. was. Who knows? Oh, right. Now I gotta fight the uh, first dungeon boss. Mm -hmm. Now I haven't got the silver silver arrows yet. And so usually silver arrows will kill these things in one hit. That's right, though I got full health right here. That's good. My sword. Oh no! I love the fire sword. I know. Come on, man. Uh, now I'm gonna get the big key. Got him. When I was playing with my brother um, a couple months ago, whenever we beat the boss, like the little mini boss in this room, we went out this left door first and then didn't get the big key. And it was such a pain to try and like figure that out again, like get back to that point. Oh yeah. Oh man. Worst yeah. mistake ever. Yeah, that's what can be confusing about Zelda games. You're trying to, I mean, you get lost, and you're like, what did I miss? And you yeah. got to backtrack and realize, oh, yeah. Yeah. Oh, uh, yeah, I got these fairies. Got them. I think that's all I can get. My balls are full now. Mm-hmm. Okay, now back to the first floor. To get the, uh, was it blue? No, red mail. Oh, I got the blue mail. Better protection than blue mail. Yep. Nice. Yeah, so instead of uh, the blue ring or the red ring, like the original Zelda, here it's the blue mail and the red mail. Mm-hmm. It's pretty cool they brought back the rings. Kind of classic. Okay, now to the other side of the dungeon. See over there, I think, you know, I would have came out on this side. Oh, yeah. Okay. Yeah. I would have used that key. and So, yeah, I... Uh, had to check a walk through, make sure you're on the right path. Because at first I failed right from the get go because I went in the main room at the beginning mm -hmm. of the dungeon. I went to the main room upstairs and oh, it's yeah. totally not where you go first. Oh, there we go. Nice. Oh man, hey, those freaking. Ah, now I forgot the wall master. Yeah, I forgot I can hit those with my sword. Yeah. Nothing's so frustrating like having that hand grab you and take you back to the beginning. That's the worst. I wish it would be like an Ocarina of Time where if you killed it, then it's gone, you know? Yeah. And they, they're also in the original Zelda. Okay. Sometimes they come out from the wall, not from the ceiling. They just grab, oh. snatch you right there. That makes sense why it's called Wall Master. Yeah. And, and here in Ocarina of Time, it's a freaking ceiling master, I guess. Oh, yeah. Ah, uh, these the mummies return. Mm-hmm. Whoa. Ooh, that's close. Yeah. Sometimes uh, my right speaker don't work, and if the hand's coming, if you're on the right side of the screen and the hand's coming, you don't hear it. You. Yeah, you have no ring. Stupid speakers. Well, they are 10 years old, so. <laughs> what I expect. Got your money's worth. Yeah, and I gotta uh, light these torches up. Conveyor belts. Mm -hmm. It's kind of weird conveyor belts in Zelda. <laughs> you expect that from like a more futuristic type game or whatever. Yeah. I guess. Like Contra or Mega Man. Which was the boss where, like, in this game where the whole floor is conveyor belts? Um. Like, what temple was that? And you're, it's like some giant bat thing. Oh, uh, I think that's the third dungeon. Oh, man. Yeah, it was. The second dungeon was the, uh... I forgot who was the water temple boss. A water dungeon boss, I forgot. I have, in I this have... game, I think it was like the eyeball or something? I don't no, know. That's in the, uh, Misery Mire. Uh-huh. Part of them eyeballs. 
bars of water. I forgot. It's weird. I have to go back and look. I really forgot. I know the water temple boss knocked me a time. It's a freaking water drop droplet. It's silly. But in here, I forgot. That's weird. I don't really remember either. Oh yeah, it is. It's a thing. I think it's. It's not an eyeball thing, but it's something where it surrounds itself with a bunch of little, bunch of little balls or little ball creatures, and you gotta mm -hmm. use a grappling hook and pull them away from it. And then yeah, just, that one. Okay. But the conveyor belt boss that was in Dungeon Three, where well, it's in the Lost Woods. Yeah, oh yeah, that one was hard to me. Yeah. Okay. Oh well, I just screwed myself. Um, ah. But yeah, but that's the only way to get the key. So how would you not have to kill you, or fall through right there to get back over there? How they get you? Yeah. <laughs> you have to hear that too a lot. <laughs> <laughs> but that's a happy sound, so that's okay. Yeah. Well, it depends. Like in that third dungeon, you run, you run over all of them on the floor, and then you keep hearing it over and over. You hit the wrong one, and accidentally fall over or fall off if you're not mm -hmm. paying attention. A freaking uh, fire stick looks like looks like one of those uh, Doppler radar signals I know. circling around. Oh. Ah. Forgot about that. Yeah, the fire sticks from Mario Brothers too. Let me use my cape to get through this. Yeah. There we go. I called them basketballs because I would just make up stuff, and that's what it looked like to me at first. Yeah. Giant basketballs. Where are the Dodongos? <laughs> I can't wait to bounce the Dodongos. Oh boy! And I think it's weird that game. It's all Zelda, you know? Yeah. Right? It's weird. Right, here we go again with this. Oh, nah, it's much easier. Yeah. All right, now time to go to the main floor or the top floor, whatever. This is the main floor right here. Now mm. to uh, basically work our way to Ganon's floor or Ag Aganum or Aganum, whatever his name is. The wizard. Yeah. Oh man, I hate those things. They mimic every move and Oh I know. And when they face you, yeah, the the pink ones will shoot at you. Yeah. Oh, I got contained with more of them here. Oh, oh the spike ah. got it, darn. Ah, yeah. Ugh. That's the first turn right here. Ah, ah! Let's go all out. I usually use that little statue up there and move it around to kind of block the spike, but... Yeah, that's right. But I'm that takes way too long. I'm impatient with this dungeon to hurry up and get right. over with. It's already long enough. Yeah. Oh, no. Come. Now you got these guys and the little laser team Yeah. <laughs> I hate those things. They're also Ocarina of Time. Oh, yeah, but at least you can kill them in that game. Yeah, you can bomb him. Here, I try to bomb it. I go, wait a minute. Oh, we I got know. Saint Ocarina Tom. <laughs> I can't wait to bomb some eyeball laser things. <laughs> I think they're so, called Bemos, but I'm not. Oh, yeah, that's right. Bemos, yeah. At least in Ocarina of Time, where you can figure out what your enemies are called. Wait till uh, some fanboy posts a comment. Oh, they call Bemos. You don't know the name of it? You suck. Oh, uh, well, sorry. <laughs> <laughs> we have lives. We may not know the name of every little uninspired. <laughs> Someone told me that one time in Metroid, like, the flying things, I go, these flying things right here, whatever, mm -hmm. and someone goes, those are called zippers, and the other one's called rippers. If you're going to commentate on the game, get the character's name right. Oh, exactly. Like, really? Well, I'm sorry, I don't know the name of every tiny flying insect in the game. Come on. Those are fruit flies. Get it right. <laughs> oh, yeah, these cannonballs from the very, the eastern palace. Yeah, hey, you got it, though. Usually, I get knocked off. Yeah. Uh, uh, horsemen over there? Little, little evil little My Little Ponies. <laughs> my Little Ponies when they turn emo or something, I don't know. Right. Oh, now now that Beemos is on a freaking conveyor belt. Yeah. As if they're not a pain enough to deal with. Ow! Oh, no. Now, I hate that noise. I mean, seriously, 
At least Ninja Turtles 1 stopped the beeping after a certain while. Zelda keeps beeping nonstop. I know. Like, I know I'm in danger. Shut up. Oh, great. Now conveyor belts and ice to deal with. And I know. It's more and more challenging. That one's too yeah. bad, though. I got lucky with that one. Ah. Yeah. Oh. Great. Now, and then those little blue glowing orbs flying around. Ah, oh, man. Uh, you got some fairies. Yep. There we go. I know it's not uh, a link to the past. You can actually see what the fairies look like in the Ocarina of Time. It's just a glowing ball. Mm-hmm. <laughs> well, at least they're not annoying, though, in a link to the past. Hey, listen! Yeah, seriously. Watch out! Okay, yeah, I'm going to skip through this. It's just another uh, uh, boss battle from uh, one of the earlier dungeons. Mm -hmm. The Tremors or whatever they are. Yeah. Uh, Kevin Bank... Kevin bacon in this game to fight him. <laughs> oh, it's a little invisible skull wizards. These things. Why are they shooting at you? Like these weird crescent moons? Yeah, or maybe oh. using a wand. They're, these guys are in the original Zelda. And you can actually obtain the wand that they use uh, as the dungeon item, I think, in Dungeon, dungeon 6. Nice. It's funny, it's a big pit right there, but the heart don't fall down to the pit. Mm -hmm. Lucky for us. I don't know those eyeballs. Not too bad. Yeah. Ah. Those spike balls. Uh, reminds me of the uh, spike balls in the water temple. Yeah. Oh, yeah, I think the floor falls right here if I don't hurry up. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Ah, you're stuck. Sucks to suck, little guy. Yeah. Oh, this room. Oh, yeah. Thanks so much grief. Get the fire staff. The only weapon I haven't gotten is the cane of Byron or something. You don't have to have that one to beat the game, though, do you? No, you don't. I forgot where it was at, actually. But, well, I don't need it. You do need the cane of Somalia, whatever it's called. Mm -hmm. uh, I can feel their eyes on me. <laughs> <laughs> Literally. Here we go. Oh, this uh -huh. room is hard for me, too. Yeah. Ah, oh, that's the wrong place to start. Okay, move out the way. There's the any uh, version of the first dungeon boss, Dark World Dungeon. Yeah, well, I can't get any more bombs. Yeah. I got 999 rubies. Can't they just upgrade to at least 1,000? That would be cool. <laughs> oh, yeah, that's right. Uh, put the bomb on the conveyor belt and time it right. Ah! Uh, nope. Tricky. There we go. There's no way to kill that thing, whatever it is, so. Yeah. That's another frustration. Oh, man. Oh, oh, I kind of got stuck right there. There you go. Moving on. Oh, oh this oh. thing. Ah. Oh. Ah, oh, this is even harder. I know. Oh, oh. I want to oh. land on the spikes. <laughs> Good thing this isn't Mega Man. Right. All right. 
Hope I don't keep failing at this like I did the first time I fought this boss. Oh man, you gotta hit him with the actual sword. You can't use the mm -hmm. full energy attack or whatever. Oh, oh. Man. Alright, got two hits. Is it four or five you need to kill on? There's only oh. three? Oh, three on this one. Oh, good. Oh, okay. I guess because it's harder to decide to show a little yeah. mercy. Oh, you have your tempered sword now, right? Yeah. Oh, yeah, that's, that's probably why. That might be it. Money that you don't get to use. Yeah. I think, like, um... When I first beat that boss right there here, I was like, oh, how do I get out of here? I got to fall down and then realize that little treasure chest is over there. I go, oh. Mm -hmm. <laughs> All these freaking bouncing things. Oh, no. Bouncers. Ah. Ah. Ah, man. <sighs> you do that. I know. It's the worst. All right, here Seven we go. Four. All right. Uh-oh. Second battle with uh, Aganum. Ho ho ho! Ha ha ha! Yeah, not gonna have a third meeting. <laughs> this one's, uh, you know, more challenging because you split into three. Yeah. And when I was a kid, I was stupid because I thought the only way you can deflect, even though they gave me the clue in the game, the only way to deflect his power was with the bug catcher net. And actually, it said that? No, no, I thought I thought they would oh, do cool. it, but they gave me a clue, you know, saying the Master Sword, or, I think, or you got to figure out a way to deflect its power back to him. Yeah. I, it actually said the Master Sword, but I thought the Bug Catcher Net was the only way to do it, and then I figured out later on the Master Sword can do it too, which is easier. Yeah. And to here, he don't shoot that lighting at you. And then you see Ganon. This was possessed a Ghanim, or that's his alter ego, and now turns to Dracula and flies away. Yeah. Oh, now the bird wants to come in the Dark World. Why right. He helped me before the Dark World. I know, seriously. So then I figured out that tap back there really was Ganon's tower. Pretty cool. It's one strong bat to break through that wall. Yeah, really. So that's the end of this part. We will see you in part 16, which will be the final part, and the let's discuss. So thank you, Laura, for joining me. My pleasure. It was fun. Okay. Until then, God bless and take care. Welcome to Let's Play Discuss, The Legend of Zelda, A Link to the Past. This is Ron Moore, along with the J-Man, Green, and the Wee Guy. Yo! And so now I am getting, re getting ready for the final battle, and i got to pay 100 rupees for this big bomb. Not like it matters because you maxed out your wallet? Yeah, really. Yeah, you'd be rolling in rupees. Yeah, and... I haven't got the silver arrows yet. And you fucked and, up. Ah, dang it. Really? Yup, you can't jump. so stupid. Bomb. You can't jump. He's supposed to follow you. What, I, what a bomb can't follow somebody? So, nope. you have to buy it again? Yep, you yes. have to buy it again. Yeah. That's so messed up. That's how they get you. Yeah. Alright, so you can't jump up or anything. <laughs> so, you gotta be careful. At least the timer isn't going down as you're walking. Yeah, they'd be messed up. So Big I haven't money. got the, they have not gotten these sil silver arrows yet. So, uh, the silver bullet, Bud Light, or whatever beard that was back then, that was called the silver bullet. Isn't that what you used to kill like a that? werewolf or something? Yeah, that's that's another thing. So Gan's really a vampire, right? Kill him with a silver bullet? I don't know. <laughs> yeah. Vampires are only allergic to silver. I thought they're allergic to onions or um garlic. I think both. It's a it's a nightmare on Hyrule Street. Yeah, <laughs> uh, yeah. It sure Pretty is. Ca Castle Zelda. I uh, fail. Zeldavania. There uh, we go. Um, you redeemed yourself. Mysterious <laughs> Pond. Won't you throw something in? Well, yes, that's why I'm here. No, I'm gonna throw. Oh. Take a swim. Yeah, and. Ah! 
Okay, Whoa. Ganon's sister now makes an appearance. And actually right here, this is what you found out that uh, the Dark World or Ganon's power is what, uh, Disfigure the Fairy? Mm -hmm. Or Fairy, however they spelt it. Yeah, Fairy, I wonder if that's a nice. or maybe that's another way to spell Fairy, I don't know, anyway. Google. And the Super Arrows! Alright, now it's time to face the Ganon. I never knew that. It took me forever to beat this game because I never knew you had to do that and get silver arrows. There yeah. is a way to beat him without um, the silver arrows. It just takes... Exploits. Really? Yeah, it's an exploit, but it takes so much longer. Like, I'd say about a few seconds longer because you have to keep hitting with the sword at a certain time. And because you're not using the silver arrows, he doesn't die as fast. You have to use the golden gun. Yeah. <laughs> the golden gun with a silver bullet? No, um... Core's Light! <laughs> yeah, there you go. Dark World. And now we are getting ready to face Ganon in the final battle as the top right hand corner of the screen has to remind us what floor we're on. And I love, I had to listen to Ganon's theme here for a second while I was recording this. I, I love Gan Ganon's theme. It's a, a, an ECW theme. Yeah, should we call it the ECW theme? And this is the first part of the, part of the battle. It's pretty easy. Yeah, it's not too terrible. I was hilarious as fighting him without that armor and watching how much damage you take when you touch him. Yeah, really. Now this is the second part of the battle, or well, first part of the second part of the first part, whatever. Second phase. Yeah. As the fiery keys to try to hit you. Oh wait, this ain't Ocarina of Time. It's like Dracula though, sending his bats at you. Well, the fire bats, but yeah, still. I think that happened in Super Castlevania 4. I think that happened in most Castlevanias. Well, shut up. They're on the same system and they're super. Okay, well, Castlevania's super, but still. Oh, well, get it right, you idiots. <laughs> uh, get back to playing this game. <laughs> I already played this game. I beat it twice. I wasn't talking to you. Oh, what do you say, J Man? <laughs> Wait, did we just go forward? I and say it rolls. Yeah, I just went forward. Uh, cut to the next part of the battle because that one part is getting repetitive. You were doing the exploit, weren't you? <laughs> the exploit. What? Exploit. The green was no, talking about. Take it forever. Ah, oh, dang it! Oh, uh, pwned. Oh, but wait a minute. He's got a fair airy. He's coming back with a fairy ECW ECW. <laughs> Come on, hurry up and kill him before all the tiles go away. You couldn't do that, in ECW. No fairies are gonna be around saving in ECW. Come on, you have a chance. No, never mind. You're not getting it. Oh, yeah. These are the tiles of fate in the S game. All right, now this is when it gets real. I thought it was not, wasn't real to begin with. It's not <laughs> fancy, man. Come on. Doo -doo. <laughs> Ronnie Doo -doo. wasn't fast enough. Doo Doo just got real. Oh. oh. Doo Doo just got real? What? <laughs> oh, come on. Know. See, if I had the no, gold arrow, I would have beat him already. Now, see, yeah, if you were fast enough, you could kill him before he started making the candles go out. Well, your face is not fast enough. Hey, I've done it before. I'm like you! Hold <laughs> <laughs> up. And, oh, there we go. Don't miss. Don't die either. Your face yeah. is a miss. That too. Got him. Oh, oh, got him. There we go. Oh, Alright, that's the end of Zelda and God bless you. Take care. Oh wait, no. Okay, okay goodbye. Oh, damn it. I closed the video. <laughs> Dang it. I don't think they were supposed to know it was a video. <laughs> And now we are in the room of the Triforce, and we are speaking with the essence of the Triforce. And why the hell Ganon didn't just go in this room is beyond me? I don't know, but uh, probably because the essence of the Triforce told him no. I don't know. Yeah, it could have been. Or Ganon no. needed no. all the time to build that bridge. I think uh, Lens of Truth said he loves this song right here, the Triforce theme after you beat... Uh, 
Ganon, Ganondorf or Ganon, whatever he's called. I think now that I think about it, I believe the pig form is Ganon and the uh, man form is Ganondorf. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right. I would say that. Yeah. I and the uh, and the I other form is uh. No. The other form is spoiler. Stop it. Yeah. <laughs> the other form Agnim. is. Agnim. Yeah, Agonim, or whatever his name Agnim. is. Agnim. Yeah, <laughs> the whole time. Gahurahim. <laughs> Algorithm. Zant. No. Uh. Boo algorithm. Algorithm. Al Gore. Algebra. Al Gore? Yeah. Yep. Alright, and yeah, I love, I love this music right here too. In this beautiful room with see through green curtains, see through and Gunstar Hero 21 curtains. And. Mm, uh, joke. Yeah. And the mode 7 of the Triforce pieces. Yeah. Because it was mandatory back then for everything to have mode 7. Yeah, I like how the text disappears like slowly, as, a, as opposed to the rest of the game. Well, who cares about that? Anyway, <laughs> here's where Link touch the, touches the Triforce and makes his wish come true. For peace and how he rule, I rule. I wish for a million dollars <laughs> or rupees. <whatever>. Why? <laughs> Why when he can just cut the grass and just make that money? All right, let's get down to brass tacks here. Uh, I wish for a sword to automatically cut grass for me. There. Best wish exactly. ever. As King Santa Claus takes his throne again, and... King Claus? I think there's church. a clause in that. Yeah. The loyal <laughs> sage didn't get his ass handed to him. Yeah, I thought he died. No, he just got his ass kicked. He didn't actually die. But he disappeared. Eh, that's just a game. Respond. They didn't want to leave the body there. And no, Sahasrila returns to Kakariko Town. When I heard, I think I, I've heard it's actually called Kakariko, not Kakariko. It's Crackhead Village. I had a fanboy uh, <laughs> the message me, You idiot, it's Kakariko. You stupid idiot, get it right. No. It's uh, Chris oh. Jericho Village. <laughs> oh, jeez. <laughs> if you just saw Venom 22 trying to break into that treasure chest in the desert, um, and uh, there's Bear and Wigan now. <laughs> I'm the, am I the one chasing Bear? No, you're, you're the, no. no, no, I'm the one being chased. I would be Bear. He's like, hey, get over here. And I'm like, no, Bear, you're weird. Well, wait, hey, you're, you're the bottom half. <laughs> now, I thought the honestly, I thought people were dead in this game. You're all bottom. <laughs> oh, so, oh well. Uh, hey, no I'll one go chasing happy, waterfalls. Happy ending. Oh. <laughs> that was Bear. The I witch know, he's, now, he's, now, he's not a merman, he's a, time to he's a, a merbear. Man, uh, magic powder. Yeah, that was that was funny. Just like, why don't you have the magic power, Ronnie? I mean, the witch would go in the shop go. and get it. Yeah, he's Stupid a lumberjack ass, ass brothers. Uh, yeah. Lumberjacks. We're gonna that's hate Piper that. and uh, we got. You already used me. Come on. <laughs> Use you again, Flute Boy. He's like Piper Goldsboro. I don't know. <laughs> Flute Boy. I guess that's. Uh, I don't know. Men's of Truth? No. Oh, that was Man. a kid in the. Uh, 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 okay. <laughs> Venus, Queen of Fairies. Why do I not remember that one? Because you're dumb. Gaming oh, Shadow. Uh, there's one of these seven dwarves. Two of them. Two of them. Uh, two of them. Those dwarves. Yeah. Wonder where the other five are. Dead. Is that uh, oh, paranoid beach bag? Look at him, his stupid hat. Kakariko Town, the bug catching kid. Um, there's that one jerk lady that if you get near her, she calls the guards on you. Yeah. Uh, the lost old man. The lost old man. Hey! Lost. There was a lost old man? Oh, sorry, J-Man. <laughs> <laughs> Mr. Leahy, apparently. Hey, hey I, I represent that statement. Wait a minute, he's still lost. How's he gonna get out off that bridge without the hammer? Exactly. How would he find the liquor? Ah, yeah. uh, the forest douchebag. Fuck you, forest thief. Control throwers. And... Uh, the Master Sword sleeps again. Just on this Five. side of the line. Yeah, just... Just for that. He 
So I wonder what happens to those three pendants that you have to use to get them. I think Link hangs them over his bed. Yeah. Yeah, he does. Where's one as an earring from time to time? Fashion. Mm -hmm. yeah, Probably so. uh, tried to sell them on eBay. <laughs> Didn't work. Yeah, the yeah. E-Great Bay. Ha-ha! Get it? Alright, and this is we no. got favorite part because you get to see the uh, music producer later on. Composer. Composer, yeah. yeah. Yeah, he'll come by soon. Who's my favorite? Oh, yeah. Director, yes. No, uh. It's, it's not home, so. I don't even care. Oh, shit. ECW wrestling script writer, Kensuke Tana Tanabe. Tanaka. Yeah. Alright, so. Silly guys. Yeah, I like the ending in this game. Nice music and just uh, a long, lengthy ending. It's pretty worth watching after beating a challenger game. Um, <laughs> not the credits. No, not that part. Well, it's kind of cool, too, because, I mean, you do see your how many times you died or whatever later on in the credits and where you Sometimes died at. Sometimes you just don't want to see. <laughs> yeah, which I hate yeah. because I'm like, no, I just, I don't want to. I want to know that I, in my mind, went through perfectly instead of the game being like, you died here this many times. And I'm like, grr. Yeah. Like, fuck, I don't recall these deaths. <laughs> Well, see, I use safe states and start over sometimes when I died, so I'd, this is not going to be accurate right here. Not <laughs> cheater, porn shack. <laughs> Pumpkin eater. Porn shack does not cheat. There's no proof of that. You know, I just, speaking of safe states, you know that there's actually a third-party device that lets you put safe states on an actual cartridge? Cool. What? <laughs> Yeah, someone showed it to me. I'm like, wow, someone's playing a Super NES. And I'm looking at the Super NES and this dongle-looking thing that lets him use save states. Oh, yeah, I saw that before. I saw that. Oh, there it is, Sound Composer. Koji Kondo. Yeah. yeah. That man is hilarious. <laughs> uh, what the yeah. hell are we talking about again? Koji Condominium. Uh, yeah. Our main guy, man. Right. I stole J Man's line. Okay. Um, Alright, so I guess now we can go ahead and do the Let's Discuss. Unless you wanted to really enjoy reading all the credits. Not that we're not thankful for their work. Um, oh, there's a uh, Yoshi. Yoshi. <laughs> cool. Uh, Yoshi, more uh, like uh, Yoshi. Because that's what it said. Who's going to so, start? Yeah. Oh, look, name. Wow. Why are we still making these names? <laughs> um... Yeah, so, well, anyway, The Legend of Zelda, I Link to the Past, pretty much uh, my second favorite Zelda game. So my first being Ocarina of Time. Um, yeah, I mean, this game was very challenging. When I first played it, like when I was, I think, 13 or 14, um, I mean, the game was just just epic. I mean, it took me years to play it after it came out for the SNES. And, well, as right here, we look, <laughs> my quest history was just not totally accurate, but, oh well. Ah, oh, dang it. First death. Yeah. <laughs> anyway, um... Yeah, I mean, this game, really, I mean, I, I forgot how I got I know I got it for Christmas one year. I think I bought it for myself, or I bought it from a friend first, and I bought it for a long time, and I played it. And I think I was able to beat it by myself. I don't think I used Player's Guide or anything, but it took a good while. But it was a very fun game, very challenging and I remember the moon tower. What is it called? The, uh, the moon tower. The place where you get the moon pearl in the tower. Uh, tower of Hera. Tower of Hera, yeah. Tower uh, of Pins. <laughs> the moon tower. The moon dungeon. That'd be cool. Um, yeah, that was... Uh, it took me a long time to get the moon pearl. I mean, I was playing it all night in my room. And yeah, and I finally was able to figure it out. And yeah, this game has a lot of fun side quests and just hit, uh, hidden items and a lot of stuff to look for. I mean, this game was just very epic. And yeah, I mean, and I like this game a lot better than the original Zelda, not just because, you know, it's Super Nintendo, but I just, the original Zelda is so hard to me. I never beat, I don't think I ever beat the original Zelda without cheating. Um, and the SNES version, not as hard, but still challenging. I remember Ganon's Tower is awesome. Turtle Rock, um, I mean, this game is just really, really brings back a lot of great memories. I played it with various friends when I was a kid, and 
when I bought it, I bought it again. I bought it in '97. It was a, a million seller. We had, the, you know, that gold ribbon on the top on the mm-hmm. cover box. I remember that. And I love the cover box. I think I still have it to this day, to where it's uh, in mint condition. I mean, it really, really uh, is one of the greatest games ever released on the SNES. And I remember seeing it on commercial when it first came out, and I didn't think too much about it. I wasn't a big Zelda fan like back then. It was all about I was all about Mega Man, Contra, Castlevania, um, and Street Fighter, and Zelda. I kind of liked, but I wasn't really a big fan of it. And then. Finally, years later, played Link to the Past, and man, it's just very epic, and yeah, I, I definitely know why. It was on the top 20, I think it was on the top 3 uh, Nintendo Power uh, SNES uh, list every month in Nintendo Power Magazine. Very good game, and it was very awesome, and yeah, I mean, the music, just the overall atmosphere, and I mean, this game is just epic, and... So yeah, Zelda: uh, Link to the Past, definitely one of the top Zelda games ever made. I give it a 9.5 out of 10. Green. Oh, okay. I guess I'll go next. Um, okay. man, it's been a while since I've played this, but it's definitely one of those Zelda games that still aged really well. And the whole light and dark world concept was amazing at the time and even other games like Metro Prime 2 looked back on that and took the concept and just kind of like paid tribute to it um what else is good about this game the amount of dungeons I think this game has more dungeons than Ocarina of Time I think there's yeah, it does. in the dark world three in the light world so I personally between that and Ocarina of Time, I like A Link to the Past a little bit more. Because it was just... It was a lot of content. It was a lot of stuff to do. Fighting Ganon. And then seeing the Dark World. It was all just a really good experience for me. So all in all, I'm going to give the game the same score Ronnie did a 9.5. Alright. J-Man? Uh, I really don't have a lot to say about this game. I played it uh, early 90s. Um, I don't know. I really never truly enjoyed a Zelda game until Ocarina of Time. Yeah. I don't know why. I can't explain that. But um, one thing that I can definitely say about this game is I hated the uh, the light world, dark world thing. I don't, I don't know. I don't like that. It it, it kind of seems like like a developer trying to repeat like the same kind of thing. I don't know. I don't like the concept. Um, bleh. Um, but overall, like this was a pretty good game. Uh, and I'll give it an eight out of ten. Well, I like the light and dark world concept better than the. Uh, Majora's Mask, Time, uh, Moon. I think, I think what he's trying to say is that he doesn't like the fact that you're pretty much going through the same place twice with just a few changes. Exactly. Um, now, oh. the, the closest thing that I can say to that um, is like uh, Castlevania uh, Symphony, Symphony of the Night, um, where they, oh. you know, they took the same castle and, and made it reverse upside yeah. down. <laughs> and that was cool. But yeah, kind of the same deal. Well, see, uh, not to not to take away from the game itself. I mean, you know, I enjoy both games, but yeah. See, the way I look at it, a link to the past uh, uh, with the light and dark worlds. Yeah, I mean they are similar, but at the same time, yet different. And how they enter, uh, like what's it? Uh, how they uh, intertwine with each other, and how like, they presented themselves. Yeah, like, and you go in the same spot, you transform into, use the mirror to go back to the light world, and how you, uh, you know, where you're at, depending on where you're at, and I just, I mean, it's just an awesome way to discover secrets, and how you found, uh, like, you know, you found one of the, the, the lost uh, dwarves that uh, upgraded your sword, and how they, ch- you know, they change in the uh, in the dark world, and, man, to me, when I first 
discover that. Like on Death Mountain, I'm like, whoa, this is epic. And so then you probably be just like, whoa, I don't recall this place looking like this over here. Yeah. And so it yeah. kind of reminds me of Back to the Future. Like, you know, it's yeah. kind of like the light world is the present, dark world is uh, the future if you don't stop again. And, and this is what's going to happen, and then they're going to eventually merge, and then that's what's going to become a higher world. Like shit. Kind of like in Ocarina of Time. Yeah, my thing. Well, Majora's Mask ain't the only time game. And Zelda, you know, you do the same thing. Ocarina of Time was like way different. Like you actually travel seven years in the future. Whereas Majora's Mask was only three days. Yeah, I hated that. You had to hurry up and do this in three days, or the moon crashes. I, I kind of didn't like that about Majora's Mask. That's just me. So the good gamer. That's all. That's all. <laughs> yeah, you did. I know. Lens of Truth is gonna. Lens of Truth is gonna start an argument. On this video, and Pretty then much. I'm going to block him, and he's not going to be my friend no more. And, no, I'm just kidding. Um, <laughs> well, and, okay, let, let me let me say this. Um, Link to the Past was a uh, a great building block to Ocarina of Time. I think they they got it. They got it right, more than right. They got it perfect on Ocarina of Time. Okay, and so yeah, I mean, I. Yeah, that's how I view the light and dark world thing. I thought it was cool, but I'll create a time. I like how I think they did it better. Yes, I have to agree with that. Um, yep. Yeah. Okay. And all right, we got uh, finally <laughs> the whole. Hey, if you can't dark wait, world. just hang up. No, I'm just kidding. Okay. Two. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. But um, I didn't really grow up with Link to the Past. I uh. More I remember growing up with the 64, Zelda's, Majora's Mask, Ocarina of Time. But I still remember playing Link to the Past and not finishing it because I got stuck. I think I said that in the uh, Turtle Rock episode, I got stuck there. And then when I finally got past that, I got to Ganon, but I never knew how to beat him. You got to get the Silver Arrows, never knew that until I got the game uh, about four years ago. At my first retro gaming expo and finally beat it. And yeah, it is... It's a great Zelda game, of course. It's probably not my top favorites, but it's still, still a still a great game. You know, you got great dungeon designs. You got great uh, weapons, a whole buttload to use. Uh, you know, the music, of course, is fantastic. Koji Kondo is the, you know, he's the Zelda man. Find the music. Condominium. Uh, pretty much, <laughs> he is the condiment on top of the cartridge. Wait, what? Anyway. <laughs> But, uh, and yeah, you know, 16-bit, it looks great, it's still, you know, still looks great, it's still aged well, and um, I would probably, I'd probably give it a, probably give it an 8 out of 10. Yeah. yeah 8 out of 10, same as Jamie. Yeah. So me and Jamie yeah, and and you and Green are the 9.5 buddies, and you can go, you know, do your 9.5 in over the internet. Okay. Nine point nine five. Okay. Um. So yeah, there you go with the uh, let's play and let's discuss of uh, the Legend of Zelda: A Link to the Past, one of the greatest Zelda games of all time. And so yeah, game is. I think we, all, we can all agree though, the game is ECW. Mm-hmm. Yeah. 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 All right. So that is it. We're out of here. I'm Ron Moore. And this is the J Man. We gotta go first. No, you go first. I won't be last. Okay, this is this is green. Are you some of the No, no, this is Wee Guy. And this is Green, the real one. No, I'm Green. That's my last name. But how and dare... This is his baby brother. <laughs> <laughs> and now uh, we got Stepdad comes in, cuts off the internet. Uh, Damn. Oh. All right, that's it. God bless and take care. That never Peace actually out. happened. Lol.